This film is purely fictional. Please do not imitate it. Your like and subscribe are the motivation for me to update. Chapter 1 Rebirth as Queen Bee The sun sets in the west. And the setting sun is like blood. The light in the forest gradually dim. And the roar of beasts and the trembling of the ground could be vaguely heard all around. The roar echoed in my ears. Um, am I not already dead? Chin Fong still couldn't forget the tingling feeling in his mind. Scratching his head, he was suddenly confused. Me? How did I become a bee? Looking around in panic, the dark forest gave him an uneasy feeling. There was a stabbing pain in his head, and an inexplicable memory was poured into him. This should be a memory belonging to the original body. In my memory, this is the demon world, where demons gather, and the original owner of the body is the little queen bee of the Black Wind Hive on the edge of the continent. Originally, the owner of the body could live without worries about food and clothing. But because his biological father, the old queen bee, was persecuted by his subordinate, Blackthorn, his body died. The original owner of the body escaped from the hive under the desperate protection of the old queen bee. But unfortunately, he was also poisoned by the black stinger's bee venom. Before running very far, the original owner of the body was poisoned and died. And he happened to occupy the magpie's nest. Oh my god! What's wrong with traveling through time? I turned out to be a poisonous bee. And I have to face the pursuit of the poisonous queen bee and the swarm of bees. Chin Fong was about to cry without tears. This start is simply H. Lish. System. System. Chin Fong called. But there was no response. It's over. There's no golden finger. How can I live? Boom. Chin Fong couldn't help but sigh. A bright light broke the silence of the night. And there was a burst of lightning and thunder. It's raining. Heavy raindrops had already fallen on him. And Chin Fong staggered while flying in the air. Boom. The dull thunder sounded from the sky. And the downpour fell instantly. Chin Fong, who was flying in the air, couldn't control his body in an instant. No matter. Let's get out of the rain first. Chin Fong said to himself that his weak wings could not withstand the impact of the rain. And he was constantly knocked down by the rain in the air. Even if Goldfinger didn't appear, he was still targeted. God is unfair. When he was angry, he found that the rain seemed to be getting heavier. When the violent storm hit, Chen Feng finally found a temporary shelter, an abandoned beehive. The hive was still shaking when the strong wind hit. The heart that had just soothed was lifted again. I'd be out of luck if I fell into a puddle. You don't have to burp when you first come into this world. Chen Feng huddled in the hive, looking very embarrassed. But contrary to expectations, the hive shook more and more violently as the wind roared. Seeing the scene, the entire hive began to panic. Ding! The host has found the first generation hive and the system activation conditions have been triggered. Does the host activate the system? In the confusion, the surprise finally came. Quick! Activate quickly! A look of surprise appeared in Chen Feng's eyes. Ding! The system activation was successful. The sweet voice echoed in my mind. Brush! A properties panel appeared in his mind. Abandoned hive. Level 0. It has basic functions such as restoring energy and protecting from wind and rain. Completeness, 35%. Upgrade when the completeness reaches 100%. Please repair the hive as soon as possible to obtain more functions. After reading this information, Chen Feng's surprise suddenly cooled down. In this case, he might not be able to withstand this violent storm. Goldfinger? Is this Goldfinger? This is too cheating. Confused. Helpless. The constantly shaking beehive made Chen Feng couldn't help but curse. The beehive was completely damaged and its internal facilities had completely collapsed. Rainwater entered the inside of the hive unbridled. What Chin Fong was afraid of was not the rainwater entering the inside, but the constant shaking of the hive. If this situation continues, the hive will definitely be destroyed in this storm. Looking at the attribute panel again, his expression also changed. Hive integrity, 29%. Heaven will kill me! Weak, helpless and pitiful. Forget it. Tear down the west wall to repair the east wall. The connection points of the hive have already shown signs of breakage. If he doesn't take action, the entire hive will fall into the puddle. Then it will be his end in this violent storm. The fierce rain washed away his body, and Chin Feng dismantled some internal facilities and began to reinforce the outside of the hive. It was still dark outside the hive. As time passed, the entire hive was soaked by rain, and the roar of thunder echoed in the sky. I don't know how long it took, but the exhausted Chin Feng fell into sleep. The shaking hive finally survived this nightmare night. After dawn, Chin Feng came to the outskirts of the hive 
and was immediately frightened by the dilapidated scene. The current hive is only the size of a fist, and more than half of it has been lost compared to yesterday. When he saw the attribute panel again, he looked around helplessly. Only 9% of the hive integrity remains. Ding! The system prompts, the host level cannot surpass the hive. Only the hive upgrade host can have the upgrade conditions. Please pay attention to the host's current attributes. Host, Chen Feng. Level, 0. Attack, 0 slash 10. Defense, 0 out of 10. Speed, 0 out of 10. Creativity, 0 slash 10. Ability to improve the hive. Evolution points, 0. Ding! The system has given the host one evolution point. Please check it carefully. A little? Stingy. Add to the creativity. Complaining is just complaining. And you would be a fool not to give up a few evolutionary points for free. When he saw his creativity reduced to one-tenth, Chin Feng suddenly felt that evolution was far away. After the rain, the sky cleared and the sun shone in the forest. In order to make the hive complete to 100%, Chin Feng began to go out to look for materials. Ding! It's detected that the host has left the hive. Do you want to start map scanning? Turn on! And this function is pretty good. Map scanning is in progress. 10%, 20%, 30%, 100% map scanning is completed. The system has detected that there are currently no threatening host organisms within 200 meters. There are honeycomb construction materials 100 meters to the south. Ding. The sound of the system kept ringing. After hearing the location, Chin Fong waved his arms and flew over. It's really amazing that the majestic queen bee actually does the work of these ordinary worker bees. If not, recalling the scene when the heavy rain came, he couldn't help but shudder. He was forced to start reinforcing his hive. As a queen bee, he also knows the structure of the hive very well. Ding! The system detects that the integrity of the honeycomb reaches 50% and will open the secret palace for the host. Please pay attention to the attribute panel of the host. The secret palace improves the quality of honey by 50% and increases the speed of cultivation. It seems that I will speed up the improvement of the hive. Chapter 2 Rambling Flowers After three days of repair, the integrity of the hive has reached 95%, and the hive is now as big as a round pancake. The improvement of the secret palace allows Chen Feng to gain an evolution point every day. After three days, he still didn't know much about this forest, but what was certain was that this was not a modern world. There is some special power suspended in the air. It's just that Chen Feng can't use these powers. After learning about it in the past few days, he seems to understand that only by relying on these evolutionary points can he become more powerful. From time to time, the sound of roaring beasts can be heard in the forest, as well as the smell of blood from the fighting between wild beasts. His injuries have recovered in the secret palace. Now Chen Feng has accepted the tragedy of being a bee. The scanning range of the system is only 200 meters. Chen Feng encountered two threats in three days but he saw this hive without any value. Those intruders chose to ignore it. Being poor still has its benefits. Chen Feng laughed to himself, and then continued to collect the materials needed to repair the hive. Add one to speed. Add one to attack. And add one to creativity. Looking at the three evolution points in his hand, Chen Feng no longer hesitated. After all, he still had to improve his strength under the current circumstances. Added points successfully. Host, please pay attention to the attribute panel. After hearing the system prompt, Chin Feng glanced at his property panel. The data had become as follows. Attack, 1 tenth. Defense, 0 out of 10. Speed, 1 out of 10. Creativity, 2 out of 10. After adding points, Chin Feng felt that his attack power had become stronger and his speed had become faster. This increase in power surprised him. I have to quickly increase my strength and then deal with the traitors in the Blackthorn Hive. Chin Feng secretly thought. He was panting heavily. Looking at the gradually perfecting hive, he had begun to have some small expectations in his heart. Ding! The system has detected that items necessary for hive upgrade appear 150 meters north. Please host to get them as soon as possible. When the system sound sounded again, after a brief hesitation, Chin Feng rushed over. Baby! I'm here! I want to see what treasures will appear after the hive is upgraded to level 1. Moving forward rapidly, Chin Feng felt his speed increase after increasing his speed. But as he moved forward, he felt an ominous premonition in his heart. This broken system won't cheat me. Probably not. If I die, will this broken system also collapse? If you think about it, it makes sense. Here we come. The hive will be upgraded soon. Chin Feng secretly thought that if he found the key items to repair the hive, he would be able to restore it to level one soon. 
It is expected that more skills will be unlocked by then. And Shin Feng is very excited just thinking about it. Ding! Host please pay attention. Host please pay attention. The system beeps continuously. Two force measure enemies have been detected and are approaching quickly. Please be aware of the host and avoid them. There was a sudden shock in his mind. And Shin Feng stopped instantly. Wipe it! Back off! As he said that, he was stunned for a moment and attached himself to the tree trunk. Ten meters in front of him was his target. This is a peculiar flower. The main reason why it is strange is that the flower exudes a special fragrance. And the flower is the size of a fingernail, but can reverberate hundreds of meters away. He was stunned. Chin Feng knew that the flower ten meters in front of him was what the system needed. Do you need such items to upgrade the hive? Is it possible that the hive also has life? Chin Feng wondered. And at this moment two things that frightened him came here quickly. Beater! The beater is a sparrow-sized bird known for preying on bees. Chen Feng gasped. His natural enemy. Suffer it! The target of these two beaters is obviously this humble flower. His natural blood restraint made it impossible for him to snatch the elixir from the mouths of these two beaters. Chi Chi! Noisy sounds echoed in his ears. But he remained motionless behind the tree. For fear of being discovered by these two guys and dying. Chi Chi Chi! Huh? No! Behind the tree trunk. A head leaked out. In front of the place where flowers were blooming. Two beaters were fighting frantically. The two of them are grabbing this thing. I felt a little happy in my heart. The two beaters started fighting at this moment. And I would have a chance to get the necessities for upgrading the hive. Laugh. The beaters' claws scratched the tree trunk. And the cracks were clearly visible. There was that special power in the air. The system has detected that the enemy in front is a first level monster. The host cannot match it in its current state. Please avoid it. Quietly staring at these two guys. The battle between the two gradually became fierce. But these two beaters didn't seem to be desperate. All they seemed to want is the right to own a flower. Things were far less optimistic than Shin Feng imagined. Although the battle was fierce, it did not have a great impact on the beaters. Staring at his attribute panel, Shin Feng secretly gritted his teeth. Give it a try. Otherwise, when will you be able to upgrade the hive? Recalling the scene of leaving the Black Bee's hive, he didn't want to feel the helpless feeling of being ridiculed again. Fight! While the two beaters were dueling, a queen bee had already arrived on top of the flower. He bit the flower hard, and the fragrance of the flower hit his face. But he had no time to experience this feeling at this time. Find wealth and danger. Speeding up, Chen Feng quickly escaped from here. He has seen the terror of two beaters. They can easily destroy his hive and kill himself. However, when Chen Feng escaped no more than 30 meters, a sudden chill ran down his back. It's broken. It's been discovered. With a start in his heart, the two beaters immediately stared at Chin Feng. They put aside the undecided battle and rushed towards Chin Feng in an instant. The two beaters were like arrows leaving the string. And their speed was terrifying. At this speed, Chin Feng would probably be caught up with him as soon as he arrived at the hive. But now the integrity of the hive is only 95%. Although the rest are some nodes, this distance does not give him a chance at all. Faster! 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 Chin Feng tried his best but dragging the flower that was close to his own body size. His speed was really no match for the beater. Chapter 3 The Beater Attacks Ding! The host gets a creeping flower and is rewarded with three evolution points. The information in my mind is like a lifeline. Speed is increased by two. Creativity is increased by one. Without hesitation, life-saving is the most important thing at this time. Ding! The point addition is completed. Host, please pay attention to the attribute panel. The beaters from behind were approaching step by step. At this moment, Chin Feng suddenly accelerated his speed and rushed towards the hive. Two beaters are in hot pursuit. Even with two points of speed, he still couldn't get rid of the beater behind him. Now Chin Feng can only place all his hopes on the hive upgrade. Finally, at the critical moment, Chin Feng took the lead in arriving at the hive. He hurriedly put down the vines and began repairing the hive. Quick! Upgrade! He said hurriedly that the beater would arrive in a few breaths, and it would be difficult for the hive to stop the opponent's attack. With the power of Bee Tiger, facing Chin Feng who has no ability to resist at all, his hive will be destroyed in an instant. Ding! The hive has reached the upgrade conditions. When the hive integrity reaches 100%, it will be automatically upgraded. Please host to improve the hive as soon as possible. The current hive integrity is 95%. The system beep echoed in my mind. Chin Feng quickly perfected the hive. He had to complete the hive before the beaters arrived. 
otherwise it might be a devastating blow to him. Once the beaters arrive, it will be almost impossible for him to perfect the hive. With only a little attack value, he was like an egg against a rock when faced with a beater. With absolutely no chance of survival, the system has detected that a force majeure enemy is rapidly approaching within 50 meters and is expected to arrive on the battlefield in 10 seconds. Quick! Chin Feng recalled the unfinished parts of the hive, and he quickly began to build the hive. The current hive integrity is 98%. The enemy is approaching quickly, and the countdown to 109876 has begun. The system sound became more and more urgent, and Chin Feng was also building his own nest quickly. When my hive is upgraded, you will definitely die badly, he complained, and the system's voice became increasingly urgent. 3-2. Ding! The system has detected that the hive integrity has reached 100% and has started to automatically upgrade. Hive upgrade 5%, 10%, 15%. Damn it! You still have to read a message when upgrading. It's so slow. What a cheating system! Chen Feng cursed, and his heart was extremely broken. At this time, the beater has arrived at the outskirts of the hive. If the integrity of the hive is destroyed at this time, his hard work for so many days will probably be in vain. The system has detected that the enemy may interrupt the hive upgrade. Please host to stop it in time. Fight! As soon as he gritted his teeth, Chin Fong flew out like an arrow from a string and bumped into the flying beater head-on. The two beaters seemed to have reached some kind of agreement. And at this moment, they both regarded Chin Fong as their enemy. The oncoming beaters left him with no way to escape. He turned around to avoid the attack of the first beater. But another beater had already charged over. The staggered attacks of the two First Order beaters caused him to stumble in the air, and he fell down as if he couldn't control his body. This is absolute suppression. Stare at your opponent. At this time, he quickly accelerated, swooped down, and then accelerated upwards. He had to delay until the hive was upgraded. However, facing two First Order beaters, he had no ability to fight back. The beater passed by Chen Feng again. The airflow around him made him unable to control it. With a series of attacks, Chin Feng could no longer hold on. 55%. Why so slow? Chin Feng's heart has collapsed. And the upgrade is now at 55%. Laugh. The sound of breaking through the air echoed in his ears. And his expression suddenly began to freeze. After Beater took off his wings, a wound appeared on his abdomen. Hiss. The kind of pain that comes through is more than just pain. He could no longer control his body in the air. Chi Chi. The chirping of beaters exploded in his ears. Another beater came from the sky. It's over! His heart skipped a beat, as the beater directly in front of him could no longer dodge. And his life might really be lost this time. You must hide away! He twisted his body crazily, but the pain in his abdomen prevented him from completing the twisting action. Boom! A dull collision echoed in his mind as he fell straight from the sky. The beater did not swallow him. But Chin Feng knew that this did not mean that he could escape this disaster. His claws were holding the wound on his abdomen and an unknown liquid was slowly flowing out of his abdomen. When he looked at the beater in the air, he realized that something was wrong. Now he doesn't even have the ability to escape. The system has been upgraded to 80%. It's still a long way from 100%. Chen Feng, who was holding his abdomen, fell from the air. At this moment, a beater swooped down, grabbed his body, and threw it directly to another one. There was a violent dizziness in my mind. Crunch. He felt the bones in his body being compressed again. Looking up, he saw the beater holding him in its mouth. After spitting it out, Chin Feng clearly saw Bee Tiger kicking him away. Beater didn't kill him, but used it as a toy. Shame. He, the majestic Queen Bee, was being kicked like a ball by two beaters. Chi Chi. Chi Chi. There seemed to be two beaters laughing happily in his mind. A scholar can be killed, but not humiliated. Secretly gritting his teeth but he had no ability to fight back. Holding his injured body, Chin Feng was kicked around like a ball by two beaters, from high altitude to the ground. After the two beaters got tired of playing, they kept rolling Chin Feng on the ground. A queen bee was actually teased by them, as if to vent their anger at being taken away by Chin Feng. The two beaters kept kicking Chin Feng in front of them. After about ten minutes, the tired beater already had the idea of devouring Chin Feng. Recalling the destructive power produced by the previous battle between Bee and Tiger, Chin Feng felt a chill running down his spine. The sharp claws scratched the tree trunk with clear scratches. If it fell next to him, his life would be gone in an instant. Hurry up and upgrade! You idiot! This is a cheating system! Chin Feng wailed. As if sensing the host's emotions, 
the hive's upgrade reading speeded up rapidly. 90%, 95%, 100%. Ding! The upgrade of the hive is completed. The hive function of Hidden Bee Pavilion is enabled in the level 1 hive. Each upgrade will directly refresh the worker bees for the host. Please pay attention to the attribute panel. The moment the system sound sounded, a flashing message appeared in Chen Feng's mind. Hidden Bee Pavilion. Three first level worker bees and ten ordinary bees are refreshed every day. Quick! Refresh the worker bees to help me fight. He was finally not a lonely queen bee anymore. The worker bees are being cultivated. Please wait a moment. Host. The first level worker bee has completed 30%, 60%, 100%. The first first order worker bee is ready. The second first order worker bee is ready. The tenth ordinary worker bee is ready. Chapter 4 Counterattack. Ding! The hive has been upgraded for the first time. The host has acquired the secret skill, Death Sting. Those who are hit will receive varying degrees of damage depending on their own strength. Everything is ready. Does the host choose to attack? Attack! Kill him to death! Chin Feng said angrily. At this time, he was exhausted. The moment he was kicked away again, Chin Feng stared at the beater in front of him. It's my turn! Activate the secret technique. Death Sting! In an instant, a black light condensed from his tail. Call out. The sound of breaking through the air came and the beater felt a tearing pain. And then its eyes became distracted. Chi Chi. Another beater rushed over. Seeing its companion being attacked, this beater charged directly. The shark claws went straight to Chen Feng's forehead. At the same time, 13 worker bees arrived in the hive. Buzz. Three first level worker bees flew at the front. And the shiny poisonous needles at their tails made people palpitate. They rushed towards the enemy quickly and decisively to defend their queen bee. Upon seeing this, the tiger gave up his plan to kill Chin Feng and prepared to kill other poisonous bees first. Stab! The beater waved its sharp claws and penetrated directly through a first level worker bee, killing it with one blow. Although both sides are of the same first level, the beater is the natural enemy of the poisonous bee and is more powerful. Buzz! Facing the death of their companions, the other poisonous bee's eyes turned red and they frantically pierced the beater's body with their poisonous needles. Grumble! The beater screamed in pain. Although he was naturally immune to be venom, he could not withstand the toxins. Stab! The beater once again struggled to kill another first level worker bee. But at this time, he was surrounded by several worker bees and began to bite him. Those toxins were introduced into his brain, and the beater's entire body swayed in the air, feeling dizzy. Finally, under the siege of the swarm of bees, the last beater fell to the ground. Why? Aren't you two very arrogant? Chin Feng came flying over. The two beaters had lost the ability to move. Their eyes were distracted. And there was a kind of fear in their eyes. I am the chosen one. If you dare to play me as a ball, I will also let you experience what pain is. Chen Feng looked ferocious. He ordered a team of five worker bees. Each team of worker bees carried a beater and tossed it around. Passing the beater in the air. Treat others the same way they treat you. About half an hour later, the two beaters were foaming at the mouth and dying. Enough fun. There is no need for you two to exist anymore. Chi Chi. Chi Chi. As if sensing the murderous aura in Chin Feng, the two beaters began to beg for mercy. But how could Chin Feng let go of his natural enemy? Pointless struggle. Chin Feng used the poisonous needle on his tail to pierce the heads of the two beaters. The beater kept struggling. And finally his consciousness slowly faded, and he left this world. Ding! It is detected that the host has killed two first level monsters. The host will be rewarded with three evolution points. Please pay attention to the attribute panel. The system sound rang in his ears. After hearing the beep, Chin Feng saw the attribute panel after the hive level 1. Honeycomb. Grade 1. Secret Palace. Improve honey quality by 60% and speed up cultivation. Two evolution points will be provided every day. Hidden Bee Pavilion. Three first level worker bees and ten ordinary worker bees are refreshed every day. Host. Chin Feng. Level. 0. Attack. 1 tenth. Defense, 0 out of 10. Speed, 3 out of 10. Creativity, 3 out of 10. Evolution points, 3. Secret technique, death sting, 0 out of 100 venom is used up. Absorbing honey can be converted into venom. At one point each to attack. Speed, and defense. Seeing 3 evolution points, Chin Fong had no reservations. Now that the hive has been upgraded, he must upgrade his strength quickly. Now Chin Fong is still a bee queen without a level. If it weren't for the secret sting technique provided by the hive, he would not be a match for the bee tiger. 
Ding! The system prompts that the host level cannot exceed the hive level. Ding! Please host reach level 1 as soon as possible to activate the skills. After receiving the prompt, Chin Fong nodded secretly. If his guess was correct, he would be able to upgrade after all his indicators reach 10. Although there are two evolution points every day, and he can become stronger by lying still. Chin Fong has to go out to find materials himself in order to continue repairing the hive. After all, the worker bees can only collect honey and cannot find the materials prompted by the system. You must become stronger quickly. In the demon realm continent, if you don't have strength, you are just a piece of meat on other people's chopping boards. Recalling the incident of being chased by Bee Tiger, Chin Fong felt chilled. The feeling that his life and death were in the hands of others made him extremely frightened. After recovering from his injuries in the secret palace, the first day passed like this. The next day, three first-level worker bees and ten ordinary worker bees were refreshed. The worker bees would provide him with royal jelly every day. Counting these things plus the evolution points he got, he could get five evolution points every day. All evolution points will be added as soon as Chen Feng obtains them. His strength continues to grow stronger. As time went by, he also figured out the area where he was. This is a forest, called the Blood Forest, where monsters are fighting, and various forces are entrenched here. Like the Black Wind Hive before, the current Black Thorn Hive is one of the forces on the outskirts of the Blood Forest. Chen Feng simply divided the forest into the periphery, the inner periphery, and the core according to the memory of the original body owner. The closer to the center, the greater the danger. Of course, there are also opportunities there that are not available in the periphery. There are many monsters in the Blood Forest, such as the Blackthorn Bee Queen who killed the old Queen Bee, which is a fourth-level monster with powerful strength. Of course, in the depths of the Blood Forest, there are rumors of existences at the level of Demon Generals. Such existences destroy mountains at every turn. They are huge and extremely terrifying. A few days ago, Chin Feng felt the ground shaking violently, and a terrifying beast's roar came from the depths of the Blood Forest. That was a Demon General-level existence fighting. Just the fluctuations it emitted made the surrounding monsters tremble, which was extremely terrifying. Fortunately, Chun Feng's hive is outside the forest, and the system has not detected any special creatures within 200 meters. Currently, he and his hive are safe. However, this kind of security was ruthlessly torn apart in just a few days. What? You were attacked by a black bee hive? On this day, Chin Feng was repairing the hive when a worker bee with a broken wing hurriedly came to report. While collecting honey, they encountered the worker bees of the Blackthorn Beehive and were attacked by them. Chin Feng arranged for all worker bees to be in groups of three. The other two worker bees died in the battle. And only this one worker bee escaped with its wings broken. Damn Blackthorn Hive! New hatred and old hatred combined, making Chin Feng extremely angry. Of course, as a human being, he is also extremely calm, knowing that with his current strength, he cannot deal with the Blackthorn Hive. Not to mention that the Blackthorn King himself has reached the fourth level. He has nearly 800 worker bees under his command, which is very powerful. If you go to take revenge now, it is tantamount to hitting an egg against a stone. Be careful these days. The Blackthorn Beehive is located in the south of us. We go to the north to collect honey. Don't expose the location of the hive. Chin Feng made a voice to communicate with the worker bees. If the Blackthorn Hive discovers that he is not dead, he will be annihilated. I should be able to get evolution points tomorrow and upgrade to the first level. I will have some power to protect myself. Chapter 5 Enemy Attack In the hive, Chin Feng is perfecting his hive. If nothing goes wrong, he will be able to complete the upgrade today. Chin Feng felt vaguely uneasy. Glancing at the properties panel, there are only two final points left to complete the upgrade. After getting two evolution points, he can upgrade, and then he can become a first level demon soldier. If he didn't rely on the secret skills provided by the hive now, his strength would be inferior to that of a first level worker bee. Not to mention the Blackthorn Queen Bee, who is as powerful as a fourth level demon soldier. Above the realm of demon soldiers are demon generals. But there are no demon generals outside the forest. Ding! The system has detected a large number of worker bees coming 200 meters away. Please be careful and avoid the host. A large number of worker bees? Hurry up and test the opponent's strength. His heart skipped a beat, and then he sent a signal for the First Order worker bees to start returning to defense. What is supposed to come has come. There are not many powerful hives on the outskirts of the forest, and he is only a few hundred meters away from the Blackthorn Hive. 
the hives nearby will definitely be constantly raided by the other party. Once the other party learns his true identity, he may be directly destroyed. The soldiers will stop us, and the water will come to Titan. Chin Feng secretly gritted his teeth, and the nearby worker bees had already begun to defend themselves. The system has detected that 21st level worker bees and one second level worker bee are approaching quickly. Please prepare the host. The moment the test results appeared, Chin Feng's heart skipped a beat. He only has 10 first level worker bees and 40 ordinary worker bees in his hands. The gap between first order and ordinary worker bees is huge, and the gap between second order and first order is even greater. 200 meters away. They will be here soon. All worker bees go looking for companions. If there is no companion information within 20 seconds, you will return quickly. The hive will encounter an existential crisis. Please prepare all worker bees, Chin Feng ordered. The moment the order was issued, these worker bees flew out quickly. The buzzing echoed in my ears, and the entire hive sprang into action. At this time, another team was quickly approaching their area. Fortunately for Chin Feng, they were not sure of the specific location of the hive. Otherwise, this distance would not give him time to react. Ding! The system has detected that the enemy is only 50 meters away from the hive and is expected to arrive on the battlefield in 10 seconds. 10 9 876. The countdown echoed in my mind, and the surrounding worker bees returned one after another. 10 first level worker bees are already in place, and 30 of the 40 ordinary worker bees have returned. These enemies must die here in this battle. Otherwise, we will be left with a bigger blow. Chin Feng's order was passed among the bees. The system's voice rang in his mind again. And at this time, he had no time to pay attention to the system's beep. Because the enemy has arrived in front of the hive. Newcomers ahead. Please hand in the greeting gift to the Black Sting Queen. Otherwise, I will make you cease to exist. After hearing the other party's words, the stone hanging in Chin Feng's heart finally fell. In this way, they were just a team searching the surrounding hives. But the second level worker bees and ten first level worker bees still gave him a difficult challenge. I must have been fatally attacked by the opponent that day and it didn't think I could survive. Chin Feng secretly thought. But then he said, What if I don't give it? If you don't give it, I'm afraid you don't know what pain feels like. Who dares not to give the territory of the Black Sting Queen Bee? The opponent's second level worker bee smiled. Facing Chin Feng's 40 worker bees, they showed no fear. On the contrary, they are dancing happily. If you don't get enough honey in 10 seconds, all the worker bees will die. In response, the level of the second level worker bees gave them a sense of oppression. Humph. A bunch of clowns came to my territory and dared to run rampant. They are really looking for death. As soon as he finished speaking, 40 worker bees began to surround the other party. No enemy can escape from this battle. Even if you risk everything. Ha ha ha. Who gave you the courage? Ignore. Ridicule. The other party watched Chen Feng swarm surrounding them, but did not make any move. In the opponent's eyes, his strength is like an ant that can be crushed to death at any time. Do you think the encirclement can face absolute suppression of strength? It's our turn. With an order, they attacked. 21st level worker bees rushed around instantly. And the 2nd level worker bee rushed directly towards Chin Feng. Today, you will all die here. And not a single worker bee will get out alive. Staring at the opponent in front of him. His tone was full of murderous intent. The attack was ready. Looking at the evolution point that had been improved again on the attribute panel. Chin Feng felt that he needed to take a gamble. Joke. With an angry shout. The other party's body appeared next to him. Chin Feng tried his best to twist his body. There was a tearing sound in the air. The two sides passed each other. And the raging spiritual power shocked him. Hide. Do you think you can escape? Chin Feng barely dodged the first attack. And the two exchanged positions and stared at each other again. His eyes swept across the battlefield. And the ordinary worker bees under him were falling rapidly. It was just a moment of fighting. And this place completely became the territory of the opponent's first level worker bees. The ten first level worker bees faced no pressure from his thirty ordinary worker bees. When the two were in a stalemate, Chen Feng suddenly turned around and rushed towards the opponent's first order worker bee. To get evolution points, he must kill a first level worker bee. Otherwise, if something unexpected happens to him, when fighting the second level worker bee, he may leave this world. At the moment when he twisted his body, the second level worker bee seemed to realize something and accelerated towards Chin Feng. It dragged an afterimage in the air and quickly approached Chin Feng. Get away. Be sure to get away. Chin Feng thought silently in his heart and accelerated forward. However, 
The speed gap between the two sides is really too big. The tearing feeling came in an instant. Why are you so strong? Activate the secret technique, Poison Sting. The poisonous needle at the tail quickly condensed to black light. Black light condenses in this space. And the pure black light makes people's hearts palpitate. Feeling this force, the second level worker be paused slightly. And then a light yellow light mask appeared in front of him. Huh? What a small skill. With a muffled groan, the black light shot straight into the opponent's light shield. Chin Fong continued to accelerate forward. And the black light collided with the opponent's mask. Boom! After the collision, a force exploded in the space. The moment he turned his head, Chin Fong saw the second level worker be speeding up again. You're done. Activate the secret technique, Poison Sting. Chin Fong came to the first level worker B and prepared to activate the stinger again. Venom in preparation. 3 2. What? Chin Fong looked at the second level worker B approaching quickly and twisted his body again. How could he have thought that the stinger could not be used continuously? It's over. I didn't expect you to be so naive. Do you really think you can survive in the realm of the Blackthorn Hive? Paying all the honey now will give you a chance to survive. The opponent's speed meant that Chin Fong could only see an afterimage. Chapter 6 Foundation Building Realm Abolition of Qin Fei was the first step in the conspiracy of Qin Jun and his son. The great elder's lips trembled, and he was furious. This move was what the elder himself wanted his son to do. When Qin Xiaoyan deposed Qin Fei in front of Qin Xiaoyan, he completely cut off the former's hope, killing his heart and thinking that he was a good move. But the result fell on him. Suddenly, a black figure rushed towards the ring. Like a mad dog. Qin Fei! I'll kill you! Stop! Boom! Two air currents in the air suddenly collided together. The sky and the earth changed color. And the space trembled. The explosive power of these two warriors at the ninth level of the Foundation Establishment Realm is truly astonishing. The Great Elder's eyes were scarlet. Like a mad lion. And he said to a middle-aged man in front of him. If the Qin family falls into the hands of this waste, it will definitely become a joke in the whole city. Kill this waste for me. Avenge my son and remove obstacles for the Qin family. Call. The middle-aged man, as well as several of the great elder's minions, quickly headed towards the ring. The third elder was completely shocked by Qin Fei's move. Now was a good opportunity for him to express his position. And of course, he would not let it go. Ah! The third elder was extremely fast and slapped him. The three warriors at the ninth level of Qi training died on the spot, leaving no trace behind. The seventh level of the Foundation Establishment Realm. The second strongest person in the Qin family. Is really powerful. Lao San. You bastard. The Great Elder roared like a wild lion. When he saw the Third Elder taking action against his people. The Third Elder grinned and said. The young master has extraordinary talents. And now that the master of the house has returned. If you are making alarmist remarks here. I will certainly punish you with a small punishment or a big warning. The head of the family never expected that the force represented by himself, which was at a disadvantage, could completely reverse the situation under Qin Fei's influence. Qin Chuan, as a great elder, if you dare to be unfaithful and unjust, you deserve to die. A cold voice seemed to come from the deep sea, chilling and cold. Qin Fei was on the stage, condescending. His eyes were like hooks and his whole body was filled with chills. Qin Xiutian's eyes flashed with relief. At this moment, he believed that his son had really changed. Then, a large phantom of a palm suddenly shot out from Qin Xiaotian's hand. The great elder's long sword was unsheathed. And the shadow was shaking. Walk! The great elder only defended but did not attack. And fled with Qin Jun. The accomplices who usually followed him to dominate, and dominate also left with him. Let him be! The second elder and others wanted to pursue. But were stopped by Qin Xiaotian. Puff! Qin Xiaotian gushed out a mouthful of blood in the Xianyan Mountains. He was seriously injured by a monster. He had just forced his energy to exert power at the same level as the Great Elder. Qin Fei couldn't help feeling sad. This father was really worried about himself. And said, Dad, just take a good rest. This time, it's just a matter of cleaning up the house. Qin Fei's expression was calm and relaxed. And there was no trace of his previous cowardice. Suddenly, Qin Xiaoyan looked excited and said, Fair! You're Marians, and that move you just made. To be honest, he didn't even see clearly how Qin Fei defeated the enemy with that move just now. Qin Fei said that during the period when the other party was away, he wanted to understand a lot of things. His meridians were actually opened, and his strength increased. Then, 
The second elder talked about the twelve levels of swordsmanship again. And the third elder even demonstrated it. Jean Xiaotian nodded frequently and went back to his room to rest peacefully. What? Xiao family? The next day, Jean Xiaotian received news that the great elder Qin Chuan had defected to the Zhao family. Qin Xiaotian immediately felt a headache. As a result, the Zhao family now had four Foundation Establishment Realm warriors. Two of them are at the ninth level of the Foundation Establishment Realm. And the other two are both at the early stage of Foundation Establishment. In Danyang City, if you want to control a party, the weight of the Foundation Establishment Realm warriors in the power is almost decisive. In addition to the Alchemy Pavilion and the Zhao and Qin families, the Qin family has one more master and has always been at an advantage. But with Qin Chuan's approach, the difference between strong and weak was instantly reversed. Of course, Qin Chuan's surrender also punctured the superficial harmony between the two families. Suddenly, the Qin family was filled with a sense of crisis. Qin Fei grinned without any panic. Bang! On the back mountain, there was a loud noise. Earth and rocks cracked. And rocks flew everywhere. Qin Xiaoyan and the two elders were immediately shocked. Was this someone who had broken through to the Foundation Establishment Realm? It's the eldest lady. It's the eldest lady who has broken through the Foundation Building Realm. At this time, the housekeeper ran all the way, crying with joy. Brother, I really did it. Thank you. Qin Shui took the elixir before the young disciples' competition and then practiced in seclusion. After the breakthrough, I learned that my father had returned. So I naturally wanted to pay him a visit. Seeing Qin Fei there, he immediately thanked him. Qin Fei's fourth grade seven snow pill that day was refined for Qin Shui. It turned out to be a fourth grade elixir. No one in the entire Danyang city, even the Yao Lao, can only refine a third grade elixir. Where did your elixir come from? The third elder's analysis was clear and logical. In an instant, his eyes were full of blazing heat. Who wouldn't be tempted by such a good thing as the fourth grade elixir? The second elder suddenly seemed to remember something at this moment and spoke very quickly. Could it be that there are recent rumors in the city that the Qin family has a young master who can make elixirs? Is it really you? The young master? Qin Fei just downplayed it and said that he was lucky in one Hongjing. These fourth grade elixirs were given to him by Yao Lao. As for why Yao Lao had fourth grade elixirs, that was beyond the scope of Qin Fei's explanation. A second level alchemist and a seventh level chirifying master. He can destroy the cultivation of the most powerful person in the chirifying realm with one move. Any one of them is enough to prove that Qin Fei is definitely not a waste. Qin Xiaoyan walked out of the door, looked up at the sky, burst into tears, knelt down and saluted, and said, Oh my god! It turns out that you have treated my son well. He has been blocked and humiliated for many years just for this day. Nowadays, the Qin family also has four foundation building warriors. Although the ninth level foundation building warrior only has the family head, it is enough to barely cope with the Zhao family. In the following days, after Qin Fei refined 30 pills, he began to practice in seclusion. Every day, he opens the seal of time. After his Dantian expanded five times, he took eight pills. Two hours later, he broke through to the 8th level of Qi Training Realm. Another day later, he broke through to the ninth level of Qi Training Realm. It's still too slow. It takes so much time to just practice Qi. Qin Fei frowned slightly, very dissatisfied with his speed. What if other warriors heard this and cursed the evildoers without being so angry that they vomited blood? In the advanced stage of martial arts cultivation, the breakthrough speed becomes slower. For ordinary warriors, it takes several years or even decades. There are even some warriors who, when they reach the 7th or 8th level of Qi training, have stopped making progress for the rest of their lives. Even for the top genius in the city, it took him two years to break through the ninth level of the Qi training realm. And he also used pills in the final sprint. But Qin Fei only spent one day. Next, prepare to attack the foundation building realm. This time, Qin Fei was not in a hurry to break through the realm, but took it slowly and slowly waiting until his dantian was the size of a pond before taking the remaining pills at once. Qin Fei's body was filled with heat. The veins on his forehead were prominent. He was dripping with sweat, and his body was wrapped in a layer of white mist. Boom! Over the Qin family, there were bursts of thunder, and the young master's mansion was filled with smoke and dust. Foundation building realm. Breakthrough. When Qin Fei appeared in front of everyone again, his steps were light, and his momentum was as strong as a mountain. 
when the head of the family and several elders saw Qin Fei's changes. Their hands trembled and the corners of his mouth twitched. They were extremely shocked. The Qin family has such a genius. Why worry about not being happy? Chapter 7 Fire Pearl Grass Ding! We found the necessary hive upgrades 200 meters ahead. With a system sensor, Qin Feng only needs to patrol, which saves effort. Qin Feng fluttered his wings and flew forward. For two days, he traveled back and forth between the hive and various directions, working hard to build a nest. At this moment, he has deeply accepted the reality that as a queen bee, he has to build the nest himself. Qin Feng looked up at the sky. Oh! The sadness of being the chosen one. Dandan, the next two days will be safe and sound. The secret hall has refreshed four evolution points. Refresh six first level worker bees and twenty ordinary worker bees. After some consideration, Qin Feng added the evolution point to creativity. He must upgrade the hive as soon as possible to prepare for the subsequent battle. Qin Feng brought up the system panel and displayed the current properties. Host, Qin Feng. Grade 1. Attack, 4 tenths. Defense, 4 out of 10. Speed, 4 out of 10. Creativity, 8 out of 10. Evolution points, 0. Skill, attack kill 335 slash 100. Secret technique, desperate sting, 100 slash 100 full of venom. Absorbing honey can be converted into venom. If you are hit, you will suffer varying degrees of damage depending on your own strength. Hive level, 1, the host level cannot be higher than the hive. The integrity of the level 2 hive is 15%. There are 11 first level worker bees and 36 ordinary worker bees. In the secret palace, the quality of honey is increased by 60%. And the speed of cultivation is increased. Two evolution points are provided every day. Hidden Bee Pavilion. Three first level worker bees and 10 ordinary worker bees are refreshed every day. With Chen Feng's efforts, the hive gradually expanded. But compared to level 1, the experience bar at level 2 was obviously compressed. More natural resources and treasures are needed. Being on the outskirts of the blood forest, there are too many miscellaneous fish, making it even more difficult to find them. Attack and kill! Chi 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 Chi! After increasing his first level speed by 4, Chin Feng had no fear when encountering a beater again. The body hovered, teasing the beater in the air, and it ducked closer. Before the beater had time to react, it was stabbed into the brain by the deadly stinger. The beater's pupils were dilated, and it fell to the ground. If Chin Feng hadn't been so small, he would have definitely seen a queen be stepping on the beater's head, stinging it with a poisonous needle every three seconds, and killing it twice every second. The picture is terrible. Ding! The detected target is dead. The attack and kill are invalid. The sting of death is invalid. And the proficiency cannot be increased. This. Hey! Why are you being so serious? Let's just give it a try. Chin Feng didn't blush. His heart didn't beat. He whistled and left. Chin Feng picked up two tiny grass flowers on the road and killed three beaters. Chin Feng was able to do so with ease. In order to practice attacking and stinging, he deliberately slowed down the killing speed. It's just a bit painful to watch the treasures of heaven and earth being moved back one by one. System. Can you get me some storage space or something? The system is unresponsive. Well, I'm so excited. I dare to give my opinion to the system. The purpose of making jokes is to make himself feel less lonely. In addition to practicing his proficiency, Chin Feng has never stopped running for his life. After searching for all the treasures of heaven and earth within a two-kilometer radius in two days, his proficiency in assault and death sting has also improved. Skill, attack kill 59 slash 100. Secret technique, desperate sting 39 out of 100 after the venom is used. Absorbing honey can be converted into venom. If you are hit, you will suffer varying degrees of damage depending on your own strength. Chin Feng passed by Shiwan Mountain and once again used attack to kill a first order emperor spider queen. He felt a flash of light from the bee's body and a system prompt sounded. Ding! The host's skill attack proficiency has reached 60 out of 100. And the attack has a 1% chance of triggering paralysis and paralysis effects. The paralysis and paralysis time is 5 seconds. Grass! Chen Feng complained while flying. There's no chance that you can win the bid once after inserting it a hundred times. If replaced, forget it. Forget it. Don't think about it. He is just a bee now. The shade of the trees receded. And two miles east, a small piece of desert suddenly appeared in front of Chin Feng. The weather was slightly dry. And a wisp of refreshing fragrance came. Which made Chin Feng feel happy. Familiar recipe. Familiar taste. 
The smell can be smelled from such a distance. It must be a rare treasure. Visually, a thousand meters away, there was nothing in the desert, except for a bright red glow in the center. It has not been discovered by other beasts yet. God help me! Jin Feng flew over happily. When he was close to 200 meters, the system prompt sounded. Ding! We found a low-level yellow elixir. Fire pearl grass. With a maturity level of 95%. It still needs two days to mature. Chin Feng couldn't afford to wait for two days. Two days. Such a long time has changed too much. I currently only have 11 first order worker bees in my hand. And I will only have 17 after waiting for two days. In front of the low level Huan level elixir. If there is a dispute, it will not be enough. What I found is mine. Pull it out before talking. Just when Chin Feng was about to take action, the system prompt sounded again. Ding! Warning! Warning! Immature elixirs cannot increase the level of the hive! Gone! Hearing the sound, Chin Feng stopped and his mind started racing. With this thing, we can definitely upgrade the hive to level 2. The risk is indeed 100%. But now this thing is not mature and it is useless. If you want to grab this thing, you have to practice assault and death sting to the full level in two days. It seems like there are two days left. But in fact there is only one day left. After some weighing, Chin Feng quickly turned back. After giving instructions to the hive worker bees to assemble their troops the next morning, they turned around and headed for the emperor spider's nest. The emperor spider is surrounded by mostly ordinary emperor spiders and first order emperor spiders. It is the best place to practice attacks and deadly stings. Chen Feng flew into the sky, and there were densely packed emperor spiders crawling below. Then I, the king, are welcome. As he spoke, Chin Feng dived towards a First Order Emperor Spider. As it approached, the Emperor Spider realized the danger, raised its head, and opened its huge fangs towards Chin Feng, wanting to bite Chin Feng into pieces and devour it. How could Chin Feng be like he was? Attack and kill! Between the shadows, he launched a direct attack and opened an eye in the Emperor Spider's forehead. He turned and charged again, directly inserting the deadly poisonous thorn into the open eye. The First Order Emperor Spider's body shook twice, and fell to the ground. This quick kill immediately attracted the siege of other emperor spiders. It suits Chen Feng's wishes. There is no need to attract monsters one by one. Three, two, one. The death sting reading bar ends. And it's a blow. He is currently only at a low level of the first level. A first level monster stabbed by a deadly stinger will have a few seconds to delay its life. These few seconds give Chen Feng a good opportunity to contact and attack. Taking advantage of the loopholes and XX's idea system. Even if you don't die, it will count as experience, which greatly facilitates Chin Feng. The attack and kill is even more life-threatening, since there is no CD anyway. Attack and kill! Attack and kill! Death sting! The attack and kill was very fast. The experience level increased step by step, and the Emperor Spider with high agility evaded Chin Feng's damage several times, and the toxin of the Desperate Stinger was quickly used up. Ding! The host's Desperate Sting Venom has been used up. Please replenish it as soon as possible. Chin Feng returned to the nest helplessly, using a very thin hollow bulrush core as a straw to drink up the food quickly. The queen bee did not dare to stay, and gathered among the emperor's spiders again. Chapter 8 Big Bee Day and Night At dawn and dusk on the second day, a system prompt of natural sounds finally sounded. Ding! Congratulations to the host for reaching 100% proficiency in the skill assault and killing, and being upgraded to shadow assault. Shadow attack? Chin Feng was overjoyed. But it was too late. He quickly got out of the pile of emperor spiders, fluttered his wings and returned to his nest, while opening the system panel to check. The other attributes remained unchanged, and the evolution points increased by four points, all of which were directly added to the speed by Chin Feng. If you encounter a fight, you must run fast even if you can't beat it. Expand the properties panel. Host, Chin Feng. Grade 1. Attack, 4 tenths. Defense, 4 out of 10. Speed, 8 out of 10. Creativity, 8 out of 10. Evolution points, 0. Skill, Shadow Strike 0 to 200. Shadow Strike has a 2% probability of paralyzing the target for 5 seconds. And the next level of Jedi Assassination. Secret Technique, Desperate Sting, 100 slash 100 full of Venom. Absorbing Honey can be converted into Venom. If you are hit, you will suffer varying degrees of damage depending on your own strength. Hive Level, 1. The host level cannot be higher than the hive. The integrity of the level 2 hive is 15%.
There are 17 first level worker bees and 56 ordinary worker bees. Secret Palace. The quality of honey is increased by 60%. And the speed of cultivation is increased. Provides two evolution points every day. Hidden Bee Pavilion. Three first level worker bees and 10 ordinary worker bees are refreshed every day. Is there really a 2% probability? Why has it never been triggered once during practice? Chin Fong expressed doubts about this probability and never thought that he might be a non-chief. After returning to the nest, Chin Fong ordered 15 first-level worker bees to go to the direction of ZB grass with him, leaving two first-level worker bees and 56 ordinary worker bees to return to defense. As a last resort, even if you use yourself to divert the tiger away from the mountain, you must still preserve the hive. The hive is too important to him. Chin Fong took the lead and 15 first-order worker bees formed a tiger wing formation and followed behind Chin Fong. Buzz buzz. Ding! The enemy has been spotted 1,000 meters away. One third-level worker bee, two second-level worker bees, and 20 first-level worker bees. Please avoid it. Host. Hack. Apparently the ZB grass has been surrounded by other animals, and they are just waiting for it to mature before picking it. After arriving at the deserted area, Chin Fong suddenly stopped, when he heard the sound of the system and ordered the first order worker bees to move closer to him in a circle and form a sky formation. Ding! The maturity level of the collected ZB grass has reached 99%. Please pay attention to the host. The maturity time is still 10 minutes. The refreshing fragrance exuded by the ZB grass is already very strong. And Chin Fong and others on the periphery can smell it clearly. The smell of the elixir is emanating. And many low level species in the periphery are eager to get a piece of the pie. It seems that we can only grab it forcefully. Chin Fong asked his subordinates to retreat, pulled him behind a big tree, and hid in the shadow of the tree. I looked outside carefully and saw the third level worker be turning around. It glanced this way unintentionally and seemed to have spotted Chin Fong and the other bees, but did not take them seriously and did not realize that the person coming was. Chin Fong is a bee. It's a big bee. The person who came was none other than the traitor of the old queen bee. The big bee. Chin Fong recognized Lai Fong from the memory engraved in his bones. The Big B was originally quite simple and honest. Although it was only the second level at the time, it was very useful to the old Queen B. Is it now the third level? Unexpectedly. In the end, it would be the one who betrayed the old Queen B first. Chin Fong looked at Big B, with murderous intent in his eyes. The murderous intent was so strong that Big B looked away again as if he had sensed. But he didn't see anything. If it's a Big B, this coward doesn't have to worry too much. Two second order worker bees are more difficult. But you can use 15 first order worker bees in groups of seven to form two small formations. And surround and kill them individually. It's just that the remaining 20 first level worker bees are more difficult. So we need to drag them down 20 at a time. And we can succeed if we buy time. Chin Fong stared at the big bee and gave the order. Leave the big bee to me to cut. Ding! The collected ZB grass will mature in 10 seconds. Please pay attention to the host. The countdown is now. 10, 9, 8. Now! Chin Fong, whose speed points have been increased to August 10th, is flying at a speed equivalent to the second level peak. A blow flew out and went straight to the ZB grass. 15 first order worker bees formed two small sky formations and followed closely behind. The big bee was also waiting for this moment. And his originally innocent eyes were filled with greed. Before his feet even touched the ZB grass. Chin Fong rushed towards him. Just at the moment when the system finished counting one, the ZB grass was mature. At the critical moment, Chin Fong was directly hit by Chin Feng's body and flew a long distance away. Big B was shocked when he saw Chin Fong suddenly appeared. Chin Fong! You're not dead! The Big B shouted in surprise. Fifteen worker bees had arrived and rushed directly into the black stinging bee colony, breaking up the encirclement of the black stinging bees and catching the black stinging bees by surprise. Fourteen first-level worker bees simultaneously flashed their black flashing tail needles and stabbed at the surrounding second-level worker bees. The attack was successful, and the second-level worker bee was paralyzed for a moment, giving Chin Fong an opportunity to take advantage of it. But in the face of absolute strength, any trick can only last for a moment. Chin Fong knew this truth very well. Originally, the best way was for the first-order worker bees to drag the big bees and other bees. He directly picked up the ZB grass and ran away. With his current speed, he would definitely be afraid of losing it. But he was really facing the big bees. Responsibility and the anger from the bottom of his heart prevented him from doing so. 
He must kill the big B. Chen Feng didn't say much. He just dodged and attacked the big B with a shadow attack. Suddenly coming in front of him. Big B realized that Chen Feng's body was dodging. When he reacted and tried to avoid it. He was still hit. Big B was surprised for a moment by Chen Feng's skill at this moment. Escaped? Chen Feng was equally surprised that Big B, who was originally a coward, could react at such a speed. Traitor! Die! Chen Feng attacked again. Big B's shock suddenly turned into murderous intent. It was true that he took refuge in the Blackthorn King. What he hated most was that others called him a traitor. It's like a scar that is being picked up all the time. Humph! You're looking for death! Just take your behead and go get it! What the Blackthorn King was talking about was that Chen Feng wanted to see his corpse. Chen Feng spun around rapidly. He knew that he didn't have much time. So he seized the opportunity and struck the sting of death like a big bee. As a third level worker bee. The big bee was far behind Chen Feng. As soon as his feet condensed, a light shield flashed slightly. Directly resisted Chen Feng's offensive. As the light and thunder flashed, a qi condensation surrounded Chen Feng. Chen Feng had no choice but to bear the blow. His belly was scratched. And he fell to the ground with a thud. Landing right next to the ZB grass. The ZB grass was as thin as a hair. Chin Feng directly grabbed it and put it in his mouth. The pain seemed to have invaded his body. Almost stopping Chin Feng from getting up. Ding! The host has obtained ZB grass. Please return to the nest as soon as possible to upgrade. Ding! The host is injured. And the system triggers the healing system. Which is really healing the host. 10%. 100%. Chapter 9 Beheading the Big Bee The second level worker bees were surrounded. And the brief confrontation showed their disadvantage. The Big Bee was flying in the sky. Looking at the former young master. His honest and honest temperament had long been replaced by greed. He could create such a situation with such a simple configuration. If he escaped today, it would not be long before his death. Likewise, Chin Feng cannot let go of this dry bee. His current ability is not enough to fight the black stinging bee openly. The big bee was approaching. Its tail stinger was attacking Chin Feng. And the wind was flowing. Chin Feng took off on the spot and struggled to avoid being killed by the big bee's light wave attack. The light wave came and bounced Chin Feng two meters away. Unable to succeed in one attack. The big bee turned directly to kill the first order worker bees. Swish. 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 With a huge gap in strength and no attribute support. The two first level worker bees were instantly shot down. The formation is broken. The threat of death approached Chen Feng again. The big bee stared at the ZB grass on Chen Feng's mouth and the bee head on his shoulder and said proudly, Young Black Wind Queen Bee, in memory of our past friendship, as long as you hand over the ZB grass and hang yourself, I will take care of the old friendship and let these little bees of yours go. The black stinging bees surrounded Chen Feng and others and the encirclement was closed. Did the black stinging bees seize the opportunity to sneak attack on the Black Wind Bees? Soon. Chin Feng brought fewer and fewer first level worker bees. The buzzing sound was filled with strong murderous intent. Chin Feng has become a head waiting to be harvested. Ding! I saw an enemy attack approaching from a thousand meters away. Please pay attention to the host. Please pay attention to the host. The sound rang twice, indicating that Chin Feng could not face a more powerful enemy. Sure enough, other beasts came to fight for it. The surrounding fields were empty. It was the front of Chin Feng and the back of the big bees. What flew in was really a second order beater. Chin Feng was overjoyed and immediately started to care about it. Humph. Old man. If you want my behead, keep your dog head first. If the situation didn't allow it, Chin Feng would even want to drink honey through a straw to show him, which would make this old guy mad. Chin Feng regretted a little at this moment. When he was practicing proficiency, he was lazy and didn't kill a few more emperor spiders. Otherwise, his evolution points at this time would be enough to add more attacks. Ding! An enemy attack has been detected 500 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. The system sound sounded again. Standing at the front, Chin Feng quickly summoned the first order worker bees to gather his team and form a back defense. The big bee seemed to be aware of it, but it was too late. Ding! Enemy attack detected 200 meters away. Chi 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 chi! The chirping of the beater came clearly. At this moment, the big bee turned around in surprise. The third level worker bee still had a natural fear of the second level natural enemy. And its wings trembled for a moment. The venom of Chin Feng's tail needle condensed, and he immediately attacked. The shadow flickered. And the tail needle stabbed into the body of the big bee. Pulled it out again. The attack was successful, and he quickly retreated. 
Bigby never dreamed that the stupid and naive young master would sneak up on him from behind. Jin Feng is only at level 1. Bigby is at level 3. And his stinger is slow to perform. The Bigby instantly formed a halo and bounced Jin Feng away, saying in disbelief, You? Ha ha. Feel good? Stabbing in the back. On the verge of life and death, Chen Feng is not a gentleman. And he has no psychological burden. All he knows is that he will kill you while you are sick. The beater flew in and directly scattered the bee team. The mouth is merciless. One in each mouth. Grabbing the black stinging bees on the outside and swallowing them in one gulp. The black stinging bees are ten to one. Surrounding the beater. Showing its tail needle. And inserting it at every opportunity. After a while. It became clear that the ZB grass in Chen Feng's mouth was more attractive. He ducked toward Chen Feng several times. But Chen Feng turned around and hid behind the big bee. Chen Feng was fast and could fly directly with the help of Bee Tiger. A large swarm of black stinging bees became a living shield. Buzz buzz. Chi 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 chi. The fighting was fierce. And the dust in the deserted area was flying. As if they had just suffered a sandstorm. Chen Feng summoned the remaining first level worker bees and flew into a group to defend. He would kill anyone who came close. The same was true for bees and tigers. The situation temporarily turned into a battle between black, stinging bees and beaters. With a small group of black wind bees hugging each other to pick up the leaks. Keep an eye on the big bee. I'll take action in a moment. Don't worry about me. Keep an eye on the black stinging bees below. If one rushes out, you'll kill it. Yes. The big bee was hit by the stinger. And now its movements gradually slowed down. It was no longer able to resist the sudden attack of the beater. Chin Feng noticed with his sharp eyes that when he swooped down, the tail needle flashed with black light, which was the venom that had condensed again. Even if the situation is critical, you cannot protect yourself. He will kill the big bee. Laugh. A black shadow fell on the top of the big bee's head, and its tail needle directly pierced the big bee's brain. Ding! The host kills the third level worker bee and obtains evolution point three. The big bee was killed. And the beater pointed at Chin Feng with a sharp voice and grabbed it in its mouth. Chi 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 chi. Hack. Speed increase by three. At the critical moment, the helicopter instantly turned into a fighter jet, turned around in the air, and accelerated away. As soon as the big bee died, Chin Feng led the beater and charged among the black stinging bees. Shadow attack. Ding. The host level has not reached level two and cannot gain proficiency. Chin Feng didn't have time to worry about why the system was beeping. All the attention is focused on the current battle situation. The Big B is dead and the battle situation must be resolved quickly. Otherwise it will be troublesome if it attracts more contenders. Chin Feng saw the right opportunity and shuttled back and forth with the ZB grass in his mouth, leaving behind a black stinging wasp corpse every time he passed by. Ten first order black stinging bees were eliminated in just a few strokes. After spinning like this for five minutes, B Tiger was a little tired and realized that he had been fooled. So he attacked Chen Feng angrily. Chi 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 chi. The black stinging bees have almost cleaned up. Currently there is only one second order worker bee and five first order worker bees. Chin Feng returned his carbine. The stinger on its tail flashed with cold light. The beater sprinted with all its strength and chased Chen Feng's butt. It had no time to stop its strength and only had time to create a light yellow light. But the light was too weak and had no effect at all. His head hit Chen Feng's poisonous needle. The remaining first level worker bees quickly moved forward and all used their poisonous needles to pierce the beater's body. The form changed instantly. The other black stinging bees all backed up and fled. The bees were frightened. The black wind young queen bee is not dead. Not only is she not dead, she has become stronger. She killed the third level worker bee, the giant bee, and the second level beater. This big news must be told to the black thorn queen as soon as possible. How could Chen Feng let them escape like this? immediately ordered his men to hunt down the black stinging bee. The troops were divided into two groups. And I was pressed for time, so I had to go back and upgrade the hive first. Chin Feng flapped his wings and quickly flew towards the hive. In the blackthorn beehive, the huge hive occupies the entire ancient birch tree. The sun is blocked, and the entire hive looks gloomy. The black sting queen bee on the throne looked violently at the two first order worker bees kneeling below. Your majesty, it's not good. Black Wind Young Queen Bee is still alive. He also killed a big bee. That was a third level worker bee. He also killed a second level beater. The Black Thorn Queen Bee is in her prime of life. She has a scar on one eye and is huge. She is already a fourth level queen bee. 
There is a faint black energy all over her body. Chapter 10 Help The black sting bee's voice was hoarse. As if it were cut apart. Chen Fong! Come on! Go out in full force and search him out for me! Even though the worker bees who came back alive described Chen Fong as how powerful they were. The black thorn queen remained mediocre. He knew the little queen bee too well after seeing it since he was a child. Buzz buzz! The sound was so loud that it trembled. It flew out from the black thorn beehive and searched for Chen Feng's team. The black mass spread out like a fishing net. At the same time, Chen Feng returned to his hive. Ding! The current hive is level 1, with a completeness of 15%. A yellow level low level elixir, CB grass, has been detected. Can the host use it? Use? Ding! The host uses yellow level low level elixir, and the hive integrity reaches 100%. Do you want to upgrade now? Upgrade! Chin Fong did not feel tired. On the way back, the system had already repaired it for him. Ding! The hive is being upgraded. The estimated time is two hours. It has been upgraded by 1%. 2%. I wiped it. It took so long. Chin Fong tapped his chin with his front foot. A little worried about the first order worker bees chasing the black stinging bees. After all, the black sting bee forces have basically penetrated into the eastern part of the blood forest. At this moment, the first order worker bees, who went to chase the black stinging bees came back. When they saw Chen Feng, all five of them knelt down. King! My subordinate did something wrong and let two black stinging bees escape. We, we chased the blackthorn hive and they escaped into it. We were afraid of exposing our target and being tracked by them. So we, ding! The hive is being upgraded. 4%. Level 2 Hive. 2 hours. According to the power of the Black Thorn Hive, it can be found in less than an hour. Chin Feng did not blame the First Order worker bees. He only felt that his brain hurt. He took out a cattail straw and took a big sip of the royal jelly. As soon as the straw dropped, Chin Feng made an immediate decision. You go and retrieve all the worker bees within half an hour and put them on defense. I haven't come back yet, so you have to guard the hive first. Even if you try hard, no one can get even half a step closer. Yes. The first order worker bees got the order and scattered. Chin Feng didn't stop and flew directly to the emperor spider's nest. This is a critical moment. Success or failure depends on this. Humph. If you want to gain an advantage in front of me, Chen Feng, I'll have to cut off your hands, break off your feet, and kill you with your brains. The emperor spider nest is familiar to Chin Feng. The outer perimeter is mostly filled with ordinary emperor spiders. The inner circle is first order with a few second order. And the center area inside is second order. The second level emperor spider has few opponents outside the blood forest and has always been arrogant. If you are teased and provoked by a bee, you will definitely become furious. What Chin Feng didn't expect was that Chin Feng had already angered the emperor spider by using it to practice his proficiency. At this moment, Chin Feng was buzzing in the air. Ding! A large number of enemy attacks have been found within 200 meters. Host! Please pay attention. The emperor spider grinned and hissed. Dumb. Crowds of people rushed towards Chin Feng. The spider silk at the tail was shot at Chin Feng. Trying to shoot Chin Feng down. Chin Feng was small in stature and could fly high. The emperor spider could only chase Chin Feng. But had no way to defeat Chin Feng. Making it even more angry. Chin Feng didn't even look at it and flew directly inside. The poison needle on the tail shone coldly. Ready. Buzz buzz. Chen Feng's figure flashed and flew to the inner area of the Emperor Spider, where he saw a second-order female spider laying eggs. With a certain determination in his heart, he swooped down. Laugh! The venom is injected into the egg sac, and the entire egg sac instantly turns black. Completed neatly, Chen Feng flew back into the air, still buzzing and circling around the head of the female spider, taunting her. The female spider reacted and roared to the sky angrily. The horse base could be heard throughout the emperor spider's nest. All the spiders raised their heads and looked at the proud bee in the sky. But Chen Feng, as if he didn't feel the hatred was enough, swooped down again, got through the gap of the emperor spider, flashed his poisonous needle, and stabbed the egg sac with one needle. Chi Chi! The emperor spider exploded. Chen Feng achieved his goal and flew up. Ding! A large number of enemy attacks are approaching the host. Please pay attention to the host. Please pay attention to the host. It provoked the second order emperor spider and even alarmed three third order emperor spiders. Black stinging bee. Right. Lao Xi will give you a special dish today. Chin Feng hurriedly flew towards the nest. 
he would not take the emperor spider back to the nest. As that would be too much of a purpose, Chin Feng flew to the only path that the black stinging bee must take to arrive. Suddenly accelerated and disappeared. Back and forth. It basically takes an hour. Take a look at the hive status. Ding! The current hive is level 1. The integrity is 100%. It is being upgraded. And the upgrade progress is 51%. Gone! Chin Feng returned to defense at this moment. 7 first level worker bees. Leading 56 ordinary worker bees. Lined up in front of the hive the size of a round pancake. Ding! An enemy attack has been detected a thousand meters away. Host, please pay attention. The system prompt sounds. Here it comes. It should be the vanguard of the black stinging bees so soon. I just don't know how many bees there are. If there are too many, I will be finished directly without waiting for the large army. Chin Feng stared ahead. Ding! An enemy attack has been spotted 200 meters away. Host, please pay attention. A formation. Two first level worker bees. And 30 ordinary worker bees appeared in front of them. When the bees saw Chin Feng, they looked at the round cake sized hive behind Chin Feng and grinned. Dozens of bees behind him laughed together. Ha ha ha. Is this the new hive of our former young queen? Ha ha. Oh my god. It's so small. How much honey can it store? And how many worker bees can it support? Life Ong was extremely proud. Chin Feng's behead belongs to him. The two ordinary worker bees retreated and left the team, reporting the news in two directions. Chin Feng looked at the ordinary worker bees leaving and did not react. The leading first order worker bee couldn't wait any longer, vibrated its wings and shouted loudly, Come on! Come on! The siege quickly unfolded, and Chin Feng was so contemptuous that he didn't take Chin Feng seriously at all. Chin Feng had some calculations, so he divided the remaining seven first level worker bees and 56 ordinary worker bees into two teams and launched them directly when the opponent was about to charge over. Ding! The hive is being upgraded. The completion rate is 56%. 57%. Buzz buzz. Chin Feng did not sit still and waited for death. He launched an attack first. The remaining worker bees gathered together and rushed into the black sting bee swarm like a projectile. For a moment, the black sting bee was broken into two halves. Twenty first order worker bees were divided into two halves, and ten were surrounded. The black stinging bee did not show weakness and wanted to strangle Chin Feng on the spot. Thus achieving this feat, the tail needles on both sides were revealed. The wings vibrated, and the murderous aura was fully displayed. Pft, pft. Shadow attack! Under the cover of the bee swarm, Chin Feng rushed into the black sting bee swarm and stabbed a first level worker bee. The black liquid condensed at the tail and shot out the deadly stinger at the same time. Laugh! As soon as the needle penetrated, the black stinging bee was instantly numb. After a brief pause, it was surrounded by the covering black wind bees and died. Ding! The host successfully killed the first level worker bee and obtained evolution point one. Add attack! To attack the high with the low is to injure the enemy by 1000 and lose 800 to yourself. Chapter 11 Teleportation But time cannot be delayed. It won't take long for the large forces to arrive. After several confrontations, Chin Feng did not take much advantage in the face of the opponent's strong strength. Soon, Black Sting Bee reacted to Chin Feng's tactics. The Black Sting Bee lost two first-level worker bees and lost five ordinary worker bees. They quickly formed a group and learned Chin Feng's tactics. Buzz buzz! Pfft. The two sides faced each other, and the poisonous needles at their tails stabbed the opponent's body desperately. The Black Sting Bee finally discovered Chen Feng's dominance. Five first-level worker bees immediately surrounded Chin Feng. Even if Chin Feng broke through, he failed. Once separated from the bee swarm, Chin Feng's original seven first-level worker bees and 56 ordinary worker bees were instantly reduced by half. Ding! The host was seriously injured and the repair system was triggered. The system repaired 20%, 50%. After the system was repaired, Chen Feng flew into the air. Three, two, one death sting is ready. Shadow attack. Deadly sting. The two skills were thrown out at the same time. Chin Feng directly faced the opponent's poisonous sting, and his belly was scratched. Chin Feng ignored the huge pain all over his body and pierced the opponent's head with a tail needle. The black sting bee's unbelievable fear amplified. The black wind bee died quickly, and Chin Feng directly entered the solo kill mode. Shi Chi. Chin Feng, who is so crazy and terrifying, is as graceful as the god of death emerging from H. L. The corpses of the black stinging bee and the black wind bee were scattered all over the ground. 
Two first-level worker bees turned around and ran away when they saw something was wrong. The two panicked and ran into the hive. The hive shook, and Shen Feng's heart trembled. The body reacted with a sound of flapping wings and a shadow attack, directly wiping both necks. The entire Black Stingby Vanguard team was wiped out, except for the two that ran away after reporting the news. Chin Feng took out a straw and swallowed the royal jelly in large gulps. Pooh! When you're full, spit out the straw on the ground. Labor and management have been in dire straits for most of the day, and we are back to before liberation. Chin Feng counted the worker bees and found only one first-level worker bee and five ordinary worker bees. Ding! The hive upgrade is 89%. 90% complete. It is expected to take 12 minutes. It's really killing bees. Hearing the sound of the system, Chin Feng looked at the remaining worker bees and issued an order. All worker bees, please return to the nest. You are not allowed to come out without my order. I hope the Emperor Spider can be of some use to delay the attack. Dee dee dee. The 12 minutes seemed as long as 12 years. Chin Feng stared at the progress bar without blinking. Ears perked up. Ready to run when the system sounds. As long as the life is still alive. No matter what kind of things can't be done. The life is gone. And it is really a fool's errand. I just don't know what will happen if I abandon the hive. Chin Feng looked at the system and clasped his chin with his front foot. Just like he was used to when he was alone. However, you can't do that unless you have to. If it kills me, there's no point in running away. It's better to save your energy and kill a few more. Chin Feng looked at his attributes. Host, Chin Feng. Grade 1. Attack, 4 tenths. Defense, 4 out of 10. Speed, 8 out of 10. Creativity, 8 out of 10. Evolution points, 23. Skill, Shadow Strike 0 to 200. Shadow Strike has a 2% probability of paralyzing the target for 5 seconds. And the next level of Jedi Assassination. Secret Technique, Desperate Sting, 100 slash 100 full of venom. Absorbing honey can be converted into venom. If you are hit, you will suffer varying degrees of damage depending on your own strength. Hive level, 1, the host level cannot be higher than the hive. And the integrity of the level 2 hive is 100%. There is one first level worker bee and five ordinary worker bees. Secret palace, the quality of honey is increased by 60%. And the speed of cultivation is increased. Provides two evolution points every day. Hidden Bee Pavilion. Three first-level worker bees and ten ordinary worker bees are refreshed every day. Even if Chen Feng didn't notice it, he would get angry when he saw that Shadow Attack has a 2% chance of paralyzing and paralyzing the target. Without him, it has never been triggered once. Gone! I'm afraid this is not a fake passivity. After returning his anger and looking at the skyrocketing evolution points, Chen Feng realized that he had accumulated so much. Use it quickly. Attack plus six. Defense plus 6. Speed plus 2. Creativity plus 2. There are still 7 o'clock left. And nothing happens after filling up. Chin Feng knows that now he is waiting for the hive to be upgraded. Ding! The host attributes are full. Would you like to upgrade? Ding! The host level cannot surpass the hive. Please upgrade the hive as soon as possible. Ding! The current hive integrity is 100%. It is being upgraded. And the progress is 98%. Chin Feng's eyes hurt when he saw the progress at the end of the experience bar. The system sound sounded again, but it was a reminder. Ding! A large number of enemy attacks were found 1,000 meters away. A large number of enemy attacks were found. Please pay attention to the host. Please pay attention to the host. Coming! Chin Feng's heart raised in his throat. He doesn't really know what upgrading the hive will bring. It's like putting his whole life on a blank spot. And maybe there won't be any. Exciting! Ding! The current hive integrity is 100%. It is being upgraded. And the progress is 99%. Quick. Hack. Ding. A large number of enemy attacks were found 200 meters away. Host. Please pay attention. Chin Feng's eyes were filled with fire. And a dark buzzing sound came miserably. Like black clouds looming over the city. At this critical moment. Ding. Congratulations to the host for successfully upgrading the primary hive to the second level. Ding. The second level hive is successfully upgraded and will open new functions for the host. It consumes 90% of the honey and can move the hive to a random area 50 kilometers away. The cooling time is two months. Ding! The secret palace has been upgraded successfully. The quality of honey has been increased to 70%. And the cultivation speed has been increased. Three evolution points are provided every day. Ding! 
If the secret palace meets the conditions of level 2, it will open an alchemy room for the host. Ding! Hidden Bee Pavilion has been upgraded successfully. 3 second level worker bees, 10 first level worker bees, and 30 ordinary worker bees will be refreshed for the host every day. Ding! The host meets the upgrade conditions. Would you like to upgrade immediately? How could Chen Feng have time to see how the hive was upgraded? All he could think about was the hive transfer function. As soon as the announcement came out, he shouted immediately, Consumption of 90% of the honey. Move the hive immediately. Call out! The hive suddenly stopped and disappeared out of thin air. The black stinging bee swooped down, leaving nothing but the dead bee on the ground, just disappearing out of thin air. All the black sting bees were dumbfounded. What kind of operation is this? They had been disturbed by the emperor spider for a long time. And then they flew over like this? All the anger and desire to take credit were suddenly emptied out. The leading second level worker be stared at the empty branches and shouted. His enthusiasm for meritorious service was instantly extinguished. And he shouted loudly. The young queen of the black wind be disappeared using a deception method. Please ask the black thorn king to step up the search. All teams continue to disperse and search. If it was a deception method, we must find him. The black stinging bees spread out like a fishing net again. But they couldn't find Shin Feng for the time being. The rest of the black sting bees began to wonder. How could it disappear? It would be terrible if it had this ability. Then find him first and kill him. Chapter 12 Stepping In The black sting bee, who had been coerced into betraying, became frightened and immediately backed down, not wanting to participate in it and reduce its sense of existence. Young, young queen bee, don't kill me. I'm being forced. Some black sting bees began to worry about comforting themselves, fearing that Chin Fong would suddenly appear and wring their heads. At this time, 50 miles away, in a beautiful canyon, Chin Fong and his beehive were located on a 500-year-old black pear tree. The wind is gentle, and the sun is bright. It was as calm as if nothing had happened. Chin Fong finally exhaled a breath he was holding in. Hu Cao! Thief Jill is exciting! I don't want to do it again! Death is not scary! Waiting to die is scary. Chin Feng took out the straw and took a big sip of royal jelly to calm down his shock. He chattered before relaxing. The tense feeling just now was deeply imprinted in Chin Feng's heart. The system flashed and the sound sounded again. Ding! The host has met the upgrade conditions. Do you want to upgrade now? Phew! Upgrade! A golden light flashed across Chin Feng's body and disappeared into the sky with a buzzing sound. Ding! The host has been upgraded successfully. Triggering a new skill. Air thunderstorm. Distance of 10 feet. Proficiency 0 slash 100. Chin Feng was not too excited to get a new skill. Or a long range attack. There was a proficiency that indicated that he could upgrade. Maybe upgrading means increasing the distance? Chin Feng stopped guessing. The experience just now had made him develop a strong heart. Now let's take a closer look at the effects of the hive upgrade. When I saw the alchemy being made, I found it really interesting. Everyone in the world practices Taoism and refines elixirs. How about this demon cultivator who also practices elixirs? It shouldn't be some unrighteous way. Dual cultivation or something like that. It's interesting. Will this king also one day become an incarnation? Chin Feng habitually clasped his chin with his front foot. There is an extra space in the secret hall. And an alchemy furnace of unknown material is sitting tightly inside. Exuding a calm and simple atmosphere. How to use it is not explained. Keep an eye on it as you walk. Although the hive has been upgraded, it looks even worse. Let's explore the surroundings first. Upgrading the hive is a serious matter. As he walked, he added evolution points to his speed. He couldn't resist anything now. And his fast speed became the key to survival. That's what Chin Feng is today. Level 2. Attack, 0 slash 10. Defense, 0 out of 10. Speed, 7 out of 10. Creativity, 0 out of 10. Evolution points, 0. Skill, Shadow Strike 0 to 200. Shadow Strike has a 2% probability of paralyzing the target for 5 seconds. And the next level of Jedi Assassination. Airborne Thunderstorm 0 out of 100. Separation distance is 10 feet. Secret Technique, Desperate Sting, 100 slash 100 full of Venom. Absorbing Honey can be converted into Venom. If you are hit, you will suffer varying degrees of damage depending on your own strength. Seeing the 2% probability of Shadow Killing. Chen Feng felt a pain in his heart again. Selectively ignore it and call the remaining worker bees to the front line. From today on, our hive will be renamed the Glory Hive. Glory to the Earth. Anyone who is black or not, get out of here. 
Glory to the hive. Glory to the earth. Glory. Glory. After hearing the statement, the remaining worker bees knelt down in front of Chen Feng and shouted Guang Yu. Chen Feng would never admit that he already felt the aura of a non-chief in himself. After arranging everything, Chen Feng planned to go out to explore where he was now. After all, the hive could not move in a short period of time. Passivity is not his character. As soon as Chen Feng flew out, the second level queen bee added seven points of speed to him, flying as fast as lightning. At this moment, Chen Feng suddenly thought of a question. If he used a thunderstorm, judging from his current size, would it be a bit like the electronic lighter in the world before his rebirth? He decided to give it a try. Thunderstorm in the air. Z. Starting from Chen Feng's tentacles, a small-scale electric shock storm appeared ten feet away. Empty space. Ding! We are preparing for a thunderstorm in the air. The countdown is ten. Nine one. Well? Empty! He suddenly didn't want to use this skill anymore. What should he do? Waiting online. It's urgent. Not counting the long cooling time. He would never tell others that there is such a thing as a lighter in other worlds. Absolute. Chin Feng continued flying and took a full circle to see this place. The canyon it is located in is not big. There is a small stream and about 10 trees in it. With uneven levels. He flew out after only 50 meters. When he came out, he was still outside the blood forest. But it was a place Chin Feng had never been before. This is not the territory of the black stinging bee. But the territory that is not the black sting bees will definitely be occupied by other forces. Chin Feng flew to a place with many flowers. Soon. Chin Feng found other worker bees, who were twice as big as him collecting honey. Follow it. Fly about 10 miles. And a hive about the same size as a black thorn hive appears. Buzz buzz. It was full of patrolling worker bees. All of whom were twice as big as Chin Feng. Bull bee? Bullfighting bees are good at fighting but not good at gathering honey. They usually rely on robbing other bee species to make a living. Chin Feng did not dare to get too close. So he stepped on the outside of the bullfighting hive, and sketched in his mind the approximate distance and obstacles between his own hive and the bullfighting hive. You have to find out what is around you as soon as possible. After all, the things that the hive needs to upgrade are not difficult to find. Now that it has been upgraded, it will only be harder. Little did he know that when Chen Feng came out to step on the site, his hive was also stepped on by others, and even almost destroyed. Chen Feng didn't dare to come out for too long. So he turned back, successfully missed the bull bees, who came out to patrol and rob. As soon as Chen Feng returned to the hive, he felt something was wrong. The remaining one first-level worker bee and five ordinary worker bees knelt down in front of Chen Feng again to accept the crime. King! A swarm of bull bees just came and stole the only honey we had left. Not even a drop of your royal jelly was left. King! They asked us to stay here since we came to this realm and don't even think about escaping. Let us collect honey honestly and not fly around. If we fly around, we will break our wings and throw them into the flower field. The worker bees were all complaining. Chin Feng didn't expect that the hive would be discovered by the bull bee so quickly. Don't worry about these threats. After all, he is the only one who ran away. As long as these bees, seeing how broken they are here, will not come back to get better. After upgrading to a second level hive, the hive is only as big as a basketball. Now that we are here for the first time, we can't make any noise for the time being. That's the end of the matter. Tonight, you can step back on tomorrow's honey and rest. The worker bees will be refreshed tomorrow, and more guards will return to the defense hive, which should be fine. He didn't take Bulby seriously, but the form was stronger than the human being, so he had to make concessions. The second day, Mizang Pavilion successfully refreshed three second-level worker bees, ten first-level worker bees, and thirty ordinary worker bees. The hive was temporarily replenished. Chin Feng also plans to explore the surrounding area and quickly upgrade the hive again. Chapter 13 Charges Buzz buzz. The morning sun is bright and the breeze is gentle. The honeycomb is printed in a halo. Surrounded by newly spawned worker bees. And work patrols are redistributed. The secret hall has refreshed evolution point 3. Chin Feng was a little confused when he looked at the panel attributes. Should he be more creative? There is a cheating tool called the system. Which can automatically repair but it will not kill you. Chin Feng thought about it and decided that his defense plus three. If the second level queen be as a tribute blessings, she should be able to resist the attack of the third level worker bee. And I'm fast. It's not easy to catch me. If you're fighting alone, you can kill the opponent by flying a kite. 
but it's better not to challenge the bottom line of the system. If you don't keep it all, you'll have to use up your death. The slender bee's feet clicked on the panel, looking at the alchemy room. Two bees drink royal jelly with a straw between their legs, like a cigarette between their legs. The alchemy room needs some kind of opportunity. After all, I don't have any knowledge about alchemy. The quality of this honey has been improved to 70%, and the royal jelly is more mellow. After drinking royal jelly, I only feel a faint aura lingering in my body. Chin Fong was overjoyed. I was just wondering why other second-level worker bees can use something like energy light waves. Why can't I do it even though I'm already a second-level worker? It turns out I'm here. Chin Fong tried to use his mind to mobilize. After holding it in for a long time, nothing happened. So he gave up. There is ample time? It's just that it's just starting now. Is it still too weak? Chen Fong was impatient and greedy. So he drank the royal jelly until he was full. Anyway, the royal jelly was his, and he didn't want to waste it. Belch! Ding! An enemy attack has been detected a thousand meters away. Host, please pay attention. Hearing the system prompt, Chen Fong quickly flew out. There were three possibilities in his mind. The most likely one was the bullfighting bee. The bees form an array outside the basketball-sized hive. A long snake formation was quickly formed. Chin Fong had no in-depth understanding of the formation. But we can adapt immediately, and it can always be done. Ding! An enemy attack has been detected 200 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. Soon, a second-level worker bee and a group of 21st-level worker bees flew over. The incoming bees were menacing and huge, and a small group shrouded them, blocking the light and shade of the entire hive. The leading second-level worker bee looked at Chin Fong and the other bees with disdain. They stepped forward, looking at Chin Fong with a sideways face and contempt. The second-order little queen bee, a hive as big as a dung ball, just laughed out loud. Ha! Look at that queen bee! It's not as big as my ass! My brother yesterday was right. A hive is really only as big as a dung ball. But the honey tastes really good. Ha 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 ha! Facing the ridicule, the glorious second-level worker be almost rushed forward and fought to the death with the bull bee. At worst, he could escape while protecting the king and rebuild the hive. Nor do they want their king to suffer such an insult. For a bee species, the hive is the most sacred thing to defend. Chin Fong secretly stopped him. Now, they have little chance of winning. And his hive is not an ordinary hive. So they have no worries. Chin Fong didn't answer. Bull bee thought that Chin Fong was already scared. In fact, Chin Fong just chose to endure it for the time being. He always followed the principle of retribution. After everyone laughed, the second order bull bee stepped forward and approached Chin Fong step by step. Are you the queen bee? Chin Fang's momentum is not weak, but he doesn't respond when faced with contempt. I'll just watch you jump around. The other party didn't have an attack as soon as he arrived. So there was obviously something else going on. Really, the second level worker bees surrounded Chin Fong and unleashed their power to coerce Chin Fong. Seeing Chen Feng's silence, they thought they had frightened Chen Feng. The first level worker bees were summoned to step forward and surrounded the hive. They moved very quickly, making Chen Feng afraid. The second level worker bee started lecturing like a boss. Arrogantly. Here! The bullfighting queen bee's territory is within a radius of 50 miles. When you come to our territory, you must abide by our rules. Oh! What's the rule? Humph! The rule is that you must hand over five jars of honey after five days. From now on, you will hand over ten jars of honey every ten days. Otherwise, he deliberately delayed his words and looked at the hive behind Chen Feng. Don't even think about running away. A monk who can run away can't escape the hive. As soon as I, the bull bee, take action, not even a scrap of your hive will be left. Just as he was about to build up momentum as usual, a wave of light was thrown towards the hive. How could something go wrong with the hive? Chin Feng had quick eyes and quick hands. He was able to dodge and block in an instant. Chin Feng's body was shaken, and he took a few steps back. The bull bee obviously didn't expect the queen bee to dare to block his attack, and almost became furious with her teeth and claws, thinking of the luscious honey produced by Chin Feng. He raised his front foot and gave Chin Feng a push. Snort! A fillet is a unit of measurement for bees, and is equivalent to half a liter. Not to mention that Chin Feng didn't want to pay at all. Even if the worker bees under him were working day and night. A hundred first level worker bees wouldn't be able to collect so much honey. What if I don't pay? Chin Feng gritted his teeth. Don't pay? This is your fate. The second level worker bee shouted loudly. 
after speaking. He waved his hand as if threatening. And the other first-level bullfighting worker bees flew towards a tree nearby. In a moment, twenty tail needles appeared in unison, shining silver light and stabbing at the basketball-sized tree. Cough. The big trees responded and broke. Bull bees have always been aggressive and good at fighting. And they have strong cooperative abilities. The glorious bee worker bees stared blankly. The gap in strength was right in front of them. And they simply couldn't compete with the worker bees in front of them. But can you endure it like this? They all looked at their king and hesitated to speak. The second level worker bee flew twice in front of Chin Feng proudly. Thinking that its goal was achieved. Ha! Huh? We bull bees are always kind. If you don't hand over the honey on time. If you delay for one day. I will kill one of your worker bees. He had also tasted the second order cow head honey that he snatched back yesterday. And it was of higher quality than other honeys. So he had a little more patience to scare Chin Feng. Otherwise, he would have eaten the honeycomb in one pot. Chin Feng didn't take it seriously. But he was thinking about how he managed to end up with a pot of bull bees. Labor and management are all going to become the bees of bandits. You collect protection and protection fees from bandits? I'm just letting you fool around for two days. Bullfight saw that Chin Feng was quite honest. After achieving his goal, he flew away. Chin Feng tolerated all this for the time being and turned around to order his men. You should patrol and collect honey. I will take care of the others. And I will give orders for fights. After hearing this, the bees seemed to relax and flew away. Chin Feng didn't want to explain anything. After all, these bee cubs were spawned by the system. To put it bluntly, they were just like props. But looking at the worried eyes about him, he couldn't help but spill the beans. In his eyes, it's a prop. But in their eyes, it's just the only one. Yeah. Realistic. Chin Feng looked in the direction of the bullfighting hive. You run wild on labor and capital's territory. And labor and capital also visit your territory and reciprocate. Shake your wings and fly away. Chapter 14 Silence is preparing to kill you. Chin Feng flew around the bull bee's forces while flying. With the current capacity of the hive. It can only produce a total of 18 second level worker bees. 61 first level worker bees and 185 ordinary worker bees in 5 days. Dealing with small-scale attacks by bull bees is not a problem. If we can quickly raise the level of the hive, it shouldn't be difficult to defeat the bull bee. I wonder what kind of surprises the third level hive has. For now, it's still too weak. We need to speed up the upgrade. After the hive level 2, ordinary elixirs can no longer add much to the completeness. Flying all the way over, Chin Feng also saw a few spiritual objects that he had been looking for before. But the system had no response. Only prompts to avoid enemy attacks. It seems that you need at least a yellow level intermediate or above spiritual creature to upgrade the hive again. After flying a mile and starting to approach the outside of the bullfighting hive, Chin Feng lay on the trunk of a tree. He flew and then stopped and slowly approached. With his second level strength and plus seven speed. In front of ordinary bee species, he would only feel a swish and find nothing. Soon, Chin Feng had a thorough feel of the outer ring of the bullfighting hive. The rules of the hive are the same as most hives. The outer circle is basically filled with classless worker bees. Bull bees are not good at collecting honey. So they build particularly large hives. Suddenly, a lone ordinary worker bee flew over. The body was twice the size of Chin Feng. Chin Feng poked his head out from behind the tree and pretended to be face to face with this guy. Chin Feng reacted extremely quickly. Before the opponent even issued a warning. The tentacles above his head flashed. Thunderstorm in the air. Puff. The body of the bull bee flashed. And the whole bull bee was charred. Black and stiff. And fell down. After Chin Feng killed him. He ran away without anyone noticing. Ding. The thunderstorm still needs a cooling time of 9. 8 1. Preparations are complete. This electronic lighter is very powerful. Bah. It's a thunderstorm from a distance. Just kill the ordinary worker bees without any proficiency. There was an accident today, and Chin Feng planned to explore again tomorrow, fluttering his wings and flying in another direction. Ding! An enemy attack is detected 1,000 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. What Chin Feng wants at this time is an enemy attack, because he wants to practice, vibrate its wings and fly directly towards the enemy. Ding! Enemy attack was detected 200 meters away. Soon, a third order woolly elephant with tusks 20 feet long and colorful patterns appeared in front of Chin Feng. This thing looked like an elephant, but was not a herbivore. Chin Feng was overjoyed. Whatever you think comes to you. A thing that is too small needs to be of a high level. So he is not aggressive. Although he cannot be killed with such a large size and bulky body. 
It is suitable for training. Jun Feng's eyes flashed, and he drooled as he flew towards the mammoth. Shadow attack! Ding! Shadow attack proficiency increased by 05. Death sting! Ding! Consumes 1% of e-venom. The cooling time of the deadly stinger is 3, 2, 1. Thunderstorm in the air. Ding! The air thunderstorm proficiency is increased by 05. The air thunderstorm cooling time is 10, 9, 8, 2, 1. The deadly sting is a secret technique with no proficiency. But it was used by Chen Feng to coordinate with a shadow attack. Practice makes perfect. And anything that seems ordinary can be terrifying if used to the extreme. Ouch! The mammoth raised its trunk to the sky, howled twice, and started running, rampant and began to destroy the surroundings. The third level monsters moved violently and instantly trampled the surrounding areas into craters. Chin Fong ignored him and chased the mammoths but in buttocks to throw away skills for free. The whole buttocks and buttocks of the mammoth were numb, but he could not do anything to Chin Fong. Chin Fong is very fast, and the mammoth often flaps its wings and flies high as soon as it turns around. He swooped down again, swung his tail and ears, and avoided it at Chin Feng's speed. After half a day, Chin Feng showed signs of fatigue. The mammoths, butt and buttocks were filled with deadly toxins. He raised his head to the sky and screamed, lying on the ground unable to get up. No longer poisonous. Chin Feng fluttered his wings and returned to his nest. It wasn't until the third day, when Chin Feng received two evolution points, that he remembered that the mammoth might have been poisoned. Chin Feng didn't know that when the quality of honey improved, the purity of the toxins converted also increased. Chin Feng opened the system panel. Host, Chin Feng. Level, 2. Attack, 0 slash 10. Defense, 3 out of 10. Speed, 7 out of 10. Creativity, 0 out of 10. Evolution points, 0. Skill, Shadow Strike 895 slash 200. Shadow Strike has a 2% probability of paralyzing the target for 5 seconds and the next level of Jedi Assassination. Air Thunderstorm 265-100, distance is 10 feet. Cooling time is 10 seconds. Secret Technique, Desperate Sting, 0 out of 100 the venom has been used up. Absorbing honey can be converted into venom. If you are hit, you will suffer varying degrees of damage depending on your own strength. Hive Level, 2, the host level cannot be higher than the hive, and the integrity of the level 2 hive is 0%. There are 6 second level worker bees. 11 first level worker bees and 35 ordinary worker bees. Consumption of 90% of the honey can move the hive and the cooling time is 2 months. Secret palace. The quality of honey is increased by 70% and the cultivation speed is increased. 3 evolution points are provided every day. The alchemy function of the secret palace has been turned on. Hidden bee pavilion. 3 second level worker bees. 10 first level worker bees and 30 ordinary worker bees are refreshed every day. Chin Feng simply ignored the 2% paralysis and paralysis effect of Shadow Strike, not wanting to see it. Why don't you be so cheating on me? What a chance! On the other side, the bull bee came and threatened Chin Feng. Two of them followed the team of glory bees gathering honey. When the glory bees stepped on the honey, they snatched it away. He poured it directly into his mouth and swallowed it. I smacked my lips and laughed happily. Although the same flowers and honey were collected by Guang Yu Bee, it tasted better. Hey! Little thing. Go back and tell your queen bee to prepare the honey as soon as possible. Otherwise, I'll let you taste what fire feels like. Ordinary worker bees have no choice but to swallow and fly away. Judging from their size, ordinary worker bees will only be bullied against bull bees. Instead of blocking the ordinary worker bees collecting honey, the first order bull bees even ran outside the hive and directly shouted to Guangyi's second order worker bees. Our queen bee asked me to ask how your honey is being prepared. If you can't hand over the five irrigations in five days, I'll smash your little hive. This kind of thing happened frequently when Chen Feng was away. Even when Chen Feng was around, he would walk by with a swagger and sneer at Chen Feng. Although the worker bees did not report to Chen Feng again, Chen Feng discovered this matter quickly. Every transaction was secretly recorded by Chen Feng, and they would definitely be settled together when the time comes. Is it so easy to get my Chen Feng's things? Two days later, the secret hall once again refreshed 6 evolution points. Chin Feng now has 12 second level worker bees, 31 first level worker bees, and 95 ordinary worker bees. Fortunately, the bull bees were greedy for honey and did not cause any real harm to the glorious bees. Speed plus 3. Defense plus 3. Chin Feng held the straw between his feet and lit the panel. 
The outer perimeter of the bullfighting bee is like a huge transportation line. Backed by the bullfighting mountain. And Shin Feng has already figured out everything. Chapter 15 Seven Colors of Night Sleep Bullfighting Mountain is a naturally concave place that is easy to defend but difficult to attack. The honeycomb spreads outward in the shape of an octopus. Winding for about two kilometers, Chin Feng had patrolled this area of Do Do Mountain. But no genius treasures had been found. However, he had picked a lot of small flowers and grasses and put all the ones he found useful into the hive, just in case it would be needed for alchemy in the future. After that, the hive looks a little messy. Chin Feng had to doubt the purpose of his rebirth. A nigger, an electronic lighter, a garbage collector using a giant beard to conquer the world. This, it's so high and is promised. Forget it. Forget it. You can't be serious. Otherwise you will lose. The only one that has not been inspected is Bullfighting Mountain. Chin Feng came to the outside of the Bullfighting Hive again. And the surroundings were quiet. See? A first order bull bee was instantly charred and rolled down into the grass. The worker bees that were electrocuted one after another did not attract the attention of the bull bees. Hey! You have strong muscles but a simple mind. Chin Feng looked at the Bullfighting Bee's hive and complained in his heart but he did not dare to relax mentally. He secretly observed the travel patterns of the bullfighting bees, and he had already seen the clues in the past two days. The execution of these idiots is so strong that no one comes out to see the brothers when they are alone? Their vigilance is really poor. Apart from learning how to threaten bees, they are really useless. Buzz buzz. Whoosh. Bullfighting bees patrolled around the hive and went out to collect protection and protection fees. Bullfighting bees noticed a black bee as big as a finger passing by them. There was a soft sound, and Chin Feng landed behind the leaves of a jujube tree inside the bullfighting bee. The body is small and just hidden by the leaves. In three days, these bull bees will come again. We have to find a way to solve it completely. Chin Feng was determined. Upgrading the hive's genius treasure is currently the biggest problem. What the level 3 hive needs is no longer ordinary elixir. Chin Feng looked at the bullfighting hive. His mind spinning. Wealth is found in danger. Chin Feng vibrated his wings and spotted a hive gap 20 meters away. The full speed point worked wonders, and he dodged past with a whoosh. After tossing and turning like this 20 or 30 times, he approached the inner area of the hive without being discovered. Ding. 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 There are a lot of enemy attacks around. Please pay attention to the host. Without moving a step, the system rang once and was ignored by Chin Feng. Going further in, there are gradually more first order worker bees, Second order worker bees, and a small number of other types of bees. Chen Feng immediately understood that bull bees were not good at collecting honey, and what they could do by robbing them was limited. So he enslaved some other bee species to collect honey for them. Chen Feng flew directly into these bee species without making any attempt to conceal himself, and swaggered around the inner perimeter of the bullfighting hive. The patrolling bull bee glanced at Chen Feng and thought that Chen Feng was a laggard. Hurry up and catch up. If you are too slow to hand over the specified amount of honey at night, your wings will be cut off. Chen Feng mingled with the team and passed by the middle and center areas of the inner circle. There was a larger bee patrolling his territory. Behind him were 22nd level worker bees in two rows. As he walked, he grabbed royal jelly and stuffed it into his mouth. He was so greedy that he even licked his toes. Chen Feng asked about the taste, and it was really royal jelly produced from his own hives. I'll eat you flying pig to death. I'll make you vomit it all out sooner or later. Even the digested ones will be vomited out from the front. Chin Feng looked at the front bull bee and locked eyes with it. A third level queen bee? According to what Chin Feng has observed so far, although the entire bullfighting hive is huge and numerous, there are not many truly high level bees. There is one third level queen bee, about 500 second level worker bees, and two first level worker bees. There are a thousand of them, and there are even more ordinary worker bees. There is strength in numbers. And that is all. But there is no way. There are just too many bees. Chen Feng's eyes were too heavy, and he stared at the queen bee and thought. Before the queen bee noticed it, he looked away. Ding. We found a large number of enemy attacks. Please pay attention to the host. Please pay attention to the host. Ding. A hive upgrade item was found a thousand meters away. The yellow level upper level elixir seven color night sleep flower. The elixir maturity is 88%. The flowering period will bloom in four days. Two system prompts sounded at the same time. Chin Feng was shocked. Sure enough, there is something on this bullfighting mountain. Chin Feng continued to follow the bees, entering and then coming out, passing by the bullfighting queen bee, 
Chen Fang's guess was confirmed. It was indeed a third order queen bee. Buzz buzz. After the bees put away their things, they fluttered their wings and flew out, followed by Chen Feng. The bees flew to the bullfighting mountain, and Chen Feng followed them smoothly. No wonder I didn't see other bee species in the periphery. It turns out they are kept in captivity. Going further in, the system sound sounded again. Ding. A hive upgrade item was found 500 meters away. Ding. Hive upgrade items were found 400 meters away. Ding. 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 What the H? L. Chin Fong was shocked in his heart. And his eyes almost glowed. But he did not look around and acted calmly. He continued to follow the bees. But the whole bee became more calm. Which was the confidence of victory emanating from a person in a high position. Chin Fong almost couldn't hold back his laughter. Things won't run away here. What I want to find first is the Seven Color Knight Sleeping Flower. After entering Do Do Mountain, Chin Fong fully understood the terrain in front of him. The bullfighting beehive is like a gate in the bullfighting mountain. It is guarded outside. Inside, there are colorful flowers and beautiful scenery. It is really a good place to set up camp without waiting for another prompt from the system. Chin Fong directly discovered the existence of Chisahemian with his bright eyes. Just because there are so many bullfighting worker bees guarding them, it is difficult not to notice them. In the innermost part of the valley, under the waterfall of the creek, there were a densely packed group of 200 second level worker bees. If Chin Fong didn't have tripophobia, he would have goosebumps all over his body. Oh, these idiots! Chin Fong came quietly and left quietly. Bobi didn't notice at all that his territory had been completely touched by others. Three days later, it was the day to hand over honey. Chin Fong was no longer out looking for spiritual treasures. He was just waiting for the day when the Seven Color Night Sleep would be released. Focus on finding mammoths to practice your skills. It is inevitable that the thunderstorm in the air will be upgraded to a level within three days. Although the bullfighting bees were not enough in front of Chin Fong, they could not stand up to the large number of other bees. With the BC tactics, he could be exhausted to death. Chin Fong never fights an unprepared battle. Chin Fong flew over a small hill, where the vegetation and trees gradually became sparse. After flying for 10 miles, he found a longhorn dog. It's always a second level monster. It's you? Chin Fong determined his target and flew forward, venom condensing on his tail needle. After the quality of the honey was increased by 70%, his venom was released even faster. With the strength of his second level queen bee, he can penetrate the body of a third level monster and determine the speed based on the size of the opponent's body. Laugh! Chapter 16 Thunderstorm The tail needle pierced the body of the long-legged dog. The long-legged dog jumped up with a howl and spun around for two weeks before finding the tiny Chin Fong flying in the air. Woof woof! The long-legged dog looked at Chin Fong angrily, its fangs dripping with saliva, and its hind legs began to feel numb. Chin Fong flapped his wings and made a half circle in the air, swooped down again, fluttered out his skills, and practiced around the long dog. It wasn't until half a day later that the system sounded. Ding! The host kills the second level monster and obtains evolution point one. After three days of this, the hive refreshed its evolution points by nine points, and Chin Fong went out to hunt. After adding points again, his skill proficiency also increased to the page-turning stage. Chin Fong nodded his chin habitually. Nine evolution points. Creativity plus nine inch. Chen Feng's previous two upgrade experiences found that the higher the creativity, the better the effect of upgrading the hive. If the success rate was originally 90%, after the creativity is topped up, it can directly become 100%. Now it is still a little short of it. Chin Feng while opening the panel to check. He flew towards the bullfighting hive. Create whatever you need. Almost kill a bull bee over there. It just happened that there was a thunderstorm in the air, and I almost experienced it. Chin Feng thought lightly. Looking around the entire blood forest, Chin Feng was the only one who dared to do this. Chin Feng's mind enters the system and is opened. Host, Chin Feng. Level, 2. Attack, 0 slash 10. Defense, 6 out of 10. Speed, 10 out of 10. Creativity, 9 out of 10. Evolution points, 0. Skill, Shadow Strike 166 slash 200. Shadow Strike has a 2% probability of paralyzing the target for 5 seconds. The next level of Jedi assassination. Air Thunderstorm 985 slash 100. Distance is 10 feet. Cooling time is 10 seconds. Secret technique. Desperate sting. 100 out of 100 venom has been used. Absorbing honey can be converted into venom. If you are hit, you will suffer varying degrees of damage depending on your own strength. Hive level. 2. 
the host level cannot be higher than the hive. And the integrity of the level 2 hive is 0%. There are 21 second level worker bees, 61 first level worker bees, and 125 ordinary worker bees. Consumption of 90% of the honey can move the hive. And the cooling time is 2 months. Secret Palace. The quality of honey is increased by 70%. And the cultivation speed is increased. Three evolution points are provided every day. The alchemy function of the secret palace has been turned on. Hidden Bee Pavilion. Three second level worker bees. Ten first level worker bees. And thirty ordinary worker bees are refreshed every day. Chen Feng's eyes were fixed on the thunderstorm in the sky. And he was looking forward to what would happen next. Buzz buzz. Chen Feng came to the outskirts of the bull bee. Where there was a corpse of a bull bee in the grass every two hundred meters. They are all the masterpieces of Chen Feng. Chin Feng lay on the tree trunk and waited for the patrol of the opponent's first order worker bees to pass by. Zitsi! The tentacles glowed with light. Thunderstorm in the air! Puff! The first level worker bee is hit and falls. And its thunderstorm proficiency increases by one point. Zero five left. Chin Feng just waited for the cooling time to end and used it directly. Accompanied by a burst of electricity. The sound of thunder cracking through the sky came to mind. Boom! Bang! The electric light shone brightly with the naked eye. Striking the first order bullfighting worker, be that flew out. At the final experience point. It's obvious that the power of critical hits has changed. The sound was so loud that it immediately alerted other worker bees around them. But when they turned their heads, they found nothing. Chin Feng had already dodged his body and flew away. Ding! The proficiency of the host skill thunderstorm has reached 100%. And it has been upgraded to thunderstorm. Proficiency 0 slash 200. Within one meter of the host's body, there is no difference in thunder attacks. And the number of attacks is limited to two, which is equal to the host's own level. Storm. Within one meter, attack indiscriminately. Chin Feng was dumbfounded. With such a well-known skill, he asked who else dared to come within one meter of him. For now, the only long-range attacks he has come into contact with are his own thunderstorms, which are still within a ten-foot range. Now it suddenly becomes a one-meter range. But the cooldown time of a thunderstorm is 10 seconds. I don't know what the cooldown time of this thing is. Would you like to know if you try it? Thunderstorm. Ba. Bang. Bang. Starting from Chen Feng's body and extending outward. Within a radius of one meter. A lightning ball shone in the air for five seconds. It made a deafening crackling sound and then disappeared instantly. Ding. The thunderstorm is being prepared. Countdown is five. Four one. Chen Feng was really happy now. His skills were upgraded, and his CD was shorter. Chin Feng did not indulge in it for too long. Today was the day to pay honey to the bull bees. He came out early in the morning and delayed for a while. I was afraid that the bull bees had already arrived. Vibrating his wings, Chin Feng added the little evolutionary points he had just gained to his creativity. Today is the day for making honey. And tomorrow is the day for the seven color night sleep flowers to bloom. What a great day! Five minutes later, Chin Feng returned to the small canyon and the sun was shining down on the hive. Ding! There is an enemy attack within 200 meters. Please pay attention to the host. Without being reminded by the system, Chin Feng also saw the fighting bees standing outside the hive. A total of 10 second level worker bees and 100 first level worker bees came. It can be seen that bullfight attaches great importance to this protection and protection fee. Chin Feng disagreed. Not all worker bees were recalled. Only 5 second order worker bees, 15 first order worker bees, and 40 ordinary worker bees remained in the hive. With Chen Feng's current power, it would be a trivial matter to deal with these bull bees in front of him. But thinking of the Kaizai Mion that was about to bloom, Chen Feng planned to endure it for one more day. The bees were menacing, with their faces upturned and their nostrils pointed upward. The little broken hive is only as big as a mammoth dung ball. What do you do for food? How can such a big hive be enough to store the honey handed over to our great bullfighting queen? The little bullfighting leader looked like he was leading an inspection and was very dissatisfied with Chen Feng. Especially when he saw Chen Feng destroying a little black wasp and guarding such a big nest to become the king. The atmosphere was a little tense because of the little leader. Chen Feng didn't want to cause trouble and directly ordered the worker bees to carry out two jars of honey and place them in front of the bull bees. As soon as the honey was lifted out, the mellow aroma of 70% quality honey suddenly came out and the eyes of the bull bees collectively focused on the honey. Why is the honey from this little broken hive sweeter than elsewhere? Yeah. Just the smell makes my mouth water. It's just too little. Didn't the group leader ask for five cups of honey? Yes. That's right. 
It's not enough just to give it to the queen bee, let alone the share for each of us. Thinking that he didn't even get a bite, the little leader became furious. Hey, are you trash? You dared to take out such a small amount of honey. Did you forget that labor and management said it was five irrigations? The bee looked so upright, but I didn't expect it to be such a lazy thing. There is even less honey. The little boss did not doubt that Chen Feng deliberately took out such a small amount. He thought that in front of the bull bees, other bees would not dare to do this. Chapter 17 Doghead Grass The bull bees were not happy, and they seemed to want to tear all the little black bees in front of them. Ten second level worker bees took the lead, and a hundred first level worker bees all stepped forward to surround Chen Feng's hive. The little leader nodded Chen Feng's head and said, Fool me! As a second level bee, Chen Feng has more attributes and other blessings. He is fearless in front of a bull bee that is twice the size. If he was still the little black bee who found a broken hive to live in, he might have been thinking about how to escape at this moment. And at this time, bee cows have bad tempers. Having the ability and having people point fingers at him is not the type of person Chen Feng is. The little boss stretched out his foot. Chen Feng knocked it off and even kicked it out. With his second level strength and the energy gained from the recent warming of royal jelly, Chen Feng directly kicked the little boss out of the encirclement and flew into the air with a look on his face. Unbelievable. Buzz buzz. The sound of flapping wings suddenly doubled in volume. Face! Chen Feng dared to take action. But the bull bees never expected that all their tail needles would light up in an instant. Pointing at Chen Feng. Chen Feng refused to accept the threat and asked instead. Watch your words. It's best to know who you are talking to. Is this all you bull bees have to teach you? What is education? Bull bee couldn't understand it at all. Seeing Chen Feng's arrogant look, but thinking of the queen bee's explanation before going out, the black bee head was livid with anger. Taking into account the queen bee's instructions, the little boss could only threaten but not take action because the honey in Chen Feng's hand was too tempting. Chen Feng took these bees into consideration and attacked the hive recklessly. For a moment, both parties showed their tail needles, but they did not take action. The competition is about who is not determined enough. Chen Feng was originally the king, so he made all decisions on his own. But the little boss wanted to ask for instructions. After a two-minute stalemate, the little boss chose to endure the situation and asked someone to carry the honey, intending to give Xiao Haifeng a good speech in front of the queen bee. Let me tell you, little black bee, our bull bee queen will give you another chance because you have just settled down. If you can't do better next time, we will wait for the nest to be destroyed. Yes. Another second-level worker bee flew directly above Chen Feng's hive and gestured like a stinger. Chen Feng watched quietly, with murderous intent in his eyes. Let's go! After the bull bee said harsh words, he carried the honey and left. The bull bee moved on the front foot, and Chen Feng immediately called all his worker bees back to the nest on the back foot. On the throne, Chen Feng looked determined to win. Ten second-level worker bees go out, and other worker bees return to defend the hive. Counting the worker bees that will be spawned tomorrow. Staying behind during his absence will definitely not be a problem. After so many days of familiarity, although the worker bees spawned by the system do not have Chen Feng's skills, their strength is indeed compared with Chen Feng's. The attributes of the second level worker bee are one-tenth of Chen Feng's total attributes. The first level worker bee is one-twentieth of Chen Feng's attributes. Ordinary worker bees have no attributes, but the quality is still stronger than other honeys, because of the nourishment of high-quality honey. Although small in size, they are still the same as ordinary worker bees of bull bees. Ten second-level worker bees lined up in a team. Chin Fong held a straw between his feet and drank royal jelly, like a greedy wolf targeting his prey. After the second-level worker bees were ready, they followed Chin Fong and flew towards the bullfighting hive. Buzz buzz. The distance between the shining beehive and the bullfighting beehive is not close. At Chin Fong's current speed, it can be reached in less than half an hour. But it is just right to take care of the worker bees to set off and lurk at this moment. The flight was unimpeded. And other monsters that had been or had seen Chen Feng persecute them all gave way. Arriving at the outskirts of the bullfighting hive. Chen Feng was already familiar with this place. Directly avoid the hive extending from the octopus in front. And fly towards the side of bullfighting mountain. There is a place on the left side of the mountain that is much lower than other places but there are no bull bees guarding it. It is obvious that the entire bull bee has not considered the issue of strict defense. They are too confident. Ding. Wang Jia's top grade elixir. Seven color night sleep flower. Was found a thousand meters away. The maturity level is 
It is expected to bloom in five hours. Please pay attention to the host. There are still five hours left. What can we do with this time? In modern times, Chin Feng might be able to advance to the second level to play Mahjong. But conditions are limited at this time. All worker bees are staying here. If there are bull bees patrolling, be careful to avoid them. I will be back at the right time. After Chin Feng explained, his wings vibrated, blended into the night, and disappeared. He didn't look carefully before. But now, he wanted to see the specific location of the elixir field guarded by Bull B. Ding. 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 As we got closer, the system once again revealed various discoveries. Sure enough, the bells and whistles of Dodo Mountain were beautiful. And Chin Feng took advantage of the cover of night to fly to the place where reminders were frequently issued. After going back and forth twice, I roughly confirmed the elixir on the bullfighting mountain. I just don't know if these things can still be used after upgrading the hive with seven color night sleep. However, although the smell and quality are not as good as the seven color night sleep flower, the quality is not bad either. Suddenly, ding, the first level alchemy material, doghead grass, was found within 10 meters. Host, please pay attention. Ding, the host successfully found the first level alchemy auxiliary materials. The alchemy room is activated and the alchemy room proficiency is 0 out of 100. Ding. The alchemy task 1 is to find 10 first level auxiliary ingredients of doghead grass. 1 shove 1 grass. 1 hemostatic grass. And refine it to the first level low level elixir and low level blood replenishing pill. What? A series of system reports stunch and phone. Happiness came too suddenly. The puzzling alchemy room is triggered here? However, the prompt only appears when the distance is 10 meters, which is really a bit of a scam. Am I going to have to fly at low altitude in the future? This bullfighting bee is really good. Chen Feng had originally been paying attention to the bullfighting hive. But now, he was even more determined. In the bloody forest where the weak prey on the strong. No one can have absolute peace. Chen Feng has always followed the principle that if he sees something, it is his. And if he can't get it, grab it. If you can't grab it, kill it. Moonlight is a guide for bees to distinguish directions and avoid obstacles at night. But Chin Feng is different. He can directly use moonlight to see at night. Chin Feng turned around and landed on the edge of an inconspicuous foxtail grass. The mission has been triggered and the thing has been found. Chin Feng had more important things to attend to and was in no hurry to check the alchemy room. After the original body returned, the ten worker bees stayed at their footing, completely ignoring what happened. At this level, others come to your hive to sleep without being alert at all. It's too weak. The moon sets in the west. Five hours later, the darkest two quarters of an hour before dawn in the entire blood forest, the fragrance of the seven-color night sleep flower is more intense and reaches the extreme. Ding! The seven-color night sleep flower, a top-grade yellow elixir, will bloom in five minutes. Please pay attention to the host. Buzz buzz. A black queen bee and ten dazzling second-level worker bees took off silently. The murderous aura is like a sharp sword being drawn out of its sheath. Chapter 18 Level 3 Hive Whoosh! Chin Feng and other bees passed by in a flash, arriving just in time for the seven color night sleep to open. Outside, a dense layer of bull bees were crawling on the ground or taking a nap on the tree. They only knew that the queen bee asked them to guard the flower. But there was no other arrangement. Ten second level worker bees spread out at a distance of one meter, ready for the bull bee to suddenly attack. Ding! I found an upgrade item. Please host! As soon as this life came out, a strange fragrance instantly emitted in the air, and the crawling bull bees all raised their heads and looked at the small black flower surrounded by the central area. Buzz buzz! Chin Feng swooped down. The moment he rushed down, ten second-level worker bees gathered in their formation and flew directly upward. This was Chin Feng's arrangement long ago. The moment he picked the flowers, the worker bees retreated directly and opened the way ahead. Crack! Bull bee looked at Kaizai Mion. But for just a second, Suddenly the light and shadow in the middle moved, and there was only a bare grass left in Kaizai Mion. The flowers are gone. By the time the bullfight bee reacted, Chin Feng had already flown out of the bullfight mountain. Buzz buzz! Buzz buzz! The bullfighting hive exploded, and the guarding bullfighting worker bee rolled up to the queen bee and reported the disappearance of Kaizai Mion. The pit bull queen bee's plump body trembled. With so many bees to look at, you can let others pick them? What a waste! The queen bee was so angry that she stabbed the first order worker bee with a slender tail needle under her belly, killing the first order worker bee on the spot. Find it for me! If you dare to disturb Tai Sui, 
Let me find that bastard. But Chen Feng was too fast. And it was so dark. The other worker bees were all focused on Chisa Yinian. And they didn't even see the flowers that the bees had stolen. When the little leader sees the queen be angry, he has to find a way to vent his anger. He bravely stood up and reported the direction of Chen Feng's hive. Humph! Who made you so ignorant? The queen bee is greedy and wants to keep you. But I don't want to. Sure enough, when the bullfighting queen bee heard that the new queen bee had stolen it, the bee was furious. The fat body trembled. Come on! Bees! Get all 50 second level worker bees. 100 first level worker bees. And 100 ordinary worker bees. Go and cut the new one into pieces. You don't have to have flowers. But you have to have beheads. The little leader showed a proud smile. Quickly ordered all the worker bees ordered by the queen bee. And all flew towards the glory beehive. Jin Fong held a seven color night sleep flower in his mouth. Quickly and with all his strength. And returned to the hive ten minutes later. Ding. The host has consumed the yellow grade high grade elixir. The seven color night sleep flower. And the hive integrity has reached 100%. Should the host upgrade now? Upgrade. Ding. The host successfully upgraded the hive. The estimated time is three hours. Sure enough. It was three hours. At this moment, the sky is gradually getting brighter. The morning mist shrouded the place. And the entire radiant hive was enveloped in a faint halo. Chin Fong stood on the top of the hive, holding a straw between his two front feet and sipping royal jelly one mouthful at a time. Level 2. Attack, 0 slash 10. Defense, 6 out of 10. Speed, 10 out of 10. Creativity, 10 out of 10. Evolution points, 3. The number of worker bees in the Shining Hive is 24 second level worker bees, 71 first level worker bees, and 155 ordinary worker bees. They were all ready and grounded on the branches behind Chin Fong. Ding. The Hive is being upgraded. 30% 31% completed. The progress was running little by little. And Chin Fong directly used the newly generated three evolution points to increase his defense by three. An hour later, the completion rate reached 60%. And the system sound sounded again. Ding. A large number of enemy attacks have been detected 1,000 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. Soon! Chin Fong complained in his heart. It's so slow. To be able to live stably at this speed is really a mercy of the blood forest. Ding. An enemy attack has been detected 200 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. The bull bees grinned in a long line and flew in front of Chen Feng. Seeing Chen Feng's formation, the little leader seemed to have expected that he was coming. And the originally wavering thoughts in his heart became certain. This queen bee must have stolen the spirit flower. I didn't expect that I was cheating on it. The death order given by the bullfighting queen bee didn't even require him to shout. He just took action. When Chen Feng saw the coming bee, he didn't give the opponent a chance to make a move. He fluttered his wings, and the little leader Fei Ling came forward. Thunderstorm. Sizzling crackling. The little leader was still astonished at Chen Feng's speed. His eyes widened in disbelief and immediately turned black. He dropped the box lunch to the ground. Killed two second level worker bees at the same time with one blow. Like sounding a horn. They collided instantly. The tail needle came out. Black and shining. And pierced the opponent's body. Bull bees are large and powerful, but lack flexibility. Although the number of worker bees came was huge, they were quickly defeated by Chen Feng's attack. Seeing that they could not kill Chen Feng, some worker bees vibrated their wings in an attempt to bypass Chen Feng and attack the hive directly. Chen Feng noticed the motive, and with a flash of his body, he reached behind the worker bee. Shadow attack. A powerful blow directly cut the first order worker bee into two pieces. Death sting. Shadow attack. Thunderstorm. Chin Fong shuttled among the bullfighting worker bees, using his skills to activate which one. Because there were so many bees on the opposite side, just letting them collide in a crowded place was a tactic. The glory bees ended up behind Chin Fong. Anyone who was hit by Chin Fong, but was not dead, was completely killed by one more stab. Chin Fong discovered that, after killing a worker queen of the same level, the proficiency of Thunderstorm increased by two points. Is this the benefit of group attack? Thanks to Chen Feng's perfect kill. No worker bee could take a step closer to the hive. Killing more with less. Chen Feng's second level worker bees were not damaged. But ordinary worker bees with little strength were lost. The corpses were all spread out under the hive. Densely packed. Soon, the morning light shone down. It was already broad daylight. Chen Feng directly paused the attacks of the other worker bees. And he would use the remaining finishing touches to practice his skills. 
for a long time. No Bulby can fly. With a ding, a large amount of information poured out. Ding! The hive upgrade is completed. The current hive level is 3. The next level requires a completeness of 0 slash 500. Ding! The host kills the second level worker bee and obtains 20 evolution points. The host's evolution points cannot exceed 10 times its own level. Ding! The host's shadow attack proficiency is 200%. It has been upgraded to Jedi Assassination 0 slash 1000. Jedi Assassination has a 3% chance of paralyzing and paralyzing the target for 5 seconds. And the next level is Tianjue. Ding! The level of the secret skill Death Sting has been increased and renamed as Death Sting 0 slash 500. Death Sting can be fired. After the venom is used, it can absorb honey and convert it into venom. If you are hit, you will suffer varying degrees of damage depending on your own strength. Ding! The quality of honey in the secret palace has been increased by 80%. And the cultivation speed has been increased. For evolution points are provided every day. The alchemy function of the secret palace has been turned on. Ding! Hidden Bee Pavilion refreshes 4 third level worker bees, 10 second level worker bees, 20 first level worker bees, and 50 ordinary worker bees every day. Chapter 19 Tyans Hiko It turns out that the Desperate Sting is a skill that can be upgraded with the hive. But after this upgrade, it seems to have become more proficient. But the next level of hive integrity requires too much. Seeing a series of suddenly huge proficiency levels, Chin Feng complained in his heart while checking his own attributes. After the hive is upgraded, he can also upgrade immediately. 20 evolution points. Attack plus 10. Defense plus 1. Ding! The host's attribute level is full. Do you want to upgrade now? Upgrade! Buzz buzz. There was a tiny tremor. And Chin Feng's wings vibrated uncontrollably for a few breaths. Suddenly, a loud buzzing sound seemed to come from his body. And a faint sense of energy was released and then closed. After a while, Chin Feng exhaled a breath of turbidity. Level 3 was like a hurdle and an excess. Which gave Chin Feng a strange feeling. Click on the properties panel. Host, Chin Feng. Level 3. Attack, 0 slash 50. Defense, 0 slash 50. Speed, 0 slash 50. Creativity, 0 slash 100. Evolution points, 9. Skill, Jedi Assassination 0 slash 1000. Jedi Assassination has a 3% chance of paralyzing and paralyzing the target for 5 seconds. The next level is Tianjue. Thunderstorm 82 slash 200. Within 1 meter of the host's body, there is no difference in thunder attacks. The number of attacks is limited to 3, which is equal to the host's own level. Secret Technique, Death Poison Needle, 0 slash 500. Death Poison Needle can be fired. After the venom is used, it can absorb honey and convert it into venom. If you are hit, you will suffer varying degrees of damage depending on your own strength. Hive level, 3, the host level cannot be higher than the hive. Level 3 hive integrity 0 slash 500. 24 second level worker bees. 66 first level worker bees. And 111 ordinary worker bees. Secret palace, the quality of honey is increased by 80%. And the cultivation speed is increased. For evolution points are provided every day. The alchemy function of the secret palace has been turned on. Please accept the alchemy task as soon as possible. Hidden Bee Pavilion, 4 third level worker bees, 10 second level worker bees, 20 first level worker bees, and 50 ordinary worker bees are refreshed every day. Gone! After looking at the whole thing, Chin Feng felt a thousand auspicious beasts in his heart. While complaining, I added the remaining evolution points to creativity. With so many things, wouldn't it be unnatural to upgrade to level 4 hive? I'm looking forward to it. Come on, bee! Exist. Throw the body of the bulby into the fertile flower field opposite. Yes. After the hive was upgraded, Chin Feng was thinking about the upgraded items on Bullfight Mountain that kept ringing. He didn't know if they were still usable. So he had to go check them out. But now that his abilities have improved and the strength of the hive has also increased significantly, it only takes a little time for the old and new accounts to be settled. Black Stinging Bee. Traitor. You don't have to keep a single bee. Chin Feng fluttered his wings and flew out, flying to Do Do Mountain with ease. On the other side, inside the bullfighting hive, a group of worker bees sent to investigate the Lingbao still didn't return. The bullfighting queen bee felt that something was wrong and immediately patted the worker bees to go investigate. At first glance, the fat body almost collapsed on the throne. You bastard! How dare you use my bull bee fertilizer field! I will definitely destroy his whole family! 
The Bulby Queen was so angry that her plump body almost rolled off the throne. Come on! Hurry up and get all the Bulbies back to their nests quickly and get ready to fight. The whole army will attack. Annihilate the glory bees in one fell swoop. And capture their queen be back to the fertile fields. Yes! The bullfighting queen vibrated her wings angrily and showed her tail needle. Buzz buzz! The bull bees became alert and all the worker bees began to return to the nest. Half a day later, the bullfighting bees were assembled. And the bullfighting queen came out with 20 guard worker bees. Before they started to lecture, another bullfighting worker bee suddenly flew in front of the queen bee. It is the worker bee responsible for the reconnaissance. Report to the queen bee. When we are gathering, the spirit snake bees a hundred miles away seem to be gathering as well, preparing to attack us. What? No matter how stupid the bullfighting queen bee is, she knows that now is not the time to strike. Once they are all out, the spirit snake bees will definitely attack. They have been enemies for many years because of the Tianji grass between Bullfighting Mountain and Lingshan Mountain. The Bullfighting Queen Bee knows very well that for a high-level Queen Bee like them, if they get the Tianji grass, they can directly break through the realm and advance two levels. Snort! The Bullfighting Queen Bee groaned, her body holding her breath so hard that her big belly trembled. Let the Glory Queen Bee dance around for two more days, and when the Spirit Snake Bee is dealt with, we will take away his nest. All worker bees obey the order. Be on alert. Restrain the worker bees and return to defense. Chen Feng, who came to check out the upgrade items on the bullfighting mountain, lay down behind the jujube leaves inside the hive and took in the entire situation of the bullfighting bees. Take into account, no matter who it is, they will be timid once they have concerns about it. Chen Feng looked at the bullfighting queen bee with contempt in his eyes. If I were the queen bee of a bullfight, I would definitely try to destroy my nest and then go straight to the enemy. Sora has such a big body and strength. What a brainless thing! The things that the bullfighting queen bee cared about aroused Chen Feng's interest. For monsters, most of the things they cared about were natural treasures. The real number of bull bees is larger than Chen Feng imagined. It seems that to completely eliminate the bull bee, we still need to use some other forces. Chen Feng flew to Bullfighting Mountain, and the system prompts did not remind him of it as crazy as before. Obviously, these upgraded medicines could no longer keep up with the current hive level. Chin Feng just picked the dog head grass one by one and threw it into the alchemy room. Fortunately, there is a small space in the alchemy room where you can put some spare medicinal materials. After picking 20 dog heads, it is full. Otherwise, if he moves them one by one to the hive, Chin Feng will definitely feel that he is the most miserable queen bee again. After all, ordinary worker bees can't come to a place like Bullfight Mountain. The Shining Hive is to the east of the Bull Bee. Chin Feng's previous exploration range has always been centered on his own hive. When he received the news and followed the route he had noted after previous exploration, Chin Feng determined that there must be something in the south. Chin Feng flapped his wings and flew south to the Bull Bee. Buzz buzz! Flying all the way here. The flowers and plants are quiet and peaceful. Suddenly, 20 miles south of Bull Bee. Ding! An upgraded item was found 2,000 meters away. The Xian level low level elixir Tian Tiko has a maturity level of 66%. Please pay attention to the host. Chin Feng's rapid flight suddenly stopped. After flying around 2,000 meters, I finally found Tianji grass in a gap on the top of a small mountain. Really? After Chin Feng wrote it down, he did not miss it and continued flying south. After flying 20 miles, I saw a large group of worker bees with slender bodies that seemed unable to attack, but were more flexible. Spirit Snake Bee? The root suddenly connected in Chen Feng's mind. The Glory Bee, Bull Bee, and Spirit Snake Bee formed a small equilateral triangle terrain. Obviously, the Snake Bee can't defeat the Bull Bee, but the Snake Bee can make the Bull Bee so fearful. Chapter 20 Spirit Snake Bee However, the enemy of your enemy is your friend. Chen Feng stopped lying behind the tree trunk and flew out directly. The Spirit Snake Beehive is only one quarter the size of the Bullfighting Beehive. It is built in the shape of a ball around a banyan tree. The terrain was not chosen well. The roots of the banyan tree stretch downwards and often penetrate the hive. He was soon discovered by the other party. And all the small bodies gathered around Chin Feng. Chin Feng just flew quietly in the air. He was surrounded by so many people that no worker be dared to step forward. Just because the aura exuded by this queen, he was so powerful that it made them fearful. As Chin Feng walked in, the spirit snake bee gradually retreated and shouted. What kind of bee is there? What's the big deal? Chen Feng stopped. I'm looking for you. Queen bee. 
to discuss something. Stop moving forward. Just wait here and we will inform you. Seeing Chen Feng stop, the worker bee seemed to be relieved and flew towards the hive. The aura of this queen bee that suddenly arrived is so terrifying. It's different from all the bee species he has come into contact with. The worker bee thought so. If he had to describe it, he couldn't explain it. Only report it truthfully to the queen bee of the spirit snake. The snake queen bee has a sharp tail and slender wings, which is in contrast to the giant and stupid bull bee. The queen bee of the spirit snake flew out, turned around a few times without leaving any trace, and led Chen Feng into the hive. Monsters don't have as many twists and turns as humans. Chen Feng got straight to the point. Spirit snake queen bee, I came here to establish friendship with the queen bee. After all, our enemies are all bullfighting queen bees. From the beginning, Chin Feng elaborated on how he was bullied by the bullfighting queen bee. After listening to Chin Feng's explanation, the wings of the queen bee of the spirit snake trembled for a moment. Chin Feng noticed it but did not show it. Oh, so you came here to seek the protection of my spirit snake bee? Chen Feng didn't show it on his face, but he laughed in his heart. It's a bit interesting. This queen bee also knows how to set a trap for herself. Once she admits it, won't she become a subordinate of the spirit snake bee? After Chen Feng came in, he secretly observed the hive structure of the spirit snake bee and the strength of the worker bees. The snake queen bee and the bullfighting queen bee both belong to the third level. But judging from the system's alarms, the spirit snake bee is obviously not as strong as the bullfight bee. But to be able to compete with the bull bee like this, the two sides are in a stalemate. Judging from the conversation just now, this spirit snake bee has a brain. The queen bee of the spirit snake was also secretly sizing up the queen bee that suddenly arrived in front of him. This queen bee gave him a very strange feeling. It's so strange that it's obviously a monster. But it always feels like a wild monster. In the world of monsters, humans have become wild monsters. Facing the question of the spirit snake queen bee, Chin Feng shook his head. I came here to form an alliance with the spirit snake queen bee. We can help each other and benefit from each other. Chin Feng showed that he had no interest in the elixir at all and only wanted to keep his own honey so that he could feed his worker bees. He seriously stated that his hive had just been established and was in a precarious state, unstable and insecure. Upon hearing this, the queen bee of the spirit snake patted Chen Feng on the back, and the two brothers let out shrill laughter. Chen Feng's strength makes the spirit snake queen be covetous. Maybe he can use it to deal with the bull bee. Seeing that Chen Feng was not fooled, the spirit snake queen bee did not show any dissatisfaction and continued to laugh. Don't worry, brother. In fact, I have no use for that bead on Xiao Tian Feng. I just can't stand the bull bee's way of bullying the bee. As long as you can help my brother kill that bull bee and get the bead thing, it's right for my brother to help you protect the hive. Chin Feng sneered in his heart, but his face was very happy. Then thank you, Queen Bee of the Spirit Snake. The agreement was reached. The alert on the Spirit Snake Hive was lifted, and the two Queen Bees flew out and began to discuss how to deal with the bullfighting queen bee. The bullfighting queen bee has a large number and powerful fighting power, which makes the spirit snake be fearful. The queen bee of the spirit snake was also complaining to Chen Feng. But Chen Feng knew in his heart that even with such insidiousness and cunning, the bull bee would not be able to gain any favor. Ding, ding, ding. The sound of the system kept ringing, and snake bees were flying back and forth outside, gathering honey and keeping watch. Chen Feng secretly observed that if compared with the bullfighting bee, the spirit snake bee is really not as powerful as the bullfighting bee. The queen bee is the third level, and the other second level and first level worker bees are only half the number of the bullfighting bee. When Chen Feng flew away, he took 50 second order spirit snake bees and 200 first order spirit snake bees with him, euphemistically saying that he was escorting Chen Feng back to his nest. He also took a look at Chen Feng's position, so that he could support his allies at any time in the future. Chen Feng didn't take it seriously and openly brought a group of worker bees that were different from him and looked nondescript back to the nest. After returning to the nest, a few first-level worker bees returned to the spirit snake bees, while the rest stayed behind. Chen Feng placed these worker bees at the entrance of the small canyon and prevented the spirit snake bees from actually entering the hive. The spirit snake bees did not become suspicious and obeyed Chen Feng's arrangement. After a long day, it is already evening. Chin Feng looked at the time. Tomorrow the hive would begin to refresh third level worker bees. The third level worker bees are my current trump card. The more time passes, the more they will be refreshed. So let these third level worker bees stay in the hive and not come out. The current hive seems to be preparing for the next worker bees to be refreshed. 
It has suddenly expanded ten times and has become a sphere with a diameter of one meter. It expands tenfold overnight. And if a bull bee sees it, it will definitely cause big trouble. Chin Feng looked at the hive. Not worried. If you dare to touch my Chin Feng's things, I will make you die in the cradle before you have the intention. If you have the intention, I will make you die unwillingly. Chin Feng glanced pointedly at the spirit snake bee at the entrance of the small canyon. The spirit snake bee intervened, causing the three forces to look at the maturity stage of Tian's Hiko. The two sides sent worker bees to check, and gradually occupied the left and right positions of Shout Yan Peak. Surrounding Tian's Hiko, Chin Feng mingled with a spirit snake bee. Ding. I found the hive upgrade item. Xian level low level elixir Tian's Hiko. The current maturity level is 67% and the remaining maturity time is 16 days. Please pay attention to the host. It took two days to mature by 1%. Really slow. Chin Feng raised his head and looked at the sky. It is said that the mysterious elixir absorbs the essence of heaven and earth. Does the maturity of this elixir depend on the moonlight? Chin Feng's body shape was obviously different from that of the spirit snake bee, and he was quickly discovered by the bull bee on the opposite side. After the two first level worker, bees whispered to each other for a while. One of them quickly flew away from Xiaotian Peak. After Chen Feng saw it, he quietly joined the team and flew back to the hive. In two days, the secret hall refreshed eight third-level worker bees with eight evolution points. The worker bees were hidden in the hive by him, and all the evolution points were added to his creativity. After all, the rest of the time is spent preparing for the hive upgrade. Chen Feng was determined to hide his strength. Even if he had many evolution points, he would keep them for now. Chapter 21 The Snipe and the Clam Fight Chin Feng realized that something was wrong. Soon after flying back to the hive, the system prompt sounded. Ding! An enemy attack has been detected 1,000 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. Ding! An enemy attack has been detected 200 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. Chin Feng flew out of the hive. 50 bullfighter bees and 200 first-level worker bees all stopped at the entrance of the small canyon. There were also spirit snake bees helping to guard the place. The bull bee saw the snake bee in the small canyon. Smoking with rage, the news of the alliance between the two parties was quickly sent back to the bullfighting queen. This time, the plump body of the bullfighting queen rolled down from the throne in anger. He usually suffered a lot from spirit snake bee, but now he suffered from Chin Feng. He was really angry and couldn't defeat him. The bullfighting bee queen suppressed the anger in her heart and forcibly recalled the sent worker bees putting all her strength on Shout Yan Peak. When we get the elixir, we can deal with these two thorns at our side. The original plan of the bullfighting queen B was that by eating the seven-colored night sleeping flower, her level would definitely rise. Tian's Hiko was indeed a magical elixir that could increase her level by two levels, and it was the only one in the entire blood forest. The entrance to the small canyon. The bull bees gathered together for a long time, looking at the spirit snake bees and glory bees inside. They left with expressions of reluctance and anger. Time proceeds steadily and closely. After the maturity of Tian's Hiko increases, the refreshing fragrance spreads out and can be smelled from a mile away. The situation became more delicate. Both sides of Shout Yan Peak were occupied by bullfighting bees and spirit snake bees. There were many other monsters around Shout Yan Peak that were ready to move, but without the huge group and flexible attacks of worker bees. They didn't dare to act rashly and were ready to pick up the slack. The moon is dark and the wind is high. Dark clouds suppress me, and I couldn't see my fingers. After Chen Feng upgraded, he could see at night without the help of moonlight. Ding! There are a lot of enemy attacks around. Please pay attention to the host. Ding! The Xian level low level elixir Tian's Hiko has a maturity level of 999% and will mature in one hour. Please pay attention to the host. The fragrance of Tian's Hiko is even stronger, and the howling of wolves can even be heard below Xiao Tian Feng. At the last moment, the moon struggled to turn its head out of the clouds, and a burst of silver light poured down, shining on Tian's Hiko. Inging's halo flashed. The original green grass of the entire ZB grassland turned into silvery white in an instant. The moon completed its mission and disappeared into the clouds again. Only the Tianji grass shone silver in the entire small Tian Feng. The elixir is ripe! Buzz buzz! The sound of flapping wings resounded and the two sides instantly charged into the sky above Tian's Hiko. The bullfighting bee and the spirit snake bee collided together, and a fierce battle broke out in an instant. The corpses of the worker bees fell down one after another. The several second-order glory bees and first-order glory bees that followed Chen Feng 
to help out had their wings vibrating the loudest and shouting the loudest. Swipe. 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 Just don't enter the inner circle of the battle. The two sides were dense and anxious. Covering the sky and the sun. Chin Fong led the team of worker bees to approach Tian's Hiko step by step. The snake queen bee and the bullfighting queen bee were fighting fiercely in the sky. Both are at the third level. And the forces of both parties are similar. If they had not lost the seven-colored knight sleeping flower, the bull bee would have won at this moment. The worker bees brought by Chin Fong gradually formed a long strip in the entire bee station with a hollow section looming in the middle. Chin Fong rushed into the bee station and killed the bull bees indiscriminately. He wanted to disrupt the bull bees' formation by killing the second-level worker bees. This was also discussed with Spirit Snake Bee before. Shadow attack! Desperate sting! The bodies of the bullfighting bees were falling down one after another, and anyone who was approached by Chin Fong would be killed in one blow. Soon, due to the decrease in the number of second-level worker bees, the bull bees became disadvantaged. Seeing that the situation was not going well, the bullfighting queen bee hated Chin Fong in her heart. She looked at Tian's Hiko, took a blow from the snake queen bee's tail needle, turned around and dived towards Tian's Hiko. How could the spirit snake bee give him what he wanted? It shot him from behind. The bullfighting queen bee was injured and almost fell straight down. Form emerges. Chin Fong directly led the worker bee team and flew down. He took the ZB grass in his mouth and pulled it up whole. With Chin Feng's help, the situation was one-sided, and most of the bull bees died. Finally, they fled back to Bullfight Mountain with the queen bee in their hands. The spirit snake bee burst into cheers. When the queen bee of the spirit snake turned around, she realized that Chin Fong and Tian's Hiko had disappeared. Someone was tricking her before her eyes, and the queen bee of the spirit snake was in full swing. Gather the worker bees and fly them all to the glorious hive. Chin Fong picked the Tian's Hiko and returned to the hive. He was not busy upgrading. He ignored the system prompts and put the Tian's Hiko into the hive. This was because the creativity test required a lot of books and there was a lack of practice time recently. So it was not enough for the time being. Current creativity 81 out of 100. Still 19 o'clock. The army marched in. And the small canyon was surrounded by darkness. The spirit snakes and bees came out in full force. Ding! A large number of enemy attacks have been spotted a thousand meters away. Host! Please pay attention. Chin Fong flew out alone and confronted the spirit snake queen bee at the entrance of the canyon 500 meters away. Spirit snake queen bee. What does this mean? What do you mean? What a drug thief. Why don't you hand over the Tian's Hiko quickly? What if I don't pay? Chin Fong also denied it. Denial is meaningless. This sentence directly made the queen bee of the spirit snake explode. And the two tentacles on her head stood up in anger. If you don't pay, today will be the day you die. The queen bee of the spirit snake gave an order and directly ordered all the worker bees to rush towards Chin Feng. After 16 days and the previous ones, the number of worker bees in Chin Feng's hive is now 72 third level worker bees, 204 second level worker bees, 406 first level worker bees, and 1011 ordinary worker bees. Except for the third level worker bees who were hidden in the hive by Chin Feng. The others were all hidden in the small canyon. Oh! Chen Feng smiled faintly. His tail needle flashed with black luster. And all the glorious worker bees flew out in an instant, forming a formation behind Chen Feng. In terms of majesty and momentum, no one can compare with the current Chen Feng. The spirit snake bee swooped in and the glory bee rushed out. Just the third level worker bees rushed directly into the spirit snake bees. And instantly, bees began to rain in the small canyon. The bodies of the spirit snake bees fell down one after another. The queen bee of the spirit snake was stunned on the spot. When she noticed Chin Feng approaching, she quickly backed away. I am only at the third level. But the queen bee in front of me has so many third level worker bees. Within two minutes, one third of the spirit snake bees were dead. The queen bee of the spirit snake was so horrified that her tail needle trembled with fear when she saw a flash of lightning from Chin Feng's body and instantly dispatched three of his second level worker queens. Bastard! Devil! With his tail between his legs, he quickly ran away with the remaining worker bees. The darkness was filled with radiant bees, silent and desolate like an unsheathed sword. The blade saw blood, beheading provocative enemies one after another. Run away! But staying is always a problem. Chin Feng added the few evolution points he had just gained to his creativity. After all, killing worker bees lower than himself could only be used as practice to gain 0-5 points. Chapter 22 Don't Be Afraid Practice Your Skills Buzz Buzz With his strength exposed, 
Chen Feng no longer intends to hide it. The third level worker bees flew around the hive, and finally stopped on the branches on both sides of the hive. Their killing momentum and calm discipline showed the strength of the glorious hive. Chin Feng turned around and looked at the current hive, seemingly feeling something. Starting with a bee. The hardest part is just the beginning. Chin Feng returned to the hive and drank royal jelly through a straw as a habit. After the quality of royal jelly improved again, Chin Feng clearly felt the changes in his body. The heaviness disappears and the body feels lighter. The added speed attribute is simply double the previous effect. After protecting oneself wisely, once one turns over, the next step is to expand territory. Chin Feng reorganized the current worker bees into reconnaissance, defense, and nest building. The reconnaissance team is divided into 10 teams. Each team consists of a third level worker bee and two second level worker bees in a group, responsible for patrols and taking turns to perform tasks. After the territory is expanded, there will definitely be arrangements to patrol the territory. The remaining third level worker bees led the remaining second level worker bees to defend and patrol with Chin Feng in peacetime. After such an arrangement, there is a shortage of worker bees on hand. Chin Feng sat on the throne, tapping the armrest with his toes and sighing. Fortunately, my worker bees are fixed in this system. If I wait for practice, how many years and months will it take to train so many third level worker bees? Chin Feng ordered while checking his level. Level 3. Attack, 0 slash 50. Defense, 0 slash 50. Speed, 0 slash 50. Creativity, 85 slash 100. Evolution points, 0. The first and fourth teams went to see the current situation of the spirit snake bee. The second and third teams went to check out the bull bee. And the fifth team went to check out where the bull bee's strength extended. The sixth, seventh, and eighth teams went back to our hometown to see where they were. Feel the situation and come back to me. Ninth, be responsible for following me. Team 10 will stay at the hive. If other teams come back and there is urgent information and I am not in the hive, come to me immediately. The worker bees took the order and scattered. Chin Feng looked at the worker bees flying away. Sending out so many third level worker bees at once is risky. But if you send out other ranks, it may be easier to lose your wife and lose your troops. Chin Feng looked at the creativity and after drinking enough honey, he flew out with Team 9. He needs a lot of hunting now. Buzz buzz. Having had hunting experience earlier, and seeing Chen Feng's figure again, all the animals in the bullfight area were as if they were seeing a murderous god, and they all retreated away. Run quickly! The black bee is here again! Oh my god! Don't kill me, don't kill me! I don't taste good at all! Chen Feng didn't even look at it. What he needed now was to hunt in large numbers, not practice his skills. Soon, a second level scout bee flew back. King! I found a bull bee stronghold! It's full of second level worker bees. There are probably a hundred of them. It seems to be where they store honey. Good. Whatever you think comes to you. At this time, Chin Feng was not afraid of offending bullfight. But it should be ten miles away from the bullfighting hive. And there is still honey reserves. No wonder the hive in bullfighting mountain is so big. But there are so few second level worker bees. They have all been dispatched. Buzz buzz. Facing two hundred second level worker bees at the same time. Chin Feng did not dare to directly enter the hive. Chin Feng sent Team 9 back to the hive and stood in the open as a bee in front of the 2 meter diameter bullfighting hive. A black queen bee stands. Buzz buzz. Soon the bull bees discovered Chin Feng's sudden appearance of the queen bee and sent a small team of 20 worker bees to investigate. This is exactly Chin Feng's purpose. As soon as 20 worker bees approached, Chin Feng suddenly attacked. Thunderstorm. Zitzi. There was a flash of lightning and three second-level worker bees fell to the ground instantly. Seeing this, the other worker bees lit up their tail needles directly at Chin Feng, and all attacked. Swish! 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 Chin Feng's bee body evaporated lightly and easily dodged the attack. Shadow attack! Desperate sting! A few rays of silver light burst out among a small group of worker bees, and the worker bees that were attacking Chin Feng fell one after another. Ding! 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 The host kills the second level worker bee and gains 0-5 evolution points. The system began to beep non-stop. And Chin Feng didn't know how long he had been pinging it. As long as Chin Feng didn't get close to the bullfighting hive. The bullfighting bees didn't come out in full force. Chin Feng did nothing but kill 120 bull bees. Reaching the upper limit of evolution points. Maxing out his creativity. And stopped after accumulating 30 more evolution points. Chin Feng looked at himself comfortably and used his slender front foot to attack. 
Attack plus 10. Defense plus 10. Speed plus 10. For a whole day, Bulby Base 2 fell into a nightmare. It wasn't until Chen Feng left that the Bulby reacted and flew back to the main nest to report to the Queen Bee. It was already night when Chen Feng returned to the hive. Without stopping, just take out Tian's Hiko. Ding! The hive upgrade item has been detected. Does the host use it now? Use? Ding! The Xian level low level elixir Tian's Hiko was used successfully. The current hive integrity is 360 slash 500. Forehead. Gone! Chin Feng thought about 10,000 possibilities. But he never thought that there was such a possibility. That's a mysterious level elixir. How come I used to be a docile little sheep who could eat as much as I wanted? But now I've reached a high level and still can't get enough. Even though Chin Feng complained, the system still showed no response. Chin Feng was so angry that he laid down on the throne and fell asleep. It didn't take long for Chin Feng to accept this reality the next day. Chin Feng added the newly refreshed four evolution points to defense. Looks like I'll have to go to Bullfight Mountain again. Report. At this time, a small team of scout bees sent a second level worker bee back. Reporting to the king. After the queen bee of the spirit snake was injured, she returned to the hive and could not come out. She even summoned the rest of the worker bees scattered outside. It looks like she is going to the bullfighting hive. Oh. Is it possible that the long-standing enemies are planning to form an alliance? And the worker bees are recalled? After a string of information was combined, Chin Feng suddenly laughed. Okay. Very good. Great. I was worried that he would not come out from the hive. So I wouldn't be able to do anything. Now it's really great. Chin Feng was so happy that he gathered all the third and second order worker bees, except the worker bees who were out. I just accidentally picked up one of the bullfighting bees' bases. At this time, the bullfighting queen must have flown to that base to check it out. She couldn't take care of herself for the time being. It really gave me an excellent opportunity. As long as the spirit snake bee can be eliminated within two hours. Before all the bees can react. Chin Feng saw the opportunity and made up his mind to attack the enemy with an empty city plan. They decisively counted all the worker bees. And directly dispatched 63rd level worker bees. 182nd level worker bees. And 400 first level worker bees. Only ordinary worker bees were left in the entire hive and were still diligently collecting honey. Chapter 23. Cutting out the roots. Buzz buzz. The sound of flapping wings was suppressed to the lowest level. But it still formed a bass sound that spread outward. Like an army advancing. Half an hour later. The snake bees form a ball and fly around the outside of the hive. Suddenly, accompanied by a buzzing sound, a black cloud came over the area and the spirit snake bee was completely surrounded by the glory bee before it had time to react. Buzz buzz. All the tail needles are exposed. And in the gloomy weather, they are dark and cannot see the light. Chin Feng stepped forward. Spirit snake queen bee, where are you going? I'll give you a ride. Seeing Chin Feng, the spirit snake queen bee was so angry that she couldn't speak for a long time. Chin Feng directly scolded him. Despicable little bee, you still dare to come. I'm planning on labor and wages. And I'm going to make you die a bad death. Chin Feng looked at the queen bee of the spirit snake, but didn't say much. I just wanted to take over the queen bee of the spirit snake and finally get a taste of some evolution points. Wah! Chin Feng dodged and was already close to the spirit snake queen bee. Without any fear, the spirit snake queen bee was still surrounded by the worker bees. Thunderstorm! Crack dash! The electric shock hit him. And the third level queen bee was caught off guard and resisted all the damage. The second level worker bee beside him was not so lucky and was killed by Chin Feng instantly. The spirit snake queen bee was unsteady and her whole body felt numb. Looking at Chin Feng in disbelief, he wanted to move away and distance himself from Chin Feng. His tail needle slenderly trembled and his long legs quickly formed an arc halo to protect himself. However, Chin Feng's speed was such that he had no time to react. When the spirit snake queen bee just took a step back, the whole body of the queen bee of the spirit snake trembled. And then she was struck by a shadow attack and her belly was torn open. In the center of her open belly was a deadly poisonous needle. The queen bee of the spirit snake could only say the word you in a hurry. You. I. Chin Feng looked puzzled and innocent as he watched the body of the spirit snake queen bee fall. Ding. The host kills the third level queen bee and gets evolution point one. Originally, one strike was enough to kill the queen bee of the spirit snake. However, Seeing such huge proficiency, Chin Feng immediately fell into the old habit. Practice your skills, even the corpses. 
as soon as the queen bee died, the entire spirit snake bee was in chaos. The glory bees, led by the third order worker bees, rushed directly into the spirit snake bee camp. For a while, bee corpses fell like rain. Anyone who tried to escape would be beaten by the first order worker bees guarding the perimeter. The speed was so fast that the battle was over in half an hour. After the battle, Chin Feng looked at the bull bee hive. Given an order, all the immature pupae and babies in the hive were dragged out by the first order worker bees, and no one was left. They were thrown on the body of the spirit snake bee, and the bullfighting bee hive was dug up to pieces. Seeing the young bee still struggling, Chin Feng had no mercy. It's just that you were born in the wrong place and were burdened by your king. After all, to cut the weed you have to get rid of the root. Chin Feng didn't want to leave any enemies for himself. From then on, there were no longer any spirit snake bees in the bullfighting mountains. Half an hour later, Chin Feng returned to the hive safely with the worker bees, and none of the worker bees were broken. It's just a pity. If I hadn't been in a hurry, I could have gained some evolution points and experience. It was a pity, and Chin Feng only talked about it, and he never dared to make fun of the hive. He tapped the attributes on the panel with his toes and added the five evolution points he just obtained to his defense. Then now, we can deal with the bull bee. In Chin Feng's opinion, it is not difficult to deal with the bull bee, although the bull bee's power is lingering. As long as he understands the bull bee's strongholds and forces, he can defeat them one by one. When the octopus's claws are chopped off one by one, only a bald head remains. It's still interesting. The next day, the secret hall once again refreshed four evolution points. Defense plus four. Chin Feng opened the panel properties, and it was completely different now. Host, Chin Feng. Level 3. Attack, 10 50ths. Defense, 19 50ths. Speed, 10 50ths. Creativity, 100 slash 100. Evolution points, 0. Skill, Jedi Assassination 111 slash 1000. Jedi Assassination has a 3% probability of paralyzing and paralyzing the target for 5 seconds. The next level is Tianjue. Thunderstorm 132 slash 200, within 1 meter of the host's body, there is no difference in thunder attacks. The number of attacks is limited to 3, which is equal to the host's own level. Secret Skill, Death Poison Needle, 56 slash 500. Death Poison Needle can be fired. After the venom is used, it can absorb honey and convert it into venom. If you are hit, you will suffer varying degrees of damage depending on your own strength. Hive Level, 3, the host level cannot be higher than the hive. Level 3 Hive Integrity 360-500. 83rd Level Worker Bees. 224 Second Level Worker Bees. 446 First Level Worker Bees. And 1111 Ordinary Worker Bees. Secret Palace. The quality of honey is increased by 80%. And the cultivation speed is increased. For evolution points are provided every day. The alchemy function of the Secret Palace has been turned on. Please accept the alchemy task as soon as possible. Hidden Bee Pavilion, 4 3rd Level Worker Bees, 10 2nd Level Worker Bees, 20 1st Level Worker Bees, and 50 Ordinary Worker Bees are refreshed every day. After a long time, Chen Feng was now numb after seeing the 3% numbing and paralyzing effect of Jedi Assassination. It won't be triggered anyway. Chen Feng wandered around Do Do Mountain again and found no items that could upgrade the system. So he had to give up for the time being. It seems that we can only think about upgrading after we have solved the Bull Bee. Not long after, all the scout bees sent out came back. In addition to being sent to the black sting bee, he has not returned yet. Chin Feng also roughly figured out the strongholds and forces of bullfighters scattered outside. In addition to the main nest, there are 23 external strongholds of bull bees, large and small, where the honey looted from the surrounding areas is stored and transported to the main nest regularly every month. The fighting strength of bullfighting bees is scattered among these strongholds. Among the surrounding forces of the bullfighting bee, there are still several hives as big as the spirit snake bee, which can contain hundreds of first to second level worker bees, and they are forced to succumb to the pressure of the bullfighting bee. After receiving the news, Chen Feng made new arrangements for the investigation team, and only the remaining third level worker bees were included in it. You can't just kill the bees! Then the body of the bee will be meaningless. Let's become the righteous dead and save the oppressed bee people! Chen Feng was probably bored and started singing to himself. He completely forgot that if he went on a patrol, all animals and plants would retreat, as if he had seen a devil. It was all because of Chin Feng's great achievements in killing mammoths before. After an impassioned speech, Chin Feng rearranged the worker bees. Looking at the simple map he drew on the ground, he arranged it from a distance, 
according to the Bulby stronghold, one to the east and one to the west, so that these two places could be attacked at the same time. The first is to prevent the Bulby from giving up its stronghold and providing full support. Second, faint attacks at other places were also arranged. After the arrangements were made, Chin Feng spread out on the throne and took a swig of royal jelly. Don't worry about other things for now. After the war is arranged, it's time for me to go out and meet the oppressed bee people. Save sentient beings or something. Chapter 24 Queen Bee Buzz buzz! The army dispersed and attacked, defeating each one. The entire bullfighting mountain range was plunged into battle. Bullfighting bees were constantly being killed. The bodies of bullfighting bees could be seen everywhere in the bullfighting mountain range. All bee species are terrified. Two bees who were used to being protected and protected by bull bees got together to discuss the situation. One is a small wasp, and the other is a small fruit wasp. I don't know who invaded the bullfighting mountains. It's not a good life. Oh, I just gave honey to the bull bee the day before yesterday. And now I'm forcing the bee to die. Brother, don't be sad. I still have some honey somewhere. I'll give it to you for emergencies first. Oh, thanks, brother. Hey, look, is that the newbie force? It was Chin Feng passing by here. He just went to meet with other small forces that were being squeezed. He only asked them to be obedient and follow orders when necessary. Most of the time, they should not act like monsters. By simply following natural selection, he successfully controlled those small high forces. Recover. Chin Feng solved the bull bees that had been suppressed for many years. And other bee species were even more grateful. The two queen bees were really talking. And one was about to step forward, but was stopped by the other. Quickly! Go and get familiar with each other first. If it's hard to get along with you or if you can't fight, run away. Wait, brother, do you think now is also an opportunity? You mean, use this power to overthrow the oppression of the bull bees. But these new forces are all third level worker bees. What are you afraid of? The bullfighting mountain range is so big. As long as there is no pressure from the bullfighting bees, you and I won't be able to grow up quickly. The other queen bee gave a thumbs up and the two queen bees quickly began to conspire to seize this opportunity to become independent. When necessary, the two queen bees would directly join forces. Here we are talking about how things are going badly for Bull Bee. The queen bee lost weight twice in a hurry, and her entire belly sank. But defeats kept coming one after another. Report! Report to your majesty! Our two strongholds in the western mountains have been occupied. More than half of our brothers were killed or wounded. We can no longer withstand it. Report to your majesty! All four of our strongholds in the south have been captured. Report. The more I listened, the more chilled I became. The bullfighting queen slumped tremblingly on the throne and looked at the top of the hive. There was a skylight where she could directly see the blue sky. The sun is shining brightly, just like the deep moon in cold winter. At this moment, the bullfighting queen bee seemed to react, and her body shook and she let out a loud shout. All worker bees gather. I'm going to go straight to the gory bee nest. After the bull bees were assembled, their huge bodies flapped their wings and buzzed. A mile away, Chin Feng led the army to stop because the scout sent by Chin Feng sent back the news. The bullfighting queen is out in full force. A thousand second-level worker bees, and countless first-level worker bees, and ordinary worker bees. Tisk! Chin Feng smacked his lips. We really underestimated the strength of the bull bees. If we can't catch them all today, there will be endless troubles in the future. Chin Feng is confident in his power. He now has 144 third level worker bees, 384 second level worker bees, 766 first level worker bees, and 1861 ordinary worker bees. Of course, Chin Feng did not bring them all out. After hearing the news, Chin Feng immediately organized the third level worker bees he brought out into teams of two and divided them into ten groups. Each led ten first level worker bees and dispersed them all to ambush. Once the war started, these groups would specifically target the senior bullfighting bees. Worker bees hunt. The remaining worker bees are all led by Chin Feng. Ding! A large number of worker bees were found a thousand meters away. Please pay attention to the host. Ding! A large number of worker bees were found 200 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. Dark clouds were pressing down on the situation. And Chin Feng was looking down as if he was holding a scepter. Flying in the air. Kill! Majestic and calm. As soon as the killing sound came out, the glory bee was like a sharp sword thrust straight into the belly of the bull bee. Instantly split the bull bee in half. The situation was one-sided. Chin Feng flew in front of me and smiled contemptuously. 
Idiot! Before the bull bee could show its angry expression, the tail needle flashed with black light and stabbed into the queen bee's body. Laugh! The tail needle was pulled out, and the body of the bullfighting queen bee fell to the ground. With unwillingness written in her eyes, an era comes to an end. As soon as the Do Do mountain range passed by Xiao Qin, the noisy sounds disappeared in an instant, as if we were back to the time when birds were singing and flowers were fragrant, and life was full of expectations and expectations. The little peak species burst into tears of gratitude and came to the small canyon with gifts. The entire small canyon is under martial law, and no bees are allowed to fly in. But these small peak species are still surrounding this small canyon, unwilling to leave. Please, your majesty, meet us. Your majesty, the little king and the little flower be want to see your majesty. Chin Fong had a lot of things to do and really had no time. However, these bees were unwilling to leave which was also a problem. In desperation, he had to get out of the hive. As soon as the bees saw Chen Feng, they all knelt down and sang loudly. See you, your majesty. See you, your majesty. There is an old bee, representing other bee species stepping forward. Your majesty, you are so powerful and powerful that we, the bee species, all admire you. Your kind heart, your kindness, and your universal love are even more admirable for us bee species. I sincerely ask you, your majesty, to be the queen bee of our bullfighting mountain range. Protect us and lead us. Us. After old Fong finished speaking, everyone knelt down piously. Chin Fong was silent. It's true that the power is strong. That's because you didn't mess with me. You have a kind heart. That is the low quality honey that I looked down upon you. Chen Fong complained in his heart, but did not say it out loud. I mean to help the old man up. As long as you obey me and don't be a monster. Bah! As long as you don't betray me and live diligently. I don't need your honey. I will protect the bullfight mountain range. Everyone, go back. Don't disturb the labor research alchemy room anymore. Chin Fong thought so in his heart. Thank you. Your Majesty. Thank you. Your Majesty. Seeing Chin Feng's promise. All the bees looked excited. Over the years, they were the happiest at this moment. From now on, the honey they collect will be their own. After receiving Chen Feng's promise, the other bee species were finally sent away. Chen Feng just turned around. Ding. An enemy attack has been spotted 200 meters away. Host, please pay attention. Chen Feng turned back. His entire face darkened. T what? Who else? A black swarm of bees, at least a thousand of them, suddenly appeared and surrounded the outside of the canyon. Apparently they came with the old man bee, but there was no bee species that went with him. It seems we have to move the hive as soon as possible. Why are all these turtles and bastards popping up? Annoying. Chin Fong raised his chin, and the second level worker be following the guard took a step forward and shouted, Come here. He Fong, you have a valuable job. It was the little wasp and the little fruit bee who came. They never thought that so many bees would respond to their proposal. And they followed the old man to Chin Feng's nest. Chapter 25 Moving The two bees now gathered a thousand worker bees and they became bolder and started screaming. Chin Feng, you are an alien bee. What qualifications do you have to dictate in the bullfighting mountains? That's right. Where did you come from? Go back to where you came from. The bullfighting mountains don't need the protection of an alien bee like you. The two queen bees shouted, and the momentum inside the entire small canyon changed instantly, becoming silent and killing. Chen Feng looked calm, as if he was still watching a show. Oh, what if I don't? Then we must represent the Bull Mountains and eliminate dissidents. The other side was still talking generously, but Chin Feng had already given instructions. Surround but don't attack. Just don't let anyone escape. I want to be familiar with the skills. Yes. The glory bee acted quickly and surrounded the small wasp. Small fruit wasp and other bees in less than a minute. Chin Feng flew into the encirclement. The little wasp was timid. When he saw something was going wrong, it was too late to escape. Buzz buzz. ZZ. Papa. Laugh. A unilateral killing. Chin Fong was disorganized in the bee swarm and ran rampant without any scruples or fear. The corpses of the wasps and fruit wasps fell one by one. After killing like this for an hour, there were too many bees coming and the killing was tiring. I'm too tired. I don't want to practice leveling for the time being. Chen Fong gasped, exited the encirclement, waved his front foot, and spoke lightly. Kill them. Leave no one behind. Yes. 
after dealing with these people who had given up their lives. Qin Feng no longer wanted to study the alchemy room, and flew towards the Bull Mountain, with his wings vibrating close to the ground. Soon Qin Feng flew to Dodo -Do Mountain. It's dead quiet here. And the hives without bees have begun to collapse, and weeds have grown. Bullfighting Mountain is even more lush. Ding! 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 Qin Feng flew close to the ground, and the system started beeping non-stop. All tips for the alchemy room. Qin Feng was helpless and stared at the interface of the alchemy room. I only have six claws and no space. So how can I pack so many medicinal materials? What the HL? What's the reason why I, Chun Feng, shouldn't take the things I saw? No matter what. Just throw them all in and refine them into something. Anyway, I've also thrown in everything I need for the first level mission. Chin Feng conveniently threw the 20 dog head grasses he had picked into the alchemy furnace. Ding! The first level mission of the alchemy room has been started. It will take 20 hours. Please pay attention to the host. Chin Feng was not in a hurry to go back and flew to the top of Dodo Mountain. The clouds and mist are lingering above, giving it a unique flavor. He was thinking about the black stinging bee, and he had no intention of staying too long in Bullfighting Mountain. But he didn't expect that someone would make trouble for him by some strange combination of circumstances, and it would end up like this. In fact, even if the bull bee doesn't cause trouble, according to Chin Feng's domineering character of wanting whatever he sees, this is the inevitable result. Blackthorn Queen! Thinking of this name, Chin Feng couldn't restrain his inner anger. It's just that I'm still planning. So I wrote down the account. It's time for the scout sent out by Ching Ching to come back. Chin Feng counted the time and clicked on the properties panel. The upper limit of evolution points is 10 times his own level. With 4 points refreshed today, there is really nothing Chin Feng can do. Host, Chin Feng. Level 3. Attack, 50 50 Defense, 50 50 Speed, 50 50 Creativity, 100 slash 100. Evolution points, 30. Skill, Jedi Assassination 699 slash 1000. Jedi Assassination has a 3% probability of paralyzing and paralyzing the target for 5 seconds. The next level is Tianjue. Thunderstorm 178 slash 200. Within 1 meter of the host's body, there is no difference in thunder attacks. The number of attacks is limited to 3, which is equal to the host's own level. Secret Technique, Death Poison Needle, 344 slash 500. Death Poison Needle can be fired. After the venom is used, it can absorb honey and convert it into venom. If you are hit, you will suffer varying degrees of damage depending on your own strength. Hive Level, 3, the host level cannot be higher than the hive. Level 3 Hive Integrity 360 slash 500. 344 third level worker bees. 848 second level worker bees. 1766 first level worker bees. And 4361 ordinary worker bees. The hive transfer function will be activated in two days. Secret Palace. The quality of honey is increased by 80%. And the cultivation speed is increased. For evolution points are provided every day. The alchemy function of the secret palace has been turned on. Please accept the alchemy task as soon as possible. Hidden Bee Pavilion, 4 3rd level worker bees, 10 2nd level worker bees, 20 1st level worker bees, and 50 ordinary worker bees are refreshed every day. The strength is definitely not what it used to be. But Chin Feng is not happy. He is simply distressed. He has flown across the entire bullfight mountain range, searching like a carpet, but has not found a single high-grade elixir that can be used to upgrade the hive. Chin Feng's body is also nourished by royal jelly, and his power is visible to the naked eye. This is a solid improvement in addition to adding points. Even if the Blackthorn Queen Bee is right in front of him, Chin Feng already has the power to counter it. There are still two days left. Let's move the hive first. Chin Feng flapped his wings and flew down from Do Do Mountain and flew back. We need to consume a lot of honey during the occupation. Now our food needs are not as good as before. If we want to go back, we should try our best to eat as much as possible in the past two days. I'm afraid we will be hungry in the next few days. After returning, Chin Feng issued an order for all worker bees to return to their nests. However, a hive with a diameter of one meter could not accommodate too many worker bees. So Chin Feng had no choice but to let the high-level worker bees inside and the ordinary worker bees outside. In case someone was left behind during the transfer, he had to look for his own way home. He had only transferred once and was inexperienced. Two days later, the two months ended. The moon hung high in the sky and the silver light came down illuminating the entire dark hive. The third level worker bees, 
who went out to investigate the black stinging bees had just returned from the team leader and had not had time to report. Chin Feng had no time to take care of it at the moment. It was really a time to concentrate. Chin Feng sat on the throne. Ding! The cooling time of the hive transfer function has expired. Do you want to transfer the host now? Transfer! Hey! Can I choose a location? After Chin Feng finished talking about the transfer, the system was started. No one answered the next sentence. Alas! Loneliness! Ding! The target transfer was successful. The next cooling time is one month. Please pay attention to the host. Oh! A month! Is it because of the upgrade again? Chin Feng complained and walked out. The familiar land came into view. And Chin Feng silently looked back at the hive. This guy really didn't do it on purpose. How else could he become a neighbor with the Emperor's spider? Unless he kills all the Emperor's spiders. He won't be able to relax. Right. In fact, Chin Feng was overthinking it. With his current strength, the Emperor's spider would immediately retreat when seeing him. Revenge for killing your son? Non-existent. Okay. Let's talk about the current situation of the Black Sting Bee. Reporting back to the king. The Black Sting Bees are operating as usual and nothing special happened. It's just that these bees look more haggard. We began to think that something was wrong. So we conducted an investigation. Fortunately, we caught up with the migration. Oh, nothing abnormal? Chin Feng was puzzled. How could the Black Thorn Queen manage this swarm of bees so well? Chapter 26 Those Who Oppose Me Will Perish Chin Feng waved away the worker bees, habitually clasped his chin, and drank royal jelly through a straw between his two slender toes, like a cigarette. In the world of bees, maybe surveying is just about taking a look? It seems that if you want to have a deeper understanding, you have to rely on yourself. It seems that I need to train him properly when I have time. If nothing happens, Chin Feng is familiar with the Black Thorn Hive root, and there is no need to explore further. On the outskirts of the Blood Forest, occupying the entire eastern area, there are forces guarding it from all directions. It was the country established by the old Queen Bee. The main tree in the Blood Forest is the Blood Birch. The tree is red all over and makes a sizzling sound when the wind blows, which is why it is named after the Blood Birch. There are only weeds, shrubs and a few tall ancient trees on the outside, which look abrupt and occupied by various bee species. The further out you go, the more desolate it becomes. Buzz, buzz, buzz. Outside the hive, various patrols and honey collection are carried out in an orderly manner. Chin Feng disappeared when he had just upgraded to level 2 and had the transfer function, which shocked the Black Sting Queen Bee. After being on guard for half a month, they found that Chin Feng was nowhere to be seen. So he felt completely at ease and sat firmly on the throne. Call out! Chin Feng flew out without any worker bees. The worker bee was originally only equipped with a percentage of Chin Feng's strength. Now Chin Feng has full experience at level 3 and is blessed with 80% quality royal jelly. The current level 3 body far exceeds the strength of level 5, flying 100 meters in one second. Chin Feng looked back at his hive. Thoughtfully, it is not conspicuous next to the emperor's spider, but the number of worker bees coming and going seems to be huge, and it is easy to attract attention. Now that I'm back, it's only a matter of time before I'm discovered. If you want to take advantage, you have to strike first. But the Black Sting Bees were originally the Black Wind Bees established by the Old Queen Bee. They are huge in number. With my current strength, it is unrealistic to kill them all. After thinking for a moment, Chen Feng made a sudden decision. Then I'll take the throne nest in one pot and leave the rest. Those who obey me will prosper. And those who go against me will perish. After making up his mind, Chen Feng returned to the hive to gather the elite troops of level 233 worker bees and flew out of the Emperor Spider's territory. Ding! An enemy attack has been detected 1,000 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. Ding! An enemy attack has been detected 200 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. Chin Feng is extremely fast. And the third level worker B is one-tenth of his strength. Already ten times stronger than the same level of worker B. If he hadn't thought about it, he would never have been discovered. Snapped! Chin Feng and his worker bees were closely packed together hiding behind a shrub leaf to avoid a small group of black stinging bees. After the black stinging bee passed, Chen Feng continued to move forward. The emperor spider's nest and the black stinging bee's nest were only separated by a rolling hill, and they had to dodge for half an hour. Chen Feng arrived at the outskirts of the main hive. After getting familiar with the original hive, Chen Feng mingled behind the honey-gathering worker bees and came to the branches and branches of the main hive. The honey-gathering team was already huge 
and hundreds more bees would not be discovered at all. After arriving at the destination, Chin Fong directly divided the worker bees into groups, sneaked into each small distribution area, and strangled all the leaders inside. Those who are not in the room will wait until they come back. Whether you are forced or helpless, since you are still standing in the team, that is your attitude. A worthy death. Chin Fong made arrangements and walked directly to the main hive of the Black Thorn Queen Bee. The team that had just returned from collecting honey saw Chin Fong going in the wrong direction and originally called Chin Fong to stop. Hey, you're going the wrong way. This way. The king doesn't like to be disturbed. Chin Fong turned a deaf ear and stepped in. The hive was dark and only the shadows of bees could be noticed. The Black Sting Queen was inside. She noticed the movement and turned around suddenly. Lunar Lee's eyes stared at Chin Fong. Who? Get out! Don't come in without my order! The dark shadow continued to move forward, reaching the center of the hive, in front of the throne, and finally appeared in the light. Chin Fong sneered. The Black Sting Queen bee looked at the incoming bee, her eyes widening in surprise. Chin Fong continued to move forward and walked to the front of the throne. The originally fierce bee face of the Black Sting Queen froze, and she involuntarily took a step back. The originally fragmented voice was trembling and even more unpleasant to hear, because just from the momentum alone, he could clearly feel that Chin Fong was different. Very different. It was the intimidation of a truly strong person. You? Chin Fong! Chin Fong seemed to be slumping his mouth and rolling his eyes, and nodded reluctantly. The stalemate lasted for two minutes, and soon workers at the door filed in brought by Chin Fong. He rushed in and stood in two rows behind Chin Fong. Gulyalu. The heads were thrown to the ground one by one. Clam! The Blackthorn Queen bee stared at Chin Fong, and her surprise turned into annoyance. Annoyance that she had not killed them all, leading to the current situation. Looking at Chin Fong, there were 200 third level worker bees, and even he couldn't make such a big move. And Chin Fong. In just over two months, the Blackstain Queen bee soon gave up and said in a split voice, What do you want? Take your hive back? But they all surrendered to me. Chin Fong approached step by step, as if the god of death was coming, even a little leisurely. Those who follow me will prosper, and those who go against me will perish. The jet black tail needle flashed out and struck the black sting queen bee with one blow. The black sting queen bee changed her mind when faced with danger, but Chin Fong held the entire hive's way out, and he had nowhere to escape. He was no match for Chin Fong if he faced him head on. But Chin Fong didn't use any skills. Just the speed of his body and the power of his tail needle. The deadly poisonous needle stabbed the black, stinging queen again and again. Dodge. Stab. The black thorn queen bee's speed could not be compared with Chin Fing's. She was pierced by Chin Fong time and time again without any chance to fight back. First the body of the black thorn queen bee, and then the limbs of the black thorn queen bee. Then he was poisoned and died slowly. The Blackthorn Queen bee was unwilling and angry at the beginning. And finally her body slowly stiffened and she breathed her last breath. But Chin Feng's current strength and venom are not what they used to be. And he will die slowly in just five minutes. Looking at the body of the Blackthorn Queen bee on the ground, Chin Feng bowed towards the throne. Ding! The host killed the level 4 worker bee and successfully obtained evolution point 2. Ding! The host's evolution points must not exceed 10 times its own level. After hearing the system prompt, Chin Fong suddenly turned around, looked at the corpse on the ground, stepped forward and squatted in front of the corpse. Worker B? Natural selection occurs in nature. Once you are selected or successfully usurp the throne and become a queen bee, it will be different. Unless it is originally from another bee species. I never thought this was possible. It's really difficult to handle. Now that the Blackthorn Queen Bee is dead, the message has been cut off. As if to confirm, the third level worker the originally responsible for reconnaissance took over. King! We didn't see it because we didn't go inside before. We've seen this bee species outside. Say it! Yes! King! It was when we were returning three days ago that we saw this bee species trading with a bee swarm team. Chapter 27 Ian Sean B. But my subordinates didn't see clearly what they were doing. Then my subordinate followed this small group of bee species and flew for a while and found that they were flying in the direction of Ian Sean Mountain. Nice. I still have some common sense in investigating. So I can only feel relieved. Inshan B. Inshan Mountain is a canyon mountain range located on the outskirts of the Blood Forest. Close to the inner boundary of the Blood Forest. It is also on the outskirts of the forest. But it has always looked high on itself. Calling itself the Blood Forest B. This B species never wants to suffer losses 
and has a strong sense of revenge. And insidious and cunning. Chin Fong looked at the corpse of the Black Sting Queen Bee on the ground and wondered what the purpose of such a worker Bee was trying so hard to occupy the Black Wind Bee. Honey? This was the only possibility Chin Fong could think of. The area at the back of Inshan Mountain was not suitable for flower fields. Soon, Chin Fong was confirmed by his suspicion. The forager who was worried about Chin Fong cautiously put his head in, but was grabbed by a third level worker bee and thrown in front of Chin Fong. The little bee looked at the bee heads on the ground, all of which were the elders of the nest, as well as the body of the queen bee, and almost died of fright. When he looked at Chin Fong again, his eyes were full of fear. I, I, you, 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 talking incoherently. Chin Fong kicked the body of the black sting queen bee aside, walked to the throne and sat down. The figure overlapped with the old queen bee for a moment. The bee looked at Chin Fong with wide eyes, and its fear turned into surprise. It's the young queen bee. Their little queen bee is finally back. Go on. Tell me everything you know. Chin Fong saw everything about collecting bees and didn't explain much. Yes. I discovered that by accident. But when I told the other worker bees, they didn't believe it. And I didn't dare to go to the elders. This one on the ground. B. I found that for more than two months. He has been going out once a month. And he goes out alone. He was carrying a lot of honey. But I didn't know where he went. I once tried to follow him. But I lost him within ten miles. Okay. Go down. I will take over the hive from now on. Yes. The bees ran out with excitement. The young queen bee is back. And she wants to tell everyone. Chin Fong asked the worker bees to go into groups to arrange work. He stayed in the hive to meditate. After a while, a worker bee came back and reported a number to Chin Fong. You always bring one third of the honey from the hive. So much. Chin Fong knew the strength of the black wind bee in his heart. One third of the amount of honey was simply a two-day ration for all the bee species outside the entire blood forest. Chin Fong poked at the body of the black stinging bee and said, You are really not simple behind this. Even if you die, you still give me such a surprise. According to the information given by the previous worker bees, the honey should have been paid just three days ago? This is the only good news right now. Chin Fong quickly roughly compared his own strength with the opponent's strength in his mind. Perhaps the strength that can level the outer reaches of the blood forest in one's own eyes may be like an egg against a stone in the opponent's eyes. The most urgent thing at the moment is to upgrade the hive as soon as possible. The original spiritual domain of the Black Wind Bee Queen was huge. After some slight expansion by the Black Sting Bee, it directly extended to the entire outer eastern part of the Blood Forest. Chin Fong handed over all the takeover matters to the third level worker bees. And reprogram the third level worker bee to shine the worker bee. Just treat it as a memorial to his original body. The hive will still use its previous name. Black Wind Bee. Since then, all the worker bees have been proud of improving their strength and becoming a glorious worker bee but none of them have succeeded. Some bees are just born with good luck. Buzz buzz. The worker bees come and go in a leisurely manner. The takeover was completed very quickly. The original worker bees were like farmers. No matter who became the emperor, they still lived their own lives. But the way they lived their lives was different. Chin Fong turned the black wind beehive upside down again and finally found some treasure. Ding! I found the hive upgrade item. Host, please go there immediately. I'll go. It's been a long time since I heard such a natural sound. Ding! The hive upgrade item has been detected. Does the host use it now? Use. Ding! The host has used it successfully. And the integrity of the hive has increased to 410500. Chin Fong continued to fly out and search the eastern area. Chin Fong actually discovered several genius treasures guarded by the Black Sting Bee sect. They were all looted by Chin Fong. Ding! The hive upgrade item was used successfully. And the current hive integrity is 489 slash 500. Ding! Huangjia's top grade elixir. Gale fruit. Will mature in five days. Please pay attention to the host. Looking at the progress bar. Chin Feng finally showed satisfaction. Damn! It's finally about to be upgraded. The entire blood forest perimeter has been searched from west to east. Chen Feng clicked on the attribute panel. His attributes had already been overtime. And his evolution points were already at 30 points. Skill proficiency is also improved in various aspects. Ding! The host skill Thunderstorm 200 slash 200 is upgraded to Thunder Fury 0 slash 1000. There is no difference in thunder attacks within 10 meters of the host's body. The number of limited attacks is equal to the host's own level. And there is no cooling time. It's just that the range has been upgraded. 
and there is no increase in attributes or anything like that. Even if there is no cooling time, the enemy attacks will only become stronger and stronger. And the own strength is still too weak. As he spoke, Chin Fong thought of his only attribute skill. Jedi assassination. Forget it. Forget it. Just don't mention it. But now is a critical time for the hive to upgrade. And the January period has arrived. If there are disobedient bees, the other party will never sit idly by, and it is not impossible to destroy the hive in due time. Soon! Chin Fong directly ordered to go down. Checklines. Patrols. And tight security. Buzz buzz. In one month, the number of third-level worker bees spawned from the hive has doubled from the original number. Time has become Chin Feng's strength. Chin Feng now has 688 third-level worker bees, 1,656 second-level worker bees, 2,366 first-level worker bees, and 5,861 ordinary worker bees. The hive has long been outgrown and is in urgent need of upgrades. After Chin Feng reoccupied the Black Wind Hive, he mobilized most of the worker bees. Only elite guards and worker bees were left in his own hive to collect honey. He also used the Emperor's spider as a cover to hide the hive. Ding. A small number of enemy attacks were spotted approaching from a thousand meters away. Ding. A small number of enemy attacks were spotted approaching 200 meters away. After dividing the black wind bees into their own forces, the system will no longer be silent. At this moment, I remembered that there are really bees coming. Sure enough, within five minutes, a small team of 10 third-level worker bees appeared in front of the Black Wind Hive. There were no bees among the third-level worker bees that came, and they stung directly into Chin Feng's main queen hive. Seeing Chin Feng sitting on the throne, he didn't show much surprise. It seems that they don't care who is the queen bee. All they care about is that they can hand over the honey. The visitor spoke directly without any politeness. One month has passed. Why haven't I handed over the honey yet? Chapter 28 Crisis It's not okay to take it slow. You know our rules. If you can't hand it over, it's not impossible for the queen bee to change bees again. The worker bees who arrived didn't look at Chin Feng at all. Looking scornful. Seeing that Chin Feng didn't answer for a long time. He thought he was scared. He was about to sneer a few more times. But when he opened his mouth, his voice was stuck in his throat and could not come out anymore. He looked at Chin Feng in horror. As if to say, How dare you do it? You know who did you offend? He didn't even think about the strength of his third-level worker bee. But he was defeated by the opponent with just one blow. The other worker bees finally came to their senses and surrounded Chin Feng, showing off their tail needles and about to prick him. Thunder's fury. Zitsi. Zitsi. Chin Feng controlled his strength. And the ten worker bees paralyzed on the ground with their bodies numb and numb from the electricity. The dark black tail needle shines out, which is obviously extremely poisonous. After the quality of royal jelly is improved, its power is even more amazing. Chin Feng was not in a hurry to ask questions. He just showed his tail needle and scratched their bellies one by one. The first one to be scratched. Within a minute, the poison took effect, rolling on the ground and wailing in excruciating pain. Soldiers first. Courtesy second. Chin Feng has never been a kind person. Especially when the other party's purpose is not pure. Ten worker bee guards rushed in and tied up and hung up all the messengers who came to collect the honey. After all this tossing, the envoy was already frightened and he didn't waste much time on Chin Feng. He just forced it lightly and even if he didn't move, he would come out. It is indeed Yin Shan Bi. However, after many years of no negotiation, Yin Shan Bi has developed to a terrifying stage. The third level worker bees who are now coming to call for payment are the lowest level. Chin Feng remembered that when his predecessor was a child, he followed the old queen bee to meet the Yin Shan Bi. The growth rate of bees is already fast. It took Chin Feng at most a year for the Yin Shan bees to grow so strong. The larger the number, the more honey is needed. So we paid attention to the Black Wind bee two months ago. But they didn't expect to be killed by Chin Feng so quickly. The Yin Shan bee is still the same Yin Shan bee. It is on the back of a natural barrier to the south of the blood forest. There is no light all year round. Now the real hive has occupied the entire Yin Shan mountain. Kill them all! All ten worker bees were dragged out. Chin Feng looked at the Shushin panel and pondered. It has been more than a month since the hive was moved, and the hive integrity is just 489-500. Now is the critical moment for upgrading. Come on, B! King! Tell me to go down and mobilize all the worker bees, including the Black Wind bees and all the worker bees on the bullfighting mountains, and be on alert. 
head to the south to the Inshan Mountains. There will be checkpoints every one kilometer. As long as there are Inshan beasts flying out, no one will be left. Necessary, it's time to take advantage of the forces of other species. Yes. The worker bees took the order and left. Chin Feng was calculating when the Inshan bees would react and fight back, and whether the hive would be successfully upgraded by then. Wang Jie's top grade elixir will take five days to mature. There was no time at all. And Chin Feng couldn't afford to wait. Buzz buzz. It had only been a day since Chin Feng issued the order when a worker bee reported it. King! It is inevitable that a small group of scouts will emerge from the blood forest. And we will annihilate them all. Well, this is just the first group. There will be other scouts coming out. Until they find out that something is wrong. A large number of enemies will attack. They couldn't resist such a huge attack. The only thing they could do was to buy time and upgrade the hive as soon as possible. You go and give the order. All the worker bees will defend the enemy with all their strength for three days. After three days, they will evacuate at full speed and divide into small groups to return to defense. Gather the zeros into hole. And then reduce the hole into zeros. Once dispersed, it will be difficult for the Inshan bees to attack again. As for Huang Jia's elixir, Chin Feng was unwilling to wait any longer. In the current situation, we can only take advantage of the tiger's den. Time is running out. After Chen Feng made the arrangements, he flapped his wings and flew out. It flew in the air at full speed, leaving only a shadow. Soon, Chen Feng flew over the low bushes. The wind was blowing here. Dark clouds covered the mountains, and not much sunlight shone down. Chen Feng first laid down on a tree, then flew forward and disappeared behind Ia. Ding! A large number of enemy attacks were found 200 meters away. Host, please pay attention. Ding! A hive upgrade item was found a thousand meters away. Sure enough, after Chen Feng flew to Inshan, the system itself remembered. Buzz buzz! The slender body of the Inshan worker bee makes a huge sound by flapping its wings on the back of the Inshan mountain. Even though Chen Feng had already budgeted, he was still surprised by the strength he saw. There are third level worker bees flying everywhere with only a few second-level worker bees carrying honey. And there are also fourth- and fifth-level worker bees flying among them. Then what level is the Inshan Queen Bee? This strength is simply the difference between the militia and the regular army. Chin Feng couldn't help but worry that his direction would not be able to withstand three days. No matter what, just stick to the plan. At this moment, Chin Feng's plus 50 speed attribute was brought into full play, and his whole body was enveloped by a faint aura. Whoosh! In a flash of light, Chin Feng flew out. Chin Feng rushed into the hive and met a fourth level worker bee. Shadow attack! Chin Feng's body flashed and his skills were released continuously. Even though the opponent reacted quickly, he was hit by Chin Feng and his body became sluggish. Desperate sting! The tail needle flashed, taking advantage of the opponent's moment of delay, and shot a blow into the opponent's body, which would have caused the opponent to shout and attract more worker bees. Chin Feng directly bullied the opponent and twisted his head off. The fourth level worker bee received his lunch without seeing clearly how he died. Chin Feng startled the worker bees, but the sound he made during the fight still attracted the attention of other worker bees, who came to check. When I saw the corpses of worker bees on the ground, alarm bells immediately started ringing. Buzz buzz. It's been discovered. Chin Feng ignored it, no longer hiding his voice, and rushed in. After turning two corners, two more worker bees rushed out. Thunder's fury. Chin Feng solved it with one strike. And further inside, he came to the place where Yin Shan be stored his treasures. Ding! Found the hive upgrade item. Ding ding ding. I found a large number of enemy attacks approaching. Please pay attention to the host. Chin Feng picked a few and stuffed them into the small space where the elixirs were stored in the alchemy room. At this time, the doorway was surrounded by Yin Shan bees. Shameless little thief! The incoming bee was a fourth level worker bee. The entrance was narrow and had been completely blocked. The hive was strong and Chin Feng could not destroy it. He was trapped to death for a while. The only option is to get out. Chin Feng looked at the worker bees approaching in darkness without fear and grinned. Come on! Beasts! Kill! A faint white mist appeared around Chin Feng, and his aura condensed. In the halo, only Chin Feng's figure could be seen for a flash, and his movements could not be seen at all. He was fighting and rushing. Thunder's fury! Papa! Zitsi. Ishan swarms rushed over. Like a wall of flesh. Chin Feng was completely surrounded. Fortunately, there was no cooldown time for Thunder's Fury, and it was just a drain on his physical strength. Otherwise, 
Chen Fong was sure that he would have to confess again today. If bitten, it will also be killed by the Yin Shan Bi. Chapter 29 Disaster Yin Shan Bi rushed in. Chen Fong electrocuted a small piece of it and quickly retreated. The room was full of treasures. Chen Fong climbed up directly, his body emitting electric light. The Yin Shan Bi temporarily stopped approaching and looked at Chen Fong with vicious eyes. It flashed its tail needles and wanted to stab the intruder thoroughly. Chin Fong also had a hard time. Although he reacted quickly enough, he was still injured in the face of the beer turn tactic. If he didn't rush up quickly, Yin Shan Bi's corpse would have buried him. Chin Fong was breathing heavily. The puncture wound on his back aching. Ding! It is detected that the host is injured. The system is being repaired. 10% 50%. Ding! The repair is completed. To repair the wound, Chin Fong secretly used an gene to make the wound still look outward but it was completely healed from the inside. Are you kidding? The wound will heal automatically in front of everyone. Don't think about having a peaceful life from now on. Although life has never been peaceful to begin with, Chin Fong stared at all the worker bees present. He stood on the row of corpses in front of him and almost reached the top of the hive. Behind him was the Ling Bao. Zitzi! After Chin Feng's body was repaired for a moment, he suddenly exerted force, and the thunderstorm directly hit the corpses and spiritual treasures within one meter. The charred corpse gave off a burst of smoke. And at this moment, the smoke flashed. Chin Fong filled up his speed attribute points. And with a flash of silver light, he rushed out instantly. The Yin Shan Bi, with its tail needle shining, was full of confidence and was caught off guard. Chin Fong knocked him to the ground and rushed to the door. The Yin Shan Bi flapped its wings and screamed. And the door was instantly blocked by the body of the bee. Jedi assassination. Thunderstorm. A small piece of light came out and Chin Feng kicked off the corpse at the bottom with his back foot and flew out. Finally flying out, Chin Feng's physical strength began to be exhausted. The power of the vibrating wings weakened, and Thunderstorm did not dare to use it anymore. It was completely dark outside, and they were already surrounded by Yin Shan bees. They were all third and fourth level worker bees. Their tail needles were revealed, and they all faced Chin Feng. Ding! We found a large number of enemy attacks. Please pay attention to the host. Ding! The southeast direction has not gathered yet. Chin Feng's whole body flashed with a faint golden light, shrouded like mist. The moment the system sound sounded, Chin Feng's wings vibrated, and a golden meteor flashed past and flew out. At this moment, I no longer care about skills. Sprinting with all my strength is the top priority. On the other side, the scout set by the Yin Shan Bees encountered the first ambush line set by Chin Feng. The Yin Shan Bees who never thought they would be ambushed by other bee species, were completely wiped out in the first battle. At this moment, behind Chen Feng, a large swarm of Yin Shan bees were biting tightly, chasing Chen Feng's tail crazily. After flying out of Yin Shan Mountain, Chen Feng was not clueless and flew directly into the blood forest. Ding! A large number of enemy attacks have been detected 1,000 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. Gone! The inner circle of the blood forest was not something Chin Feng dared to enter rashly, especially if there was a system prompt. Chin Feng and the Yin Shan Bi spent a whole day outside the blood forest. His body was exhausted, but he couldn't stop. Finally, Chin Feng hid on the leaves of a big tree in front of Yin Shan Mountain. At the entrance of Yin Shan Feng's main gate, the Yin Shan Bi could not find Chin Feng at all, and the Queen Bee's rage directly knocked out of Yin Shan. Chin Feng lay behind the leaves, listening to the roar from the Yin Mountain and sneered. He couldn't laugh out loud because he had misjudged Yin Shan Bi's strength. Too careless! Chin Feng's body was hidden in the dark night. The elixir was obtained, but Yin Shan Bi was angered in advance. Chin Feng had no retreat. After this day's dealings, he had a deep understanding of the strength of the Yin Shan Bi. The several kilometers of defense line he had deployed might only be able to delay it for a while. Regardless of his physical fatigue, Chin Feng flew into the nest. He still took out the straw and took a big sip of royal jelly. Ding! An upgraded item has been detected. Will the host use it now? Chin Feng didn't look at the things when he took them. Now he took those things out from the corner of the alchemy room. There were more than ten pills. Chin Feng picked up the one with the lowest visual grade and clicked on the system. Use? Ding! The hive has successfully used the upgrade items. And the hive integrity has reached 500%. Will the host upgrade now? Upgrade! This is the moment I have been waiting for. Ding! The host has been upgraded successfully. The estimated upgrade time is five hours. Five hours! It's not long. 
It's not short. If you want to find this place, you only need one hour. I hope the confusing behavior will be effective. What Chin Feng did was to sacrifice his car to protect his commander. He also thought about using some forces from other races to block it. But Chin Feng was notorious. Any other race that was provoked would just consider themselves unlucky. They would not foolishly run to serve as human shields for Chin Feng like the Emperor Spider did back then. Of Chin Feng looked in the direction of Yin Shan Mountain. The sky in the dark night was abnormal and flickering. It was obviously the light caused by the flow of the master's aura. Chin Feng stood up suddenly. Gone! Yin Shan B gave up the investigation and launched an all-out attack. Moreover, the strength sent out is definitely no less than that of the Blackthorn King. The Blackthorn King is a fourth-level worker bee. So those who come are at least fourth-level worker bees and above. All worker bees listen. Exist. The remaining worker bees will be divided into ten small teams, arranged in echelons in the direction of the Black Wind Hive, and evacuate all the honey-gathering worker bees in the Black Wind Hive. At least save the last bit of life. As long as we can still collect honey, we can breed a new team and come back to life. Yes. All the worker bees flew away. In the hive with a diameter of one meter. Only one bee. Chen Feng. And four newly spawned third level worker bees. Ten second level worker bees. Twenty first level worker bees. And fifty ordinary worker bees were left. Buzz buzz. Chen Feng flew into the sky as if frozen in the air. Standing five hundred meters away from the hive. Facing the direction of Yin Shan Mountain. Ding. The hive is being upgraded. The current progress is twenty percent. The upgrade cannot be interrupted. Please pay attention to the host. The night was dark, and the lights in the distance kept flashing. There were still about five hours before dawn. Buzz buzz. Getting closer and closer, it seemed that the sound of flapping wings was right next to my ears. Mixed with the angry roar from the Inshan bee. Swish. 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 Like the sound of raindrops hitting leaves. Chin Fong knew it was the sound of dead worker bees falling. Chin Fong was completely hidden in the dark night. It has been more than two months since I was reborn. Some human habits are still maintained to this day. After experiencing many ups and downs of life and death, Chen Feng was regarded as a natural selection. No matter how good or bad he was, strength was the capital of his speech. But today, there was a complex feeling in his heart. I'm really not a good king. I'm not that kind-hearted. There is only killing and living. And if I don't want to die, then the other bees must die. Buzz buzz. The sound of flapping wings is near. Ding. An enemy attack has been detected 1,000 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. Chapter 30 Level 4 Hive Ding! An enemy attack has been detected 200 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. Coming! You're not too stupid. You know where the troops are divided. It seems that they didn't find you when they swept over. So you're worried. Chin Fong was able to see at night. And 5 5th level worker bees and 24th level worker bees appeared at the outer door. Seeing Chin Fong standing still, Everyone showed a meaty smile. It seemed as if Chin Fong was going to be eaten alive. After all, they had never seen a wasp that could tease them like that all day long. In front of the fifth level worker bees, the few worker bees that Chin Fong had just spawned were simply not enough to eat. Chin Fong rarely showed his kindness and just let a few worker bees wait for the last hit. Ding. The hive is being upgraded. The current progress is 77%. The upgrade cannot be interrupted in the middle. Please pay attention to the host. The Yin Shan Bi on the opposite side looked at Chin Feng and couldn't hold his wings anymore with excitement. If you are brave, you dare to have a bee waiting for them here. Boss, we found this miscellaneous bee. Do you want to go back and report it? No need. Just kill the bee head and go back. The leader of the Yin Shan Bi waved directly and took action to surround Chin Feng. The Yin Shan Bees knew that Chin Feng was extremely fast. So all the worker bees moved together, forming a halo on their front feet. Together. They instantly enveloped Chin Fong, forming a small barrier. The barrier was formed, and the Yin Shan Bee leader's tail needle showed up and stabbed towards Chin Fong with a black light. Other bees also took action at the same time. Thunderstorm. Papa. Zitzi. Shadow attack. Chin Fong had already drank enough royal jelly to replenish his energy. After being nourished by 80% quality honey for several months, Chin Fong had already formed traces of spiritual energy in his body. Facing the fifth level master's full blow, he only took two steps back, and then was struck by his close range thunderstorm. Hit. We can't let one of these worker bees escape. Otherwise, all the time we bought will be wasted. Chin Fong gritted his teeth. In the small ball of light, 
Worker bees buzzed and fluttered. The long black tail needles collided with each other, as if flashing fire. Ding. The host triggers the passive effect of Jedi assassination. Paralyzing and paralyzing for five seconds. Chen Feng's alarm clock sounded, and the system prompted him. And his body responded without stopping. Desperate sting. Once the needle was shot, the opponent was frozen for five seconds, and the distance was short, making him a living target. The fifth level worker B leader was knocked down by Chen Feng with one blow. The venom spread rapidly in his body, and he lost his ability to fight. He was waiting to die. When the other worker bees saw this, they looked at Chen Feng like a devil. During the battle, it was surprising enough that their attack patterns were completely different from theirs. According to their physical calculations, Chen Feng was simply a magic attack. And even if it hits Chen Feng, it will only make his movements slow. It doesn't take long to catch up again. Rather than saying that they surrounded Chen Feng, it would be better to say that Chen Feng surrounded them all. The fifth level worker B leader fell to the ground. And the one-sided killing officially began. Chin Feng grinned, his eyes full of gloom. Want to kill me? You can do it ten times as much as you do. But with this amount, you have no chance to go back and report to the king. Swish. 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 Shadow kill combined with a deadly poisonous needle will cause a burst of electric shock once a bee approaches. Chin Feng's entire bee was like an untouchable small universe. Bursting out with deadly radiation. Half an hour later, Chin Feng escaped danger several times and the black tail needle pierced the body of the last Inshan worker bee. At the end of the battle, although Chen Feng won, he was still very tired. The system did not detect Chen Feng's life-threatening hand, and did not come out to repair it for Chen Feng. Fortunately, the defense is strong. Otherwise, there is a real possibility of death. Without looking at the corpse on the ground, Chen Feng quickly returned to the hive to replenish his strength. This was just a small team attack, and Chen Feng attacked with all his strength. Next is a large-scale all-out attack. And we must seize the time. Come on, B! All the remaining worker bees knelt in front of Chin Feng. You go and collect all the treasures and elixirs in the territory and bring them back to the lair. Be quick! Chin Feng planned to run away immediately after the hive was upgraded. Ding! The hive upgrade is 89% complete. The upgrade cannot be interrupted. Please pay attention to the host. The worker bees fly out and back again and again but none of the worker bees sent out to set up an ambush came back. Chin Feng couldn't take the risk of sending bees out to search for the enemy. Every minute and every second he had was earned. And the real army might already be on the way. Ding! The hive upgrade is 99% complete. The upgrade cannot be interrupted. Please pay attention to the host. Buzz buzz. Ding! A large number of enemy attacks have been detected 1,000 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. Ding! The hive upgrade is 100% completed. The current hive level is 40 slash 1000. Completeness. The host is open to level 4 qualifications. Ding ding ding. A series of system sounds sounded. And Chen Feng had no time to check. The naked eye has seen the Yin be fly into the territory of the Emperor Spider. And the Emperor Spider has already retreated when it sensed the danger. System. Move the hive. Ding. The hive transfer cooling time has been refreshed. Is the host sure about the transfer? Gone! Transfer! Buzz! The hive was upgraded to level 4 and doubled in size instantly. However, the Inshan Bee did not see the size of the hive before. What it saw in front of it was the hive that had been upgraded. I saw the hive vibrating with a buzz. The flat ground disappears among the branches. The light flickered, and the leaves rustled under the pressure of the wind blowing around. As soon as Chen Feng got out and wanted to explore the territory, he bumped into the King of Beasts, the Whitetail Falcon, who came out to patrol the territory. Gia! The two-meter-wide wings flew through the air, and at a glance, he spotted the hive here and Chen Feng who had just emerged. A white-tailed falcon swoops down. The sharp beak shone with silver light. Cold and murderous. Be and falcon. In front of the falcon, Chen Feng turned into an ant that could easily be crushed to death. The air conditioning swooped down and reached you in an instant. Ding! An enemy attack has been detected 1,000 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. Ding! An enemy attack has been detected 200 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. The system scrolled continuously. And after saying the last word, the white-tailed falcon flew in front of Chen Feng's eyes. Its spread wings were as big as Chen Feng's honeycomb. This, Chen Feng had a fragrance in his heart that he must spit out. Gone! Where did the little bee come from? Before Chen Feng could fight, 
the white-tailed falcon looked at Chen Feng's hive and used its sharp claws to open the hive to see if there was anything good hidden inside. Upon seeing this, Chin Feng quickly flew to the white-tailed falcon and shouted loudly, I am the Black Windy Queen. I came here to pay tribute to you after hearing about your majesty. Your majesty! Hearing the shout, the white-tailed falcon stopped and looked at Chin Feng. Forced by helplessness, Chin Feng shouted because he wanted to keep the hive before making plans. Now he only had one hive left. And the white-tailed falcon was so powerful and huge that he could not shake it now. Oh! The white-tailed falcon became interested. Chapter 31 Spiritual Vein Who doesn't know how to flatter someone? And who doesn't feel comfortable being flattered? After some negotiation with Chin Feng, White-tailed Falcon believed Chin Feng's sincerity. After all, Chin Feng was alone and didn't bring any threats with him. Chin Feng's only worry was that the spiritual treasure hidden inside the hive would be smelled by the White-tailed Falcon. The hive after the upgrade seemed completely different. And no clues were found. It's just that Chin Feng doesn't have time to take a closer look now. In the end, in order to protect Mingzhi, Chin Feng handed over all the honey in the hive. After the upgrade, the honey had reached 90% quality, which made Whitetail Falcon very satisfied. He smacked his lips and left, looking back at Chin Feng before leaving. Now that you're here, let's stay longer. The Whitetail Falcon flew out of sight, and Chin Feng finally took a breath and relaxed his tense mood. Now there is not a drop of honey left. I am hungry and opened the system panel to see the newly upgraded hive. At one glance, Chin Feng's eyes widened. Host, Chin Feng. Level 3. Attack, 50 50 Defense, 50 50 Speed, 50 50 Creativity, 100 slash 100. Evolution points, 30. Skill, Jedi Assassination 856 slash 1000. Jedi Assassination has a 3% probability of paralyzing and paralyzing the target for 5 seconds. The next level is Tianjue. Thunderstorm 200 slash 200. Within one meter of the host's body, there is no difference in thunder attacks. The number of attacks is limited to three, which is equal to the host's own level. Secret technique, death poison needle, for 75 slash 500. Death poison needle can be fired. After the venom is used, it can absorb honey and convert it into venom. If you are hit, you will suffer varying degrees of damage depending on your own strength. Hive level, four, the host level cannot be higher than the hive. Level 4 Hive Integrity 0 slash 1000 For 3rd level worker bees, 10 second level worker bees, 20 first level worker bees, and 50 ordinary worker bees. Transfer cooldown time is 1 month. Hive Defense, 0 out of 10. Hive Attack Power, 0 out of 10. Hive Invisibility, 0 slash 10. The invisibility time is limited by the hive level. Host Strength Improvement, 1 to 1. Once the hive attribute is fully leveled, the host will gain an improvement in its own strength. Secret Palace. The quality of honey is increased by 90%. And the cultivation speed is increased. Five evolution points are provided every day. The alchemy function of the Secret Palace has been turned on. Please accept the alchemy task as soon as possible. Hidden Bee Pavilion. Five fourth level worker bees. 23rd level worker bees. 52nd level worker bees. 100 first level worker bees. And 200 ordinary worker bees are refreshed every day. This is. The hive also has attributes? Can it attack and defend? Awesome. You can also improve your own strength. Not long after he was happy, Chin Feng ran into trouble. This doesn't say how to improve attributes. After not struggling for long, Chin Feng decided to take a look. Now the two upgrade attributes are full, and the strength improvement has been flashing in the system panel. Chin Feng decided to upgrade first. After all, the higher the basic level, the higher the strength will be. Upgrade! Ding! The host attributes are full and meet the upgrade conditions. Buzz! The upgrade was successful. Chin Feng only felt the crackling of the bones and joints in his body. Like the muscles sprouting from his slender little arms and legs. Stretching and crackling. The pain is different. But a kind of smooth relief. Upgrading has never been done before. After the upgrade was completed, Chin Feng felt his body was light. And a halo formed on his hands that made a crackling sound. After the upgrade is completed, predictably, the successful attribute bars have increased to 0 slash 100. Chin Feng didn't have time to sigh and clicked on strength improvement. Buzz! Chin Feng felt a soft sound coming from his body, as if something exploded and filled his body. Bang bang bang. There were continuous sounds in his body, and the pain of tearing and shattering bones made Chin Feng roll on the ground. 
It was as if countless pairs of ghost hands were pulling him toward the abyss. An hour later, if Chen Feng hadn't been a bee without sweat glands, he would have been completely wet. Call! Chen Feng lay on the ground and exhaled, his stomach growling. I saw that the attributes and experience that were originally 0 out of 100 on the attribute panel instantly became 0 slash 500. That's it. Level 3. Attack, 0 slash 500. Defense, 0 slash 500. Speed, 0 slash 500. Creativity, 0 slash 1000. Evolution points, 30. He wanted to complain. But Chin Fong had no energy left. So he still wanted to find something to eat. Of all the little bit. Attack plus 10. Defense plus 10. Speed plus 10. After two days of repair, Chin Fong completely recovered his energy and was full of strength. He vaguely felt that the energy in his body seemed to be condensed. Similar to the human she see, Chin Fong never fought an unprepared battle. After he fully recovered, he planned to explore the surrounding areas. Although this was still the outskirts of the blood forest, it was very different. Blood birches could be seen everywhere here. Chin Fong plans to explore the surrounding area while exploring the development of a newly upgraded level 4 hive. Before leaving the house and flying far, the system prompt sounded. Ding! An enemy attack has been detected 1,000 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. Not waiting for the second report. Jia! The cry came, and the white-tailed falcon had already swooped down and came to Chin Fong. It spread its wings and fluttered twice, and stared at Chin Fong with its vertical pupils. Little bee, your honey tastes good. The white-tailed falcon got right to the point. It was obvious that he was here to get something. Chin Fong understood, but he didn't plan to do it a second time. He was even thinking about how to make him vomit out what he had eaten. On the surface, Chin Fengxiu thought he was a snake. Your Majesty, it's fine if you like it, but as you can see, my hive is only this big and there are only so many worker bees. If you want to try honey again, I'm afraid it will take some time. The white-tailed falcon was not happy when he heard this, but he also knew that he had taken out all the honey before, and he really didn't have any at the moment. How long do you need? One month. It takes every other month to provide you with high-quality honey. You see? Only high-quality can preserve your noble identity, and high-quality takes time to brew. And you, the king, cannot appear frequently. Here in my hive, if you scare my little bees with such force, they will not be able to produce high-quality honey. White-tailed falcon has always been unruly and has not had many friends since he became the king. Now that he was flattered by Chen Feng, he felt very comfortable and happily agreed to Chen Feng's request. Jia! Fly away happily. Chin Feng watched the white-tailed falcon fall two kilometers away and followed it. It's up to you to lead the way and explore your strength. The white-tailed falcon did not patrol the territory anymore. After flying over two mountains with dense bushes, it came to a cliff and flew twice into the wind cave on the cliff. The cave was rugged with strange rocks and very crude. Is this your lair? Chin Feng lay on the rock wall outside the cliff, stretched his head and looked in, finding that the white-tailed falcon had entered the wind tunnel. Chin Feng fluttered his wings and flew in. When he entered the cave, a refreshing breath hit his face, making Chin Feng feel as if he was floating in the clouds and felt as comfortable as a dream. Ding! I found a low-level original spiritual vein. What? What is the spiritual vein? What is its use? Chapter 32 Discovering Upgrade Items While feeling the changes in his body, Chin Feng flapped his wings and flew inside. No matter what it is, Chin Feng will decide it. Entering the cave, Chin Feng lowered the vibration frequency of his wings, making it almost silent. In the dim cave, he could only see a small black shadow moving forward. There are no fork directions in the cave. Just go straight after turning a corner. After about a thousand meters, a stone wall appeared in front of us. No way! It's up there! Chin Feng walked around and found that the end of the road was pointing upwards. Chin Feng roughly drew a map of the mountain in his mind. If he walked in this way and faced up after 1,000 meters, he should be right at the top of the cliff. After winding up for 500 meters, Chin Feng guessed that he had reached the top of the cliff. How much the temperature has dropped. Please! Enemy attack is detected 200 meters ahead. The system voice sounded, and Chin Feng lay down on the rock wall nearby. On the dark and concave rock wall, Chin Feng was small and instantly hid in the darkness, crawling upward slowly. Jia Jia! The call of the white-tailed falcon can already be heard. Chen Feng approached. The tentacles on his head were pushed back, and his head stretched out. Here! 
That kind of comfortable spiritual energy is more abundant. Just staying here makes you feel comfortable. That thing must be here. Is that the spiritual vein? Chin Fong saw that in a circular hollow space above his head, a bell-like white crystal bar grew from the top. The top is crystal clear and exudes a ruby white luster. At this moment, the white-tailed falcon closed its eyes and was immersed in the soft light emitted by the spiritual veins and did not notice Chin Fong. Chin Fong only poked his head out and when the soft light shone on his face, he felt comfortable all over his body as if his body was being washed, undergoing subtle and strange changes. Ding! The host successfully absorbed the original body's spiritual veins and triggered the Beast King's mental method. Tian Chin Star Technique! What the H, L! An unexpected system prompt made Chin Feng stunned. Tian Cheng Xingju. What the H, L is that? Chin Feng quickly opened the system interface and took a look. I only saw that on my attribute interface. There was an additional mental technique in front of my skills. Tian Chin Xingjue, the Beast King's mental technique, which is divided into 10 levels. The first level is, Beast King's Roar, the host needs to improve his ability to cleanse himself to a certain extent and find the spiritual vein before setting off. Hidden Mission Chen Feng quickly came to a conclusion. If I hadn't reached level 4 and hadn't run to the white-tailed falcon's territory due to the Yin Shan Bi's attack, I wouldn't have had such an opportunity. I have eliminated all the weaknesses of the Yin Shan Bi. Ha ha. It's a blessing in disguise. Chen Feng looked at the spiritual veins and then at the white-tailed falcon. This thing is so powerful. No wonder the white-tailed falcon, which is weaker than ordinary birds of prey, can be so strong and become the overlord of the outer forest. If I stayed too long, I would be discovered by a white-tailed falcon, which would cause serious trouble. Chin Feng took one last look at his spiritual veins and flew out silently. Ding! A large number of enemy attacks were discovered a thousand meters away. Chin Feng flew out. It was now evening. The clouds were glowing, and the tired birds were returning to their nests. Outside the white-tailed falcon's cave, countless sparrow falcons are circling and flying. They were all level four and five beasts. About two thousand of them. With Chen Feng's current strength, he could easily hit an egg against a stone. Jie Jie! The falcons were circling in the sky, and Chen Feng's shadow was in the crevices of the rocks, staring at the sky. This beast king has something. After the route was surveyed, and he had a general understanding of the white-tailed falcon's strength, Chen Feng happily circled the white-tailed falcon's power route and reported from the top of the cliff every day. Chen Feng also discovered a crack on the top of the cliff, which happened to lead to the spiritual vein. Only Chen Feng's figure can pass through this crack. Going down is the root of the bell of the spiritual vein. Looking from the bottom up, only the bell can be seen. But from top to bottom, the whole thing can be seen clearly. After getting close to the spiritual vein, the spiritual energy of the spiritual vein flowed out, and a milky white halo instantly surrounded Chen Feng. Chen Feng's system strength and body was like a sponge. The spiritual habits that emerged from his spiritual veins were instantly compressed by the Beast King Tian Chen Xingjue into a size as big as a needle tip and sank into Chen Feng's body. At this time, Chen Feng's strength has been greatly improved through the baptism of his spiritual veins. Although his evolution points add attribute slowly, with each added point, the power contained in it is unmatched before. The level 4 hive has been upgraded at such a high cost. After the upgrade, the evolution points required for expansion have also become five times the original number. It's difficult, but the effect is twice as good. Just the hidden attributes provided by the system made Chen Feng feel a little nervous. This, it's just a matter of luck. Although Chen Feng's Jedi assassinations paralysis and paralysis probability skills trigger rate is low, his overall luck is pretty good. After 23 days of stealing spiritual veins, Chen Feng's worker bees were also regenerated. Now he has 124th level worker bees, 483rd level worker bees, 1200 second level worker bees, 2400 first level worker bees, and 4800 ordinary worker bees. After the honeycomb is upgraded, it has the shape of a sphere as big as 4 cubic meters. At this moment, it is located in the jungle that stretches down the cliff from the white-tailed falcon's nest. Occasionally, the leaves of the blood birch trees fall over, and the ground is covered in red. Buzz buzz. Chin Feng flew back to the nest because the day to hand over honey to the white-tailed falcon was coming. Chin Feng sat on the throne, drinking royal jelly through a straw like a cigarette, while tapping the spiritual treasures he had collected previously, and devoted himself to hive proficiency. Ding! I found the hive upgrade item. Do you want to use it now? Use? Ding ding ding. 
the host successfully used the item. The current integrity of the hive is 660-1000. It was expected, but also unexpected. I knew that the level of these elixirs was quite high, but I didn't expect them to reach such a high level of 660 points. It seems we still need something to break through the key. Chin Feng is still thinking about how to deal with the January period. As long as he has some strength. Chin Feng doesn't want to be threatened so easily. Clicking. Clicking. Tiptoeing to the alchemy room. Ding! The host has surpassed the level of alchemy. And the level of the alchemy room has been raised to level 3. Triggering two second level elixir recipes. Two counterfeit medicine-like objects rolled onto the ground. And Chin Feng reacted. Is this okay? It took Chin Feng a long time to remember that there was an emergency situation in the Dodo -Do Mountains. So he threw all the elixirs he collected into the alchemy furnace. Chin Feng picked up two pills. The properties pop up automatically. By Ling Dan. It requires 100 kinds of gentle herbs with different properties and incompatible properties to be refined. Solidified version. Improves defense and attack power. And can be effective against items. Level 2 unilateral. Violet pill. Holy spirit pill. Chin Feng held the elixir up to his mouth and sniffed it. He made gestures around his mouth for a long time without taking it down. He had big doubts in his heart and was a little doubtful about his own skills. System. This thing. Chin Feng wanted to ask. But before he could finish speaking, the system voice came up again. Ding! I found the hive upgrade item. Can the host use it now? Chapter 33 very speechless. Huh? Use it. Can this also be used? Ding. The host uses the upgraded item successfully. The hive defense plus 2. And the invisibility plus 1. The invisibility time is limited by the hive level. The two pills in his hand turned into two halos of light and melted into the hive. What? Chin Feng stood up with admiration and was surprised to see all the changes and all the foreign language was written by Chin Feng Yu. How can this thing be used like this? Isn't this a fake honeycomb? Chin Feng never expected that the hive's defense and attack would evolve like this. He stamped his feet dubiously, confirming that the hive was really hard and had no life characteristics and was not a living thing. Hive! Ability! Chen Feng finally understood. The complementarity between himself and the hive has been impossible to understand from the moment of binding. He is in the hive, and he is gone! While he relies on the hive to grow, the hive needs him to complete its own evolution. It's okay! Old man! Chin Feng patted the wall of the honeycomb and said, It seems that I need to go to the bullfighting mountains. Regardless of the effects of the other parties, this bailing pill is exactly what I need now. Chin Feng patted the hive wall again, flapped his wings and flew out. There are not many black wind bees flying outside the hive. And the Guangyao group, which all elites still need to reorganize, has been hidden inside the hive by Chin Feng. So the entire hive looks like an abandoned thing. There are only dozens of second level worker bees leading some first level worker bees. And ordinary worker bees doing the work of collecting honey. Everything is done for the white-tailed falcon to see. White-tailed falcon kept the promise and didn't bother him midway. He must be too confident in himself and didn't take Chin Feng seriously at all. Chin Feng's love for flying. Check the system evolution point. 115. The upgrade of the hive was in sight. And now that there were spiritual veins to eat, Chin Feng put all his evolution points into creativity. Host, Chin Feng. Level 4. Attack, 10 slash 500. Defense, 10 slash 500. Speed, 10 slash 500. Creativity, 115 slash 1000. Evolution points, 0. Comrades still need to work hard. After Chen Feng made arrangements, he flapped his wings and flew out. Chen Feng, whose speed has reached level 410 out of 500, can only detect his flight trajectory if his strength is two levels higher than him. Otherwise, he will be able to see a ghost passing by. The entire blood forest is a long oval shape, and to the east of its periphery is the original strength of Black Wind Mountain. The south is connected to Yin Chanfen. Further to the northwest is the Bullfighting Mountains. The cliff of the white-tailed falcon is at the edge of the blood forest, right between the black wind beehive and the Inshan beehive. At the same time, the entire southeastern periphery of the blood forest was suppressed. There were still six days left until the day to hand over honey. Time was running out. Chin Feng flew in a straight line without stopping, heading towards the bullfighting mountains. Buzz buzz! Flying over the nest of their old friend the emperor spider. All the emperor spiders felt as if they had seen a devil when they saw Chin Feng and they were ready to move their territory. The emperor spider fled in all directions, waving its claws. Oh my god! 
It's the Black Wind Queen Bee. This guy is so scary. He will suffer disaster wherever he appears. The Inshan Bee didn't find Shen Feng. So the Queen Bee vented her anger and killed so many surrounding creatures. Run! Get out of here! As soon as this guy shows up, there will definitely be another battle. Chin Fong was so high that he didn't hear the frightened discussion below. I didn't hear it, so I naturally didn't understand why the Emperor's spider suddenly started running wildly. He is only thinking about upgrading the hive attributes now. Whoosh! Speeding up again, flying towards the bull mountains. When Chin Fong arrived at the bullfighting mountains, he flew directly to the bullfighting mountains without disturbing the bee species that had already surrendered to him. Under the fluorescence of the moonlight, the flowers and plants on the Douyu Mountain are lush and dense, and have not been trampled or affected at all. Because of Chen Feng's influence, other bee species automatically turn the Douyu Mountain into Chen Feng's private property. These bees are quite honest! Ding ding ding! The system prompt sounded, and Chen Feng rushed into the flower field without ceremony and started picking again. Buzz buzz! Suddenly, the sound of flapping wings startled me. Chen Feng suddenly raised his head, and looked warily at the sky behind him. Unknowingly, it was densely packed with worker bees. Grass! Chin Feng was shocked. What's going on? We're so close. But the system doesn't prompt you at all. Could it be that the professed worker bees automatically divided themselves into their own side without prompting? It's impossible to prompt them before. Thousands of possibilities flashed through Chin Feng's mind. And his body responded, flapping its wings and flying into the air. After flying into the air, Chin Feng's fear suddenly turned into surprise. The densely packed worker bees that caught my eye were vibrating their wings in the moonlight. They were not other bees, but his glorious bees. Chin Feng was flying in the air, and worker bees were densely lined up in front of Chin Feng. A team of third-level worker bees stepped forward and knelt in front of Chin Feng to express their feelings. King! The Inshan bees scattered us before. We were worried that the Inshan bees would find us when we went out to look for the beehives. So we hid in the bullfighting mountains. I didn't expect that the king would appear in the bullfighting mountains today. The third level glorious worker be requested to return to the team. Behind them, the voices of worker bees begging to return to the team came to mind. Good, Chin Feng said loudly, thinking in his heart. No wonder the system didn't prompt. It turned out to be the worker bees spawned by the system itself. Although they are still alive. Although more than half of them were killed or injured. The power of the remaining worker bees has increased since they came back. It seems that the Inshan Bee didn't get much benefit from that battle. And the elixir was even stolen by me. Ha ha ha. So refreshing. Chin Feng laughed, waved his front foot, and said, You go back to the hive in batches, and be sure not to be discovered. Don't go out after you go back. Just rest and recuperate in the hive. I will make my own arrangements for the rest. Leave 23rd level worker bees to go back with me. Chin Feng felt happy and speeded up the collection of herbs. Originally, he took the time to fly over, intending to stay here for 20 hours, waiting for a batch of elixirs to be prepared, and then collect a batch of herbs and stuff them into the alchemy furnace. Now that the worker bees have returned and have a new arrangement, he can rush there as soon as possible. Gone back. Time was running out, and he needed to explore the roots and defenses around the cliff and make complete preparations. Ding! The host has put in a hundred kinds of herbs. Chin Feng. Whoosh. Chin Feng flapped his wings and flew out, heading straight for the source of the ambergris scent. It was exactly on a shrub hillside 2,000 meters away. There was a strange little tree that looked like a flying dragon's claw and had no leaves. It had a single red fruit on it. Chin Feng rushed out. With his current speed, as long as he was not suppressed at a super level, he would definitely get the dragon fruit. Ding. A large number of enemy attacks have been spotted a thousand meters away. Host, please pay attention. Oh, there's something. Chun Feng, who was flying straight, turned around, lay down behind the leaves of a short shrub, and stuck his head out. Jie, a falcon roar sounded in the air. The ground also rustled. Chin Feng raised his head and saw a white-tailed falcon hovering in the air with a bunch of falcons. But it did not swoop down and immediately grab the dragon-shaped fruit. Chin Feng looked at the ground again and saw that it was occupied by a large group of vipers. Hiss. The viper raised its head, spat out a red letter, and stared at the white-tailed falcon hovering in the sky. The viper king is huge, three meters long, with his half-raised head as tall as a person. The vipers behind him stretch into the blood birch forest. The white-tailed falcon is a level six bird, and the viper king is probably at least level seven. 
The power gap between the two sides is not that big. But the vipers are obviously more numerous and come from the blood birch forest. Chen Feng was glad that the system prompted him in time. And he didn't rush out in a moment of excitement. He wouldn't be afraid of the viper just based on its level. But if it came from the blood birch forest, no matter whether it stepped into the edge of the blood forest, Chin Fong was afraid of it at this moment. Of. At present, the vipers have not launched an attack. But they have not stopped moving. The surrounding vipers are gradually surrounding them. Surrounding the small hills of the dragon-shaped fruit. And gradually narrowing the encirclement. Jia. The white-tailed falcon made a sharp sound. Obviously anxious. And wanted to swoop down several times. The aroma of dragon fruit continues to spread. Chin Fong lay aside. And the current situation was clear at a glance. You haven't been fighting for a long time? Grandpa will help you and send you to the west. When Snipe and Clam fight, Chen Feng shouldn't play too casually. His brain thought quickly, and after a while, Chen Feng had a plan in his mind. He quickly turned back and sent a worker bee back to bring reinforcements. He took 19 worker bees and laid down on the blood birch tree. Buzz buzz. This place was originally not far from the cliff, but the worker bees came back soon bringing with them 200 second-order worker bees and 2,000 first-order worker bees. Strength is not important. What is important is quantity. The quantity that makes the white-tailed falcon think that I have already dispatched all my troops. Attack. Chin Feng gave the order directly. I saw a swarm of black bees in the middle and center of the two forces that were still anxious in the sky and on the ground. They quickly shot out a swarm of black bees. Their bright black tail needles all flashed out and stabbed straight at the low-level vipers in the middle and center of the group of vipers. At the same time, Chen Feng shouted, King Whitetail, let me help you. Buzz. Jie. Hiss. The seemingly balanced situation was instantly broken. The attack from the sky came down, and the snake on the ground waved its tail to wrap up the captured falcon and strangle it. Puff. Laugh. Blood burst out, and the fishy smell instantly filled the shrubs around the dragon-shaped fruit and the fluttering bird feathers flew like snow. Chin Fong didn't care and just rushed forward, catching level 4 vipers and killing them wildly. The appearance of bravely killing the enemy made the white-tailed falcon feel a hint of approval. Looking at the black crowd of worker bees, the white-tailed falcon only felt that it must be more powerful than a tiger. Suddenly, the white-tailed falcon's murderous intention suddenly appeared. It screamed fiercely and swooped down. It grabbed the viper king with its sharp claws and flew up and down. The two kings faced each other. The sixth level is opposite to the seventh level. Although the viper has its own limitations, it is not easy for the white-tailed falcon to attack. The suppression of the opposite level makes the white-tailed falcon suffer. Gia! The white-tailed falcon thought it had spotted the right moment and swooped down. Unexpectedly, the viper king had already planned it. So he just made a feint and flicked its tail hard the moment the white-tailed falcon rushed down. Puff! The white-tailed falcon was shot to the ground. The world on earth is dominated by the snake king. Not to be outdone. The white-tailed falcon showed its sharp claws. The three-meter-long king viper and the two-meter-wide white-tailed falcon fought fiercely in an instant. Although Chin Feng joined. Chin Feng pretended not to attack. Buzz buzz. Two thousand first-order worker bees are gnawing around a snake. And two hundred second-order worker bees are gnawing around a snake. The tail needle stabs in. Pulls out. And one snake must be completely dead before it attacks the next one. It looks slow, but the effects are remarkable. A delicate balance emerged from the originally overwhelming forces. After Chin Feng stabbed the level 4 viper to death again, he spread his wings and came to the place where the viper king and the white-tailed falcon were fighting. Chin Feng looked up and saw that the dragon-shaped fruit on the hill was dazzlingly red. The white-tailed falcon was covered in blood, and the viper king's iron skin was covered with scratches. Buzz buzz buzz! The two parties trembled. Chin Feng came behind the viper king and his tail needle flashed. Desperate sting! Call out! The tail needle bounced on the copper skin of the Viper King. Under the level suppression, Chen Feng's poisonous needle was unable to do anything to the Viper King. The sneak attack from behind failed. The Viper King was covered in wounds. And Chen Feng would not say that he hit the intact iron sheet on purpose. The Viper King was extremely angry. His eyes were scarlet red. He turned his head and swept towards him. Bang! It hit Chen Feng, and he was instantly knocked back a hundred meters before stopping. His body was shaken, and he almost fell to the ground and couldn't fly. But Chin Feng's attack also created an opportunity for the white-tailed falcon. The white-tailed falcon took the opportunity to fly up, 
stretched out its sharp claws, and grabbed the Viper King seven inches, temporarily pressing the Viper King to the ground. The Viper King quickly reacted and rolled up its tail to wrap around the white-tailed falcon. For a time, neither party could benefit from it, and they couldn't separate their hands to seize the treasure. The white-tailed falcon dragged the Viper King, feeling extremely anxious. Every moment longer was a risk. For monsters like them who rely on treasures to practice. Treasures are strength. Chapter 35 Attacking in the East and Attacking in the West Buzz Buzz! Chin Feng's figure appeared in the eyes of the white-tailed falcon. And the white-tailed falcon felt its eyes light up. Quick! Seize the dragon-shaped fruit cliff! Originally, the white-tailed falcon was not worried about Chin Feng. But seeing that Chin Feng was willing to risk his own life to help him. Presumably Chin Feng had truly surrendered to his power. The white-tailed falcon shouted. Chin Feng smiled in his heart, but didn't show it on his face. He fluttered his wings and flew towards the red fruit on the hill without hesitation. Chin Feng picked the fruit easily, holding the red fruit as big as his own body without any difficulty. Call out! Chen Feng, whose speed was also level 4, disappeared in front of the beast in an instant. Not even a black spot could be seen. Also disappearing with Chen Feng was the black wind bee who appeared together. The dragon-shaped fruit was picked, but the viper was able to completely suppress it and watched it being picked. The viper king roared, opened its bloody mouth and bit the white-tailed falcon. The other vipers wanted to break away from the battle and chase Chen Feng, but were pulled into the battle by the chasing moth falcon. Chen Feng quickly evacuated with the dragon-shaped fruit, but the direction he flew was not the cliff, but his own hive. The edge of the blood birch tree was not far from the cliff. Half an hour later, Chen Feng flew back to the nest. Time was running out. Chen Feng threw the dragon-shaped fruit on the throne as soon as he landed, quickly opened the system panel, and added all the evolution points he had just filled to creativity. Originally, he thought the upgrade would not be so fast. But now the evolution points are scarce. Just now Chen Feng was fighting and increasing. And now, he would only have 112-1000 evolution points. Ding! I found an upgrade item! Do you want to use it? Use? Chen Feng is busy now. Operating the system, and taking out the newly refined bailing pill at the right time. Ding! The Tian level middle grade spiritual fruit dragon shaped fruit was used successfully. And the hive integrity reached 1000 slash 1000. Ding! The item is used successfully. Hive defense plus 2. Attack plus 1. Mid level heaven level. No wonder he's so strong like crazy. Chin Fong was stunned for a moment. He didn't expect this fruit to be of such a high grade. But what he likes will eventually come into his hands. But now is not the time to be happy. Chin Fong calmed down the excitement in his heart and quickly opened the attribute panel to check. Ding! The integrity of the hive is full. Enough to upgrade now. Emmy! Chin Feng looked at the creation point, and took a deep breath of the fragrance. Judging from past experience, creativity is the success rate. Now this creativity is equivalent to a success rate of only 0.112%. Too special. So low. But Chin Feng had no choice. The white-tailed falcon would soon find out that the dragon-shaped fruit was missing and would definitely attack in force. Even if Chin Feng hit his strength, Chin Feng's hive would be vulnerable to a large number of raptors. Taking a step forward is death, and taking a step back is also death. I, Chin Feng, have no time to back down. Upgrade! It's this 0112% that's blocked. When Chin Feng called for upgrade, the system did not respond immediately. It delayed for a full minute, and only sounded when Chin Feng thought it had failed. Ding! The host has been upgraded successfully. The estimated upgrade time is 5 hours. It cannot be interrupted during the period. The current completion level is 1%. Gone! It's so, so exciting. Although Chen Feng was used to seeing big waves, he couldn't help but feel overwhelmed at this moment. There is a 0112% probability that labor and management will hit each other. Who are you talking about labor and capital being evil? Labor and capital will definitely kill him. The paralysis probability of Jedi assassination is just a fake skill. With the honeycomb upgrade, Chin Feng can ignore this side for the time being. But the upcoming enemies will have to find a way to deal with them. Chin Feng flew out of the hive. And there was already a crowd of worker bees kneeling in darkness outside the hive. Now that the hive has certain defense and counterattack capabilities, it only needs to hold back the white-tailed falcon so that the hive can be upgraded and improved. Chin Feng immediately divided the worker bees into three groups. One group formed a ball shape and intercepted the white-tailed falcon on its way. The second group divided into two teams, harassing the white-tailed falcon's team 
and biting their tails to make dumplings. The third group stayed behind to guard the hive and capture the dense forest to delay. Twenty level four worker bees will come out to follow me. At this time, the white-tailed falcon finally got rid of the battle with the viper king and returned to the cliff with a disabled body, waving its wings. When he saw the coal pots and stoves on the cliff, with no worker bees left, he let out a violent cry. Gia! No matter how stupid Whitetail Falcon is, he still understands that he has been deceived by Chen Feng. Still under his nose, the angry Whitetail Falcon's shrill voice resounded throughout the cliff. Hearing the king's call, the falcons flew out crazily, densely packed in the air. Gia! In a shrill scream, the Whitetail Falcon took the lead, followed by countless spur falcons, all flying towards Chen Feng's hive. At this time, Chin Feng had already taken precautions. Although the precautions were weak, Chin Feng led 24th level worker bees, excited for several seconds, and flew towards the cliff at extremely fast speeds. Chin Feng was small in number and was flying at a low altitude. It was not until he reached the cliff that Chin Feng suddenly lifted up and flew to the top of the cliff. At the entrance to the crack in the spiritual veins, Chin Feng didn't stop, and the bees quickly got in one after another. You pick up my nest! And I'll blow up yours. Let's see who's tougher than who. Chin Feng took the lead and got into the small space of the spiritual veins. When the army of falcons came out of the cave, the white-tailed falcons did not relax the defense of the nest. Instead, they strengthened the guard of the spiritual veins. Just at the entrance of the main entrance of the spiritual veins, there were two fifth-level falcon guards. Masato didn't notice that there had been a bee attack and was still discussing the spiritual veins in a low voice. Ha <laughs> ha. Although we are so far apart, the spiritual pulse is clear through it. It feels so comfortable. Yes. Yes. It would be great if we could get closer. Maybe we could reach the sixth level soon. No wonder the king is so precious. Still want to get closer. I don't want my life. Hey. I'm just talking. I don't dare. Chin Feng led the worker bees to fly down. With their strength, it was actually a bit difficult to easily capture Zhong Ru. Thunderstorm. Since Chin Feng upgraded, he has never used Thunderstorm in order to preserve his strength. Now, not only has his level been improved, but he has also been forged with the Beast King's mental skills. As soon as Thunderstorm was used, although the number of attacks remained unchanged, the power changed drastically. I saw Chin Feng reaching his tentacles, and a burst of electricity flashed out. Boom! Within one meter of Chin Feng's body, a thunder and lightning ball formed and exploded instantly and the exploded electric sparks hit the bell. The bell vibrated, and gravel fell down. Chin Feng felt happy, with the power of the cover. It was only a matter of time before the spiritual veins were blown up. The roaring sound immediately attracted the guarding Ma Falcon. But Chin Feng ignored his plan to have a large battle, and used Thunderstorm again. Coax. The spiritual veins vibrated directly. Seeing this, Ma Falcon's heart and liver trembled. If this thing fell, not to mention their lives, the bodies would probably not be saved. Jia Jia! Ma Falcon roared and attacked Chin Feng. Chapter 36 Playing with Birds Little Bee Thieves! It's the Black Wind Bee! They broke in! Alert! Alert! Two fifth-level worker bees that were close together roared, and five more fifth-level worker bees rushed in from the outside, surrounding Chin Feng and Ling Mai. Chin Feng didn't know whether to live or die, and was not afraid of the fifth-level falcon. His body flashed with lightning and made a sizzling sound. Suddenly, Chin Feng focused his eyes and spotted a falcon, fluttering his wings and flying towards it. Shadow attack! Thunderstorm! In front of Chin Feng, the Ma Falcon that was being approached was like a sparrow waiting to be slaughtered. The thunder and lightning blasted Ma Falcon's whole body into numbness instantly. Seizing the opportunity, Chin Feng struck directly at the opponent's head with a shadow attack. The size difference is too big, but Chin Feng is extremely fast. Ding! The host kills the 5th level Ma Falcon and obtains Evolution Point 2. 24th level Worker Bees, now 1 tenth of Chen Feng's attribute strength, quickly surrounded a 5th level Falcon. Their tail needles all showing out, and their knee coordination was perfect. Wah! 10 of them lured 10 more to attack, and all of them stabbed into the eyes of the Mahal Falcon, killing the other one on the spot. There were a total of 7 Falcons. Two of them were killed in an instant, and the remaining 5 were so frightened that their wings trembled. Looking at the bell that was still falling off, the last falcon finally realized that it was not the black wind bee at all. The opponent fluttered his wings, turned around, rushed out of the cave, 
and went to report the news to the white-tailed falcon. A falcon ran away. But Shin Feng did not send bees to chase it. What he wants is this kind of effect. Compared with the spiritual fruit that he cannot get. The spiritual veins must be more important. After letting one go, Shin Feng no longer delayed. It fluttered its wings and approached. And the thunderstorm exploded like a ball of light. The cold shield formed by Ma Falcon instantly could not withstand the full blow of the thunderstorm. Before using thunderstorm, Chin Feng would feel tired within a short time. Now with Tian Chen Xingjue, he could explode five falcon heads without feeling out of breath. I don't know what power the Beast King's roar will have. There was no time for Chin Feng to think too much. After quickly taking care of the remaining Ma Falcons, Chin Feng directly added evolution points to his creativity. Thunderstorm! Chin Feng continued to use critical strikes, and the lightning on his tentacles sizzled and crackled in the middle of the spiritual veins. The place was completely scorched, and gravel was falling away. The milky white halo at the tip of the spiritual vein was now shining silver like a diamond. Trembling. If the spiritual veins would fall and break, Chin Fong ordered 20 worker bees to form a bee net to catch it below. Crack dash! The thunderstorm struck with one blow, and the bell stones connected to the spiritual veins all broke in the middle. The spiritual vein was too big for Chin Fong, and it was impossible to return the same way. At this time, the white-tailed falcon mobilized his army to attack his nest. All of them were mobilized, leaving only basic guards on the cliff. Chin Feng led the worker bees to fly out of the cave with a sting. On the road, I encountered one or two falcons of only two or three levels, but Chin Feng took care of them in a few moments. Buzz buzz. After Chin Feng flew out, he quickly asked the 19 bees to carry the spiritual veins back to the hive and continued to fly close to the ground, passing through the cover of the bushes. There was only one bee left and quickly went back to lead the remaining worker bees to fight Chen Feng. This was originally an unplanned matter. And Chen Feng made a temporary decision. The hive is still being upgraded and it will take time. During this time, he will accompany the white-tailed falcon for a good brushing. Now that I've finished playing, I'm going to let the white-tailed falcon have enough fun. He wanted white-tailed falcon to understand that he, Chen Feng, was not so easy to threaten or exploit. At this time, after being blocked by Chen Feng's roadblock, he finally found the right path. But when he encountered the first and second groups of worker bees arranged by Chen Feng to make dumplings, the messenger who reported the news finally caught up with the large army. Your Majesty! Oh no! Your Majesty! Your spiritual veins have been attacked! Your Majesty! If the white-tailed falcon is an explosive oil barrel, then Chen Feng is the explosive bag that ignites the oil barrel. Spiritual veins? That is the white-tailed falcon's real name. Its capital for dominance. If it loses its spiritual veins, it will lose its continuous supply of spiritual energy. And the Ma Falcon power will soon be swallowed up by other growing forces. White-tailed falcon knows this well. Therefore, as soon as he heard that Chin Feng took the opportunity to steal the spiritual veins, the white-tailed falcon's entire fur exploded. And the feathers on its head exploded and stood up. The entire army returns to support. Hurry! Chen Feng's battle was not only about the time difference, but also about the reaction speed of his respective teams. But if a bird wants to compete with human beings in cunning, it will be completely defeated. Although Chen Feng is a bee now, he still has a human soul in his heart. The white-tailed falcon led the huge group of falcons, directly gave up the attack on the hive, and began to return to defend the cliff nest. And there, there was another wave of worker bees arranged by Chen Feng waiting for him. Falcons are not birds of prey that can fly long distances. In the raptor world, falcons are considered small. But in this other world, white-tailed falcons can grow up to two meters wide. He had just experienced the viper battle. After returning, he flew to the hive without stopping. Now, he was forced to return to defense and fly back, including the white-tailed falcon. Everyone was very tired. Chen Feng, on the other hand, led the entire hive and waited in high spirits. But Chen Feng didn't give him any pleasure. The jungle under the cliff is Chin Feng's best cover. Ding! A large number of enemy attacks have been detected 1,000 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. Coming! Chin Feng ordered the worker bees to form groups of 10. Ding! A large number of enemy attacks were discovered 200 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. Attack! Then under the cover of bushes, the worker bees flew straight up in a group, grabbed a falcon, and stabbed it with its tail needle quickly. The blow was successful. The black wind bees cooperated perfectly and did not want to fight. If it is hit, it will retreat. If there is an attacking Mahal Falcon, 
Another group that is always ready will attack directly. The cycle goes like this. Cover. White-tailed falcon was ambushed by Chen Feng and was furious. The falcon circling high in the sky became densely packed and swooped down collectively. However, in front of the bushes, the worker bees are small and can easily scatter. Once the falcon takes off again, it will gather together for the next round of attack. The first and second teams were originally arranged by Chen Feng. At this time, they had their hands free. And after arranging some return defenses, they all came to fight Chen Feng. For a moment, under the cover of low shrubs, the carcasses of the white-tailed hawk spread out on the shrubs. The white-tailed falcon was so angry that it howled in the air. Jia! Jia! Chen Feng hid in a thorn bush. Crawling around leisurely, it flapped its wings twice, as if it was about to fly out, and then laid down on a thorn as if it was too lazy to move. The white-tailed falcon flew down directly, stopped outside and stared at Chen Feng, wanting to use its eye knife to cut Chen Feng into pieces. Hand over your spiritual veins! I'll spare your life! Otherwise, Chen Feng couldn't bear to hear these words. He was always a soft-spoken person. If others beg him, he will consider it. If it is forceful, then I'm sorry. The thing Chen Feng is not afraid of the most is threats. Chapter 37 Drawing Fire from Under the Cauldron Chen Feng rested his front feet on the back of his head and grinned at the white-tailed falcon outside. Is the whole world the land of the king? And the shores of the land are the king's ministers. Do you understand? The white-tailed falcon didn't understand what he was saying. It pecked the thorns with its angry beak. Seeing that the thorns were about to be pecked away, Chen Feng calmly took a few steps back. The angry white-tailed falcon ignored the pain and started to squirm. Grasp. He vowed to dig out Chen Feng. Ding! The hive upgrade is 98% complete and is expected to be completed in half an hour. The system sound sounded, and Chen Feng smiled even brighter. He stretched out his front paws to wave to the white-tailed falcon, turned around and stayed close to the ground, and flew away. The worker bees received the order, and the black mass instantly broke into pieces, then took cover and disappeared in place. The white-tailed falcon is confused. Jia, Jia! Find it for me! I have to dig three feet into the ground to get Chen Feng out. I just want to see his behead, not other body parts. Letting out an angry roar, he had already forged an undying grudge with Chen Feng. Chen Feng quickly flew back to the nest, followed by other worker bees. The assembly was completed half an hour later, which was when the hive upgrade was completed. Ding! The host upgraded the hive successfully. The current hive level is 5. The cooldown time for hive transfer has been reset. Do you want to transfer the host now? Transfer! There was too much information to read. So Chen Feng directly clicked on transfer. After the upgrade was completed, the hive, which was as big as a 20 square meter room, made a buzzing sound and disappeared in two seconds. Chen Feng felt his figure flicker. What flies out of the hive and comes into view is the original nest of the emperor spider in the Bata cave. This, even though the hive has been upgraded, the distance it can move has not increased. It's back again. Chen Feng was afraid of offending the system so he only dared to complain in his heart. In fact, Chin Feng himself is an actor and wants to act. So even if he complains about it, the system won't care. The Emperor Spider couldn't stand the constant anger and persecution of the Yin Shan Bi, so it was forced to migrate. Chin Feng didn't know this yet. Chin Feng lay on the throne, holding a straw between his feet and sipping royal jelly while opening the system panel. Host, Chin Feng. Level 4. Attack, 10-500. Defense, 10 slash 500. Speed, 10 slash 500. Creativity, 124 slash 1000. Evolution points, 3. The Beast King's Mental Technique, Tian Cheng Singju. The first level of Beast King's Roar, 1 out of 10. Skill, Jedi Assassination 961 slash 1000. Jedi Assassination has a 3% probability of paralyzing and paralyzing the target for 5 seconds. The next level is Tianjue. Split the Sky 2 slash 1000 within one meter of the host's body, there is no difference in thunder attacks. The number of attacks is limited to four, which is equal to the host's own level. Secret Technique, Death Poison Needle, 489-500. Death Poison Needle can be fired. After the venom is used, it can absorb honey and convert it into venom. If you are hit, you will suffer varying degrees of damage depending on your own strength. Hive Level, 5, the host level cannot be higher than the hive. Level 5 Hive Integrity 0 slash 2000. Number of Worker Bees, 5755. Has a Sphere of Influence, 
bullfighting mountains. The transfer cooling time is one month. And the hive can be transferred to a fixed point with coordinates. Hive defense, 4 out of 10. Hive attack power, 2 out of 10. Hive invisibility, 0 slash 10. The invisibility time is limited by the hive level. Host strength improvement, 0 to 1. Once the hive attribute is fully leveled, the host will gain an improvement in its own strength. Secret palace, the quality of honey is increased by 100%. And the cultivation speed is increased. 10 evolution points are provided every day. The alchemy function of the secret palace has been turned on. Please accept the alchemy task as soon as possible. Hidden Bee Pavilion, 24th level worker bees, 53rd level worker bees, 102nd level worker bees, 501st level worker bees, and 1000 ordinary worker bees are refreshed every day. God's favorite pavilion, 1 out of 100. The trigger condition is hidden. God's family pavilion? What the H L is this? It looks like something that specifically triggers hidden tasks. It needs to be triggered by certain places and things. Chin Fong glanced at it and lost interest. It's okay not to mention the world of looking at faces. However, the hive has been upgraded to level 5. And Hidden Bee Pavilion does not show the refresh of level 5 worker bees. Chin Fong was in a dilemma. Worker bees were equal to their strength. Chin Fong had already realized how powerful a high level worker bee was. But now, he did not refresh it. After thinking about it, Chin Fong could only think of one reason. That is, his own level is only 4. And the system cannot spawn worker bees with a higher level than him. Currently, the only place outside the blood forest that has not been stabbed by Chin Fong is the north. In Chin Feng's fear of influence, there are still a large group of high-level subordinates that can be upgraded by Chin Fong. Chin Fong immediately thought of Yin Shan Bi. Chin Fong clasped his chin with his front foot, his mind running rapidly. The Emperor Spider's nest is closer to the Lion Shan Bi. According to the Yin Shan Bi's vengeful character, it must not have given up searching for Chin Fong. Chin Fong doesn't like to be passively beaten. He only likes to take the initiative. After thinking about this, Chin Fong grinned. He still remembered the elixirs and treasures accumulated in the huge space in the Yin Shan Beehive. After finishing all this, Chin Fong remembered that he had also taken away the white-tailed falcon's spiritual veins and immediately asked the worker bees to carry the spiritual veins into the hive hall. Ding! The host has triggered the hidden conditions of the Divine Familiar Pavilion. Fusion! Do you want to fuse now? What the H, L? Chin Fong couldn't believe it. The hive's appetite was so big that it even ate the spiritual veins? Chin Fong was a little embarrassed. The fused handle would have no spiritual veins. His own beast king mentality still needed the support of the spiritual veins. If the unfused handle was not fused, he was curious about what would happen if the hive ate the spiritual veins. Itchy. It's so itchy. Chin Fong looked at the spiritual veins and took a big mouthful of honey. I finally made up my mind and threw myself on the ground. What the HL? Labor and management want to see if you want to go against the will or something else. Integrate. Ding. The hive has successfully fused with the primary spiritual veins. Ding. The honeycomb throne is successfully inlaid with primary spiritual veins. Invisibility function plus 10. Ding. Divine favor pavilion 2 out of 100. Trigger condition is hidden. Hearing the system prompt. Chin Feng's mouth froze in shock. He stretched his legs and climbed to the throne to sit down. The unique and refreshing breath of the spiritual veins emerged, forming a white mist that enveloped Chin Feng. Chin Feng felt it for a while, then moved his butt and buttocks away. The white mist disappeared, as if it had never appeared. Obviously, only when Chin Feng is sitting on the throne at this time, the spiritual veins will be emitted to nourish Chin Feng's body. Chin Feng stretched out his slender front legs, facing the throne and tried his best to give a thumbs-up gesture. What a good old man. You are in trouble. Ha ha ha. Well done. From now on, just lie down on the throne and sleep. Okay. Now we can go see our old friend in Sean B. It was already getting late, so Chin Fong didn't take it with him. After arranging the hive matters, he flew out directly and headed towards Inshan Mountain. When flying over the Black Wind Beehive, there were no rags as expected, but there were a lot fewer worker bees and there were a few slender figures flying around in it. Apparently during the month that Chin Fong left, the Black Wind Beehive had been occupied by the Yin Shan Bees. Chapter 38 Meeting Ceremony Buzz Buzz At night, Chin Fong relied on his night vision ability to fly out unimpeded. If he doesn't want to be discovered by others, others will only feel the breeze in the air. In the entire blood forest periphery, there was basically no one who could catch Chin Fong. 
but the queen bee of Yin Shan is still unknown, which has always worried Chin Feng. The night was dark, without light or moon. Chin Feng hovered over the black wind beehive and found that the black wind bee was still forced to work, bumping into the hive mindlessly. Chin Feng landed and stopped at the top of the black wind beehive. The situation of the entire hive can be seen at a glance. There were four third order Yin Shan worker bees at the entrance, and two teams of fourth order worker bees outside the hive. Chin Feng stood on the top of the hive, and two third order worker bees below were guarding the door. The vigilance of the worker bees was already low at night, but the Inshan bees were even more relaxed at this time. And no bee was found standing on the top of the hive. If it is daytime, you can find a black queen bee spread out on the top of the hive, even with her legs crossed. The Inshan bee's defense is too weak. According to the Inshan bee's usual revengeful mentality, it would be impossible to send only this few manpower to guard the black wind beehive. Watching the black wind bees buzzing around in the black wind beehive, Chen Feng felt a little unhappy. Chen Feng considers himself not a good bee, but if someone bullies him, he will only be worse than others. At this time, the moon was dark and the wind was high. A battle is brewing in the direction of the cliff. The white tailed falcon lost his wife and lost his troops. The viper king was never the one who suffered losses. Wherever he suffered a loss, a big hole would be created. The viper king gathered all his men and they were densely packed within a radius of five miles, like a carpet spread by snakes, head towards the cliff. When the white-tailed falcon was searching vigorously for Chen Feng, the rear defense was weak, and the Viper King almost took over. The Viper King is powerful. When he reappeared after losing the first battle, he was directly promoted to a level. However, he was unable to fly. The white-tailed falcon lost its spiritual veins, and its own power was greatly reduced. It no longer dared to fight against the Viper King and was forced to hover in the air. Only when flying far away from the nest can it rest. After causing such a big trouble and getting nothing out of it, the white-tailed falcon wanted to tear Chin Feng into pieces when he thought of the culprit of all this. Jie Jie! The white-tailed falcon soars in the sky, not missing any disturbance. Look for me. Even if you search the entire blood forest, you must find Chin Feng for me. Chin Feng was calm and unhurried at this moment. Let me give you a little gift first. Chin Feng flew straight down. He had recently felt that his Jedi assassination skills had loosened up a bit. This feeling is like a bamboo shoot about to burst out of the picture and grow into a green bamboo. The previous levels and experience are all a kind of accumulation. And what you get in the end will definitely not be bad. Chin Feng clicked on the attributes. Skill. Jedi Assassination 866-1000. Jedi Assassination has a 3% chance of paralyzing and paralyzing the target for 5 seconds. The next level is Tianjue. Jedi Assassination. After being nourished by 90% quality honey and running the mind of the Beast King, Chin Feng used Jedi Assassination again, and a light and shadow flashed one meter away. The heads of two third level worker bees rolled down silently. As soon as the attack started, Chin Feng did not stop, spread his wings and flew close to the ground, and instantly flashed behind the two small pairs of fourth level worker bees guarding the hive. Jedi Assassination. The critical attack came again, and before a total of 24th level worker bees could react, they lay on the ground with their heads missing. Chin Feng opened his bow without turning back, and directly cleared away all the Inshan bees that were patrolling and controlling the Black Wind beehive. They were all killed with one move, and their heads were missing. Chin Feng acted quickly, and did not expose himself in front of any bees. Call out! It's just too weak. I can't even practice more to become more proficient. At the same level 4. It's not that others are too weak, but that Chen Feng is too strong. I'm sorry to complain, but if the Inshan Queen Bee finds out, she will be so angry that she vomits blood. He flew away from the Black Wind Beehive and headed directly to the Inshan Beehive. Chen Feng is not worried that the Inshan Queen Bee will discover what is going on in the Black Wind Beehive. Now that he is hiding, even if he is discovered, he will not be found for a while. Flying all the way, Chen Feng became even more strange. It stands to reason that the Inshan Bee will patrol the surrounding areas of its territory no matter what. It is extremely disciplined and alert. The reason why I was able to break out of the Inshan Beehive was entirely due to the blessing of attributes and the Inshan Bee's uncertainty about its own abilities. In Chen Feng's opinion, if it weren't for the white-tailed falcon size and spiritual veins, who would be the designated king of the peripheral forest? If this happens again like before, I will never be able to escape. Chen Feng can be sure. Call out! The Black Wind Beehive is only 50 miles away from the Inshan Beehive. With Chen Feng's current speed, 
it can be reached in less than half an hour. In the dark night, there was a slight breeze, which slowly made the bushes rustle. Chin Fong was lying on a big tree closest to the Inshan Beehive. The Inshan Beehive is a little too quiet, abnormal and demonic. Chin Fong never plays his cards according to common sense. And if you act erroneously, he will take a closer look. Chin Fong fluttered his wings and approached, only to vaguely see a black dot moving in the dark night. Buzz buzz, flying closer. Chin Fong heard the sound of some Inshan bees flying. But why were they flying so late at night? As Chin Fong approached, the hive of Inshan bee realm fell into his eyes. Ding! 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 A hive upgrade item was found a thousand meters away. Please pay attention to the host. You guys are still thinking about other people's treasures. When Chin Fong heard the system prompt, he couldn't help but tease the system. But the system had no other response. Ding! An enemy attack has been detected 200 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. Sure enough, the Inshan bees have decreased a lot. Chin Fong hid for a while and flew in. In this way, he soon arrived at the warehouse nest of Inshan Bee, where a large number of treasures were placed. At this time, there were only a few guards patrolling the outer edges of Inshan Mountain, and the inside seemed to have been hollowed out. There was not a single worker bee, and only in important locations of the hive were any guards found. The ones left behind are the higher level worker bees of the fifth or sixth level. Chin Fong was hiding behind a leaf. It was not appropriate to expose his whereabouts at this time. But Chin Fong did not intend to leave. There's something fishy. If there is nothing, the queen bee of Inshan would not be able to send such high level worker bees to defend the nest. But if there is another conspiracy, then where are the other worker bees? And the queen bee, I didn't see it last time. And she doesn't seem to be here this time either. Chin Fong held his breath and concentrated, then immersed himself in the gaps of the hive in the dark night. The Inshan Beehive is built on the entire side of the Inshan Mountain. The mountain is a small groove, and the Inshan Mountain becomes a natural barrier on the left side of the Inshan Beehive. The Queen Bee's main nest is located at the outside, and the treasure storehouse is at the innermost location. The rest of the hive spread directly across the entire side of Inshan Mountain. If you want to attack, you can also go directly over Inshan Mountain and go straight to the warehouse. Taking advantage of the absence of Inshan bees, Chin Fong quickly touched the nest of Inshan bees thoroughly. Chin Fong was curious and tasted Inshan honey. Chapter 39, Empty the Family Fortune. Pooh! What kind of honey is this? It tastes so bad? The honey next to it was naturally incomparable to the 90% quality honey from the system. Chin Fong deliberately stabbed the hive containing the honey. The honey was left ticking, but it didn't attract the Inshan bees' inspection. Inshan was completely impressed by Chin Fong. Except for the narrow entrance. The inside was like a gourd. Chin Fong came here to find out. He didn't get any useful information and didn't plan to leave. He continued to stay in the Inshan beehive. After dawn, Chin Fong hid on the queen bee's nest. The entire queen bee nest is currently guarded by only two fifth level worker bees. Buzz buzz. After a while. After dawn, the sound of a large group of worker bees vibrating their wings was heard. Ding! There are a large number of enemies attacking 1,000 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. Came back? Sure enough, Chin Fong lowered his tentacles and lay down in the gap at the top of the hive. Not long after, a queen bee flew in from the outside of Inshan Mountain surrounded by overwhelming worker bees. Ding! An enemy attack has been detected 200 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. The queen bee is at the 7th level, and there are about 2,000 other 6th level bees. And then... There are generally fifth level worker bees. Sure enough, the fourth level worker bees, like the Black Thorn Queen, are all sent out to do odd jobs. And the really capable ones stay in the hive. With this strength, today's Chin Fong can't beat him. Buzz buzz. The Queen Bee of Inshan took the lead and flew directly into the nest. Except for the six sixth level worker bees that followed the Queen Bee of Inshan back to the main nest. The rest of the worker bees flew back to their respective nests. For a time, the whole Inshan mountain became lively again. Chin Fong dug a hole on the top of the main hive. And the membrane in the middle happened to be the top of the Queen Bee Hall. So, found a bristle pig. Hunted it, and threw it in the alchemy furnace. Near the blood ant's lair. After the first bloodthirsty ant discovered the dead bristle pig, other ants quickly rushed over. Surrounded the bristle pig, and lifted it up densely. Preparing to move it into the cave. Chin Fong flew in the air. A smile appeared on his lips and his eyes lit up, like an evil ghost who saw a feast. The wings vibrated and swooped down, 
Jedi assassination. Swish. 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 The skill upgraded from the most basic has no cooldown time and can instantly kill 5 second level bloodthirsty ants. Although the level is low, it has a proficiency of 0-5 when used. In order to lift the huge bristle pig, thousands of bloodthirsty ants were dispatched. Chin Fong was stuck on the back road. And whenever he was surrounded by bloodthirsty ants, he would use split the sky. The thunderstorm had not been used since it was upgraded. Once it was used, the explosion sound startled Chin Fong. It was like lightning falling from the sky. And it exploded directly on the ground, causing splash damage. Originally, Split Sky only had four targets due to level restrictions. But the splash damage is indeed unlimited. And the damage is half of the hit target. Chin Fong dived to the ground. And the corpses of the bloodthirsty ants he killed piled up into a hill. At this moment, the bloodthirsty ants felt real despair. They couldn't fight again and again. And they couldn't run away. They would die faster if they resisted. Ding! The host skill is Jedi Assassination 1000-1000. Do you want to upgrade it now? As the system sound announced, Chen Feng finally stopped, vibrated his wings and flew away while whistling. Only two hours have passed. Chen Feng originally wanted to practice his sky-splitting proficiency and death sting. But after flying away, he couldn't find another spirit wherever he went. Chen Feng had no choice but to give up and fly back to Dodo Mountain. Chen Feng clicked on the attribute panel and looked at the flashing skills. Upgrade! Chapter 40 Shantian Sword Shadow Ding! The host skill Jedi Assassination has been successfully upgraded. Because the spiritual energy has a dual effect. It has been upgraded to Shantian Sword Shadow. The Sword Shadow has a 10% chance of paralyzing and paralyzing the target for one second. Shantian Sword Shadow? Chin Fong was confused for a moment and couldn't wait to use Shantian Sword Shadow. Swish! 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 The area within 10 meters from Chin Feng's body was controlled by Chin Feng's thoughts and two waves of murderous aura the size of steel needles flew out like a phantom. Cut off blades of grass in an instant. Okay. Ding. The refining of the bailing pill is completed. After the system prompts, Chin Fong quickly collects the herbs needed for a bailing dan and throws them into the alchemy furnace, vibrating his wings and flying back to the hive. Ding. The host uses the bailing pill, the hive defense plus two, and the attack plus one. Check the hive. Ding. Hive level, 5. Hive defense, 6 out of 10. Hive attack power, 3 out of 10. Hive invisibility, October 10th, invisibility time is limited by hive level. Host strength improvement, 0 to 1. Once the hive attribute is fully leveled, the host will gain an improvement in its own strength. Chin Feng lay on the throne, drank enough honey, and after running the Beast King's mind technique for a week, he felt that the spiritual energy in his body was even more abundant. The time is at night. Chin Fong ordered 2,000 worker bees and disappeared in the direction of the Inshan bees under the moonlight again, flying over the black wind beehive. It was quiet and peaceful at the moment. The road was smooth and there were no Inshan bee patrols. The plan begins. Ding! A large number of enemy attacks were discovered 1,000 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. Inside the Inshan mountain, a large number of flapping wings sounded. Chin Fong led the worker bees to lie on a big tree outside the Inshan mountain to give the Inshan bees a path. Not long after, a large number of overwhelming worker bees flew up from the inside of In mountain, gathered for a moment, and then flew towards the blood birch forest. Within half an hour, I was completely gone. Once the main team left, there were only two small teams left inside Inshan, guarded by less than 200 worker bees. Chin Fong quickly took to the air and hovered for a week before grinning. He the mantis stalks the cicada, and the oriole follows. Let's go! Whoosh! Two thousand worker bees took off together, and rushed into the Inshan hive, following Chin Feng's instructions. Chin Feng really wanted to implement the three light policy. But we are not that kind of bee. Chin Feng took the lead, flashing lights and shadows around the guards. Before the other bees could see clearly, the lightning flashed for an instant, and all two hundred fourth level worker bees came to the ground. The worker bees, Sensing something was wrong, wanted to fly out to report the news, but bumped into a bee wall composed of 2,000 worker bees. Chin Fong showed his tail needle and pierced it with one blow. The slender thousand-legged finger pointed towards the hive, which was exactly where the Inshan bee placed various treasures. Take them all! Yes! The worker bees moved out one by one, and Chin Fong lay on the hive and began to think about the current situation. 
The Inshan bees just flew out completely. And there were at least tens of thousands of worker bees. However, my own situation was still too weak. And I couldn't use hard steel. Chin Feng clicked on the hive. Excluding first level worker bees and ordinary worker bees. He currently only had 2,982nd level and above worker bees. It's still a bit too weak. An hour had passed until the last worker bee flew out carrying something. The total number of small and small things was over 500. After the things were moved and all the worker bees flew away, Chin Feng continued to stay in the Inshan hive and lay down in the hole he had dug before to sleep. It wasn't until dawn that the Inshan queen became back with her large army. There were tens of thousands of worker bees when they left, but there were only less than 5,000 when they came back, and they were all elites. All the low-ranking ones were buried in the blood birch forest, which shows how tragic this battle was. It's a miserable life, but getting the spiritual vein is the biggest gain. The Inshan bee returned to its nest to prepare for moving. But as soon as it reached the side of the Inshan mountain, it noticed something was wrong. When the whole thing flew in, the discomfort turned into anger. Shameless little thief! Who is it? The Inshan bees brought back instantly covered the entire Inshan mountain. And even the blue clouds could not fly past. But Inshan is empty. Except for an empty SH. L of a honeycomb. There is nothing left. Chin Feng slowly flew out of the cave yawned and came face to face with the Inshan Queen Bee. Good morning. Queen Bee of Inshan, you have been busy all night. Please take a rest. I won't disturb you anymore. Bye. After Chen Feng finished speaking, he greased the soles of his feet and flew away with a hiss before the Inshan Bee could react. The Inshan Mountain trembled, which was a sign of being angered. But Chen Feng happened to fly away right under the noses of all the bees, and no one could catch up. Yes. I'll kill the bee if I'm angry. The queen bee of Inshan was so angry that she turned pale. Asshole! Angry and angry. Their family was emptied out. Which was a premature blow to the Inshan bees. They originally planned to get the spiritual veins and immediately take the opportunity to march into the inner reaches of the blood forest. Now that I only have spiritual veins and no other spiritual treasures to continue them. I can't stand the spiritual veins at all. Lao Yi stepped forward to ask despite the anger of queen bee. King! What should we do now? The queen bee of Inshan suppressed it forcibly. And then the color changed back. And she gritted her teeth. It's Chen Feng again. Digging three feet deep for me. After taking a few deep breaths, Inshan queen bee spoke again. Immediately send bees to check the spiritual veins. We want to deal with Chen Feng and get the treasure back. We won't move the hive for the time being. Yes. In fact, Chen Feng didn't go far. He was hiding in the big tree outside Inshan mountain. What was waiting was for the Inshan Queen Bee to send worker bees to the Blood Birch Forest to guard the spiritual veins. He just had to follow the clues and follow the clues. What a clever little guy! Chun Feng complained about himself, fluttering his wings and followed. The Blood Forest uses the Blood Birch Forest as the dividing line between the inside and outside. Beyond the Blood Birch Forest, to the southeast is the cliff of the White-Tailed Falcon. To the east is the Black Wind Beehive. To the south is the Inshan Beehive. And further to the west is the bullfighting mountain range. Only the north side was on the other side of the blood birch forest. And Chin Feng was temporarily beyond his reach. Inshan Mountain is to the south of the cliff. But the tail of the entire mountain range extends out. Basically reaching the edge of the blood birch forest. Chin Feng followed the Inshan worker bees. As they flew along the Inshan mountains. They meandered for an hour. Passing through the blood birch forest. And the mountains became rugged. The inner perimeter of the blood forest is filled with strange rocks and chaotic trees. The worker bee in front was flying with its figure hidden. Chin Feng kept up with it easily as he reached a certain speed, recording the route in his eyes. Flying over several stone hills, we faced a wetland canyon. The canyon splits deeply from the flat ground downwards. It is covered with clouds and mist above and cannot see the bottom below. There seems to be a chill coming up. There were also densely packed corpses of worker bees and some bats lying on the edge of the canyon. Apparently the queen bee of Inshan got her spiritual veins from the hands of these night bats. The Inshan worker bee didn't realize that he was being followed all the way. After checking the surroundings for a while, he rushed down and flew into the rift valley. Chin Feng followed to the edge and the system prompt sounded. Ding! Spiritual veins found! It is also accompanied by a light refreshing feeling of comfort. It's spiritual veins. And it's not small. Chin Feng hit his figure and flew down. The closer he got, the richer the spiritual energy aura he exuded. Chapter 41 New Spiritual Veins The entire rift valley looks like a large gap. 
and vegetation has not yet grown on the rock wall. Maybe it was the cracking of the ground that split the spiritual veins. And it didn't take long. Chen Feng flew down and approached slowly. When he was almost at the bottom, he lay down on the stone wall. There are about a thousand worker bees entrenched below, building a nest using local materials. More than half of it has been built and is about to surround the spiritual veins below. Then it became foggy, and Chen Feng could see clearly. It was a white crystal with a few impurities, but as big as a football, connected to the ground, with only a little protruding. You can't dig it out. That's fine. You can help me guard my spiritual veins first. Chen Feng didn't disturb any bees. He flew in silently and flew back silently. After Chen Feng returned, he once again organized a team of 100 worker bees into 10 small teams. Three teams flew out in a triangle shape to start patrolling. Three groups flew out, and the remaining small team returned to defense. He knew that the Inshan bee would not let him go easily if it was completely angered. Instead of being found and taken over by the Inshan bee, it would be better to take the initiative and confuse the opponent's behavior. Chin Feng clicked on the hive. Host, Chin Feng. Level 4. Attack, 10 slash 500. Defense, 10 slash 500. Speed, 10 slash 500. Creativity, 133 slash 1000. Evolution points, 210. Hive level, 5. Hive defense, 4 out of 10. Hive attack power, 2 out of 10. Hive invisibility, October 10th, invisibility time is limited by hive level. Host strength improvement, 0 to 1. Once the hive attribute is fully leveled, the host will gain an improvement in its own strength. The current total number of worker bees, 6668. Chin Feng once again added evolutionary points to creativity. A low attack point can slowly kill the opponent. But a low creativity point is really fatal. Fortunately, the Yin Shan bees are enough to kill. Looking at the number of worker bees, Chin Feng nodded his chin. The bee power is really lacking. In the previous battle, in order to save the hive, he had sacrificed a large number of black wind bees and bee species from the bullfighting mountains. And his vitality had been severely damaged. Chin Feng looked towards the Inshan Mountains. I can still instigate rebellion. Just like we did in the bullfighting mountains. Use your people to defeat your empire. Chin Feng was happy. Isn't he just a clever little guy? If you want to get the spiritual veins, you can only get rid of the Inshan bees in one pot and get rid of the roots once and for all. The worker bees sent out encountered the first wave of Inshan bees near Haifeng Mountain. The first team ran away after being unable to defeat them. The Inshan bees chased behind them. The second and third teams that followed the small team began to bite the tail of the Inshan bees. When the Inshan bee turned around, the other teams changed positions. The glory bees in Chen Feng's formation inherited one-tenth of Chen Feng's strength and were twice as fast as ordinary worker bees of the same level. It was simply shameless to engage in guerrilla warfare. It's like a bunch of naughty kids chasing your butt and popping firecrackers. Even if the firecrackers can't kill you, they can annoy you to death. Chin Feng flapped his wings and flew out, wandering around the entire Inshan Mountains. Soon some other bee species were discovered. The hives vary in size and are all rather scruffy. The strength is not bad. Some worker bees have reached the fifth level, but there are only one or two who stand out. Most of them are still first level worker bees and ordinary worker bees. It's a bit hard to put into words. Ding! An enemy attack has been detected 1,000 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. The system prompt sounded, and Chen Feng became alert. On the side of Inshan Mountain is a small stretch of woods, and scattered bee species are scattered among these woods. Ding! An enemy attack has been detected 200 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. It's the Inshan bee that's coming. Chen Feng followed the trend and arrived in a hive at the outermost edge of the grove ahead of the Inshan bee. Seeing Chen Feng's arrival, the little black bee thought it was an Inshan bee and immediately exploded. Oh my god! The Inshan bee is here again. Hide now. Queen bee. Queen bee. Please inform Queen bee that the Inshan bee is here again. They were flying around aimlessly. Before they could see clearly what the enemy was like. They were in such a disarray that some of the worker bees even bumped into each other and fell to the ground in a ball. When the queen bee came out, her face was full of panic. And she was completely unable to withstand the panic of the hive. That's the quality. Chin Feng couldn't bear to look directly at him. Chin Feng stopped in the air, unmoved, watching the turmoil gradually subside. Only then did the queen bee realize that there was only one bee in the air, and it was not the so-called Inshan bee. On one side of queen bee's face was a look of despair that made things worse. Pill. 
Here comes another person collecting protection fees. After a while, I saw that Chen Feng still hadn't moved. With a little more strength, he flew towards Chen Feng with courage and courage. Before he could fly, Chen Feng threw a knife at him, and the queen bee retreated again. Well, listen, I am not here to bully you. On the contrary, I am here to help you. Help us. After hearing Chen Feng's words, all the worker bees, including the queen bee, looked at Chen Feng, looking naive, and Chen Feng raised his forehead again. Chen Feng didn't want to say more at this point, and used his strength to prove that he could come faster. Ding! An enemy attack has been detected 1,000 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. Here we come! Chen Feng said. What's coming? The little black queen bee asked in confusion. Chen Feng didn't answer, and the answer was quickly revealed. The Inshan bee is here. Oh my god! Inshan bee! When the little black queen bee saw the Inshan bee, she screamed in fright and ran into the hive to hide. Chen Feng stood outside the hive, standing like a sculpture. Ding! An enemy attack has been detected 200 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. In the blink of an eye, five fifth level worker bees and 24th level worker bees appeared outside the small black hive. The entire hive was silent, with only Chen Feng standing outside. The Inshan bee stared at Chen Feng. For a moment, he didn't recognize that this bee was the one the king was looking for. He just thought it was a bee that didn't know how to live or die in the way. Where did you come from? Night bee. Get out of here. How dare you block my way? You don't know whether to live or die. The little leader shouted arrogantly at Chen Feng and flew straight over, showing his tail needle, intending to assassinate Chen Feng directly. Chen Feng's figure swayed. Xientian sword shadow. Two rays of sword energy flew out and under the control of Chen Feng. They flew into the Yin Shanbi squadron with great speed. In the blink of an eye, they were blessed with Yuanli, and their strength was ten times stronger than usual. Swish! 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 Before Yin Shanbi could even open his mouth to announce what he was doing, he was instantly killed by Chen Feng. Ding! The host killed five fifth level worker bees and twenty fourth level worker bees to gain thirty evolution points. The little black bees were hiding in the hive. Stunned, they all lurked under Chen Feng's strength. Chen Feng was definitely the first one in so many years who dared to fight against the Yin Shan Bee like this. But Chen Feng's killing of the bees now made them worry about revenge from the Yin Shan Bees, which was a mixed blessing for a while. Oh, don't worry. I won't just ignore it. As long as you obey me and don't seek death, you won't die. Not only will you not die, but you will also have a good life. Think about the days when you were not forced to collect honey and eat it yourself. It's rare for Chen Feng to give some inducements. According to his personality, those who can do it will definitely not beep. Chen Feng reported an address and asked the little black bees to gather while he went to the next point. Chapter 42 Siege My lord, are you going to other areas to gather brothers? I'll go with you. The little black queen bee kept up with her, not looking like a queen bee at all. After receiving Chen Feng's promise, the little black queen bee seemed to be grasping at the only straw and refused to let Chen Feng go alone. Frankly speaking, he still has some favors around him which can help Chen Feng quickly gather the bees. Following Chen Feng out, the little black queen bee realized how lucky she was. All the other hives were destroyed by the Inshan bees. This is the third time this month. I don't know what kind of bees the Inshan bees are, and they are frantically searching for their spiritual treasures and honey. The other hives are all miserable. Until the little black queen bee arrived with Chen Feng, everyone responded positively. But their temper was the same as that of the little black queen bee. Cowardly, the Inshan bees killed by Chen Feng before were only a small group. When Chen Feng and the little black queen bee returned to patrol again, other Inshan bees had already plundered all the honey in other hives. If you can trust me, you can follow me. If you can't trust me, don't force me. But I, Chen Feng, have spoken first. If you follow me at this time, I will definitely get a share of the food and drink. If you don't follow me, I will live or die. You don't know how to supervise, and don't let me see you anymore. As long as we regain it, this place will be my territory. No rebels will be allowed on my territory. Do you understand what I mean? Well, the queen bee who followed Chen Feng was startled for a moment, and quickly gave up the idea of retreating as she was already weak-minded. Oh, what a mess. It's so unreliable. Chen Feng didn't care too much. He had already surveyed when he came. There were 20 groups of Inshan bees that came out to collect honey. One group was divided into 10 small groups, and one group was divided into 25 bees. 
a total of 500 fourth and fifth level worker bees. After collecting the honey, they will gather outside the grove and go back together. At this moment, this team is waiting for the 25 worker bees that Chen Feng killed instantly. What Chen Feng was leading at the moment was 3,000 chaotic bee species. Not to mention a pile of scattered bees. There were only three in total at the fourth and fifth levels. The others are all first order worker bees and ordinary worker bees. At this moment, Chen Feng felt like he was Hong Xiuqiu and holding a sickle. All first order worker bees obey the order. A thousand of them will be sent out. And the others will be on standby. To show strength, the weak must defeat the strong in order to achieve the effect Chen Feng wants and gather more worker bees. A thousand worker bees were arranged in two rows by Chen Feng, surrounding the city in a circle. Attack. Buzz buzz. The first level worker bee, who was originally timid, was completely driven to the top by Chen Feng. If not, he was afraid of being killed by Chen Feng. But if he was afraid of dying, he would die. But among the two answers, the first one is more lively. Thousands of first level worker bees braved themselves and obeyed Chen Feng's command. After the siege circle, their tail needles were revealed and they rotated at high speed. The entire bee array was like a gear spinning in the air. In Shan Bee was caught off guard. The high level worker bees were surrounded and they reacted by condensing their spiritual energy to protect themselves, showing their tail needles and stabbing them randomly. But the first level worker bees moved too fast and couldn't find the sting at all. On the contrary, being surrounded by a thousand worker bees, the Inshan bees fell down one by one. Unity is one to many. My brother has someone. So why should I challenge you? That's the truth. In a clean and beautiful battle, five miscellaneous bees died, and 500 fourth and fifth level Inshan worker bees died. All the worker bees and queen bees who watched the battle expressed their admiration for Chen Feng. As for the fact that it was Chen Feng who stabbed those worker bees to death in the end, he would not tell it. The bees all knelt down to Chen Feng and shouted, Your Majesty, Ding, the host kills the 4th and 5th level worker bees and gains 600 evolution points. Okay, your task now is to help me spread the news. From now on, this part of Ishan Mountain belongs to me, Chen Feng. In two days, all the worker bees will gather in the grove and will annihilate the Inshan bees in one fell swoop. Yes. The other bees responded loudly, each in high spirits, as if they had never had a good life. Some worker bees have been oppressed by the Inshan bees since they were born, and it has been engraved in their bones. Now they are suddenly liberated, as if the shackles in their hearts have been released. They are trembling with excitement. When they look at Chen Feng, they are even ready to swear allegiance to the death. Chen Feng did know. Inshan B was originally looking for him. But now, he is destroying his search team. If you get rid of it step by step, no matter how good your temper is, it will explode. The Queen Bee of Inshan will definitely send out a large number of worker bees. And they will gather in the grove again in at most two days. Chen Feng returned to the hive and listened to reports from his subordinates. The gorillas were progressing quite smoothly. And the entire Inshan Bee was so angry that it exploded. Chen Feng listened, thinking in his mind and turned on the system. 630 evolution points. All added to creativity. Ding! The host has successfully added points, and the current creativity is 973 slash 1000. View properties. Host, Chen Feng. Level 4. Attack, 10 slash 500. Defense, 10 slash 500. Speed, 10 slash 500. Creativity, 973 slash 1000. Evolution points, 0. Level 5? The day after tomorrow. With the added creativity, Chen Feng feels more at ease, sitting on the throne, feeling the clearness of the spiritual veins. But the white-tailed falcon's spiritual veins are really too small. When Chen Feng saw the spiritual veins for the first time, he didn't understand the normal size of the spiritual veins. He only found a small piece of the white-tailed falcon placed there. In fact, it was just the white-tailed falcon embedded in the cave for his daily use. After I get the peace in the blood birch forest, I wonder what effect it will have. I'm really looking forward to it. During the two days of waiting, Chin Feng finally took the time to filter the spiritual treasures he had collected from the Inshan hive. Ding! I found the hive upgrade item. Do you want to use it now? Use? Ding! Ding! Ding items were used successfully. And the current hive integrity is 888 slash 2000. You've eaten all the food you can. So you only have so much? Chin Feng threw the remaining herbs into the alchemy furnace. After all, 
He relies on honey and spiritual veins to improve himself. And spiritual treasures are of little use to him, and the worker bees spawn by the system. Two days later, Chin Feng appeared in the grove with 2,000 worker bees. 6,000 other bee species were already waiting there. It was really the queen bees who had fought with Chin Feng after Chin Feng left. The quality may not be satisfactory, but Chin Feng is satisfied with the quantity. Chin Feng nodded to the swarm, not intending to lecture, but pretending to be cold. The worker bees they brought only divided the 6,000 worker bees among themselves, and each led a team to ambush in the grove according to Chin Feng's previous distribution. Buzz buzz. Soon, about 3,000 worker bees flew out from the Silver Mountain. Chin Feng lowered his body and continued to ambush. The others who had just joined the team could not help but be excited. But they were not impulsive. Ten minutes later, after the Inshan worker bees flew away, Chin Feng fluttered his wings and flew in the air towards the Inshan hive. The tentacles above his head pressed back, preparing to sprint with all his strength. Attack! Chapter 43 Killing the Nest Shui Sha Dash! 8,000 worker bees obeyed the order and flew out together, covering the top of Inshan Mountain in a thick black mass. Buzz buzz. The momentum was suppressed, like thousands of troops galloping towards him. Oops! The old Inshan bee did not go out with a large army to collect honey and spiritual treasures this time, but stayed in the hive on duty. Suddenly, a black crowd of worker bees pressed down on him. At first, he thought it was the Inshan bee that was back. He was wondering. But later it became clear that it was an enemy attack. The enemy attack has flown into the range of 1,000 meters. The old one ran towards the main nest, shouting warning as he ran. Enemy attack! Enemy attack! The Inshan bees have always been fighting everywhere and react quickly. When they find something is wrong, they respond one after another and assemble quickly. It's just that compared to Chin Feng who made a surprise attack, he was a little more unorganized. What? Hearing the sound, the Inshan queen bee rushed out and flew into the air. After countless encounters, this was the first time that Chin Feng and Inshan queen bee met. Buzz buzz. The two bee swarms faced off and 3,000 Inshan worker bees went out. At this moment, there were less than 5,000 Inshan bees guarding the Inshan bees. Chin Feng's glory bee was mixed in so as not to be too conspicuous. After all, in terms of strength, glorious bees are twice as powerful as ordinary worker bees of the same level. You? It's Chin Feng! The Inshan queen bee looked at the queen bee who had made her suffer so much. Her guess turned into certainty, and she gritted her teeth. Yes! It's your grandpa Feng! Chin Feng looked indifferent, even a little contemptuous. Today, we must destroy the nest of Inshan Bi and put an end to this old incident. Shameless little thief! I will kill you first and then destroy your hive! Inshan Queen Bi didn't want to say more. It was a waste of time. When he saw Chin Feng, he wanted to crush Chin Feng to ashes. Kill me! Just you? You used to have some brains and knew how to send spies to control the Black Wind Bee. But you were just too confident. Chin Feng flapped his wings, flew high into the air, and looked down. The black wind bee, who was mixed in the team behind him, finally realized the whole story after hearing Chin Feng's words. When he looked at the Inshan bee, his eyes became even more angry, wanting to tear the bee species in front of him into pieces. There are also other bee species that have been bullied by Inshan bees for many years, and they live a life of precariousness and danger at any time. They have had enough of this kind of life. The emotions of both parties were ignited. Boom! The vibrating wings rushed together, and the exposed tail needle flashed with black light, just to pierce the opponent's body. Chin Feng's figure flashed with light, and his sword energy condensed and rushed towards the Inshan Queen Bee. The two kings faced each other. The Queen Bee of Inshan was already a seventh level bee species, and her whole body was nourished by the elixir. Shua Shua, choking! Shuantian's sword shadow struck towards the Inshan Queen Bee and struck the Inshan Queen Bee with a snap. The Inshan Queen Bee paused. A burst of light flashed out, and her whole body was wrapped in a small circle. Shuantian's sword shadow fell into nothing. Both kings were shocked by the other's strength. If the two bees weren't already a life-or-death enemy, the Inshan Queen Bee would even have the intention to accommodate Chin Feng. With such a Queen Bee to help, it would be a safe thing to step into the inner circle of the blood forest. The Queen Bee of Inshan sighed in her heart, but put all her strength into her hands. The condensed aura took advantage of Chin Feng's dodge and struck out. Chin Feng couldn't avoid it. So he took the blow forcefully and fell back two meters before flying steadily in the air. Fortunately, Tian Chinchingjua has already refined his body. Otherwise he would have been here today. 
In terms of strength, the Inshan Queen Bee is probably not inferior to the White-Tailed Falcon. I'm afraid the Inshan Queen Bee's thoughts were in the Blood Forest from the beginning. So she was crowned king by the White-Tailed Falcon. But these are no longer important. Which in Fong here. There is no need for these bees and falcons to exist. Coexistence or something? How can you allow others to snore on the side of the bed? The sky above the Inshan Mountain was as dense as a hurricane. And corpses of worker bees kept falling down. In an instant, the Inshan Mountain was covered with a dense layer. It feels like snow burying your feet when you step on it. Chen Feng's spiritual energy condensed. His whole body glowed with a faint golden light. And his black tail needle shone with silver light. Diving. Accelerating. The airflow around the body retreats sharply. The two kings fought together using the most primitive methods. And Inshan Queen Bi fought against them. Facing a novice like Chen Feng. Inshan Queen Bi was even more at ease. Suddenly, Chen Feng grinned and shot out his tail needle. And the Inshan Queen Bi easily dodged it. Just as he was about to mock Chen Feng. He was prepared to die or something. When suddenly, he felt a surge of electricity all over his body. All of which exploded like lightning striking the earth. There was a crack in the air. Boom! Crack dash! Split the sky! The Queen Bee of Inshan thought it was too late to mobilize her spiritual protection. He and Chen Feng were fighting too close. It was so close that it couldn't fly 10 meters away in 2 seconds. Zitzi! There was a burst of lightning and thunder. And the Queen Bee of Inshan fell to the ground with a crash. Her wings were touched. Her whole body was blackened. And there was even smoke. And the smell of cooked meat wafted out. A lightning flash occurred in the bee swarm. And the worker bees close to Chen Feng were struck indiscriminately. All the worker bees stopped moving for a moment and looked at Chen Feng with wide mouths. Fear gradually filling their eyes. The glory bee had long been used to the strength of its king. So it didn't make a fuss. When the Inshan bee was stunned for a moment, it started killing them. The queen bee of Inshan died. And the situation was clear. Chen Feng shuttled through the entire swarm without stopping. Xuantian sword energy surrounded him. Killing people and killing Buddhas. Soon Chen Feng's evolution points reached the upper limit. And Chen Feng put all of them into creativity. After maxing out his creativity, Chen Feng began to increase his attack. Defense and speed. Level 4 is a big hurdle. Chen Feng knew it all and silently worked on his evolution points. Ding! 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 The host successfully killed level 4. 5. And 7 worker bees and obtained 1. 2. And 3 evolution points. The system kept beeping. And after the death of the Inshan Queen Bee, the glorious worker bees changed their formation and surrounded but did not attack. Encircling the Inshan bees in small pieces makes it impossible to escape. And you can't beat them even if you fight them. Death becomes a countdown. Ding! The host attributes are at full level. Do you want to upgrade now? At this time, the remaining Inshan worker bees were almost dead. Chin Feng was not greedy for the remaining points of evolution. After all, the Inshan worker bees, who went out soon came back. Led by the Guanya worker bees, all the worker bees were divided into ten small teams and lurked in the Inshan area. They only waited for the Inshan worker bees to return to their nests and then outflank them. Yes! The glorious worker bee took the order and left. Chin Feng flew alone into the queen bee's hive in Inshan. In the large hive, these spiritual treasures that had just been collected were piled up. Ding! I found the hive upgrade item. Do you want to use it now? Use? Chin Feng picked and picked and threw all the usable ones to the hive, which increased the hive integrity by 50 points. Chin Feng clicked on the attribute panel, and his level kept flashing. Upgrade! Chapter 44 Hunting Legend Buzz! As Chin Feng shouted, a buzzing sound came from his body. Chin Feng felt as if every joint in the entire bee body was broken instantly and then quickly reconnected. Severe pain spread from all parts of his body. Chin Feng lost his balance and rolled down from the throne. Ah! Chin Feng couldn't help but scream in pain and rolled on the ground. In addition to the pain, it seemed as if a steady stream of spiritual energy was pouring out from all parts of the body, drilling into the broken bones to help the bones heal. About an hour passed. The severe pain gradually disappeared. Ding! The host has been upgraded successfully. Current level, 5 inch. Chin Feng lay on the ground, not even wanting to lift his wings. At this moment, he wanted to take a sip of royal jelly. There is no royal jelly of 90% quality in Inshan Beehive. Chin Feng picked up the royal jelly in Inshan Beehive and planned to take a sip. After drinking it, he thought that he had to suffer. So he spit it out. He immediately sent out worker bees 
to get royal jelly for him, and drank it until he was full, and finally recovered. Call! Jin Fong exhaled a breath of turbid air. After the upgrade was completed, he felt that his whole body was full of strength. Jin Fong waved off his subordinates and asked them to continue to be on guard. According to calculations, it was about half an hour before the Inshan worker bees, who had gone out should return. At this moment, although the victory is already certain, it is better not to make any mistakes. Chen Fong clicked on the attribute panel. When he reached level 4 and suddenly needed so many attribute points, Chen Fong knew that this would be a big hurdle. After a workout, what kind of surprise can this big hurdle give you? Chen Fong clicked on the panel properties with doubts. Why didn't the system report anything just now? Host, Chen Fong. Level 5. Attack, 0 600. Defense, 0 600. Speed, 0 out of 600. Creativity, 0 1500. Evolution points, 0. Beast King's Mental Technique, Tian Chang Xingju, 1st level 1 1. Obtain the Beast King's Roar. The Beast King's Roar will greatly improve one's own abilities within 2 minutes. Skill, Xiantian Sword Shadow, 1st level, Xiantian Sword Shadow has a 10% probability of paralyzing and paralyzing the target for 1 second. Split the sky 466-1000 within 10 meters of the host's body. There is no difference in thunder attacks. The number of attacks is limited to 5, which is equal to the host's own level. Block, first level, pure defensive skill. Defense power is equal to 1% of own strength. Secret technique, Wu Wu Poison, first level, after the venom is used, Honey can be absorbed and converted into venom. If you are hit, you will suffer varying degrees of damage depending on your own strength. Divine Favorite Pavilion, 3 out of 100. Hive Level, 5, the host level cannot be higher than the hive. Level 5 Hive Integrity is 956-2000. Number of Worker Bees, 6666. Transfer Cooling Time is 1 month. Hive Defense, 6 out of 10. Hive Attack Power, 3 out of 10. Hive Invisibility. October 10th, invisibility time is limited by hive level. Host strength improvement, 0 to 1. Once the hive attribute is fully leveled, the host will gain an improvement in its own strength. Secret palace, the quality of honey is increased by 100%, and the cultivation speed is increased. 10 evolution points are provided every day. The alchemy function of the secret palace has been turned on. Please accept the alchemy task as soon as possible. Hidden Bee Pavilion, 6 5th level worker bees, 10 4th level worker bees, 23rd level worker bees, 52nd level worker bees, 100 first level worker bees, and 200 ordinary worker bees are refreshed every day. This, new skills have been added, and the skills that were originally upgraded by proficiency have now become layers? Chin Feng was sure that all this was because of Tian Shin Xingjue. In the entire system panel, Tian Shin Xingjue was lying in the corner, a tattered parchment with no other words on it. And then, the words Tian Shin Xingjue on the cover. Next, there are the training tips that come directly to your mind. Chin Feng stared at Tian Shin Xingjue and seemed to notice something different. When his body was being recast and upgraded, Tian Shin Xingjue seemed to flash for a moment. And a few dark words were written on it. The things couldn't be taken out. And Chin Feng couldn't check them for the time being. So he had to give up. After some experience, Chin Feng finally realized what was wrong. Gone! There are no more evolution points. Creativity has returned to zero after upgrading. Gone! Looking at the 1500 evolution points, Chin Feng wanted to cry. God knows how difficult it is to upgrade your creativity when there aren't a lot of worker bees to kill. There are only about 3000 Inshan worker bees left. So save some and kill them! Chin Feng flew out of the hive. And it was already evening. All the worker bees he brought were hidden in the corner as planned. They were so dark that if you didn't pay attention, you might think they were big mushrooms. Chin Feng was thinking carefully about how he could save the effort of killing the remaining Inshan worker bees. Well, buzz buzz. Chin Feng stood at the door of the Inshan Queen Bee Master's lair when suddenly there was a buzzing sound in the distance, followed by the sound of the system. Ding! An enemy attack has been detected 1,000 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. Chin Feng didn't take it seriously. After the Inshan bees flew into Inshan, the worker bees that had been lying in wait quietly rose into the sky. Surround but not kill! Chin Feng shouted loudly, flew into the sky, and rushed into the swarm of worker bees in Inshan Mountain. Before all the worker bees could realize what was going on, they were reduced to tool bees to maintain order. Chin Feng flew into the swarm alone. There was a flash of lightning, a thunderclap, 
and a burning smell filled the entire Inshan Mountain. Split the sky! Be careful at the thunderstorm scene. Crackling and exploding. The Inshan worker bees finally reacted and wanted to escape. But all exits were blocked. At this moment, the outskirts of the blood forest appear again. Can't escape. Can't hide. Can't win. Are they waiting to die? Sorry to wait any longer. I'll kill you right away. The worker bees who followed Chin Feng to encircle and suppress them were all dumbfounded. They looked at Chin Feng as if they were seeing a devil. Chin Feng killed them unilaterally, using all the sky splitters. Others are not allowed to interfere. They are not allowed to intervene. And they are not allowed to leave. They just watch. After all, the number of kills in the split sky is limited. They kill them one after another and consume the whole night. Chin Feng was also very tired. Until dawn, Chin Feng didn't want to use Sky Split for the time being. So he struck with his tail needle and pierced the body of the last Inshan worker bee. This battle finally came to an end. At this point, the legend of a night demon spread throughout the entire blood forest. If you are attacked by a demon, don't move and just wait for death. Ding! The host will gain 1,500 evolution points by killing level 4 and 5 worker bees. There are prompts one after another, and the bee killing machine adds points while killing. When it finally ends, the creativity is topped up again. When using Splitting the Sky, Chin Feng had a feeling that was the same as when he realized the Beast King's determination. Ding! The upgrade of the host's sky-splitting skill has been completed and has been renamed Earth Chant First Level. The sighs are accompanied by thunder and thunder, like the wrath of a god. This lighter is amazing! Chin Feng looked at his hands and rarely rubbed the tentacles on his head. It's like completing a ritual. The lighter turned into a thunder hammer. The only flaw is that it is too small. In the face of absolute power, Wu Wu Poison still needs to be effective. Chapter 45 Loyalty The Inshan Bee completely collapsed, and all the remaining bee pupae in the hive were picked out by other bee species and thrown to the ground, slowly squirming and moving, waiting to die. After Chin Feng picked out the remaining honey and spirit treasures, they all were given to other bee species. In Chin Feng's mind, the entire east, south, and west sides of Inshan Mountain had all cleared out. After finding three relatively large bee species, Chin Feng arranged these three bee species in the east, south, and west respectively, and placed other small bee species in the middle. It stretches all the way, covering the entire east, south, and west of the blood forest. Chin Feng knew that it was no problem to rely on these bees to temporarily defend the perimeter. If he wanted to continue to conquer the country, he needed his own strength. Chin Feng looked at the newly spawned 5th level worker bees and thought about the spiritual veins discovered by the Inshan bees. It was a bit difficult for a while. Chin Feng hovered over the Inshan beehive. At this time, all the bee species on the outskirts of the blood forest were crawling under Chin Feng's feet. On my territory, as long as you have the strength and want to fight everywhere, you can, but there is one thing. There was silence all around, and Chin Feng deliberately emphasized the last point. Whenever there is an invasion from outside, please give me a unanimous response. Our own people fight our own people. You can do whatever you want. Foreign species want to bully my Chin Feng's territory. No. If there are bees who want to invade my territory, that's fine. Speaking of this time, Chin Feng smiled softly. Before the next words were spoken, all the bees present felt as if they were bathed in the cold wind of the 12th lunar month. And everyone was frightened. Chin Feng changed the topic and continued. This is not my idea. And I will not force anyone. As long as any worker be above level 4 who wants to follow me can stay. Chin Feng now needs men and horses. But he has no intention of forcing anyone. Everything is done voluntarily. You can think about it and gather here tomorrow. If he wanted to enter the outskirts of the blood forest in one fell swoop. Chin Feng's current strength was still too weak. Buzz buzz. It was Xiao Jing when I came. And Xiao Jing when I left. All the bees followed their hives and dispersed quickly, preparing to go back and think about whether to die in peace or to expand their territory. Chin Feng also led his 2,000 worker bees back to the nest. After returning to the nest, after a short rest, Chin Feng took off again with 4,000 worker bees. The place they flew to was really the Rift Valley where Inshan Bee discovered the spiritual veins. The tail of the Inshan Mountains originally extended at the edge of the Blood Birch Forest. Taking this route from the Inshan Mountains, has more cover and directly connects the outer and inner areas of the blood forest. Chin Feng led the swarm to the top of the Rift Valley and did not feel much spiritual energy flowing out. A solid beehive had probably been built below, 
covering most of the spiritual energy. Hey hey! Chin Feng grinned. If he hadn't killed the Inshan Queen Bee, he would have said thank you first. Chin Feng directly led the swarm and flew down. There were clouds and mist at the top, and it gradually became clearer below. But the vision was still hazy, which did not affect Chin Feng. A large area of neat ground has been cleared by the Inshan bees, and the entire hive sits on the meridians as if it were upside down. The top is a deconstruction of cut stones, covered with emperor spider silk to make it stronger. And then, there is the honeycomb structure. No wonder I can't feel the spiritual veins outside at all. It turns out it's so well hidden. Chin Feng flew around the top and became more and more satisfied. Ding! Enemy attack was detected 200 meters away. Chen Feng continued to sink. And then the system reported the remaining Yin Shan bees. The area below was sealed tightly, with only one opening for entry. It was easy to defend but difficult to attack. But this did not trouble Chen Feng. There is an enemy attack! There is an enemy attack! The Yin Shan bees below finally discovered Chen Feng. And there was a dark mass of worker bees behind Chen Feng. His legs were shaking with fear. And he ran directly into the hive even trying to get used to guarding the gate. In terms of speed, among the bee species in the entire blood forest, Chin Feng believed that no one could claim to be the second best. In an instant, a flash of dark light was seen, and ten worker bees flew into the small stone door pushed out by the Yin Shan bee. They were the fifth level worker bees that had just emerged from the hive. Wails rang out, but they were not heard. Soon, the place was completely wiped out by Xiao Qing, and the last Yin Shan bee was separated from its head and its head rolled out. In the hive, the spiritual energy filled with spiritual veins overflowed, refreshing the heart and mind. Chin Feng stepped into the innermost part of the hive. A piece of spiritual vein as big as a football was embedded in the rock. Chin Feng laid down directly on it. Chin Feng took a deep breath and felt relaxed all over. Ding! A large number of initial spiritual veins were discovered. The system prompted. But there was no next action. System! Can't this spiritual vein be embedded into the hive? It would be great if you swallow it. Not to mention it saves trouble. And it is right under your nose. Ding! The hive can no longer accommodate the huge spiritual veins. Well, what should I do if I just keep guarding it like this? What if my Chin Feng's things are noticed by someone who has no eyesight? You can see it. You can touch it. But you can't take it away. This is the most frustrating thing. Chin Feng was used to taking over. But this was the first time he felt like he couldn't swallow anything. Wanting to put the matter aside, Chin Feng did not dwell on the current situation, quickly accepted the reality, and made his own plans. Of the 4,000 worker bees they brought, 3,000 were left to defend here. It would be a waste to guard the spiritual veins if they were not in use. So Chin Feng built a separate hive on top of the spiritual veins for his own use, leaving the rest of the exposed space for the enjoyment of the glorious worker bees. Because Chin Feng discovered that as long as the worker be as close to the spiritual veins, regardless of whether the system is fragmented or not, it can improve its cultivation. In just two days, the strength that was originally only the fourth level was raised to the fifth level. If his strength is high, Chin Feng can use it, and he doesn't worry about his worker bees betraying him because of his strength. Yeah, it would be nice to have one here. If there are other worker bees who surrender, you can give them some sweet treats. Why don't you just work and not eat? Afterwards, Chin Feng continued to arrange for the remaining worker bees to exchange with the remaining worker bees in the hive, quickly improving his overall strength. They are distributed in steps on the periphery, and the worker bees go out alone to patrol in order not to attract attention. Patrol within a hundred miles. On the second day, to the bees' surprise, 5,000 worker bees came to the Inshan hive location, all of which were level 4 or above. This time Chin Feng was completely happy. At this moment, following Chen Feng's footsteps and leading the worker bees, the body of the queen bee gradually changed and turned into a worker bee. Chen Feng didn't treat these queen bees badly. Okay, from now on, I declare that you are my king star bees. Ding! The host successfully recruited the scattered worker bees and triggered the divine favored pavilion 4 out of 100. Ding! The host triggers the hidden mission of the god's pavilion, is loyal, and gets an opportunity to multiply the worker bees. The refresh conditions are based on the number of recruits and the level. Do you want the host to refresh now? Can you still play like this? Chin Feng was stunned and laughed from ear to ear. Chin Feng chose to refresh without hesitation. And 5,000 worker bees buzzed out of the hive. At this point, Guangyu and Xingyu have become the two major swarms inside and outside Chin Feng. Buzz buzz! 
Chin Fong led the swarm to fly over the blood birch forest line, directly to a small jungle near the rift valley and close to the cliff, and set up camp. Chapter 46 Giving Bird Heads Chin Fong was not familiar with the inner area of the blood forest. The outer edge of the blood forest comes from the tail of the Inshan Mountains. Facing the Inshan Mountains, there are cliffs on the left and the west on the right. The small jungle is located on the inner edge of the cliff leading to the blood birch forest. At present, the cliff is the only place that Chin Fong needs to guard against. As for the vipers, that was the place where white-tailed falcon died. It had nothing to do with him. Chin Fong. Everything was ordered by white-tailed falcon. Wasn't it? After settling the worker queen, Chin Fong set up an extended patrol and retreated immediately if danger was discovered. Since then, the upper part of the rift valley has become increasingly lively. And with Chin Fong deliberately hiding it, the seemingly non-existent clouds and mist above the rift valley have become thicker and denser. Unless the sun is shining brightly in broad daylight, the visibility is less than 10 meters. It is easy to get lost in the rift valley and eventually fall into the rift valley. Under the rift valley, the hive that was originally repaired by the Inshan bees was diverted by Chin Feng's intentional pushing of rocks. If you fall straight from above, you will fall directly into the abyss at the bottom of the valley, and the spiritual vein will become a hollow in the rock dripping down from the rift valley. After taking many precautions, Chin Feng finally returned to his lair to rest after being busy for many days. Sitting on the throne, Chin Feng held a straw between his front feet and drank 100% quality royal jelly comfortably. It is sweet but not greasy, soaked in silken threads, and spreads throughout the body. There is also a small piece of spiritual vein embedded in the throne that promotes the determination of the beast king. Although Chen Feng is busy as a dog, his strength has been growing. Chen Feng clicked on the properties panel. Hey, I must have been kind enough to throw something into the alchemy before. Why didn't you give me a reminder? Chen Feng looked down and saw that the alchemy room was dark. Is this a failure? Chen Feng was very handy. So he took a straw and dropped a few drops into the alchemy furnace. The originally dark alchemy furnace suddenly looked brand new. Ding! The host refined a second grade elixir. Qingxin Dan, and successfully triggered the Qingxin Dan prescription. Ding! The host's alchemy room has been successfully upgraded to a first-level alchemy recipe. Some herbal medicine purchase functions have been enabled. The purchase consumes evolution points. Ding! The host has successfully enabled the elixir purchase function, and the upper limit of evolution points has been increased to 1,000 points. Is this successful? Regardless of what the clear heart elixir is, Chin Feng opened the purchase function of the alchemy room. Good guy. Any herbal medicine that has learned the elixir recipe can be purchased there. That is, even this point of evolution requires too much. Doghead grass. 500 evolution points. Purple tail flower. 1000 points. Chin Feng watched all the way. It's better to let the worker bees pick it. There are so many worker bees now that they are not using it for nothing. Chin Feng picked up the Qingqing pill. Ding! The host has received a Qingqing pill. Level 1. Quality 80%. After taking it, it can increase spiritual energy absorption. This is a good thing. While reading, Chin Feng opened the prescription to check the required medicinal materials. He wrote them down one by one and found that there were as many as 20. He also ordered the other medicinal materials to be collected by the worker bees. Only then can I start doing other things with peace of mind. Chin Feng was standing at the entrance of the Emperor's Spider Cave. His lair, looking towards the blood forest. The branches of the blood birch trees swayed and the entire forest seemed to be shrouded in a layer of blood mist. There is light rain in the sky today. Then and continuous. Chin Feng jumped into the mist and rain, flapped his wings and flew towards the blood forest. If I don't look at the reality, I can't rest assured. The raindrops hitting Chin Feng could not shake Chin Feng's direction. He flew all the way inward and quickly followed the tail of Yin Mountain into the blood forest, passing by the small jungle and not entering the rift valley. Chin Feng spun twice outside the small jungle. Chin Feng kept fluttering his wings and flew to the top of the blood birch tree. He looked around and found that he was in the innermost tunnel of the entire blood forest. The entire blood forest can't be seen at a glance. And what comes into view right now is a tall, towering mountain. You can even see white snow on the top of the mountain. Chin Feng flew forward two steps. And the left and right directions appeared. The stretch of rugged terrain on the left seems to be getting more and more desolate as it extends to the west while the towering trees on the right are getting denser and denser. No matter how far away it is, it becomes invisible. The desert is to the west and always to the east. The more desolate it is, 
the more ferocious the monsters above it are in order to survive and use resources. The denser and more fertile the place is, the more coquettish and cunning the monsters above it are. Competing for living space. Jin Feng did not hesitate and flew eastward. In his view, power can always be suppressed. But cunning cannot, and requires maneuvering. Buzz buzz. Jin Feng flew along the outer line of the blood birch forest, but flew no more than 2,000 meters when he suddenly encountered a group of black sparrows in front of him. Ding! An enemy attack has been detected 1,000 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. Ding! An enemy attack has been detected 200 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. When Shen Feng heard the prompt, he immediately mobilized his body to sink down. But the sudden enemy attack was too fast and arrived in front of him in an instant. The earth groans! A loud thunder exploded within a radius of Chin Feng's body. Several sparrows were unable to dodge and were blown to pieces, turning black and falling to the ground. The other sparrows saw this but did not attack Chin Feng and flew away without their lives. Chin Feng finally came to his senses at this moment, feeling that he was running for his life. But Chin Feng turned around again, and his body directly hit a pile of soft feathers. Ding! We found a large number of enemy attacks. Please pay attention to the host. Since he was already surrounded by enemy attacks, Chin Feng didn't pay attention to the enemy attack shouted by the system. So he turned around and came face to face with the Whitetail Falcon. Whitetail Falcon. It turned out that the sparrow was being chased by a Whitetail Falcon. Compared with the previous Whitetail Falcon, the Whitetail Falcon at this time seems to be more powerful. Chin Feng quickly retreated within a kilometer. And the Whitetail Falcon also discovered Chin Feng at this time and chased after him. Chen Feng, where are you running? Jie Jie, don't run. Only fools won't run. Chin Feng not only ran, but also played a trick and ran directly towards the Whitetail Falcon. The moment the Whitetail Falcon pecked its beak, he passed by the Whitetail Falcon and flew far away. Ha ha ha. Waste. At this time, Chin Feng had returned to his prime. The Whitetail Falcon could not easily deal with Chin Feng. It immediately called out other falcons to surround Chin Feng with a jeering cry. Within two minutes, a thousand falcons flew out of the jungle. Chin Feng was not very concerned. The Shining Bee was also on the way. Chin Feng asked the system to call it for help. In the face of absolute strength, everything is empty talk. The white-tailed falcon thought that he had finally found Chin Feng and could cut Chin Feng into thousands of pieces. But he didn't realize it until the entire army was wiped out. This was not the first time that Chin Feng had seen the desperate queen bee who was forced by the Inshan bee. I didn't understand until my death that I had misjudged the bee from the beginning. Ding! Successfully killed the level 7 monster, Whitetail Falcon King, and gained 5 evolution points. Hey, it hasn't been long before you reached level 7 and you're so powerful? Chin Feng expressed doubts about the Whitetail Falcon's strength. Is there any secret treasure hidden that I don't know about? Chin Feng guessed that this thing must not be too far away from the cliff. And maybe it was eaten by the Whitetail Falcon. With the mentality of giving it a try. Chin Feng started exploring from the cliff to the north just to explore the way. Ding! Enemy attack was detected 1,000 meters away. Ding! I found a hive upgrade item. Please pay attention to the host. Ding! Found the initial spiritual vein. Spiritual veins? There are also spiritual veins? Are you a wholesaler? Chapter 47 Split The discovery of spiritual veins was purely accidental. Chin Feng had never thought that the white-tailed falcon had two different thoughts. Every bit of spiritual vein found on the cliff was definitely picked up by the white-tailed falcon. The real spiritual vein is at the bottom of the cliff. In a gap in the rock wall of an inconspicuous mountain, the spiritual vein is stuck in the stone peak in the form of a long strip. The white-tailed falcon is too large to get through. All kinds of thorns and vines are intertwined here. Ordinary strange beasts can't even think of entering. Uh-huh. No wonder the white-tailed falcon was able to reach level 1 in such a short period of time. The Viper King must have received his lunchbox, which saves him some trouble. System, how are the marks made? Ding! Wherever the host arrives, you can mark it, but it cannot exceed a certain distance. After marking, the host can move the hive here. Oh, this is better. You can adjust the place yourself. Although Chin Feng didn't want to move the hive to such a place of right and wrong, he still marked the place as, okay because he had a bold idea in his mind at this time. Build a hive. Although the two spiritual vein locations are one on the inner edge and one on the outer edge, Chin Feng did not return to his own hive, but returned to the gap between the rift valley and the small jungle. He worried the worker bees. The hive established in the small jungle continued to be used, 
and another hive was built on the road leading to the cliff's spiritual vein to form a patrol net and use a small number of refreshed worker bees and most of the surrendered worker bees to build a nest at the cliff's spiritual vein. After working hard for more than half a month, Chin Feng finally completed the entire route. The worker bees move extremely fast and have already built a hive as big as a basket at the edge of the cliff's spiritual veins. Everything went well and Chin Feng was very satisfied. From now on, this is the star hive and the rift valley is the glorious hive. I, Chen Feng, have two separate hives. Those who followed Chin Feng later never saw the bees in Chin Feng's real hive again. Ding! The host successfully established the branch hive. The branch hive will inherit one-tenth of the attributes and abilities of the main hive. Ding! The current hive level is 5. And the subhive level is 1. Ding! The host triggered the divine favored pavilion the construction of separate nests. And the success was 4 out of 100. The quality of the honey from the separate nests was improved by 10%. After getting used to hearing the system's voice, Chin Feng has become immune to most of it. Just click on the system panel to view it and add the updated evolution points to the attribute points. It means that the integrity of the hive has not changed much recently. Chin Feng has discovered that the contents of the hive are not announced all at once, but require continuous exploration and discovery by himself. Wait until the hive is successfully established and start patrolling the surrounding environment. Only then did Chin Feng finally stand on the edge of the Blood Birch Forest. Then the next step is to truly march into the inner reaches of the Blood Forest. Chin Feng soared into the air and looked at the entire Blood Forest and the mountains in front of him. The tops were covered with pure white snow. But everyone knew that underneath the white snow was a mountain of corpses and a sea of blood. Chin Feng returned to the main hive. The Blood Forest is now Chin Feng's territory. The hive is considered safe. Chin Feng does not plan to move unless it is absolutely necessary. At present, there is no need to rush to increase power. What is needed is time. Chin Feng then concentrated on refining elixirs. Ding! The host has succeeded in refining by Ling Dan with plus 90% quality. And the alchemy room experience has been increased by 1%. Chin Feng's mind was not on the alchemy room at the moment. But on the hive. All in all, they have successfully refined 7 bailing pills. And the one currently in Chen Feng's hand is the seventh one. The current hive properties are Hive level, 5. Hive defense, 10 out of 10. Hive attack, 9 out of 10. Hive invisibility, October 10th. Invisibility time is limited by hive level. Host strength improvement, 0 slash 1. Once the hive attribute reaches the full level, the host will get a chance to improve its strength. That's all that's left. Chen Feng clicked on the attribute point and directly pressed the bailing pill. Ding! The host successfully used the bailing pill. And the hive's attack power plus one. Ding! The hive attribute level is at full level and will be automatically upgraded. Chin Feng took a look. Hey guys! All attributes have been increased by 20 experience points. And the bailing pill has turned gray. Unusable. Below the invisibility, a gray attribute is displayed. Poison Mist. 0 slash 20 turns on after increasing attribute points. It seems that everything should be left to chance again. After upgrading the hive attribute, Chin Feng also got an opportunity to improve his own strength. But Chin Feng did not plan to use it for the time being. He wanted to wait until he reached level 6 before using it. After all, upgrading was happy. And he wanted to double his happiness. Just when Chin Feng was immersed in happiness, the glorious worker bee who was out on patrol flew in and knelt in front of Chin Feng. King Chi, we found a swarm of man-eating bees stealing the honey from the hives patrolling outside our cliff branch hive. What? Does this lead to something else? It's quite fast. This won't work. It's a small thing to steal honey. But if your spiritual veins are discovered, you'll be in trouble. It is self-evident what spiritual veins mean to these monster beasts. Chin Feng couldn't sit still anymore and led the glory worker bees directly to the thorn bushes outside the cliff. Sure enough, these worker bees were buzzing and flying everywhere. Apparently a conflict broke out after the cannibal bees were discovered. When Chin Feng saw this, he simply rushed over and killed all the cannibal bees. The cannibal bee is five times the size of the radiant bee. But after long-term nourishment through spiritual veins and honey, its strength cannot compare with the radiant bee. How long has this been going on? Chen Feng didn't want to blame him. The most important thing now was to solve the immediate trouble first. The worker bee stepped forward and answered, Wang, I found out that there was less honey this morning, but I suspect they came to visit the place yesterday. Yesterday? 
Chin Fong turned around and looked at the spiritual vein in the gap between the thorn bush and the cliff. It was stuck, and it would be very difficult to transfer it. Urgent! Everyone patrolling the hive outside! Immediately start transferring the spiritual veins here! Yes! Buzz buzz! The worker bees took action, and a black mass quickly surrounded the gap under the cliff. This is how I feel at this moment when ants shake a tree. After all, the worker bees have small bodies, and it is difficult to move the stone. It may still be the stone stuck in the gap. As much as you can move! At this time, in a huge cave within the blood forest, the Jigo King opened his fangs and mouth, listening to his subordinates, who came back to report. When he heard the word spirit, his scarlet eyes widened. Spiritual pulse? Are you sure? The small ones are not particularly sure. Well, if you look into it, you will know that you have the guts to hide things on my property because you want to cause trouble. The Jigo King came to the entrance of the cave and snarled twice. The snarlings below the cave quickly recalled one after another in response. The Jigo King jumped up, and his two meter long and one meter high body fell straight to the ground. Countless groups of dogs quickly gathered behind him, as well as some groups of monsters nearby. The scarlet eyes of the Jig King flashed domineeringly, and saliva flowed from the gap between the fangs that could not be closed. Set off! Chin Fong didn't know that the army was coming at this time, but he always had a strong premonition. He flapped his wings and flew directly into the air, standing on a high place and looking around the blood forest. Suddenly a burst of smoke and dust flew up. Chin Fong secretly yelled something bad. Quickly! Move everything that can be moved away! And leave those that can't be moved away! Chapter 48 Moving The densely packed worker bees on the cliff are acting in unison. Finally, with Chen Feng's participation, a small piece of spiritual vein was taken away. The worker bees withdrew completely, leaving only a mess on the ground and the spiritual vein stuck in the gaps. Chen Feng stood in the air. Ding! A large number of enemy attacks have been detected 1,000 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. Coming! There was a billowing cloud of smoke and dust and the leader was 500 geldings, especially the leader who was huge. Ding! A large number of enemy attacks were found 200 meters away. Host, please pay attention. 200 meters away. You can already smell the fishy smell coming from the pavement. Chin Fong fluttered his wings and flew around, lying on the trunk of a blood birch tree, taking advantage of his small size. He looked at the animal species arriving below. There are hounds, hounds, falcons, and some small animals. It is obvious that the front dog is the king of this area. Chin Fong secretly made a mental note, looked at the direction in which the Jigo was running, and turned around and flew away without intending to stay. The glorious worker bee quickly flew to the outskirts of the blood forest carrying a small piece of spiritual veins that had been powered down. Chin Fong planned to place this small area on the periphery of the forest, so that the surrounding forest would completely form a network spread by Chin Fong, and this piece of spiritual vein would be the existence of the formation eye. After the spiritual veins were placed, Chin Feng returned to the hive. The emperor spider's nest has been abandoned for a long time. Chin Feng lives here. No other species comes close. Thinking of the jig dog, Chin Feng has other plans. Chin Feng opened the properties panel. The newly refreshed five evolution points continue to be added to the attack. Today's attributes are Level 5 Attack 100-600 Defense 0-600 Speed 0 out of 600. Creativity, 0 slash 1500. Evolution points, 0. I've been too busy recently. I haven't had any reaction from Tian Shen Xingjue for so long. I only have the feeling of improving my own strength. I haven't been doing much in close combat recently. Chen Feng collapsed on the throne, looking at the attribute panel and complaining, tapping the armrest of the throne with his front foot. What's on my mind is still inner things. The Jigo is huge, and its strength is unknown. It looks like a 9th level monster. I wonder what a 10th level monster would look like. If we follow the general practice, 9 is a big hurdle. In the blood forest, a place where the weak and the strong prey on each other, Jiu Gong is a turning point in strength and destiny. Chin Feng originally wanted to send the glorious worker, Bees out to investigate. But after thinking about it again, it was better to go by himself. He could decide what to do based on the actual situation. He would not be able to seize the opportunity if he waited for his subordinates to report everything. Alas! Mental training is going to be delayed again! As Chin Feng said this, his body still flew out quickly. And we also need to find a completely safe place for the hive. Chin Feng flew to the door and quickly explained the construction of the hive in the outer mesh. 
and asked the glorious worker bees to supervise it before flying away. Flying away was exactly the direction the dog came from. Chin Fong flew to the cliff first. And within two hours of leaving, the place had been quickly occupied by Jigo. The dog king was not there. A large beast pushed a stone down below, creating a high platform and blocking the spiritual veins. The cracks were also covered with larger stones. Everything is still being set up. But it's already there. Hey! Chin Fong was happy in his heart. This way he didn't have to build it, which saved him a lot of trouble. Thank you for your help in repairing the wall. I'll let you enjoy it for a few days. After Chin Fong hovered over the cliff for a week, he flew to the lush backside of the blood forest. Ding! An enemy attack was unexpectedly discovered 1,000 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. Chin Fong is small and fast. He is not afraid of the animals on the ground when he travels through the dense forest. He only takes cover when he needs to hide his identity. From the cliff to here, it is only 2,000 meters, and there are three fifth-level geldings patrolling below. After a short section of dense forest, there is a relatively flat section of small rugged area with more grass, like a sinkhole, surrounded by tall forest trees. Fong Yen looked around and saw several more boulders standing in the sinkhole. With piles of jigos spread out underneath, the Jigo King's lair is on these huge rocks. And there are six falcons on the top of the rocks responsible for lookout patrols. The precautions are quite tight. Chin Fong fluttered his wings and took to the air, expanding the scope of his inspection. The approximate location of the entire G Dog group fell into Chin Feng's eyes. If we really had to count, it would take less than an hour to fly straight from the dog group to the small jungle. There are only some trees in the middle, leaving the rest unobstructed. The Rift Valley Spirit Vein is to the south of the entire Blood Forest. And the Jigo is to the east. A bit tricky. Chin Fong flew towards the north. To the high mountains in the center. He had to find a safe place for his lair. The further north you go, the closer you get to the snow-capped mountains. The vegetation becomes denser. And even the towering trees block the sunlight in the forest. Making the entire Blood Forest miserable. Woo. I don't know if it's the wind. Or some strange cry of another species. The system did not prompt anything. And everyone was quiet. Chin Fong slowed down. Going further inside is meaningless at the moment. They are all towering trees. And it is easy for animals to climb up. Chin Fong flew high and reached the sky above the tree. Today's hive is as big as 20 cubic meters. And it can't be hidden anywhere. Chin Fong looked around. Suddenly his eyes lit up. Yes! It is really a place where the snow-capped mountains stretch down. It is the steep rock farthest from the main peak of Lishua Mountain. There is a crack in the mountain rock that is sunk into the sky. The crack is so deep that it would be difficult to find a honeycomb in the crack without direct sunlight. It is easy to defend but difficult to attack. Chin Fong was overjoyed and flew over to check it out. The more I watch, the more I like it. The system marked this place and named it Xiao Fontian. Ding! The host has been marked. It's good, but it's a bit far. I don't know if the hive can reach here in one transfer. Can the system reach it? Ding! This place is 4,500 kilometers away from the hive and cannot be reached. The host can consume honey to choose a jumping point. Ding! Does the host consume 60% of honey to set a jump point? What? Doing so much? It's too confusing. Chin Fong was helpless. But the system never bargained. Only agreed or disagreed. The evil XX doctrine. Set the rift as a jumping point. Ding! The host consumed 60% of the honey and set the jump point successfully. Should the host move the hive now? Transfer. Ding. The host has consumed 80% of the honey to transfer the hive successfully. The hive will be transferred in 10 seconds. 10. 9, 2. 1. Ding. When the countdown ended, Chin Fong felt the air in the wind sway. And with a buzz, the beehive appeared behind him. Chin Fong ran into the hive, drank the rest, and got some royal jelly. The deduction is for the royal jelly as well. Two glorious worker bees flew in, and knelt in front of Chin Fong. King! Well, you go down and make arrangements. The location of the hive cannot be known to any other bee species. Those returning to the hive must first go to the small jungle hive, and then come back. Yes! The hive is hidden. Now what's next? Just solve the problem of diplomatic relations with Chigo. After Chin Fong drank enough honey, he flapped his wings and flew out. Chapter 49 Reciprocity Chin Fong did not explore the blood forest in depth. If the snow-capped mountains were used as the boundary, then Chin Fong would be at the foot of the snow-capped mountains at this time, with the Jigo group on the left and the Rift Valley on the right. Chin Fong followed the snow-capped mountains 
and flew towards the group of dogs. After a distance of 2,000 meters, the system sound sounded again. Ding! There is an enemy attack a thousand meters away. Please pay attention to the host. This group of jig dogs is scattered a bit. There is something there. Ding! I found the hive upgrade item. Host, please go there immediately. Ding! An enemy attack has been detected 200 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. Oh! I finally found it. I almost thought that this jig was the poorest dog king in history. Chen Fong turned around and flew down. This place was the nearest point from the jig's den to the triangle of the snow-capped mountains. A small stream flowed underground. 100 jig dogs were scattered around. And 50 jig dogs were surrounding the center. The source of the stream is on the edge of a small pond. The pond is as red as blood. And two lotus flowers bloom in the middle. Bright red. Chin Fong came closer and lay down behind a leaf. And the familiar scent of medicine spread to his nostrils. There is a trace of blood mixed in the middle. Chin Fong was 200 meters away. And after smelling it for a while, he got a little excited. What an overbearing medicinal property. It looks like it's just a two-beaded water lily that is not of high grade. How come the medicinal properties are so strong? Only then did Chin Fong discover that the underground pond was red. But the water flowing into the stream was clear. Is it feeding with essence and blood? This Jigo King has something. Chin Fong determined the coordinates of this place and continued to explore. It's not like he can become a king just by having the elixir. He must also have spiritual veins. And Chin Fong has the system as a cheating tool. If he wants to discover the spiritual veins, he only needs to patrol. Sure enough, Chin Fong discovered the spiritual veins in a small boulder behind G Dog King's lair. Ding! Found the initial spiritual vein. Chin Fong quickly locked onto the target and swooped down. With Chin Fang's speed now, as long as he doesn't want to be discovered, nothing will be able to detect him. The 200 Jig Dogs below were all guarding the outside of the small boulder, and there were two 7th level Jig Dog handles at the entrance above. Chen Feng's aura sank, and his wings vibrated. Call out. Jigo only felt that something flashed in the wind, and did not make any defensive move. Chen Feng flew into the middle of the small boulder, and headed straight to the next cave. After entering, there were two more 8th level geldings guarding the door. Two 8th level geldings were lying on the ground. Their eyes closed, as if they were slowly absorbing the spiritual veins. What a good guy. He's hiding himself. Does your dog king know that? If the situation didn't allow it, Chin Fong would have wanted to be mean and give each of them a shot. Chin Fong held back and continued to fly downward. Below you can see a small platform. On top of a crack, there are two pieces of translucent spiritual veins the size of a wash basin. Good guy. The two spiritual veins are still together. Just by getting closer, Chin Fong could feel the spiritual energy flowing into his body. The abundance of spiritual veins here is incomparable to the spiritual veins he currently possesses. Chin Fong looked at the two geldings still lying down at the entrance, flew directly to the spiritual veins, and laid down on it with his whole body. You have occupied my spiritual veins, and I will lend them to you. Let's reciprocate as courtesy. Taking advantage of his small body, Chin Fong lay directly on the rock wall in the gap between the spiritual veins, closed his eyes, and started the Tian Cheng Singju. With the guidance of Tian Cheng Singju, the originally slightly yellowed spiritual veins became pure and integrated into Chin Feng's body. Well, the spiritual veins were constantly being stolen by Chin Feng. And the Beast King's mentality, which was already a little loose, was now even more so because of the nourishment and accumulation of the spiritual veins, which was washing Chin Feng's body. I don't know how long it took, but suddenly a fishy smell filled the cave. Chin Feng almost spit out the honey he drank yesterday. This special smell is the same as the fishy smell emitted by those two beads of elixir. Vomit. Chin Fong stuck his head out. Really? It was the Jigo King who came in. And the two 8th level Jigo, who were originally lying at the door now stood energetically behind the Jigo King. Protecting the Jigo King. King Jigo has been controlling the spiritual veins for a long time. He can detect even the slightest fluctuation. Chin Fong temporarily stopped stealing food from his spiritual veins. With his current strength, he doesn't dare to compete with the Jigo King. The Jigo King stayed there for five hours before leaving, which was very frustrating for Chin Fong. As soon as the Jigo King left, Chin Fong flew out of the cave without wanting to take a breath of air. What a bastard. This beast doesn't pay enough attention to being a dog for a living. What a stinky bastard. After taking a few deep breaths, Chin Fong folded in again. It's been smelly for a long time. It's not worth it to just leave like this. 
Chin Fong never sells or buys at a loss. Chin Fong flapped his wings, turned and flew back, lie down between the two spiritual veins and feel the direct freshness of the spiritual veins. The Beast King's mind inside the body is running rapidly. This made up for the time that Chin Fong had been too busy to take care of for so many days. The Beast King's mental method doesn't have a method? It's a bit strange. Could it be that it's not time to trigger it yet? But Chin Fong didn't know that the Beast King's mental method does not have a method. As long as it feels the breath of the spiritual veins, it will automatically operate. It only needs to absorb the spiritual energy of the spiritual veins. No method means that there are no barriers and no need to break through. It only needs to reach the later stage. It just requires more and more pure spiritual veins. Even though the size of this spiritual vein is a bit unfriendly. With my current strength, I can't do anything to King G-Dog for the time being. If it cannot be killed with one blow, the consequences will be endless. Chin Fong continued to lie on the spiritual veins, devouring it with big mouthfuls. The two eighth-level Jigo guarding the door were still unaware. Suddenly, Chin Fong felt that his body was full of spiritual energy. As if he was about to burst through something when it was full. White gas is sizzling all over the body. Which is the spiritual energy emanating from the inside of the body. Full? Why don't you feel anything at all? What should I do if there is no method? Just as Chin Fong was wondering. The white smoke coming out of his body mixed with the surrounding spiritual energy and exploded with a buzz. Forming a burst of white mist in the entire cave. Chin Fong is among them. Ding! The host Tian Chin Heart Resolve has reached the second level, one half. Use the Beast King skill to peek, you can see through the opponent's strength and weaknesses from a certain distance. Although it seems that this mental method is a bit undignified. Without a mental method or a sense of breakthrough. But the things given are all good things and there is nothing to say. After being promoted to a level, Chin Fong flew out with satisfaction. Open the attribute points and continue to add the evolution points refreshed today to the attack. That's it at this time. Level 5. Attack, 105 slash 600. Defense, 0 slash 600. Speed, 0 out of 600. Creativity, 0 slash 1500. Evolution points, 0. Chin Fong flew out of the hive, and did not intend to go back directly. Instead, he continued to explore around G-Dog King's territory. But he did not encounter any high-level elixir. It seems that all the good things in this place have been plundered by the G-Dog King. And only those two plants are left. Chin Fong lay on the stone wall of Jigawang Cave, clasping his chin and thinking. At this time, two falcons came in from outside and flew into the cave. Reporting to the king, a large number of beehives have appeared in the south of the Blood Birch Forest. We suspect that the black wind front that defeated the white-tailed falcon came in. Chapter 50 Yellow Grade High Grade It doesn't matter. It really doesn't matter. It was only a matter of time before such a huge hive group was discovered. Chin Fong just flew away silently and flew back to the nest in the direction of the Rift Valley. The sky above the Rift Valley is already dense with foliage. And there are many thorns all the way down. Unless small flying insects like bees can fly in. Other species will have to pay a huge price to get down. Since it was discovered so quickly, the lotus flowers carefully raised by G-Dog King should be exchanged. Chin Fong has never been one to suffer losses. When he cannot keep something and has to give it up, he will definitely get back something more valuable than what he gave up. Chin Fong sat on the throne in the Rift Valley Beehive. Come on! Listen! Twenty glorious fifth level worker bees kneeled in front of Chin Fong. Ten worker bees go out separately to inform each branch of the Xingya worker bees to pay attention to defense. If you can't defeat them, don't fight to the death. Whenever there is an enemy attack, use travel tactics to delay the enemy attack. Yes! For the rest of the worker bees, please gather the 4,000 glory worker bees to accompany me on the expedition. Remember, all the scattered workers will return to the Rift Valley for a return visit. If the enemy has not discovered this place, don't show up rashly. The topographic map of the entire Blood Birch Forest appeared in Chen Feng's mind. He was not a bee who always thought in the right direction. After so many battles for so long, he had been on the verge of death several times, which made him prepare for the worst at any time. The situation is stuck in the Rift Valley and Xiao Feng Tian. And the two worker bees are divided into two parts. The current arrangement is because he is afraid that if something happens to hold him back, and the G-Dog King launches a large-scale attack, with his current strength, he can only defend in a roundabout way. What happens after the war begins will only be known after it unfolds. Set off! Buzz buzz. 4000. A large group of glorious worker bees flew out together with Chin Fong. 
the other 10 5th level worker bees left the team and flew to other hives in the blood birch forest. Shen Feng soared into the air, flying 50 meters above the ground, bypassing a straight line, heading east from the foot of the snow-capped mountains, and flew directly to the creek where G Dog King's essence and blood raised the elixir. Half an hour later, for a thousand worker bees were lying on the trunk of a large branch. Still two kilometers away from the creek, only Chen Feng stuck his head out and flew forward another hundred meters. Ding! I found a hive upgrade item. A high-grade yellow elixir. And a ten-leaf blood lotus. High-grade yellow class? Why is there another high-grade yellow class? You didn't say that before. System. Chen Feng was shocked and surprised. He flapped his wings and flew towards the creek. He was small in size and fast. He flew over the creek in a few seconds without disturbing the patrolling Jigo below. Chin Fong looked down and saw that the lotus flowers were still the same two lotus flowers. He did not find anything else. But the lotus flowers at this moment were faintly emitting a dark red light. This flower has been upgraded. Chin Fong was happy, grinning and looking at the little flowers below. High-ranking Huang class. I don't know how much spiritual energy and blood the G-Dog King spent raising it. I just accepted it with a smile. Chin Feng turned around and flew back. His plan changed. If such a magical elixir were taken by him, King Ji Dog would definitely pursue it with all his strength. Chin Feng immediately went back and arranged for a thousand worker bees to return to the grove and directly attack the Ji Dog King's territory, attacking with all his strength, until the Ji Dog King was forced to come in person. Buzz buzz. Previously the worker bees flew back quickly. Then, the number of glory worker bees and star glory worker bees gathered above the rift valley reached 20,000. Attack! Following the shout of a fifth level worker bee, a black mass of worker bees quickly flew out, heading towards the territory of the G Dog King. After flying over the G Dog King's territory, all creatures in sight were undoubtedly spared and were all strangled by the radiant and starlight worker bees. The starlight worker bees were originally scattered, but after being gathered together by Chen Feng, they also cooperated quickly and hit wherever they pointed without any fear. Inside Jigawang Mountain Cave, a falcon fluttered its wings, but it was too anxious to land and rolled directly into the cave, hoping to get in front of the dog king. Your Majesty, it's not good. Your Majesty, the black wind became directly to kill you. It's too scary. They are plowing the ground. They must want to destroy all the creatures on your territory. After hearing this, G Dog King's scarlet eyes widened in admiration. The fangs that could not close his mouth were bared. Roar! Before he even took action, he was hit in the face by a hairy wasp. G Dog King roared loudly, and the same roar echoed outside the cave. With a big palm, he slapped the horse falcon away, and jumped out of the cave with his two meter long body. Jigo Dynasty roared again in the direction of the Rift Valley. The power of the ninth level monster beast shook the sky with its roar. Go and kill the Black Wind Bee for me. The nest will be completely destroyed. The King of G-Dogs gave the order, and 5,000 G-Dogs flew out with a thousand falcons. Two hours later, a falcon flew back with half of its wings and landed at the feet of the G-Dog King. Your Majesty, we can't defeat them. There are too many bees. Come prepared. The G-Dog King slapped the mouth falcon flying back to pieces. Waste. The water from his mouth that couldn't be closed fell to the ground. G-Dog King roared again, obviously angry. 5,000 G-Dogs came running from all over the jungle again. This time, the G-Dog King took the lead and ran towards the Rift Valley. The small jungle is a battlefield. At this time, 20,000 worker bees were flying in the sky together, attacking with their big palms. After attacking, they flew into the sky again. The dogs couldn't find a way to suppress them for a while, and they were stung all over their heads. But this one stung the dog. The worker bees were still alive and kicking one by one and they would not die as usual. This made Jigo suffer a lot, and the thousand falcons that followed them were all wiped out at this moment, unless the black wind bee was accidentally beaten to death by a G-Dog. The others were not damaged. There was a rumble and dust billowing in the distance. In front is the G-Dog King leading the way. It is expected to arrive on the battlefield in 10 seconds. G-Dog King was covered in blood, and before he even got close, his fishy aura poured into the battlefield. The G-Dogs led by the G-Dog King were all G-Dogs of level 6 or above. At this time, each one had some spiritual blessings, and they formed a fighting force with the Black Wind Bee. As soon as the G-Dog King arrived, an inconspicuous third-level Radiant Worker Bee flew away from the team. After Chen Feng got the news, he grinned, 
looking at the 200G dogs holding hands below. They vibrated their wings and swooped down, flying straight towards the lotus. The lotus was too big, and he was too small to hold it in his mouth. But when the time came, Jin Fong didn't stop doing anything. He opened the alchemy furnace and took in all the two lotuses. It was usually filled with honey by Chin Fong. But when he threw it into the lotus, it happened to become the medium of the lotus. Ding! The level of the host's alchemy room is level 2. And the time required for the Kahua Huang level elixir is 5 days. What? 5 days! Forget it. It's good if you can practice. If you can't practice, you must leave it for me. I will take it out in a moment. Before Chin Fong could finish speaking, the system voice sounded again. Ding! The host breaks through the steps and sets out to use the Huang level elixir prescription. The spiritual blood elixir, which triggers 5 out of 100 of the divine favored pavilion. No matter what the elixir was, Chin Fong knew that he would definitely make a profit, either by upgrading the hive or by upgrading the hive attributes. Chin Fong showed his tail needle, and Xian Tian sword shadows all flew out, quickly killing the 50G dogs below. The strength of the 7th and 8th level Jigo should not be underestimated. Chin Fong was not reluctant to fight. He took the elixir and flew directly into the air. The Jigo roared underneath. But he couldn't hit him. Chapter 51 Forbidden Land The army dragged the Jigo king. And Chin Fong dragged the Jigo, who was chasing after him. They were not in a hurry. The blood birch forest was so large that by the time the G-Dog king found his lair, he had already refined the elixir to increase the level of the hive. At this moment, Chin Fong even thought about fighting in front of the army to get some evolutionary points. The 58th level worker bees that had just been surrounded and killed basically died from Chin Feng's Wu Wu poison. Although Chin Feng's level is low, he has attribute blessings. And the Wu Wu poison after reaching full level is already equivalent to an 8th level poison. Ding! A large number of enemy attacks have been detected 1,000 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. The system prompt sounded. And Chin Feng instinctively flew high to check. In the distance, smoke and dust billowed. It was the army led by King Jigo. The army was followed by black wind bees. Their number was reduced by more than half. But they still bit the tail of King Jigo's team and attacked desperately, running towards the creek. Chin Fong was shocked. What's going on? Why are you here? This place is at least 20 kilometers away from the small jungle. Even if the G Dog King has eyes and hands, it is impossible to find it so quickly. It only took an hour to go to Chin Fong to pick flowers and kill 50 G Dogs. The gap between the ninth level G Dog King and him is not even a little bit. No matter how high his attributes are, he will not be able to break through the ninth level defense line for a while. Coupled with the siege of other G Dogs, Jin Fong could not even think of landing and died of exhaustion in the air. The ninth level G Dog King was extremely fast. He was close to him in less than five seconds from a thousand meters away. Jin Fong saw something was wrong and ran away. The moment the G Dog King came closer, a fishy smell spread across the surface. Chin Fong directly shot out his tail needle. And all the woo-woo poison shot out. A layer of light red halo suddenly lit up in front of the G-Dog King's fierce face. And Chin Fong was stunned. The tail needle that shoots out is blocked. Scarlet eyes stared at Chin Fong. The red light seemed to pierce Chin Fong. And he opened his huge mouth and roared. Ho ho ho! This is a sign that the G-Dog King is completely angered. The high-grade elixir of the Yellow Order was carefully raised by G-Dog King and Gong himself broke through the ninth level. Now it was stolen by Chin Fong, which completely angered the G-Dog King. The roar shook the entire east side of the Blood Birch Forest, causing birds and beasts to fly away. Chin Fong ran, hoping that the Dog King would chase after him. After several turns and ups and downs, the G-Dog King was not thrown away. Chin Fong vibrated his wings and flew directly towards the snow-capped mountains at high speed. There are rugged rocks at the bottom of the snow-capped mountains. Chin Fong is small, and can easily fit into various gaps. Chin Fong thought this plan was feasible. But every time Chin Fong hid in the gap, and thought he had gotten rid of the G-Dog King, the unique smell of the G-Dog King would come out after a while. As if a radar was installed on Chin Feng's body. Of. Gone! Chin Fong rushed out again. The jagged rocks under the snow-capped mountains were getting denser and denser. Further inside, there was already fog covering his eyes. And the visibility was getting lower and lower. This ten-leaf blood lotus must have been raised by King Jigo's essence and blood. And it will have a special connection with King Jigo. However, it will take five days to be refined after I put it in the alchemy room. Chin Fong felt bitter in his heart. If he had known this, he should have killed the army led by the ten-leaf blood lotus 
and returned to the nest to upgrade. At this moment, Chin Fong rested with his back against a sharp stone forest. The visibility here was already very low. However, despite this, a quarter of an hour later, a familiar stench came over him. His scarlet eyes were like evil spirits in the white mist, and his big palms were placed on the pile of rocks where Chin Fong was resting. Chin Fong flew up. The rocks were smashed to pieces on the ground. At this time, Ji Go Wang and Chin Fong were running away and chasing each other, not noticing the changes in the surrounding environment at all. They were both trapped in the fog of the stone forest. Being in it makes you feel confused. Chin Fong set off at dawn. It was noon. Chin Feng's wings were sore, and he was already very tired. However, there is no reason to spit out what is taken into the mouth. The sharp claws of the Ji Dog King came under his command again. Chin Fong was unable to dodge, and could only use his spiritual energy to resist. At the same time, he summoned Xuantian's sword shadow to attack the Ji Dog King. The Ji Dog King did not even dodge, but directly faced Xian Tian. The shadow of the sword bounced off Ji Dog King. Chin Fong spat, flew out again, and rushed into the fog. He would be angry if his things were stolen by a bee. But Chin Fong would never be able to escape. The Ji Dog King pursues him again. But at this moment, under the scorching sun, it was high in the sky at noon. Buzz? A sound like a mountain shaking came from underground. Sweeping up in an instant, the fog in the rock forest formed a vortex. Stirring, rising into the air. Sweeping and shaking. A powerful airflow came out. Shaking Ji Do King's two meter long body to the point where he was a little unsteady. Chen Feng, who was flying in the air, was directly moved by the wind and blown a hundred meters away. Not good! The Ji Dog King bared his teeth and roared. It's a forbidden area! At this moment, a first level thunderbolt fell from the sky and struck at the feet of King Jigo. King Jigo jumped to avoid it. In this way, the distance between him and Chen Feng became wider and wider. The explosion of thunder was just the beginning followed by dense explosions of thunder. Boom! The rocks on the ground flew around and shot out like cannonballs. Ji Dog King quickly stabilized his body and ran away. When he looked for Chen Feng, he could no longer find him. Explosions of thunder fell. Hurricanes rose. And the fog that had been lifted and dissipated became increasingly dense. Oops! It's the Forbidden Land Sacrifice! Ji Go King did not know what the Forbidden Land Heavenly Sacrifice was. He had heard this legend since he was born. But he was unexpected when he chased Chen Feng and unknowingly broke into the Forbidden Land. The Ji Dog King retreated step by step, and his two-meter-long body jumped up and ran out of the forest stone. At this time, the foot of the snow-capped mountain was completely shrouded in white mist, and he could not see his fingers. Among them, hurricanes roared and thunder roared. Chen Feng couldn't be found. The vision was foggy, and the aura of the ten-leaf blood lotus was getting weaker and weaker. Ji Dog King gritted his teeth. His eyes were shining red. He looked at the sky and then at the foot of the snow-capped mountains bitterly, and then left after a while. At this time, Chen Feng was even more miserable. He had no idea where he was. The thunderstorms were so dense that he couldn't dodge them. So he had to rely on his luck to resist them. But after all, his body is small. And the spiritual energy he can gather is only about the size of a palm. Boom! Chen Feng couldn't dodge. So he simply lay down on the rock wall and endured the blow. Zitzi! His whole body was numb and numb. And a strong electric current passed through his whole body. Chin Feng's whole body was scorched black. And he fell to the ground and convulsed. Chin Feng was lying on his back. And Ku Yen couldn't move. But the thunder continued. And the thunderbolts fell. Hitting Chin Feng's side. And the stone he was lying on was also bounced away. After an hour, the thunder finally stopped. But the fog did not disperse. Chin Feng was unknowingly thrown into a creek. His wings were folded in half. And he was slightly buoyant on his back. Floating along the current. Ding! The host has entered an unknown area. Ding! We found a large number of enemy attacks. Please pay attention to the host. Ding! I found a low-grade alchemy elixir. Please go to the host. Chin Feng listened numbly to the system report. It was difficult to move his toes. The most difficult thing was that his wings were completely soaked and stuck to the water. Making it difficult to turn over. Suddenly, Chin Feng seemed to hear something moving under the water. He glanced sideways and saw a pair of huge dead fish-like eyes and a bloody mouth full of fangs. Gone! Chapter 52 Desperate Situation Seeing that he was about to be swallowed in one bite, Chin Feng's long sliding legs separated in desperate situation. 
but he couldn't even get out of the vortex stirred by the big fish's mouth. At the critical moment, Chin Fong was about to be eaten. The two tentacles on Chin Feng's head trembled. It made a sizzling sound. Snapped. The earth groans. Ah! In an instant, the two tentacles met and produced a sizzling electric current. Chin Fong felt as if his whole body was about to burst. With waves of numbness and numbness gushing out, he endured the tearing pain of his own electricity. Boom! Starting from the moment when Chin Feng's body was 10 meters square, countless electricity exploded all over his body. The water conducts electricity. The big fish in the water was sizzling for a while. Chin Feng jumped into the air with a splash of electricity vibrating. The big fish was electrocuted in the water, and the bait in its mouth flew away just like that. He jumped out of the water and continued to open his mouth towards Chin Feng. Gone! Chin Feng had one of his wings folded in half, making him unable to fly stably. Seeing the big fish jumping out of the water, Chin Feng folded his wings and sank, perfectly wiping the big fish's mouth. The big fish didn't catch it again. The moment he turned around and fell into the water, his long tail slapped Chin Feng. Laugh! Under the huge force at close range, Chin Feng's body was directly ejected and hit a big rock on the shore. Puff! If Chin Feng had internal organs, he would have been smashed to pieces at this time. Without internal organs, Chin Feng would not have a hard time. He was first slapped on a stone and then fell into the grass. He felt that his body had been torn apart and only a little spiritual energy was left to maintain it. Chin Feng endured the severe pain and weakness in his body, and with only one thought in his head to survive, he stretched out his six unconscious limbs. Nunley crawled into the gap under the stone, and collapsed to the ground. Too tired, Chen Feng wanted to comfort himself, but before he could finish a sentence, he passed out. Before he passed out, he heard a faint system prompt. Ding! The host's health value is below 20%. Honey resources cannot be detected. And the repair function cannot be activated. All Chin Feng thought in his mind was, Will it all be used up? I haven't used it much yet. So whatever. I completely passed out. After Chin Feng completely passed out, he didn't hear the prompt sound from behind the system. Ding! The host's health value is below 10%. Small fragrant flowers and honey are detected 100 meters away. And the repair function is activated. During this sleep, Chin Feng didn't know how long he had slept. He only remembered that his stomach was full of daydreams. When Chin Feng woke up, his body made a decision first and crawled towards the nearest flower. When he reached the point, he fell headlong into the flower. I took two licks and drank nothing but dew. Even though there was only dew, Chin Feng still drank heavily. As long as his stomach doesn't feel uncomfortable, he can just look for something to eat. Chin Feng even took a few bites of flower petals with a stalk in his stomach. Chin Feng finally came to his senses. He moved his wings habitually and found that his wings had been completely repaired. I quickly checked my body and everything was fine. But I was a little too hungry. Could it be that the system is reluctant to let me die and is trying to fix me? Chin Feng opened the attribute panel. The alchemy room glowed red and was still refining the ten-leaf blood lotus. The alchemy room showed that the refining time of the ten-leaf blood lotus was three days. It's been two days? Chin Feng checked himself and found that everything was normal. The only abnormality was where Chin Feng was at this moment. This place is like a sinkhole, about 2,000 meters in scope, surrounded by a circle of green pines, with some streams winding in the middle. In the middle of the stream, there is a steep, high, cloud-like mountain, standing upright. No boundaries can be seen. The strangest thing is that this mountain does not seem to be formed naturally, but rather seems to have been caused. The sense of violation against nature is too strong. Chin Feng fluttered his wings and followed the edge of the creek to find some small flowers with honey and ate them to his fill. Although the quality of flowers and honey cannot be compared with honey, we can only make do with it first. The only thing worth complaining about is that there is no straw, which makes the turtle-haired Chin Feng not used to drinking. He simply spits out after one sip, until the flowers around him were ruined and ruined. After drinking enough, Chin Feng fluttered his wings and flew into the air and began to look around. The surroundings are quiet, but there are no birds, beasts, insects, or butterflies. It seems so quiet. Why does the system prompt that there are a large number of enemy attacks? Chin Feng did not dare to fly up to the towering rockery. He looked at the stream on the ground and prepared to go upstream to find a way out. Although he was unconscious at the time, he knew that he was washed here by the current. Chin Feng flew upwards. But after flying for a long time, he found that he had only circled around the rockery. The water flow on the entire ground is like connecting with each other 
and turning in circles. Chin Fong felt relieved. It seems that if we want to go out, we can only find a way on the rockery. If Chin Fong does a little bit of feng shui, he will find that the water here is surrounded by water like a tired dragon's nest, which is the image of Long Tan. And the sky-high rockery in the middle is the highlight of Long Tan, which is illuminated by the sun. At that moment, it appeared, with a faint dragon energy surrounding it. Although it was a dragon pool, it was not a dead pool. The surrounding water was still living water. So the dragon was just showing off and resting. Where is this? Inside the snow-capped mountains? Chin Fong remembered in his mind that he and the G-Dog King were playing a chasing game. They arrived at the foot of the snow-capped mountains. Although they were still in the mist, they didn't go too far. The snow-capped mountains are so big that it is not something that petty monsters like them can circumvent. Judging from Chin Feng's speed and strength, it would take at least a month to fly around the foot of the snow-capped mountains. And that's without encountering other monsters. So this place is even more suspicious. Buzz buzz. Chin Fong flapped his wings. And his voice became the only sound in Long Tan. Everything was eerily quiet. No matter what. If you die in the past, you will die if you can't get out. You will die anyway. Even if you die, you will have to find a few people to bury with you. Chin Fong looked at the stream and said harshly. After ruining another flower, Chin Fong finally collected some flowers and honey and placed them in the alchemy room where a small amount of medicinal herbs could be stored. Chin Fong flapped his wings. And as soon as he got close to the stream, a big fish began to swim in it. The water splashes were more than two meters high, forming a wall of water for a while. And fish jumped out of the water from time to time. Gone! Although Chin Fong was prepared, he did not expect that the entire water circle would immediately erect a wall of water. And he was almost sucked into the water. Chin Fong had no choice but to fly at a higher altitude. When he flew to a height of two meters, which was equal to the height of the water wall. He could no longer rise higher. It seems that I can only pass it through forcefully. I should have known that a tribute point should not be added to the attack in the first place. Now the attack is useless, and the speed is not even close. After several attempts, Chin Fong finally caught the small gap where the water wall stood up. After the water wall completely fell, there would be a two-second delay when he got closer. It just takes a little time to pass through the one-meter-wide water wall. Chin Fong vibrated his wings and aimed with all his strength. Call out! After the second test, Chin Fong rushed over during a two-second delay. After rushing over, it was not easy. The place that looked sunny and sunny in the distance turned out to be a blizzard when we entered here. As soon as the temperature dropped, it was so cold that Chin Fong almost froze. Chapter 53 Water Drops Gone! The journey was only a few meters away, and Chin Fong didn't know how many words he had said but he had been serious all the way. And now it seemed that it was impossible to retreat. So he had to bite the bullet and go forward. In two days, at the same time, the blood birch forest was surrounded. After Chin Fong disappeared, the G-Dog King directly spread his anger on the east side of the blood birch forest defense line and inevitably, even on the outskirts of the blood forest, the remaining worker bees were not strong enough. Without the leadership of Chin Fong, they lacked some edge. So they were taken advantage of by the G-Dog King. Snap! With a wave of his hand, the Jigo Legion led by Chin Fong pounds directly on the branch hive established by Chin Fong. Within two days, all the hives on the surface were shot down and destroyed. The ones that are a little more secretive are also being raided by the Jigo King. The fifth level worker bees, led by the Glory Bees, were forced to evacuate, and they all hid in the Rift Valley and in Xiaofengkin's hive. All the Star Glory worker bees flew out of the Blood Birch Forest, scattered into the outskirts of the Blood Forest and fell into pieces. Inside Long Tan, Chin Fong stared at the scorching sun, feeling the cold wind, and flew forward separately. The sun was shining brightly, but it was chilling to the bone. It took an hour to fly before it reached a distance of one meter. If it doesn't reach that point, he won't be able to hold on any longer. His newly repaired body is like half a new baby. And Chin Fong feels very strenuous at this moment. Chin Fong gritted his teeth, vibrated his wings, and roared. The Beast King roars. Wang! A burst of light erupted from Chin Feng's body, and his strength instantly increased. After withstanding the wind, the burst of ability propelled Chin Feng forward. Call out! He rushed into the foot of Longhand Mountain. After passing the wind outlet, the wind was warm and sunny here again, and the flowers and fragrant flowers turned green. As if the life and death that Chin Feng experienced just now were all half an illusion. What Chin Feng didn't know was that there were already a lot of traps under his feet at this moment. 
if Chen Feng hadn't been too small and light. He would have already set off the traps and been shattered to pieces. With his feet on the ground, Chen Feng never wanted to fly again. He would rather hold on to the ground and crawl step by step. Otherwise, there would be nothing he could do if the wind blew out. Fortunately, Chen Feng was too tired to fly. Whenever you fly, a different kind of mechanism will start in the aura at the foot of the mountain. So when someone in later generations broke into this place, they found that all the mechanisms were there, but the things inside were missing. Chin Feng went all the way up, looking at the endless rockery. His head hurt, but he couldn't find any way out unless he climbed up. The mountain was bare, with not a single weed on it. But every time he went up, Chin Feng felt his body feel more relaxed. Two full days had passed before Chin Feng climbed halfway up the mountain. Looking up, you still can't see the edge. Looking down, it's already covered in clouds and mist. And you can't see the bottom. Chin Feng stopped to rest. The moon rose and shone above the clouds. Chin Feng couldn't sleep and was thinking about whether to go down or continue the night. How on earth can we get out of this confusing place? Silver light shone down. And a line of small words appeared in the clouds. Chin Feng looked up. What is above the Xietian is the sky. And what is below the Xietian is the water. The Long Yu Heavenly Sacrifice is for Qin. And the Long Mountain Pond is low for Kuan. What is this? Chin Feng didn't know that the moon hanging high in Lantan was exactly the time when Chin Feng's accident happened outside Lantan at noon. Boom! The sound of thunder came, and the sound of an explosion pierced through the clouds in the air. Just hearing the sound made Chin Feng scared. He didn't want such a thunder to happen again. On the rockery, a strong wind suddenly blew. A dragon war sounded, shaking the entire Lantan. The earth was shaking. The rockery was collapsing. And the sound of dragon roars was heard one after another. Suddenly, the sky seemed to be torn apart, and a ray of sunlight came out. For a moment, a strange phenomenon occurred. The moon hung high, the sun cracked out, and it was pitch black outside the gap. The moonlight and the sun shone together. Rockery. Chin Feng's entire bee was also illuminated. Pain. The pain, which was more like being shattered than torn, was felt throughout the body. The pain was so painful that Chin Feng felt that he was still a human body at this moment and his body was experiencing the pain of cramps and skin peeling. But the pain was not as painful as death. The head split open, and the brains burst open, and were separated. Ah, uh, uh, buzz! At this time, the mountain shook, as if it could not withstand the simultaneous illumination of the sun and moon, and began to scatter rubble. Chin Feng was unable to grab the object, and was directly thrown into the air. However, the hurricane that attacked from below also prevented him from falling down. Chin Feng was separated from the scattered rocks in the air, causing pain in his body. From time to time, debris was shot down and thrown out. But there were too many rubbles, and I dodged one and was hit by the next. His body was numb, and he was already in the worst pain. He couldn't feel any more pain. Chin Feng's eyes were blurry, and his consciousness was a little blurry. As if, two voices sounded at the same time. A dragon's roar resounded across the sky, causing Chin Feng's eardrums to ache. In a daze, Chin Feng felt that he had no wings and was the same person he was before the time travel. But he was covered in blood. The wind blew the blood into blood mist. The air turned bright red for a while. After turning into a human body, the hurricane could no longer bear the weight of Chin Feng's body and began to fall rapidly. The wind blew by my ears. And the distance halfway down the mountainside was visible to the naked eye. At this critical moment, the system sounds like the sounds of nature. Ding! The host has successfully refined a 10-leaf blood lotus, a top-grade yellow elixir, and refined a first-grade yellow ammunition and a Guyuan soul-gathering pill. Chin Feng had no time to think about what it was and whether it could be eaten. Grab a handful and stuff it into your mouth. The elixir melted in the mouth. After refining, there was no longer the smell of blood from G-Dog King. Otherwise, Chin Feng would have to spit it out after eating it. The elixir spread all over the body instantly, and his consciousness gathered in a trance. The thought of turning into a human body at that moment was all an illusion. Although it was an illusion, Chin Feng's body still fell sharply. Under neutral acceleration, it was not a weight that a bee could reach. Even if Chin Feng falls down now, he will still be shattered into pieces. The moment his consciousness returned, Chin Feng vibrated his wings with all his strength. Laugh! After grazing the ground, Chin Feng took to the air again. But Chin Feng had no strength left and flew 10 meters away still lying at the bottom of the rockery. The gravel rolled down from above, 
and Chen Fong hid on a slightly larger stone to escape his breath. The sun and the moon illuminated each other for only a quarter of an hour. Chen Fong seemed to have experienced an entire century. The sound of the dragon's roar gradually faded away, as if he was half dying after accepting the punishment and could no longer resist. Chen Fong lay in the moonlight and looked at the small characters in the air. It seemed as if there was a huge dragon shadow rolling inside. Finally, it gradually subsided and the stone stopped rolling. The peripheral creek stopped flowing for a moment and then resumed its gurgling flow after a while. Chin Fong didn't know that if he hadn't ran up the mountainside for no reason and was illuminated by the sun and moon at the same time. Taking away one-tenth of the heavenly sacrifice, Longing would have been dead at this time. The sun has withdrawn, but the moon is still high, and the tranquility of Long An instantly returns to normal. If it weren't for the pile of rocks on the ground, nothing would have happened. Gulu! There was a sound of water, and a drop of water that could not soak into the ground rolled to Chen Feng's feet. Chapter 54 Chong Yun The drop of water was only the size of Chen Feng's body, and was only one foot away from Chen Feng, lying quietly on the ground. The mysterious flow in the middle seems like the stars, and the universe are contained in this small drop of water, exuding a faint glaze. Ding! Ding! Ding found hive upgrade items! The system kept beeping, causing Chen Feng's brain to hurt. Chen Feng lay on the ground, his body still very tired, as if his soul had returned after leaving the body. Wings and six limbs shake uncontrollably. Despite this, the temptation and desire emanating from the water droplets made Chin Feng stretch his trembling feet toward the water droplets. Chin Feng was a little dazed at the moment. His eyes were unfocused, and he was dragging his body to crawl on the ground. Well, finally, the tip of his toes touched the water droplets. The glaze on the water droplets instantly dispersed, and the silver light of the stars inside was completely exposed. In the moment of distraction, Chin Feng's eyes suddenly became clear, and he was slightly surprised at how his feet were touching the water drops. Immediately, Chin Feng was stunned. A pair of huge compound eyes reflected the universe inside the water droplets. Crystal clear and agile. What's this? Before Chin Feng could investigate, the glaze of the water droplet dispersed and turned into a water droplet. It penetrated along Chin Feng's outstretched front foot and sucked Chin Feng in. Gulu! At this time, Chin Feng was wrapped in the middle of the water drop like amber. The water droplet swayed, quickly gathered up, and was completely absorbed into Chin Feng's body. Snapped. The change in an instant was too fast. Chin Feng was originally weak and surrounded by water droplets, and was at the mercy of others. But just a moment ago, Chin Feng was lying on the ground, staring at the sky with dull eyes. It was pitch black in front of me, and there was no light in the vast endless night. However, the sound of the system sounded quickly. Just like when the water droplets were just discovered. Ding! 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 Hive upgrade items found! Call out! As if time traveled, a strong light suddenly came, forcing a burst of white light in Chen Feng's eyes. The world was completely white, and nothing could be seen. But images kept flashing in Chen Feng's mind. After the chaos of heaven and earth, human beings began to rise. The sky ascended to the nine heavens as immortals, and the earth sank to darkness as H. L. The initial scene lasted only a moment, as if Chin Feng was unable to explore it because of his lack of ability. Then, there was a sea of war corpses and huge waves of blood. Chin Feng felt that his body was like dust, flowing up and down with the words of others. The thick resentment directly made Chin Feng breathless. Suddenly, a dragon roar broke through the waves, and the whole earth shook like a sieve of chaff. A giant golden dragon, with golden light shining from its dragon scales, rolled up huge waves that reached a level outside the sky. The ocean was full of waves, and for a time, the earth was devastated. A chaotic war between gods, humans, monsters and demons. Seeing that the last human race was about to be exterminated, an immortal above the nine heavens finally forged the Chongyun heavenly sword. It was extracted from the earth essence and condensed from the chaotic soul to forge the edge sword that can kill all monsters. The immortal used his own soul to activate the Chongyun heavenly sword. When he swung the sword, Xiao Xiao instantly turned into powder. The immortal finally fought with the golden dragon for 300 years. Both sides were evenly matched and both were at the end of their powerful crossbows. However, the immortal used his soul to activate the Cheng Yun sword. Domestic demand was in urgent need of consumption. Finally, the immortal was worried that the golden dragon would come back after his death. So he led the golden dragon to the sky above Shuesen and used the Cheng Yun heavenly sword as a weapon to suppress and suppressed the golden dragon in the Chongyun heavenly sword. 
he dug out his own eyes, turned one into the shadow of the moon, and the other into the sun. He refined the golden dragon every hundred years, until he completely killed the golden dragon one hundred thousand years later. It is a sacrifice to heaven. The sudden day suddenly turned into eternal night, and Shen Feng fell into darkness again. But the strange sword technique was left in his head, with many strange characters, like a scroll of bamboo slips. But many of them were damaged. Chin Feng didn't have time to check. And he didn't even notice that there were two shadows in his body, each occupying one side of his heart. At this time, his whole body felt uncomfortable, and his head felt like it was going to explode due to the incorporation of too much information. The first thing that comes to mind is the overall situation of the entire blood forest and the occupation from the beginning, and then the separatism and war. From the first batch of natives, who arrived here 20,000 years ago, to the current entrenched forces. They occupy the blood-soaked southeast and northwest respectively and the entire blood-soaked central and central areas, as well as the endless snow-capped mountains that can be seen at a glance, are not a place where anyone dares to touch. Ding! It is detected that the host's health value is below 20%, and automatic repair is in progress. 10%, 30%. After the system repair was completed, Chin Feng's head no longer exploded in pain. Chin Feng stood up, his night vision restored. Fortunately, there is a system cheat. Otherwise it would have died. In the darkness, there seemed to be a space of 1,000 square meters. The space was circular and divided into three floors. Chin Feng was standing on the bottom floor. From bottom to top, he could see many strange things placed on it. As things, the system kept beeping. Precisely because at Chin Feng's feet was a pile of elixirs that had been dusty for many years, but were intact and fresh because of the preservation of this space. Taking out any one of them at random can make the entire blood forest robbed. There are also some magic weapons mixed in the elixir. Chin Feng can't tell the grade, and he has no use now. So he just ignores it. Staring at the elixir, Chin Feng drooled. Get rich. Compared with the elusive things in his mind, Chin Feng prefers the real things. For example, the pile in front of me seems to be of good quality. Chin Feng's eyes lit up, and he completely forgot how many lives and deaths he had experienced. His first reaction was this, and his second reaction was, How can I get out? How to get out? Chin Feng said it unknowingly. As soon as he said the word go out, Chin Feng turned around and appeared on the ground where he was lying just now. But the water droplets had disappeared. Enter? Go out? Swish. Chin Feng recited quickly silently, and his body moved quickly with his thoughts. Not only did he want to go in, but he also wanted to directly take the things inside without moving his body. Success? Gone! Chin Feng was completely overjoyed. He would have jumped with joy if he hadn't been hungry and weak after getting such a treasure. His head was still aching. And Chin Feng didn't dare to think about the things imprinted in his head for the time being. At least, he would think about it after he went back. The water drop space seemed to have been integrated into Chin Feng's body. As for the compartment in the water drop space, Chin Feng tried it. But with his current ability, he could not open it to a higher level. So hungry! Chin Feng sighed and gave up lying on the pile of rocks to catch his breath. Then the question is, how do we get out now? Chin Feng turned to look at the tall rockery towering into the clouds. But he knew in his heart that this was probably the Chong Yun heavenly sword. There was no change in Chong Yun in the sun and moon just now. But the dragon shadow wrapped around the sword god disappeared. Chin Feng looked at the giant sword and felt scratchy in his heart. Where can I go back to Baoshan empty-handed? If I haven't finished taking it, I'll still be empty-handed. Chin Feng raised his head and looked at the line of small characters halfway up the mountain. Hazy in the mist. What is above the Xiantian is the sky, and what is below the Xiantian is the water. The Long Yu heavenly sacrifice is for Qian, and the Long Mountain Pond is low for Kuan. Chin Feng murmured. The sky is dry. The earth is Kuan. The sky is not moving. There is no water. The water is not covering it. And the heaven and earth have no way? Chapter 55 Widow's Sword No way. Why is it unruly? Isn't it Chong Tian? Chin Feng also made random guesses. But Fu Lingxin said it in his mind. As if something flashed in his mind just now. No matter what. Chin Feng shouted loudly. There is no way in heaven and earth. Boom! The dull sound was like a roar coming from the ground. At first, it was just a tremor. Chin Feng only felt the earth move slightly. And then, the sound of rolling thunder resounded from the ground. Suddenly a gap opened in the ground and the surrounding creek collapsed instantly. The big fish inside was instantly swallowed up by the gap. Chin Feng flew in the air, 
trying hard to keep his body shape from being hit by the falling stones. But his eyes were bright and focused. At Chongyun Mountain. There's something moving! Are you afraid you won't be able to get it? Chin Feng never considered the possibility that even if he got it, he wouldn't be able to use it. But no matter what, if you see it, it belongs to him. Chin Feng. This is his principle as a bee. The rocks collapsed and the ground surface collapsed like a magnitude 12 earthquake. Chin Fengfei was unable to fly safely in the air. At this time, the blood forest and the entire deep forest were shaking. Thousands of years of snow on the snow-capped mountains avalanched and collapsed with a rumble, stretching throughout the blood forest. Boom boom boom. The sound lasted for a whole hour. After the crosstalk underground stopped, the snow-capped mountains that stretched thousands of miles began to collapse. Within the secret realm, Chongyun Mountain instantly disintegrated and peeled off after the last roar. Like the sky falling. No! Run away! At this time, Chin Feng had no way to escape but to fly upward. The flying became more and more difficult. And the surrounding snow-capped mountains began to collapse directly inward from the top of the mountain. The huge mountain that originally looked like it would collapse for several years. Collapsed instantly after Chin Feng took off. Forming a snow pit tens of thousands of meters high. Call out! Snow was flying everywhere. And there was a vast expanse of white. Just when the snow mountain collapsed, a golden light flew out from the bottom and flew straight towards Chin Feng. The golden light surrounded Chin Feng, forming a protective posture to protect Chin Feng from the earthquake collapse. The golden light shines like the brilliance of the sun at dusk. Then the sound of collapse rumbled and shook. The evil aura rushed overwhelmingly in an instant, as if it shrouded the entire snow-capped mountains. Chin Feng was so suppressed that he could not swing his wings, and his body fell straight down, unable to move. Chin Feng was horrified, and he worried that he could not escape at all. Chin Feng instinctively raised his front feet in a blocking posture to defend himself. Chong! With a golden sound. After rushing toward Chin Feng, the overwhelming evil aura disappeared instantly. Chin Feng lay on the snow, his eyes focusing for a while. With Chin Feng's size, everything was completely white at this moment, and he couldn't even fly out. Hey! I really can't get it this time! Chin Feng sighed and looked at the snow. He was afraid that the Wudao sword had been buried underneath. Chin Feng felt that he could not dig through the snow with his size. So he gave up his plan and did not check the water drop space he had just obtained. If you check it, you will definitely find that on the top floor of the space, there is a slender dagger that is a little longer than a dagger. But the sword body is rusty and dull at this time. Chin Feng looked at the sky and didn't know how long it was now. It can temporarily distinguish the direction through the sun hanging high in the sky. Now Chin Feng is completely out. The snow-capped mountains are really big. And the snow pits are even more deceiving. At Chin Feng's current speed, it took Chin Feng 10 days to fly out of the top of the snow-capped mountains. But at this time, the blood forest was in turmoil due to the collapse of the snow-capped mountains. All the birds, birds and beasts were dispatched, sweeping through the blood forest in a mighty manner. All the old monsters from a long time ago knew that there was something in the snowy mountains. But they didn't know what it was. Now the thing has obviously been moved by others. At the foot of the snow-capped mountains, there were three circles inside and three circles guarding the monsters. But none of them looked at the small black bee that had just flown over their heads. Chin Feng discovered the current situation. Some of the demonic beasts dispatched below had even reached the second level. Not to mention the ninth level demonic beasts everywhere. Chin Feng flew in a low profile and continued to fly out silently. Finally on the twelfth day, he returned to Xiao Fengtian's own lair. Xiao Feng Tian is just a corner of the strange protruding rocks at the foot of the snow-capped mountains. On the left is a desolate desert and on the right is a dense forest. Xiao Feng Tian occupies a desert, just like the desolation of the Gobi. Chin Feng was lying on the throne. And a small piece of inlaid spiritual veins gurgled out and melted into Chin Feng's body. After a whole day of nourishment, Chin Feng finally came back to his senses. In the hive, the number of worker bees has decreased by two-thirds, and only a few high-level fifth-level worker bees are still there. At this time, they were all kneeling in front of Chin Feng to accept his guilt. King! After you disappeared, King Ji Dog carried out crazy revenge and raids on our hive. It was almost a carpet-like search. So almost all of our hives were destroyed. And our worker bees also. Spiritual veins and peripherals. Although the situation was not good, Chin Feng's mood did not fluctuate much. He had long expected that it would turn out like this. There is really nothing to worry about when the weak eat the strong. As long as he lives, everything will be fine. As he spoke, 
a worker bee became even more angry. King, the spiritual veins have been occupied. Most of the people who have taken refuge with us in the periphery are just outsiders and have taken refuge with King Jigo. Otherwise, our spiritual veins would not have been occupied so quickly, as well as the branch nests and brothers. The worker bee was too angry to say anything. Chin Feng rubbed his chin. He didn't care how unfavorable the current situation was to him, because as long as the main hive was still there, he could make a comeback. What he cares about is that the worker bees copied and pasted by the system seemed to be a little different. After listening to the report, Chin Feng asked the worker bees to focus on collecting honey. He drank honey until he was full, as he had not done for a long time, and touched his stomach after drinking. Comfortable! While sighing, Chin Feng opened the properties panel. Level 5. Attack, 100 slash 600. Defense, 0 slash 600. Speed, 0 out of 600. Creativity, 0 slash 1500. Evolution points, 75. Hive level 5. Hive defense, 6 out of 10. Hive attack power, 3 out of 10. Hive invisibility, October 10th. Invisibility time is limited by hive level. Non-toxic, 0 slash 20. Chin Feng put all his evolution points into speed. Then Chin Feng noticed that the God's family was flashing non-stop. And the God's family pavilion itself also became 10 out of 100. What's going on? The system is stuck? Chin Feng tapped his toes. And a dazzling golden light suddenly bloomed. Fortunately, Chin Feng returned to the hive and opened it. Otherwise, the golden light would have illuminated half of the blood forest. Then the system sound started to sound like crazy. Ding! The host has found the ancient heavenly sword Wudao. The system will reward you with two skill upgrade options and an evolution opportunity. You will be rewarded with an immortal level immortal cauldron. Ding! The host successfully triggered the secret realm and was rewarded with 5,000 evolution points. Ding! The host is on the verge of death. Trigger the critical moment. Bring him back to life. And be rewarded with a soul reviving pill. Ding! The host succeeded in refining the cross level medicine. And got a double chance and got two soul reviving pills at the same time. Ding. The host gets a storage space and a chance to strengthen his body. Ding. The host successfully killed the ancient golden dragon. Gain 20,000 evolution points. Raise the upper limit of evolution points to 100,000. Got a chance to strengthen his body. Got a comprehensive skill upgrade. Triggered new skills. Commanded the three armies. First level. Golden dragon with one drop of blood. You will get a golden token of 10,000 demons a golden dragon reverse scale, and a golden dragon pill. Chapter 56 upgraded to four levels in a row. A series of system sounds stunned Chin Fong. He quickly recalled the situation in his mind. Could it be that he was exposed to a little light from the sun and the moon as a demon? The golden dragon thought it saved him and gave him the water drop and obtained the golden dragon inheritance. Then the golden dragon still died and the system judged him kill the golden dragon and received a series of rewards? Ha ha. Chin Feng's wild laughter resounded throughout the hive. Then Chin Feng calmed down, and the whole bee exuded a dark aura. He thought of the monster beasts he saw on the way back. A token made of unknown material fell to the ground exuding black mist. Chin Feng took it out and rubbed it for a while. And then it was put into the space by Chin Feng. I'm afraid that's all they have. At this moment, a fifth level worker bee flew in. King, a large number of wild monsters have begun to appear in the blood forest. They have already clashed with the monsters inside. There may be a battle. Creeps? Yes, King. Two leg. Huh? Two leg? Hearing this title, Chen Fengful suddenly thought of him. Indeed, if he is a monster now, then the person will undoubtedly become a wild monster. Does anyone know this token? Yes. The blood forest is so big, and the noise caused by it is so big. It's not an exaggeration to say that the entire continent knows about it and the ancient golden dragon war will always leave some legends and so on. Chin Feng didn't think about it anymore. What he needed most at the moment was to improve his strength, quickly filling up all his attribute points. Chin Feng began to take out the spiritual treasures in the space. When taking the medicine, Chin Feng looked up at the top of the space, where a sword was looming in the dark light. The elixir was taken out, and the system sound started to sound. Ding. I found the upgrade item. Do you want to use it now? Use. Ding. Using the god level high grade elixir. Xian Tian 9 Lotus was successful. The current integrity of the hive is 100%. Do you want to upgrade now? What? God level? I just took it casually. Okay. 
Chin Fong looked at the other spirit treasures on the ground that looked ordinary to the most ordinary, and his heart was bleeding. But when he thought that there were still a bunch of these things in the space, he felt a little better. It's really a drought. It's a drought. I think I almost died for an upgrade item. But now I have reached the pinnacle of life. Upgrade. Ding. The hive has been upgraded successfully. The current hive level is 6. Then came a series of other system sounds. Chin Fong didn't listen and directly clicked to upgrade himself. When he reached level 6, he quickly filled up his attribute points and creativity and then took out another elixir. Feed it to the hive and the hive will be upgraded again. After three consecutive times, the evolution points are exhausted. Hive is currently at level 9 and Chin Fong is at level 9. Chin Fong upgraded too quickly and moved too quickly. The system sound almost jammed again and stopped. The entire property panel shone with golden light. Chin Fong stretched out his front foot and touched it. And his attributes instantly unfolded. Host, Chin Fong. Level 6. Attack, 0 slash 10,000. Defense, 0 slash 10,000. Speed, 0 slash 10,000. Creativity, 0 slash 20,000. Evolution points, 0. Number of reinforcements, 2. Number of evolutions, 0. Beast King's mental technique. Tian Cheng Singju, 2nd level 0 slash 1. Beast King's deterrence. Opens up Dantian Chi Si. Permanently improves own attributes by 10%. Peeping, 2nd level 0 to 1. Check for weaknesses within a certain range. Skill. Xientian Wudao, 2nd level. Xientian Sword Shadow has a 20% probability of paralyzing and paralyzing the target for 2 seconds. The earth groaned. Within 100 meters of the host's body, there is no difference in thunder attacks. The number of attacks is limited to 9, which is equal to the host's own level. Block, second level, pure defensive skill. Defense power is equal to 5% of own strength. Secret technique, Wu Wu Poison, first level, after the venom is used, honey can be absorbed and converted into venom. If you are hit, you will suffer varying degrees of damage depending on your own strength. God's favorite pavilion. 10 out of 100. Trigger 10 to view the reminder of the gods. Hive level. 9. The host level cannot be higher than the hive. Level 9 hive integrity is 0 slash 50,000. Number of worker bees. 2666. The transfer cooling time is 1 day. Hive defense. 6 out of 10. Hive attack power. 3 out of 10. Hive invisibility. October 10th. Invisibility time is limited by hive level. Hive toxicity. 0 slash 20. Host strength improvement. 1 to 1. Once the hive attribute is fully leveled, the host will gain an improvement in its own strength. Secret palace. The quality of honey is increased by 200%. And the cultivation speed is increased. 200 evolution points are provided every day. The alchemy function of the secret palace has been turned on. Please accept the alchemy task as soon as possible. Hidden Bee Pavilion. 59th level worker bees. 108th level worker bees. 207th level worker bees. 306th level worker bees, 405th level worker bees, and 504th to ordinary worker bees are refreshed every day. Ding! The system scanning range has been increased to 5,000 meters. Ding! The hive has been successfully upgraded to level 9, and the host has been physically strengthened once. Ding! The hive invisibility function can be turned on according to time periods, and the cooling time is one day. Ding! The host self-repair times increased by six times. Sure enough, there is a limit to the number of system repairs. The other attributes are nothing. But the skills have not increased. What is Xiantian Wudao? Ding! It is detected that the host's weapon Wudao sword is damaged. Do you want to consume honey to repair it? What? Can I still use a sword with my body? No matter what. Let's repair it first. Ding! Consume 90% of the honey. And 1% of the Wudao sword will be repaired. The estimated repair time is 10 days. Chen Feng finally understood and the system was humane and left him 10% of the honey for food rations. But where is this Wudao sword? Chin Fong looked left and right, but couldn't see the reason. Suddenly, he saw the skill on the attribute panel. Xian Tian Wudao. This. Chin Fong suppressed his excitement, flew out of the nest, and rushed into the forest. Two Hebei dogs happened to be patrolling him, and Chin Fong flashed by. Xian Tian has no way. Brush. The original three Xientian sword shadows turned into a golden sword energy and rushed out. The range expanded to a hundred meters and flew straight away. Tisk tisk dash. Two times. Two eighth level G dogs fell down in response. 
Xian Tian Wu Dao seems to have turned into a physical sword shadow. Qin Feng was so surprised that he couldn't open his mouth from ear to ear, lying on a tree trunk and laughing wildly. Although the system used one of his evolutions without authorization, if the system didn't use it, he himself wouldn't know that it could be used in this way. There's no way. He's just so materialistic. Nothing is as stable as the strength that is truly in your hands. Right? When Ning first used Xiantian Wudao, the inheritance in his mind told him that the Wudao's sword from 100,000 years ago could only kill demons and could not be used by demons. However, 100,000 years later, he fought with a golden dragon and fought with 100,000 demons. The Wu Dao sword of 2000 has long been corroded by the blood of the golden dragon and has become the first immortal weapon in the world, capable of slaying gods and demons. However, Qin Feng was too weak at the moment and could not exert the full power of Wu Dao's sword. Don't panic. You can use honey to fix it. Just repair it slowly. At this time, Qin Feng was not worried about the beehive. It was time to deal with the matters in the southeast of the blood birch forest. If you dare to do it in front of him. Chen Feng. The grass on the grave is already two meters high. Chen Feng flapped his wings. Swooped down. And returned to the hive. If you encounter Jigo again along the way. You will solve it together. Chapter 57 Betrayal equals death. With Chen Feng's current strength. Apart from the fact that the quantity is not large enough. The quality has been improved. Chen Feng returned to the hive. And slumped on the throne. The spiritual energy continued to flow out and the beast king's mind flowed through his body automatically. After a night's rest, the hive successfully spawned a new batch of worker bees. With the improvement in strength, Qin Feng directly took 50 worker bees and flew out. Separate 10 worker bees, and let them pay attention to the situation inside the blood forest, and the movements of humans at all times. If they can't find anything, they will probably evacuate and turn to covert investigation. But no matter how hard they look for death, they won't think that all the things they want are in my possession. Chin Feng took the remaining 40 to 9th level worker bees and flew directly to Yishan, Cliff, and Dudu Mountain to meet old friends. The area closest to the cliff has been completely occupied by Jigo, and a stone castle has been built around the spiritual veins. Chin Feng looked at it, a little satisfied. After all, the main purpose of abandoning this place was to use the Jigo's large size to build a defensive castle so that he could directly occupy it. Chin Feng flew to the Yishan Mountains where other bee species had regrouped and took up residence. With the help of Chen Feng's resources, the beehives covered the entire Inshan Mountains. Ding! A large number of enemy attacks have been detected within 200 meters. Chen Feng flew to the top of the mountain and landed directly on the main hive. The hole he had dug on it had not yet been covered. Chen Feng settled down and was soon discovered by the bees below. Enemy attack! Enemy attack! The worker bees screamed twice in panic and then realized that there were only 31 enemy bees attacking. It was too funny. They were a nest with tens of thousands of worker bees. When he saw clearly that it was Chin Feng, his expression changed drastically, and he ran to other hives in panic. Enemy attack! Enemy attack! It's Chin Feng! It's him who's back! But the sound immediately attracted other worker bees, and instantly 2,000 worker bees surrounded Chin Feng, hovering in the air, forming a bee tornado's circle. Then the queen bee flew over. When he saw Chen Feng, his eyes darkened. He didn't know what was going on in his mind. When he saw Chen Feng, he was afraid of Chen Feng's personal strength. He had seen Chen Feng kill bees with his own eyes. But in the current situation, it was definitely impossible for him to rely on Chen Feng again. It would be better to strike first. The queen bee of Xinyanchen quietly vibrated her wings behind her, and more worker bees gathered in the air. The new queen bee looked at Chen Feng and explained word for word. Chen Feng! We all thought you were killed by the G-Dog King. Shen Feng responded calmly, showing no emotion. Oh, you thought that since I was killed, I was a loser and could no longer protect you. So you started your own business. Right. Isn't it true? If not a single worker, Bee of Glory can be seen. How can Star Glory survive with the empty name of a Black Wind Bee? No matter how good the reason is, it's useless. As he said that, with a flash of golden light, Chen Feng summoned Xiantian Wudao and continued. In my dictionary, Chen Feng, there are only loyalty and death. Brush! As soon as the sword energy came out, Queen Bee's head rolled directly to the ground. Her eyes stuck in disbelief. Buzz! The sound of vibrating wings instantly doubled in size, and Yin Shanbi species rushed down in disorder. Humph! You still want to use the same method that I, Chen Feng, used to deal with me? What a dream! 
The worker bees swooped down. Chin Feng climbed up. And 31 bees rushed into the swarm in an instant. At this moment, the entire Yin Mountain began to rain bees. And all the worker bees that fell to the ground were chopped into two pieces. As soon as Chin Feng's sword energy came out, even if the high-level worker bees could summon their energy to resist, they would be cut in half like tofu. Boom! The hive was cut open directly by the sword energy. With Chin Feng's current speed, he could kill all the worker bees gathered in Yin Shan in half an hour. Turn south and arrive at the original hive location of the Black Wind Bee. The hive here seems to have gone through a century of induced labor and is in a state of disrepair. There are about a thousand worker bees on it still collecting honey secretly and patrolling and hiding. When I saw Chin Feng coming, I thought it was an enemy attack and was about to run away. However, Chin Feng's current speed was unmatched by any bee. And he was suddenly blocked by Chin Feng. When Black Wind Bee clearly saw that it was Chin Feng, they all knelt in front of Chin Feng and choked. King! It's great that you are back! It's the king who's back! It's the king! He's coming to pick us up! Finally, we don't have to hide anymore! For a moment, all the Black Wind Bees surrounded Chin Feng. They were all worker bees crying to Chin Feng or cheering with joy. Although their grades are only one or two. And even more are ordinary worker bees. After taking a peek, Chin Feng knew that they were real bees celebrating his return. After some pleas, Chin Feng helped Feng Zhong stand up. Although you are of low rank, you are still my star bees. All bees must obey my orders. Yes. Everyone was excited when they heard Chin Feng's words. Even if Chin Feng ordered them to die at this moment, they had no complaints. Chin Feng separated ten worker bees and pointed them in front of the Xingyao bee. You are divided into ten teams and go to find other star glory worker bees respectively. As long as the black wind bees, all other bee species will be killed. After killing them, first build a branch nest outside the blood forest. Although there are few bees, slow down, but don't let any more traitors appear. Yes! The glorious worker bee and the starring worker bee quickly left. Chin Feng stood in front of the dilapidated black wind old beehive, looking to the sky, and then turned his gaze to the blood forest, where the dense forests were covered in blood. Those who are not of my race must have different minds. This is indeed a wise saying. Chin Feng no longer needed to personally take action, and all the surrounding areas of the blood forest could be recovered in just one day. Chin Feng turned to the rift valley. The terrain there had been processed by him before, and the terrain was dangerous even if it was snatched away by the Jigo king. The defense should not be strict. After all, Jigo's body would be too big if he wanted to go down there. Chin Feng led the few remaining worker bees and flew to the Rift Valley. 500 G dogs were directly guarding them above. The sound of cattails fanning below the Rift Valley sounded like a falcon. Chin Feng swooped down. Chin Feng was small in stature but fast. And his current ninth level strength made him dodge past in a flash. Entering the bottom of the Rift Valley surprised Chin Feng. There are only three seventh order falcons guarding below. It is not difficult to guess that G Dog King does not completely trust Ma Falcon. Shui Sha Dash! After taking care of Ma Falcon twice, Chin Feng lay directly on the spiritual veins. Feeling the abundant spiritual energy flowing out continuously, Chin Feng began to think. There are a huge number of Jigo Kings. Even if his power has become stronger now, the ton of war is also getting bigger. It will take some time to eradicate the Jigo Kings altogether. The blood forest is neither big nor small. The land occupied by the G Dog King is only as big as the blood forest sesame. But for species, it is already a large forest. After taking care of the outer edge of the forest in one day, Chin Feng led the worker bees back to the hive, leaving ten worker bees and the shining star worker bees to reestablish the outer hive together. As for the inner circle, let's start from the next day. Chapter 58 Preparation On the second day, the hive spawned new worker bees, and Chin Feng added evolutionary points to his creativity. Currently, Chin Feng has 109th level worker bees, 208th level worker bees, 407th level worker bees, and 606th level worker bees. The remaining glory worker bees number 3,000, and the gathered star glory worker bees are about 10,000. Chin Feng sat on the throne, holding a straw between his front feet and drinking royal jelly comfortably. Now there is only one Jigo King in the Blood Birch Forest. And the entire sphere of influence in the Blood Birch Forest is controlled by a red refined King Snake. With other races that have surrendered scattered in the middle. After receiving the inheritance, Chin Feng knew the layout of the entire Blood Forest clearly. Even if the forces in the outside continent are rising, he can know something about it. But it has been a long time ago. 
so he doesn't know how it will develop now. The lair of the Red Refined King Snake is in a group of rugged canyons to the north of the Blood Forest. Near the next door. It's just that my current power is a bit inferior to that of Chico King. The defense and attack capabilities of the hive itself are also a problem. But, it is still difficult to annihilate the Jigo King on a large scale in one fell swoop. After all, the Jigo is huge, and it will take time for the attack to be effective. And Chin Fong cannot afford to wait for this time. Buzz buzz. Chin Fong flapped his wings and flew towards the east. Since it can't be annihilated in a while, let's get some interest first. Ten minutes later, Chin Fong flew to the vicinity of the G Dog King Cave. Thousands of G Dogs gathered here and were patrolling alternately. No mosquito could fly past. But Chin Fingning, he is an extremely fast bee. Call out! Chin Fong flew over and explored. He had only explored the main lair of the G Dog King before, but the rest of the sphere of influence had not yet been figured out. Although he had inheritance in his mind and could check it at any time. After all, it had been many years and it could only be used as a reference. In the barren mountain cave where the G Dog King is located, there is a large piece of flat land below, followed by a network of small roads. Every 50 meters, there is a G-Dog den, with levels extending outward from high to low, occupying the entire east side of the Blood Birch Forest. Further east is the Cliff Spiritual Vein, and east to the north is a denser forest, where there is a faint chill. Hey, let me talk about the system. Can you also remind me about the upgrade elixir that the Hive can no longer use? After all, I don't know it. It would be too difficult for Chin Fong to look at them one by one. So we started discussing with the system. Ding! The system activates the exploration prompt system. Ding! A low-grade elixir, purple dragon grass, was found 200 meters ahead. Ding! A medium-grade elixir was found 500 meters ahead. I am worried about my soul. Hey! Okay. Not bad. Not bad. Chin Fong was happy. This way. It would be easier to find low-level ones after unblocking them. It would be great if a high-grade elixir could be used to upgrade the hive. After all, the elixirs in the space were too powerful, and any time one was released would cause disputes. And space is a secret treasure that cannot be revealed. What he needs most now is a large amount of elixirs and treasures so that the Star Glory worker bees can also improve their abilities. Bringing bees to collect them is the best way. As long as you take this into consideration before, you won't be scattered all by others when you come back. Well, Chin Fong sighed, but he knew in his heart that without the original battle, there would be no original opportunity, and everything would be in the dark. After that, the system beep sounded frequently, but Chin Fong didn't feel annoyed anymore. Okay, okay, no wonder the G-Dog King wants to occupy this land as his lair. It turns out that the soil nearby is suitable for the growth of various elixirs. It's no wonder that most G-Dogs are of higher levels. At this time, there are 10,000 8th level G dogs guarding the G Dog King's lair. There are many G dogs, but they have not stepped up their guard. Some are napping, some are looking around, and some are even in harmony. After Chin Fong looked around, he saw that the entire G Dog King's territory had been imprinted in Chin Feng's mind. He turned his head and flew into the barren mountain cave with a hiss. The place was still guarded by two 8th level G dogs. Chin Fong flew in and two the spiritual veins exuded spiritual energy. And Chin Fong landed on the spiritual veins after two seconds. The gurgling spiritual energy merged into the body, and the Beast King's mind began to circulate, spreading to all the limbs. Call! Chin Fong let out a breath of turbid breath, and his body exuded a faint fluorescent light. The two Hebei dogs at the door seemed to feel something. They raised their heads and took a look inside. In the end, they did not enter the cave to investigate. Chin Feng's hive needs time to recuperate at this time. And Ji Dog King thinks that it will be difficult to make a comeback after breaking up Chin Feng's hive. Because of the time gap, Chin Feng stayed in the barren mountain for five days. In five days, Chin Feng's Tian Chin Xinjua directly reached the second level zero point due to the nourishment of the spiritual source. A large number of worker bees were refreshed in the hive. After the entire blood forest periphery was cleared, branch hives were established again. Chin Feng quickly calculated the current situation. The plan to seize the treasure and kill the dogs can be carried out in advance. Although it cannot be annihilated in one fell swoop, it can still be implemented. Chen Feng built a larger branch nest in Xiao Feng Lin, 1,000 meters away from Xiao Feng Tian, where he usually stayed. One's own natal hive will not be revealed in front of others no matter what. Five days later, Chen Feng was sitting in the throne of Xiao Feng Lin's hive. 
and below him were kneeling the star glory worker bees for reselection. The five major leaders who came out, and the five major leaders of the glorious worker bee. Reporting to the king. All the branch hives outside the blood forest have been established. One of the star glory worker bees took a step forward and knelt down. Chin Feng did not speak, but looked at Guangya worker bee. Guangya worker bee understood. Stepped forward and knelt down. Reporting to the king. All the forces outside the blood forest have been eliminated. And all those with second thoughts have been killed. Well, I would rather kill a thousand by mistake than let one go. This king surrenders to those who are loyal. And I, Chen Feng, will protect him. The Xingyu worker, who was kneeling on the ground shook without any trace. I was secretly glad that I had never had second thoughts about the young queen bee. Go ahead and start building hives in the blood birch forest. Wherever there is higher ground, we will build one. You don't have to hand over the honey you collect. You can eat it yourself. The worker bees will take turns every day and follow me on the expedition. After listening to Chin Feng's order, the Guangyu worker bees had a dull expression. But all of the Xingyu workers were excited, hovering over the barren mountains. Buzz buzz. The Ji dogs quickly discovered the situation and quickly reported to the Ji dog king. Not long after, a falcon flew out and rushed towards Chin Feng and the others. A thousand falcons were gorillas in the sky screaming wildly. Chi! You beast! Chin Feng vibrated his wings. And 200 guard 9th level glorious worker bees spread out. Like Chin Feng's left and right arms. The falcons flew close. And their sharp beaks flashed with cold light and struck at Chin Feng. Chin Feng managed to dodge. And Wu Dao's sword energy flew out. Slashing down two falcons and falling down. The other worker bees displayed their tail stings at the same time. Whenever a falcon approached, they would spread out and close up at extremely fast speeds. Their agility far surpassed that of the falcon. At this moment, the worker bees turned around instantly, and their tail stings pierced the falcon's head. Middle, Chin Feng flew so high that the G dogs could only watch from below. The falcons fell one by one. The G dogs howled and barked at Chin Feng from below. Some of the more advanced ones attacked Chin Feng with all their strength. But the speed was too slow. The accuracy was too low. And it was impossible to hit Chin Feng at all. Until the end, Ma Falcon died under Chin Feng's sword energy. Chin Feng flew so high that Ji Go below did not see clearly what Chin Feng was using. Only that it was powerful. However, the arrogant Ji Go didn't care and therefore did not report Chin Feng's condition. Only until the Queen Bee who was dispersed by them came to die. From beginning to end, Ji Dog King never showed up. Chin Feng did not plan to attack the Ji Dog King today. He had another purpose. After everything was settled in the air, Chin Feng shook his wings and turned directly, flying towards the back of the barren mountain. No! Go and report to the king quickly! The Black Mountain Peak has gone towards the back mountain! After seeing Chin Feng's direction clearly, Ji Go below finally realized Chin Feng's purpose. The back mountain is where Ji Go's second largest source of strength is. Besides his spiritual veins, Ji Go ran towards the barren mountain cave to report to Ji Go King that Chin Feng had led the worker bees to fly over the top of Ji Go King's cave and landed on the blood birch tree in the back mountain. In the medicine field below, the elixir is guarded by two 7th level G dogs at every moment. It's not a big problem. The only one we need to be afraid of is the G dog king. Come on! Boys! Whoever gets it will get it! Chin Feng shamelessly implemented the OK 3 light policy. Stealing light, taking light, and brightening. Fortunately for the glory worker bees, their rank originally followed the attributes of the queen bee. But the Star Glory worker bees were born and raised and naturally have no resistance to elixirs. As soon as he heard Chen Feng's order, he buzzed his wings and flew straight towards the elixir without fear of death. A group of 200 bees flew down together. When the dogs couldn't bear it and fought back, 20 worker bees immediately retreated from the group and flew towards the elixir. For a moment, the pickers who were picking the medicine and the worker bees who were covering it formed a group and circled around the Jigo. Whenever the Jigo tried to take care of the elixir, he would be stung all over the back of his head. Chin Feng stopped in the air behind him, right at the straight line distance from the barren mountain cave to the Bakium field. Ding! A large number of enemy attacks have been detected 5,000 meters behind. Coming! There was a system prompt, so Chin Feng didn't need to look back to confirm. He looked at the hard-working little worker bees in front of him with a smile on his face. Ding! A large number of enemy attacks were detected 2,000 meters behind. Chin Feng's smile grew bigger and bigger and all the mature elixirs on the ground were picked up by the starlight worker bees. Ding! We found a large number of enemy attacks 200 meters behind. The system sound sounded, 
And at this moment, Chin Feng gave an order. Retreat! Buzz! The sound of the wings vibrating grew louder. And the worker bees, who had just touched the elixir gave up and flew into the air. 200 meters away. G Dog King's 2 meter long body arrived in an instant. And his fishy smell instantly filled the area of 100 meters. When the G Dog King arrived, Chin Feng flew up in an instant and was already 20 meters away. The G Dog King arrived, but failed to catch Chin Feng. He angrily raised his eyes as big as copper bells, opened his fangs directly, and spurted out a powerful mouthful, hitting Chin Feng. Chin Feng's speed at this time was not what it used to be. He made a small detour and dodged over. He even deliberately flew lower because of his itchiness and hovered over the head of the G Dog King. The G Dog King was furious but could not be beaten. Chin Feng grinned and left without saying anything, leaving the roar of G Dog King behind him. Asshole! The G Dog King looked up to the sky and roared. He watched Chin Feng fly away but was helpless. Suddenly, his scarlet eyes revealed a ferocious look because Chin Feng didn't intend to go back just like that. He looked back and saw that there were still many worker bees who had not picked the elixir. Chin Feng directly dispersed to the left and right, regrouped the worker bees who had not received the elixir, divided them into teams of 200 to 1, and scattered them to both sides of the barren mountain. Ouch! The G-Dog King looked up to the sky and roared, and began to gather the G-Dogs, seeing that Chin Feng didn't run away after getting an advantage, and planned to sweep the floor directly for him. He was so angry that he spat out a bloody mouthful of saliva. Bastard! Come on! Kill them all! Chin Feng was calm and unhurried. Those flying in the sky were in a straight line, while those running on the ground were always stumbling. Whenever the G-Dog King went to the right, Chin Feng would mobilize his team to the left. After the G-Dog King turned around, he quickly turned back to pick the elixir. This way repeatedly. Play with a whole group of dogs and have them in your hands. At the same time, there are 9 level monsters. And Chin Feng has even more 9th level monsters. Except for the G Dog King. No one can stop him anymore. Unscrupulous. Just so rampant. The G Dog King was on the ground angrily. His sharp claws clawing at the grass. Which was full of big holes. And his scarlet eyes stared at Chin Feng. Chin Feng wanted to fly in the air and taunt him. But after thinking about it. He felt that yelling would be a waste. So he let the G Dog King stare at him. And continued to go his own way. In half a day, 1,500 of the 2,000 worker bees brought by Chin Feng had obtained the elixir. The first echelon is enough to move up to the next level. The G Dog King was unhappy down there. And Chin Fengfei was also unhappy in the air. Why should such a good place be ruined by such a sloppy dog? Chin Feng looked towards the direction of the cave. The entrance, hidden below the cave, was where the entrance to the spiritual veins was. And spiritual veins! Chin Feng turned to look at G Dog King again. Their eyes met for a moment. Both sides were determined to kill each other quickly. Chin Feng snorted coldly and waved his foot to retreat. It's just some interest. Sooner or later, I, the king, who was taken over by you, will get my capital back with interest. Chen Feng flew away, flying high in the sky, without even a chance to compete. G Dog King was holding his breath the whole time, and his scarlet eyes were about to burst. Seeing Chen Feng's flying figure, a long war broke out. Ouch! Breathing heavily, he didn't dare to think about today's losses. There were some elixirs that he had not given to his subordinates for a long time. Not only were they reserved for critical moments, but they were also used to honor his superiors. The G Dog King bared his teeth. Give it to me! Get all their lairs for me! Get them! Kill them all! Leaving no one behind! Woof woof! The dogs barked suddenly one after another, and everyone gathered together. Chapter 62 Bad Chin Feng returned to the lair, sat on the throne, and drank royal jelly with a straw between his front feet. After reaching 200% quality, the royal jelly seemed not as clear and moist as before. But Chin Feng knew in his heart that his body might have reached a bottleneck. It's just that at the current time, it's not suitable for upgrading. As for the current hive, it is not difficult to upgrade. What is difficult is the point of evolution. Chin Feng entered silently, then disappeared on the throne and entered the water drop space. At this time, there was already some dim light in the water drop space. And he could not see clearly yet. But it did not affect Chen Feng as he had night vision. The dark light is emitted by the Wudao sword on the top floor. The hive level has been raised. But the defense of the entire hive is still above level 6. It's a bit difficult to deal with. Chen Feng muttered while picking through the pile of elixirs. System. 
Can you help me divide these genius treasures into equal parts? Ding! The host will consume 90% of the honey when using the system classification. Are you sure? Gone! Why so many? Chin Fong knows that if there is so much honey, it means that there is not enough honey. After it is used up, some rations will be left for you. Chin Fong turned to look at the mess of elixirs and felt a little headache. Point! If you run out of honey, you can brew it again. He really doesn't know this pair of elixirs. Ding! The host successfully classified using the system. 90% of the honey was consumed. One third of the quantity is expected to be classified. And it is estimated to consume two hours. Yes! It still takes time. Although there is an alchemy room in the hive. As well as single prescriptions. Chin Fong always doesn't care about the level of the alchemy room when refining medicine. He just throws it in, and whatever he gets out of it counts. Anyway, it can be done in any alchemy room. But the time required is different. Chin Fong randomly picked up two elixirs that looked like foxtail grass, threw them directly into the alchemy furnace, and then added a jar of 200% quality honey into it. Ding! The host has successfully put in the dragon beer grass. The dragon scale pill is expected to take five days to refine. And the current progress is 1%. Hey, Chin Fong grinned, thinking silently in his mind, and then returned to the throne in a flash. The completeness of the hive is not something to worry about. What is worrying is the point of evolution. Report. While Chin Fong was thinking about where to go to gain some evolution points, and thinking about G Dog King again and again, a ninth level radiant worker bee flew in and knelt in front of Chin Fong. King Chi. The G Dog King has gathered a large number of G Dogs and started to attack us. A lot of the newly built branch nests have been destroyed along the way. Chin Fong listened to the report and calculated his manpower. Now is not the time to be tough. All the worker bees disperse. And those who can't hold it will abandon the hive. Just build it up after they leave. Once the G-Dog King leaves the nest, we will sneak attack on his nest. Yes. As such, it would take several days for his hive to regain a significant number of manpower. Suddenly, Chin Feng's mind flashed. And he finally thought of what he should do now. I'm really worried that I can't find the place and time to improve my abilities. Now that you have left the nest, it will be convenient for me. As he spoke, Chin Fong flapped his wings and flew towards the east with a hiss. The direction is exactly the G-Dog King's lair. The small entrance to the north of the barren mountain cave. All the way to the bottom. The G-Dog King was dispatched. It seemed that the whole army was dispatched, and no one was left behind. In fact, the defense in the Spirit Vein Cave was strengthened. However, this was not a problem for Chin Fong. Chin Fong was fast, and had already flown away before the 8th level G-Dog was noticed. Go in and lie down between the two spiritual veins. The two G-Dogs did not lie down at this time, but stood up, paying full attention to their surroundings. Chin Fong lay in the middle of the spiritual veins and directly activated the Tian Shin Hard technique, reaching all four limbs. The system, the body is strengthened. Ding! The host has successfully strengthened its body, and the number of enhancements is one. As the sound of the system sounded, the feeling of bone cracks in the whole body came again. Tan Xiang strengthened in the spiritual source. When the bone cracks opened, a steady stream of spiritual sources poured into the body. This time it wasn't as painful as the last time, but it lasted longer. Since Chin Feng's upgrade, spiritual energy suddenly started flowing wildly in the cave, forming a small whirlwind that penetrated Chin Feng's body. The two Ji dogs felt the fluctuations in the spiritual source. When they turned back to look, they saw Chin Feng lying on the spiritual source. They were angry and shocked for a moment. And they bared their teeth and roared at Chin Feng. Whoosh! Enemy attack! Enemy attack! The two G dogs that were close enough bared their teeth at Chin Feng, but did not dare to get too close. After all, they were spiritual veins, and everyone knew their importance. Not to mention that there was a crack in the ground beneath the spiritual veins. Hey hey! Chin Feng felt the Lingyuan hurricane and smiled at the G dogs. The pain in his body was slowly easing and the pain of bone cracking was followed by the relief of body reorganization. Ding! The host's mental technique Tian Shinshin Jue has been successfully upgraded to the third level, and the martial arts skills have been upgraded at the same time. Anyway, those were his skills, and Chen Feng didn't bother to check. As soon as Wu Dao Sword Chi came out, he killed two G-Dogs instantly. The G-Dogs attracted by the G-Dog shouts at the door all became Chen Feng's evolution points. Miso Miso Miso. The evolution point increased by 100 points. 
in addition to the 500 points gained in the past few days. Jin Feng put all his efforts into creativity. Looking at the evolution point that required 20,000 yuan, Jin Feng's head hurt. With a grimace on his face, he continued to fly out with Wu Dao's sword energy and continued to kill the approaching Ji dogs. It would be nice if there was something that could directly add creativity. Jin Feng sighed and flew out of the cave. When he came out, he met the starlight worker bees who came to rob the Ji dog king's lair again. At this time, most of them had already reached the sixth level. Moreover, robbery is an addiction. Seeing Chen Feng coming out, they all knelt down and led Chen Feng to get them all up. Then madness disappeared and went to rob the spiritual treasure. For a time, the Ji Dog King destroyed the hive in revenge, and Chen Feng came again to steal the elixir. After the two sides competed, they still expected the Dog King to suffer, but there was nothing the Dog King could do against Chen Feng. The scarlet eyes of the Ji Dog King were waiting for the black wind bees flying around in the sky and the fangs that could not be closed were so angry that they stretched out two feet. What if we can't kill all these little guys? The Jigo King got angry, and once again led the Jigo to clean the area. However, Jin Feng had already ordered him to fly if he couldn't beat him, and to play if he could beat him. Pure play. Who told the G-Dog King not to fly? After two days and half a month, the total number of worker bees refreshed from Jin Feng's hive, plus the remaining ones, reached 20,000. Chen Feng clicked on the attribute panel, looked at the evolution and said, It's time to get some evolution points. Buzz. Chen Feng flapped his wings and flew out, taking 10,000 worker bees with him directly into the blood birch forest. At this time, in the blood birch forest, 5,000 G dogs led by the G dog king were sweeping through the area, scratching to pieces the branch nest that Chen Feng had just built. Chen Feng stared at the G dog king. His tail needle flashed out and his Wu Dao sword energy flashed around him. Jigo King also discovered Chen Feng, and rushed towards Chen Feng with a roar. With a ninth level strength, his whole body was glowing with red light, and a fishy aura suddenly floated out. Vomit! Chen Feng, who was originally going to fight, turned directly. Hey, I need to gain some evolutionary points, so I can't stand the taste. It's too bad. Chapter 61 Red Train King Snake Chin Feng turned around and rushed into the Jigo crowd. The Wuda sword flew with great speed and pierced the Jigo's body with one strike. Ji Dog King, who was about to charge forward, stopped for a moment. The Jigo King never expected that Chin Feng would have such strength. He was two meters long at the ninth level, and even the psychic energy he exerted throughout his body might not be able to withstand the sword Chin Feng was using at this moment. After giving instructions to drag Chin Feng, Ji Dog King quietly disappeared among the dogs. Chin Feng didn't care. He just committed suicide happily. Swish! 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 Three swords flew out. A G dog surrounded Chin Feng. Chin Feng vibrated his wings to keep them in a fixed space. The Wuda sword was running like a roller aperture. Block! After blocking, Chin Feng followed suit, and the aperture instantly expanded. The A G dogs that were already close to him moved their spiritual source apertures and did not resist at all. Shichi! Several swords pierced the body, and the G-Dogs fell to the ground one after another. If King G-Dog turns around at this time, he will see a mountain of dog corpses, and he is the only one alive. Dogs are easy to kill, but they are too tiring to kill. In the end, Chin Feng simply laid down on a tree and flew out with his Wu Dao sword to assassinate him. If he hadn't brought a straw, he would have started drinking honey. On the other side, G-Dog King got down on all fours and ran quickly to the northeast. After running through streams and rivers and dense jungles. An hour later, we came to a dark cave. The entire cave is on the other side of the snow capped mountains. It is a plateau mountain that is comparable to the snow capped mountains. There is no vegetation on the mountain, and it is all smooth stone surfaces. It was pitch dark on the plateau mountain, and the G Dog King was kneeling at the entrance of the cave. Crying with tears in his eyes, Hao Chen Feng bullied him and stole the elixir he offered to the king. Russell! After two sounds, a huge red snake emerged from the darkness of the cave and stood half upright. It had red scales all over its body like a battle armor. Its vertical pupils stared at the G-Dog King. The letter protruded 20 centimeters long. Looking at the G-Dog King seemed to see things. But the G-Dog King didn't want to swallow it because it smelled too fishy. Sloppy dog, what are you doing here on the plateau mountain? G-Dog King burst into tears and cried again. Chi Lian snake nodded and turned back to the cave. After a while, Chi Lian Snake came out again. The king said he could help you. 
but everything comes at a price. Do you understand? Understand. The G-Dog King quickly nodded and bowed in response. But he was feeling bitter in his heart. Now that he had nothing, what could he use to honor the Red Snake King? It was absolutely impossible to sacrifice his own people. So I was afraid he could only sacrifice his spiritual veins. Let's go! Chi Lian Chi said in disgust without even looking at G-Dog King. The Red Snakes walked out. And in an instant, 5,000 Red Snakes emerged from the cave without a sound. Each one was red all over with fiery red scales like armor. Although they are all snakes with a first-level mirror, the red-trained snake at the head is even more of a second-level mirror. Demon cultivators must first cultivate before they can enter the realm. Unlike humans, humans start by entering the realm directly. If a demon wants to break through the realm of Taoism, it is a life-or-death situation, and it requires genius, earth, treasure, heaven, time, and place to come together. When the G-Dog King saw the Red Snake King sending out its elite, he immediately became energetic and heard the strange sword energy used by Chin Feng. He felt that Chin Feng had definitely not reached the Mirror Realm. Perhaps after Chi Lian she kills Chin Feng, he will no longer look down on his spiritual veins. Ji Go Wang was like this. So he hurriedly followed him and reported his findings to Chi Lian Shi and the strange weapons used by Chin Feng. Sure enough, Red Snake became interested. From Plateau Mountain to the southeast. There is a snow-capped mountain that has turned into a snow-capped pit. G-Dog King kept running very fast. But when we turned back, the team was huge and a little full. Therefore, the Jigo King did not know that in just half a day's back and forth, his Jigo team was about to be killed by Chin Feng. Ding! The host successfully killed the 8th level monster and obtained 13,985 evolution points. Ding! A large number of enemy attacks have been detected 5,000 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. Chin Feng was really tired of killing. He was lying on the tree trunk and added the newly obtained evolution points to his creativity. In this way, the hive could be upgraded again. When Lang Beating heard the sound of the system, Chin Feng reacted instantly and flew directly into the air. In the forest 5,000 meters away, a puff of smoke rose, and the direction of the smoke was exactly where he was currently occupying. Ding! An enemy attack has been detected 2,000 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. The enemy attack was approaching. So Chin Feng flew directly over. When he was still a thousand meters away, he finally saw clearly through the branches. It's the Red Refined King Snake. When Chin Feng saw the Red Refined King Snake, the scroll he had inherited in his mind shone a little brightly. It recorded how the Red Refined King Snake parachuted into the Blood Forest and then occupied the entire Blood Forest. But something was wrong. But Chin Feng didn't know what was wrong. In the past few days, I haven't seen the humans or beasts who arrived because of the collapse of the snow mountain. They seemed to have suddenly disappeared. And it seemed as if nothing had happened. Chin Feng looked at the red refined king snake that was about to rush towards him. He flew into the air and looked at the direction of the snow mountain. It was true that it had collapsed. There is no problem with the snow-capped mountains. But there is a problem with the entire forest. Five thousand king snakes shone fiery red in the sun. Chin Feng showed his tail needle and stabbed directly at the head of the king snake. Even if I can't beat him, I still have to try to see how far I can't beat him. Chin Feng did not use Wudao sword chi and stabbed the red refined king snake with his tail needle. Chin Feng felt a dull pain in his tail and couldn't penetrate it at all. Once hit, Chin Feng did not fight consecutively. He was originally very fast. But when he suddenly took action, he simply turned back and escaped with one stab. You bastard! Come down and die! With the snake backing him up, the G-Dog King began to show off his power. Chin Feng flew in the air, looked at the G-Dog King who jumped up, and then looked at Chi Lian's snake. He calmly said nothing and directly returned his troops. After all, the Red Refined King snake has no wings and cannot catch up. Fly away directly? What is this operation? Ji Go Wang planned to fight to the death with Chin Feng. So why did he withdraw immediately after meeting in person? G-Dog King felt as if he had swallowed a fly and felt uncomfortable. When he saw the dog corpses piled up on the ground, the dog's eyes were scarlet, and he was in a daze. And a breath of bad breath directly entered the trachea. Okay. The people and the bees have already killed enough. Why don't you leave now and stay here to celebrate the new year? Chin Feng! The angry voice of the G-Dog King roared out Chin Feng's name. Chin Feng heard this and continued to fly away without stopping. The hive will be upgraded soon. It's not a good time to cause trouble now. Chin Feng thought in his mind smeared the soles of his feet with oil, 
and disappeared before G Dog King and Red Refined King Snake could react. Also disappearing were all the branch nests within the Blood Birch Forest. What's so shameful about running? I'm not a human being and have no principles. The southeastern part of the Blood Birch Forest was so large that Shen Feng had nowhere to go for the time being. So he went directly back to Xiao Feng Lin. Send the order, and all the bees will return to the outskirts of the Blood Forest. Yes! Chapter 62 Start Heading North Chin Feng withdrew completely, leaving only the SH, L of the Hive, and nothing else. In the Blood Birch Forest, the Red Snake King stared at the G-Dog King with cold eyes. Is this what you call needing reinforcements? Nothing happened except that he stung me with a needle and ran faster than a mosquito? Is it still making you miserable like this? After repeated questioning, G-Dog King did nothing with his tail between his legs, wishing he could pretend he didn't exist. All the pain can only be swallowed in his stomach. God knows how much he wants to tear Chen Feng into pieces, pull out his six limbs, and chop Chen Feng into pulp. Snort! The red refined king snake snorted coldly and led the snake team away without looking back. His indifferent attitude showed that he was very angry and the consequences would be serious. The snake king is currently very dissatisfied with your actions. Please take care of yourself. After the scarlet lian king snake left, the other scattered G-dogs gathered around the G-dog king each one howling and telling their dissatisfaction with Chen Feng. The corpses of Jigo were piled up and down in the blood birch forest, which showed the horror of the battle. So many people died, which was even more unexpected by Jigo King. How could this happen? So many people died? Even though his team was huge, 5,000 of them died in one go, causing the G-Dog King to spit out a mouthful of blood. It was like a sharp knife thrust into G-Dog King's heart. G-Dog King's eyes were scarlet, his fangs that couldn't be closed opened his mouth wide, and his saliva dripped onto the ground, which was very smelly. Chin Fong! G Dog King gritted his teeth and read out the name. Search for me! Find Chin Fong for me! Clear out his lairs one by one! And clean them out! The G Dog King had a vague hunch that Chin Feng's ambitions were not limited to the Blood Birch Forest, even though Chin Fong had already made the G Dog King fearful, and he has been given up by the Red Snake King. But King Jigo knew that if Chen Feng broke through his defenses and occupied the Blood Birch Forest, he would die faster. Inside Xia Fenglin, Chen Feng sat on the throne, drinking honey through a straw and opening the attribute panel. I'm still a little short of evolution points. I'm annoyed. I'm a little annoyed just by killing enemies. I don't make much money, and I'm exhausted. Is there no magic medicine that I can take? Chen Feng clicked on the system panel, looked at the elixirs in the space carefully, and sighed. This feeling of knowing that I am desperately poor. Guarding the treasure mountain, but having no use for it is really frustrating and uncomfortable. Gone! If you're tired of working, other beasts won't be happy either. Chin Feng threw away the straw and summoned the leaders of the Glory Worker Bee and the Star Glory Worker Bee. At this time, due to the elixir that Chin Feng led and snatched, the strength of the Shingi Worker Bees has been rising steadily, and the highest level has reached the eighth level. Eight Worker Bees knelt in front of Chin Feng. The order is passed. All the worker bees will hide themselves to protect themselves. It is important to improve their own power. You can put down other things first and organize the peripheral forces to spread and improve them. If there are any bees who think I'm not on the periphery and have any ideas, you know what to do. Other races can have their own management standards, but they can't have second thoughts. Do you understand? After Chen Feng finished speaking, he looked at the eight kneeling worker bees below. He knew clearly about the Guangyu worker bees, and mainly looked at the Xingyu worker bees. Even though the Star Glory worker bees can't figure out where their king developed glory, all the Glory worker bees have a series of attitudes that they can learn from and admire. Here in Chen Feng, there is only loyalty and death, or have the ability to destroy him. After the explanation, Chen Feng flapped his wings and flew out. The direction is west, next door, about 20 miles away. The place was desolate, but across a bullfighting mountain was the outskirts of the blood forest, roughly approaching the north, and vegetation gradually appeared. The road was barren. Even Chen Feng opened the system to explore and didn't teach a single elixir. The Gobi was really desolate. Ding! An enemy attack has been detected 5,000 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. Chen Feng ignored the system prompts and continued moving forward. Ding! An enemy attack has been detected 2,000 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. Next door, close to the vegetation, is a stone forest. Strange stones are lying in the low shrubs, and they have been built by people to look like a cave on land. 
Chen Feng flew closer and looked down. Looking at it, I found that we were still old friends. Emperor Spider. Hey! Chen Feng became interested and swooped down. Landing on the top of a pinnacle in the stone forest, the Emperor Spider had already discovered the enemy attack. And at a glance, it was definitely Chen Feng. Why is this evil star? Instantly remembering the fear of being dominated by Chen Feng, the entire swarm of Emperor Spiders violently moved, gathering in a dark mass into the cave. All surrounding the spider eggs, the Emperor Spider King crawled out and looked at Chen Feng's position with a worried look on his face. Don't panic! Don't panic! I was just passing by! Really passing by! I saw you so I came down to say H, Lo! We are all old friends! Chen Feng shouted quickly. After all, the Emperor Spider couldn't keep up with his needs now. No. 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 It's still a friendly passing by. It's definitely not because the other party's level is too low and can't keep up with the demand. He has no intention of killing the Blood Forest. Otherwise, all species will be wiped out except for the Black Wind Bee. And the world will be too boring. Seeing Chen Feng's behavior, he did not make further custom orders. The Emperor Spider relaxed a little, but did not let down his guard. Then you've already passed by and said H, Lo. So hurry up and leave. We don't welcome you here. Chin Feng was unhappy when he heard that they were being chased away. He casually let out his murderous intention, jumped off the stone, and landed directly on the forefoot of the Emperor Spider King. He also spoke with momentum. No hurries. The Emperor Spider King instantly became honest and stood still. Look, if I don't kill you, I just treat you as allies. Let's talk about anything fun lately. When Chen Feng opened his mouth, the Spider King couldn't help but obey, because he has deeply felt the intimidation exuded by the species that is only as big as his toes at this moment. There is no one who was forced to be an ally by B. The Emperor Spider doesn't have much IQ and has a strong desire to win, as long as the opponent doesn't attack him. That's fine. According to Chen Feng's question, I will answer it accordingly. In the Emperor Spider's limited knowledge, it only knew that there were bigger landowners in the north. So when Chen Feng occupied the other three areas, the Emperor Spider crossed the Gobi and migrated north to avoid disaster. Chen Feng rubbed his chin with his front foot and listened to the information given by Mikado. After all, inheritance has been around for a long time, and its form has changed many times. It still depends on the current situation. Chen Feng immediately stabilized himself and allowed the hive to continue dormant and develop secretly. Now the only way to become truly powerful is to strengthen his own strength. After saying H, Lo, Chen Feng continued to fly north. Don't worry if you don't go and see him. Only by knowing yourself and the enemy can you win every battle. This is the principle that Chen Feng has always adhered to. After flying 20 miles again, this place is already quite close to the north, which is the other side of the snow mountain pit. If the snow mountain forms one third of the blood forest, then the entire two thirds of the blood forest lies to the north. Further inside, it is like a continent with no end in sight. Chapter 63 Shuanya Ziajintan His After truly stepping into the north, various snakes began to appear on the other side of the dividing line. To the north is simply a large snake cave. Ding! A large number of enemy attacks have been detected 1,000 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. Snakes are reptiles and move close to the ground. Chin Feng deliberately flew much higher, brushing against the treetops, stopping behind the tree trunks, and then flying to the top of the rocks. Ding! An enemy attack has been detected 1,000 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. Moving forward again, a red figure appeared among the dense branches and leaves. It was the red refined king snake. Chin Feng's eyes lit up, and he followed. It really comes to whatever you want. Chin Feng was small in stature but fast. He followed the red refined king snake and shuttled through the top of the dense forest. He could lie down here or stay for a while without any problem. Although the red refined king snake is as big as a python. It is not slow at all. Chin Feng needs to use all his strength to keep up. Is this the power of Yi Zhongjing? The Red Refined King Snake that day was obviously a second level mirror. And the 5,000 Red Refined King Snakes he carried were all first level mirrors. At that time, when I tried it for the first time, I felt the real gap in strength. Now that I am only at the ninth level, it seems that I need to upgrade as soon as possible. But it is too slow to increase evolution points just by killing enemies. It is not ideal to kill species in such a huge number. He doesn't want to be a lonely king. The red refined king snake was walking on the ground. And Chen Feng was flying above. Following along. The red refined king snake passed through most of the Tulong Canyon in the north. Flying past. 
Chin Feng saw it in his eyes, and calculated in his heart. If you want to truly grasp the inner strength, it seems you need something. Looking at the general map passed down by Dajin Long, we can see that the entire north is a large natural basin, which is suitable for the survival of snakes, insects, rats and ants. The entire basin is sunken 10 meters down, with a circle of purple cypress around the edge. There is a huge waterfall on the side, with the snow-capped mountains behind it. The cave under the waterfall should be the lair of the Red Snake King. I just don't know what kind of mirror the Red Refined Snake King is at this time. Chen Feng estimated that the Red Lian King Snake King was around the fifth level mirror in strength. The Red Refined King Snake followed by Chen Feng circled most of the outside of the Purple Cypress Circle, and then started to return to the Snow Mountain Waterfall in the east. It seems they are out on patrol? After Chen Feng roughly knew the location, he did not continue to follow but turned around and started to look inside the basin. The terrain here is vast, and there are many hills and scenery in the middle of the basin. There are already densely packed red king snakes guarding or patrolling, and the number is a bit unusual. Ding! I found Huangjia's top grade elixir. Shuanya Zaya Jintan. Ding! I found the heavenly top grade elixir. Golden Snake Bodhi. With a maturity level of 80%. It is expected to mature in 10 days. Please pay attention to the host. As soon as the system beeped, Chen Feng flew down onto a bush and hid his figure. After all, it is short here, so it is easy to be spotted by the Red Refined King Snake. How can you guard two elixirs in one place? Chen Feng felt strange and lurked inside to check. He must find out. Soon, above a small waterfall, two plants were growing in the rock gaps of the Bear Mountain. There was no cover on the mountain. Chen Feng did not dare to fly up rashly. He could only look up from the leaves of the shrubs below. I saw a black epiphyllum blooming next to a golden two-leaf shrub. All the silver light emitted by the epiphyllum was absorbed by the golden two-leaf shrub. This was the first time Chen Feng had seen such a companion plant. Can the system check this half-grown plant? Ding! The host can peep on his own without turning on the detection function. Oh! Can peeping be used like this? Chen Feng looked at Curfew Tan and stared. Peep! Ding! The host successfully used peeping. The target is Shuanya Ziajintan which is high-grade yellow-grade and a companion grade Xing grade Can it be eaten by the host? Increase evolution points by 5,000 points. What the H, L? Evolution point? Chin Feng thought he heard wrongly and used peep again. But the system just repeated the announcement. The excitement is beyond words. It's not a loss this time. You can say you're making a profit. Chin Feng locked his eyes on Xiao Jin Tan and then looked at Golden Snake Bodhi. Only the little shrimps make the choice. And I want all the hard work. Ten days? That's enough. Chin Feng was not in a hurry to go back, but turned around and flew in the direction of the Snow Mountain Waterfall. Along the way, as he approached the Snow Mountain Waterfall, the Double Mirror Red Refined King Snake began to appear. The aura around the Double Mirror was enough to make the legs of the little shrimps outside tremble. Chin Feng lay down behind a tree trunk and looked at the entrance under the waterfall. From this look, it felt a bit like a water curtain cave but he didn't know if there was a cave inside. Chin Feng knew that the reason why Lintai Cave Mansion was located here was because there were either spiritual treasures or cave heaven paradise. Chin Feng looked down and realized that there must be many treasures inside. It's not certain whether there will be spiritual veins of a higher grade. After staying outside for more than half an hour, Chin Feng was careful not to disturb the second mirror red refining king snake and flew into the snow-capped mountains. From the snow mountain pit, we went straight back to Xiao Feng Tian. Plot! You have to have a plan to have a strategy. Chin Feng sat on the throne of Xiao Feng Tian Lord's lair. The spiritual veins and laid on the throne slowly emitted spiritual energy to nourish Chin Feng's body. But for Chin Feng's current state, the spiritual source is not enough. Chin Feng habitually rubbed his chin to think about the exam. Come on, B! After Chin Feng called out, two ninth-level glorious worker bees came in and knelt down in front of Chin Feng to listen to the order. If you spread it, it will be said that a spiritual treasure will appear in the North Basin in 10 days, and it will be a high-grade heavenly treasure. In this way, when the ant bites the elephant, there is no need to worry about the Red Refined King and the Snake King not coming out. Yes! Two worker bees took the order and flew out. Chen Feng may not necessarily be interested in the top-grade Tianjia. He is interested in the companion plant of the Golden Snake Bodhi, Xiao Jin Tan. After all, there are a lot of Tianjia in his space but who would dislike something with such a high quality? But in the blood forest, where high-level spiritual treasures were scarce, the disputes were even more ferocious. 
Chen Feng's main purpose at this moment is to upgrade the hive. Strength represents everything. And the further you enter the blood forest, the greater the need for strength. The small first level mirror was not enough in Chen Feng's eyes. But the real life first level mirror still made the bees afraid. After all, the highest level of Chen Feng's worker bees at this time was only ninth level. 10 days. It is also the key for Chen Feng to upgrade the hive. On the ninth day, Chen Feng's hive now had 1 to 200 ninth level worker bees, 5,000 eighth level worker bees, and several other worker bees. Most of the glorious worker bees are at the seventh level at this time, and only a few have reached the eighth level. There are a total of 50,000 worker bees that can be mobilized, and the remaining 20,000 are scattered around the periphery of the blood forest and the blood birch forest defense line. Just being in the outer circle and trying to plot things in the inner circle is not enough. Chin Feng did not intend to take out all of the 50,000 animals. He divided 20,000 of them to stay in various places, ready to assemble at any time, and distributed all the most elite ninth level worker bees along the way from the Blood Birch Forest defense line to the inner circle, forming a huge encirclement. Chapter 64 An Iron Bastard 900 ninth level worker bees were scattered into nine teams, leading 20,000 worker bees on the Blood Birch Forest defense line. Just in case, the troops were divided into three groups. The worker bees who were ambushing in the second group took care of the G-Dog King to avoid any trouble later. Chin Feng himself took 100 to 9th level worker bees and 10,000 7th level and 6th level shining worker bees directly through the snow mountain pit and headed towards the Great Basin. After the snow mountain collapsed, it was still covered with snow and not many birds and animals came to set up camp. This is also the reason why after the snow mountain collapsed, only a small group of people appeared and did not cause a large-scale sensation. The snow mountain had not melted. These monsters and people thought that the snow mountain was just a ground change, and the spiritual treasure was still inside, but was buried. Underneath, the snow has not melted, indicating that the formation is still there. These beasts only guessed half of it right. The formation was indeed still there. That was because Chen Feng had not triggered it before. But the treasures were empty. Buzz buzz! A large black swarm of black wind bees flew over and went directly to the snow mountain pit from Feng Tian. Without disturbing anyone else or anything, Chin Feng was familiar with the road and led the swarm of worker bees. After half a day, they passed through the snow mountain pit. The snow mountain waterfall in the north originally leaned against the snow mountain pit. Chin Feng led 10,000 worker bees to lie on the north side of the snow mountain pit. In front of them was the snow mountain waterfall. There are still a few towering trees here in the north. They are the few that protruded from the secret realm after the collapse of the snow mountain pit. But they did not attract the attention of other beasts. It takes an opportunity to enter the secret realm. It doesn't mean you can enter by finding something. But now this opportunity has been used up by Chen Feng. The rest of the time is waiting. The dark night is falling. And movement has begun to occur in the distant surroundings. Ding! A large number of enemy attacks have been detected 5,000 meters ahead. In order to confirm. Chin Feng took advantage of the darkness and flew out to the 2,000 meter point. Ding! A large number of enemy attacks were found 5,000 meters ahead. Host, please pay attention. Listening to the system information, Chin Feng understood clearly. What he should pay attention to must be a large number of high-level enemy attacks. According to Chin Feng's considerations, at least 50,000 people were waiting for the Red Refined Snake King. Chin Feng suddenly felt a little annoyed. Why did he forget to let Jean Shipon take a peek? I quickly realized that I had to get it anyway. And it would be the same when I look at it. Thinking of this, Chin Feng was instantly relieved. Ha ha. I don't know if the Red Train King Snake King likes the surprise I prepared for him. I'm looking forward to it. It's also dark and windy. Ding ding ding. It had been a long night. And at dawn the system was ringing like crazy. Various sounds of climbing and falling into the water came from the cave under the snow-capped mountain waterfall. The Red Refined King Snake King is out? Chin Feng quickly popped his head out to investigate. Really? I saw two teams of 20 triple mirror red king snakes crawling out side by side. Followed by a huge red king snake with a horn on its head. A red body. A body of 10 meters long. And spitting out a 50 centimeter letter. It's the red refined king snake king. 40 triple mirrors in front and 40 triple mirrors in the backs around the red refined snake king and protected tightly. Chin Feng looked at the red lian king and the snake king wondering whether he should catch a glimpse. There are beasts everywhere anyway. If you are discovered, who will know it's me? That's right. Peep. After saying that, Chin Feng directly used Peep. While using it, 
The red refined king snake king turned his head and looked in Chen Feng's direction as if he was feeling something. However, time was running out and he did not pursue the matter, but rushed towards the basin. Discovered. Ding! The host successfully used peeping. Target. Red refined king snake king. Quadruple mirror. Skills. Poisonous fong. Three yuan zero fire. Although he was discovered, Chen Feng's peeping was based on distance. As long as the distance was enough, anyone of any level could peek. The weakness of skills depended on his own strength and the strength of the opponent. Chin Feng felt a little pained when he heard the sound of the system. As much as you can breathe fire. Hey! This lighter will light your fire today. The red refined king snake walked away side by side and took away a large number of the king snake's followers, which gave Chin Feng a chance. All worker bees obey orders. Yes! Stay all the ninth level and eighth level worker bees. And let me double the red refining king snake's nest. The old rule is that any elixir you find will be given to you for your own use. If it's a little special, you can see the donation for yourself. This king. There were less than 10,000 level 6 worker bees left. Chin Feng took them with him and followed the team of the red refined king and the snake king as they quietly headed towards the great basin. On the outermost big tree, Chin Feng no longer had to think about hiding anything because there were many species densely gathered here. All come in the spirit of the golden snake. Although the red refined king snake controls the strength of the north. This loyalty is not enough in the face of the temptation of the elixir. All the swords were facing each other, and they surrounded. Not a single jigo was seen. And it seemed that the team had already laid an ambush. Choke! There was only a sound. And no one knew who bumped into whom. A wild boar suddenly arched towards an iron tortoise in front of him. The iron tortoise flew directly into the air, and hit the red refined king snake king in the face. The elixir treasure that originally belonged to him was being spied on by everyone. The red refined king snake king was already angry enough. But now he was slapped in the face by a live broadcast. And his whole body was radiating coldness. The moment he was slapped in the face, the iron bastard fell to the ground. The red refined king snake king directly opened his mouth and spat out a stream of essence fire, roasting the iron bastard until it was fragrant, and swallowed it in one gulp. Dark red eyes scanned the surroundings coldly. This. Aren't you going to fight? Chin Feng lay down behind the tree and stared blankly. Ding! The golden snake Bodhi will mature in half an hour. Host, please pay attention. The system prompt sounded. But the people below were still anxious. It was obvious that the highest level of the beasts who came to seize the treasure was only level 3. They felt that they were no match for the huge first level mirror team of the red refined king snake. So they began to feel a little timid. What if we don't fight? Chin Feng is not happy anymore. He worked so hard to lure you here. Are you just here to watch the show? Chin Feng flapped his wings and quietly flew behind the jumping red king snake, which was a first level mirror. With a flash of silver light, Wu Dao Sword Chi struck out, cutting a first layer mirror of the red refined king snake into two ends. Before the red refined king snake died, Wu's poison was used. Another hound next to the snake. The hunting dog was poisoned and howled wildly. In front of him was a red king snake broken into two parts. The red refined king snake king saw this. His eyes narrowed into slits. And he became completely angry. Hiss! Nobuko spit out. And an army of 20,000 red king snakes immediately attacked and attacked the surrounding areas. Oh! Those who want to retreat can no longer do it. And those who don't want to fight can only fight to save their lives. After Chen Feng successfully messed up the matter, he returned to the big tree where he stopped. There were densely packed worker bees brought by Chin Feng, and they began to pick up leaks frantically. Worker bees have smaller bodies, making it easier for them to shuttle through various gaps. Ouch! Woof woof! Hiss! Hiss! For a time, there was no place to stand in the entire Great Basin, and they were all fighting together. Chin Feng was flying in the air, and when he saw the opportunity, he flew out and killed the two monsters who were fighting happily. We're all going to die anyway! So why not take advantage of me? I'm not even close to the point of evolution. Chapter 65 Treasure Hunt After all, the basin is the territory of the Snake King. And the red refined King Snake Army led by the Snake King is more orthodox like an army. Everything is well trained and well coordinated. According to the 10 minute maturation time of the elixir, it only took 3 minutes for the red refined King Snake to clear a small clearing. At this time, those who came to rub the treasure finally understood who they were against. Then some animals began to flee in all directions. Seeing this, Chin Feng was flying in the air, and the golden snake Bodhi was halfway up the mountain. 
It might not be easy to fly up. If all the beasts were gone, he would be in trouble. Chin Fong gave an order, and all the worker bees joined the battlefield. But the thunder was loud, and the raindrops were light. All of them attacked the red refined king snake halfway up the mountain and all the way up. It looks like the formation is huge. But in fact it flies so high that no one can hit anyone. But just such a cover action gave hope to the other beasts that were originally bullied by the red refining king snake. They have already suffered such a loss today. And they have plans to break off your spiritual treasure and piss you off at any cost. Buzz buzz! The worker bees took the lead. And the other beasts followed. Gathering in one direction and swarming away. Seeing that something was wrong, the red refined king snake king opened his bloody mouth and breathed fire. Return to defense. If anyone dares to take a step forward, I will kill him without leaving any body intact. Get away! The golden snake Bodhi was originally transplanted here carefully by him. And the thought he put into it is inextricably linked. And the sun and moon can illuminate it. Not to mention trying to find a small golden tan that can accompany the golden snake and Bodhi. The snake king flicked his long tail, making a snapping sound in the air, mixed with vigorous energy, and hit the nearby animal, causing its head to be dislocated. The strength of the fourfold mirror is in another realm, facing a monster that has not even risen to the mirror. It is like the strength of humans and ants. The red refined king snake was angry, and the snake team raised its tail and surrounded the basin. Ding! The golden snake Bodhi will mature in two minutes. Please pay attention to the host. The sound of the system sounded, and the worker bees continued to hover in the air to cause trouble or cover. Chin Fong turned around and looked halfway up the mountain, where golden light was already emerging. At this time, the sun was high in the sky, and it was the exact moment of noon. The Red Snake King below was also anxious, and used all his strength to massacre these ignorant people, seeing that the battle was about to end. Ding! The Golden Snake Bodhi is mature. Please pay attention to the host. The bold ones will be starved to death, and the timid ones will be starved to death. How can I? Chun Fong. Give up what I. Chun Fong. Like to others? This has always been Chun Feng's principle. The weak will eat the strong. Even if he is weak now, he will still eat the strong. Chin Fong quickly arranged for the worker bees to evacuate. The worker bees moved quickly and dispersed with a buzzing sound. They withdrew the second line of defense to help return to the defense. Chin Fong flapped his wings and flew directly towards the golden snake Bodhi halfway up the mountain. Chin Fong was fast and arrived in the blink of an eye. At this time, the red snake king was opening his mouth to swallow a monster beast. When he turned around, Chin Feng's small figure had already flown halfway up the mountain. Call out! Chin Fong has space. He only needs to fly to a distance of one meter from the items. And then he can directly pick the items and put them into the space. Halfway up the mountain, a shadow flickered, and the originally brilliant golden snake Bodhi disappeared. Hiss! Dumb! The red refined king snake looked at the bare mountainside. A pair of vertical pupils spurted fire directly, opened its big mouth, and directed the Yuenhua at the mountainside to burn half of the mountain. But Chin Fong was fast and had already flown away. Chin Fong was originally something that the red refined king snake king saw but didn't pay attention to. He never expected to be hit in the face by such an inconspicuous little thing. Chase me! Find this thing for me! The second level King Snake, who had gone to support the G-Dog King before, widened his eyes at the same time. He never expected that he would be persecuted by such a thing. In an instant, he led 10,000 King Snakes and headed southeast. However, with the snowy mountains in the middle, their route became the line that Chin Fong had planned to fulfill as the Jigo King's territory. It will be an encounter. Chin Fong took the elixir and flew directly through the snow mountain pit to Xiao Feng Tian. On the way to fly, he directly nodded Xuan Ye Xiao Jin Tan and saw a faint black mist appear from the body flying in the air. Chin Fong was so fast that a long black shadow even appeared in the air, floating over the snow mountain pit. This made people later who mistakenly believed that the miracle of the snow-capped mountains was still there, more convinced that it was true. Well, after swallowing the elixir, Chin Fong intuitively felt that as soon as his body was in the air, his evolution points increased by 5,000. There is still one mile away from Xiao Feng Tian. Chin Fong spent all his evolution points on creativity in the air, and all the remaining evolution points on speed. Fortunately, I just missed it and killed hundreds of little monsters. Otherwise, I wouldn't be able to keep up with this point of evolution. Now Chin Feng's attributes are Attack, 0 slash 10,000 Defense, 0 slash 10,000 Speed, 50 slash 10,000. Creativity, 
20,000 slash 20,000. Evolution points, 0. Number of reinforcements, 1. Number of evolutions, 0. In the blink of an eye, Chin Feng returned to the hive. The hive in Xiao Feng Tian Tian Cave was now as large as 40 cubic meters. Ding! Check that the hive integrity is 100%. Is the host upgraded now? Upgrade! Wait! Can the system speed up the upgrade of the hive? Time is running out. The system paused for two seconds, as if making a decision, and then sounded again. Ding! The hive has been successfully upgraded, and 50% of the host's honey has been deducted. The estimated upgrade time is two days. Chin Fong heard the voice and murmured. Two days is fine. After saying that, he got directly into the space. There were so many elixirs in the space, and there must be some that he could consume directly. However, it took time to classify them and arrange a series of upgrades. Therefore, Chin Feng did not spare time to search for them, and instead chose to pick Xuanya Ziajintan. After all, the G-Dog King is also a threat. The red refined king snake behind the G-Dog King makes Chin Feng afraid. Instead of taking it easy, it's better to be ruthless. In the current space, because January 3rd has been tidied up, gray-white light can already be seen. System, where is the elixir with the same properties as Xuanya Ziajintan? Ding! We are searching for the host. Ding! We found 20 Shuanya Ziajintan plants, 3 purple leaf magic flowers, and 5 TNI Sanchikeo plants. The elixir found by the system was instantly placed in front of Chin Feng. Looking at his attribute panel, Chin Feng swallowed 6 Shuanya Ziajintan directly without thinking, and his body burst out with golden light. There will be 30,000 more evolution points. Chin Feng directly added evolution points to attributes. Chin Feng sat on the throne and his spiritual veins exuded traces of spiritual energy that warmed Chin Feng's body. What Chin Feng didn't know was that if he had not strengthened his body before, he would not be able to consume elixirs to increase evolution points. Otherwise, the system would not prompt him. Ding! The host successfully takes the companion elixir to increase the evolution points to 20,000 points, triggering the Divine Favor Pavilion 6 of 100. The host will be rewarded with a body-tempering pill. At this time, the Blood Birch Forest was already at war. The Red Refined King Snake Team chased after them. Although there was a huge gap in strength between the Worker Bees and the Snake Team. Chin Feng ambushed all the ninth level Worker Bees here. The attributes of the Worker Bees were one-tenth of Chin Feng's. He took the lead in ambush and took advantage of the terrain. This caused the Red Refined King Snakes to suffer unspeakably. Chapter 66 Preparing for Transfer One day passed. And Chin Feng left the newly spawned ninth level Worker Bees in the hive. Now that he has gone out hastily, Chin Feng is worried that the Snake King will notice the location of his real hive. Let's go to Xiao Feng Lin. Xiao Feng Lin below Xiao Feng Tian has a huge branch hive that is equivalent to the main hive. Chen Feng usually stays here, and it seems to have become a secondary hive. There are also other hives of various sizes scattered inside Xiao Feng Lin, all of which are used to store honey. For the hive upgrade, Chen Feng had to make complete preparations and make some sacrifices when necessary. The other side, 10,000 king snakes went to chase them. Not to mention they didn't catch anything. And more than half of them were destroyed. And only less than 2,000 came back? That's it? And when the red refined king snake king returned to his lair, he found that his lair had been ransacked by monsters? What? The faint anger had been suppressed for a long time. Not only did the red refined king snake king feel that his inner alchemy was scurrying around, but the whole snake was about to burst with anger. The area around the snow-capped mountains and waterfalls was so low that the air pressure almost exploded. If possible, the Snake Army would like to escape completely and not dare to dodge in front of the Snake King. The Snake King could not find a target to vent his anger, so he directly killed all the Jigo King and the Jigo who managed to survive and came to protect them. Air heard the news at this time. The Snake King directly breathed out fire and scorched a Double King Snake. The Double King Snake's body was charred in black and its eyes were scattered on the ground. Trash! If you can't catch something, why are you coming back? Trash! You can't catch up with such a thing that doesn't even have a mirror. You still have the nerve to live. Drag them all out and kill them! The Snake King wants to kill his own snake. At this time, the Golden Snake Bodhi is no longer important to the Snake King. What is important is that if there are any little things who dare to challenge the majesty in front of him, they must be eradicated in one fell swoop. But what he never expected was that this little thing that suddenly appeared had such great abilities. The red refined king snake king looked at the king snake lying underneath, wondering if he had revealed any information. Come on snake! 
exist. Let Elder Chi Lian lead an army of 10,000 snakes to search out that little bee for me. I will personally pluck out his six limbs and take off his head. Yes. Turn back to Chin Feng. After Chin Feng got the information about temporarily repelling the Red Refined King Snake, he quickly evacuated most of the low-level worker bees and asked them all to leave the Blood Birch Forest and stay temporarily outside the Blood Forest. Chin Feng didn't take any of the spiritual treasures obtained from the Duanchi King Snake's lair and distributed them all as rewards to other worker bees. Chen Feng never makes trouble, but whatever he does is always a big deal. At this moment, it was the critical moment for Hive Upgrade. And after the Hive Upgrade was completed, he planned to transfer the Hive directly. There is still one day left. After Chen Feng made the arrangements, he left some ninth level worker bees to guard the small Feng Lin. And the rest of the worker bees returned to the main nest. If the Hive is gone, you can build it again. If there is an enemy attack, you only need to postpone it until tomorrow. After saying that, Chin Feng flapped his wings and flew out directly, flying towards the foggy area of the Blood Forest to the north. Chen Feng, whose speed increased again, flew out at the speed of a bullet, heading north with all his strength, flying over the snow mountain pit, over the snow mountain basin, and crashed into the foggy area. The foggy area was a place that Chin Feng wandered and walked around the edge without entering when he was exploring the basin. Ding! There is an enemy attack 5,000 meters ahead. Host, please pay attention. As soon as I entered, a system prompt sounded. Fog and night vision are different. And Chin Feng became blind in the foggy forest. Fortunately, after Chin Feng flew forward another 2,000 meters, the world became clear. The birds here are singing. The flowers are fragrant. And the sky is bright. It is no exaggeration to say that it is a paradise and it does not look like the inside of the fierce blood forest. Chin Feng only took a rough look at the map and combined it with the inheritance in his mind to understand that this was the entire center of the blood forest. I just don't know what kind of raised monsters live here now. The misty forest we just passed through, because the visibility inside was too low, could easily be ambushed by various monsters. So it became a relatively safe place. After Chin Feng turned back, he relied on the system prompts to find a tall and towering misty mountain in the misty forest. It seemed that all the fog started from this mountain. And the visibility was extremely low. System. Set a coordinate here. Ding. The coordinates are complete. That's right. Chin Feng plans to move the hive here. Within the natural barrier. Ding. The hive upgrade is 90% complete. Chin Feng drew up the coordinates and checked the surroundings again. Except for the corpses everywhere on the ground in the foggy forest. There were really no other monsters here. Not even birds or beasts. It's not just for some reason. But if any birds or beasts fly in, they can't fly out. And they starve to death in the mist. After making sure everything was safe, Chin Feng flapped his wings again and flew back. If Xiao Feng Lin fails to resist, then Xiao Feng Tian will be too dangerous. If he goes back, he can delay it for a while, as long as he shows up. Chin Feng speeds up his return journey. At this time, the men of the Red Lian King and the Snake King have arrived to the east, where the G Dog King once occupied. They carried out massacres and sweeps, leaving no grass growing anywhere. Chin Feng had never done anything like this, except for the clear evacuation in the air and not a single bee to be seen. All the hives were destroyed by the Red Snake. In Xiaofeng Forest, all the worker bees are entrenched on the trees. If you look at it at this time, you will find that there are densely packed worker bees everywhere. After Chin Feng came back, he stood on the top of Xiao Fenglin's hive and looked east. Ding! A large number of enemy attacks have been detected 5,000 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. Please pay attention to the host. I haven't heard this for a long time. It seems that the number sent by the Red Snake King is not a small number. Chin Feng smiled calmly and opened his mouth. Ding! The honeycomb upgrade completion rate is 95%. System. Can it be faster? Ding! The host has reached the online level by consuming honey to accelerate the upgrade and it can no longer be accelerated. Uh, okay. That's it. The hive has been moved. Although the starry worker bees have been incorporated into the team, they cannot be taken away. Chin Feng had already asked all the Xingya worker bees to leave the blood birch forest and wait for news secretly outside the blood forest. At this time, the entire Xiaofeng forest was filled with none of the glorious worker bees spawned by Chin Feng's hive. Ding! A large number of enemy attacks have been detected 1,000 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. As the system announced, there was also noise outside. Found it. 
Here. Come on. Those nasty black bees have been found. Sasha Shaw. The Red Snake Army turned to its target in an instant and flew toward the mocking sky. It's finally found. The strength of the first level mirror can destroy everything in an instant. It does not intend to leave any time for the opponent to react. It attacks the hive directly when it sees it and shoots the living beings when it sees it. Like a huge sweeping wave. Elder Chi Lian at the entrance raised his head and looked straight at Chin Feng until his eyes focused on Chin Feng. He locked onto Chin Feng, bared his fangs, and roared to the sky. Dumb! Chapter 67 A Mirror Elder Chi Lian of the Triple Mirror, whose speed was not comparable to that of ordinary worker bees. He raised his head and had a big mouth with fangs, and exploded with great energy, killing a large number of worker bees. He ran towards Chin Feng. It moved as soon as Chin Feng moved, and in an instant Elder Chi Lian's tail swept across, and Chin Feng flapped his wings and soared into the air. All worker bees, retreat! Chin Feng shouted and immediately planned to abandon this hive. Even though this hive was second only to the main hive. But if you keep the green hills, you won't have to worry about running out of firewood. Chin Feng made two moves to avoid Elder Chi Lian's attack again. As a third level mirror, he was being played with by a ninth level bug, and Elder Chi Lian's temper suddenly increased. The whole body seemed to be emitting a fire like light. Papa Dash! Pressing down a powerful tail blow. Chin Feng dodged again with ease. The elder was trapped. And it was the opportunity for the other worker bees to evacuate. After listening to Chin Feng's order, all the worker bees flew to a height that was beyond the reach of the red refined king snake and could only use their own energy to attack. Buzz buzz. All the worker bees flew towards the outskirts of the blood forest. Ding! The honeycomb upgrade completion rate is 99%. The sound of the system sounded again. After Chin Feng heard it, he also raised his body and flew towards the outskirts of the blood forest. Elder Chi Lian thought that Chin Feng was going to fight him to the death and was not prepared at all. Seeing that Chin Feng was now escaping, he roared again, assembled an army of red lian snakes, and chased him outside the Korean blood forest. The blood birch forest is a line of defense. The periphery of the blood forest beyond the blood birch forest is mostly shorter shrubs and all kinds of messy stones. But it is not as good as the next door to the west. But in a place like this, because of the inaccessibility of people, the weeds gathered on the ground were like a net, which made the heartbeat of the huge red king snake slow down. After chasing for a while, not a single bee could be seen. Gone! This is what Elder Chi Lian said while looking at the vast green plants. Chin Feng had originally planned to abandon the nest to save the bees, but he decided to run away in person at the last minute. And whoever told me about the direction of disappearance was more real than what I saw myself. Chin Feng walked around the outskirts of the blood forest, re-examined the situation outside the blood forest, and finally decided on a small wasp among the starry worker bees to become the hive manager outside the blood forest. Little Hornet came out of the original Black Wind Bee and was also a loyal follower of Chin Feng. Alas! After the hive is upgraded, the spiritual treasures outside are no longer useful to me. I don't know what I will need to raise after reaching the first level of mirror. Chin Feng flapped his wings passed through the bushes, flew close to the ground and flew toward Xiaofeng Tian. The area was completely dispersed, and most of the red refined king snakes were still trapped on the outskirts of the blood forest. In a dilemma, at this time, the red refined king snake completely beat Chin Feng hard. It was also hard at the beginning, and now it probably increased its fight to the death. As soon as Chin Feng flew into the hive, suddenly the hive shook and doubled in size with a loud bang. Then the system prompt sounded. Ding! The hive has been successfully upgraded and is currently at level 10. Ding! The host has upgraded the hive to level 10 and will be rewarded with a hive space. Ding! The host has successfully upgraded the hive to level 10 and will be rewarded with 3 yuan returning pills. A secretary to the beast king. A beast control atlas. Body fusion once. And the ability to explore the map of the explored area and predict once. Ding! The current level of the hive is 10. And the hive attribute level is too low. Please upgrade it as soon as possible. Ding! The quality of honey has been increased to 300%. And the properties of honey have become more sensitive. Ding! Please check the rest of the attributes automatically. This, after finally luring the red refined king snake away. With a few minutes to spare, Chin Feng planned to lie down on the throne and listen to what he had upgraded. After all, the previous upgrades had been thrilling and hurried. Although today was also thrilling. Chin Feng was helpless but he didn't plan to watch it right away. System, 
I want to upgrade. Ding. Please host consume the number of fusion times first. What the H, L? Fusion? Jin Feng thought hard, and then remembered that the system also provided a fusion last time. But during the upgrade, the system directly fused Wu Dao's sword to drive it into his own sword energy. What else can I fuse with? There is no response from the system. Chin Feng walked around the main hive twice, and couldn't think of anything worth wasting a chance to fuse. He originally planned to save it for later and kill something for use. But Chin Feng had no choice but to helplessly spread it out on the throne. Gan Hugen shouted. I choose to upgrade. Ding! The host selected the fusion successfully, and the host upgraded successfully. Before Chin Feng could react, he shouted loudly. What the HL? I'm not fused. Why did you fuse it for me? Before Chen Feng could finish speaking, a sharp pain swept over him from every part of his body. Chen Feng, who had been strengthened twice before, should be relatively relaxed about strengthening and merging again. But this upgrade and fusion made Chen Feng feel so painful that he felt like a human again at this moment. Because insects have no heart. At this moment, Chen Feng only felt a heartbreaking pain in his chest. The pain seemed to throw Chen Feng into nothingness. Immersed in darkness, as if 10,000 years had passed. Maybe more. Chin Feng closed his eyes and indulged in chaos. Suddenly, a dragon roar came from the sky. And the low, groaning sound caused Chin Feng's head to explode with pain. When Chin Feng finally opened his eyes in the chaos, only 10 minutes had passed in reality. Chin Feng sat on the throne. His eyes were a little dazed. His body felt as if he had been raped. And he felt a sigh of relief in his heart. So, what exactly did the system integrate for me? At this moment, Chin Feng has no feeling in his body, no feeling in his spiritual source, and his strength is not improved but is still a little stagnant. This system set the coordinates here and transfer the hive to Miss B. Ding! Hive transfer is starting. After customizing the coordinates, transferring the hive is a matter of instant movement. Chin Feng didn't even feel panic, but the air outside was already wet, damp, slightly cold, and visibility was extremely low. He is not worried that the glorious worker bees will not find their way, because the hive has a guiding feeling for the mass-produced worker bees. Chin Feng sat on the throne, and only then clicked on the attribute panel to check it thoroughly. Host, Chen Feng, Xientian First Mirror, 1 slash 10,000. Number of reinforcements, 1. Number of fusions, 0. Beast King's Mental Technique, Tian Cheng Xingju, 3rd level 0 slash 1. Beast King's Deterrence, Opens up Dan Tian Chi Si. Permanently improves own attributes by 10%. Peeping, second level 0 to 1. Check for weaknesses within a certain range. Skill, Xian Tian Wu Dao, second level, Xian Tian Sword Shadow has a 20% probability of paralyzing and paralyzing the target for 2 seconds. The earth groaned. Within 100 meters of the host's body, there is no difference in thunder attacks. The number of attacks is limited to 9, which is equal to the host's own level. Block, Second level, pure defensive skill. Defense power is equal to 5% of own strength. Secret technique, Wu Wu Poison. First level, after the venom is used, honey can be absorbed and converted into venom. If you are hit, you will suffer varying degrees of damage depending on your own strength. God's favorite pavilion, 10 out of 100. Trigger 10 to view the reminder of the gods. Hive level, 10, the host level cannot be higher than the hive. Items that need to be upgraded, rebirth flower. Number of worker bees, 2666, the transfer cooling time is 1 day. Hive defense, 6 out of 10. Hive attack power, 3 out of 10. Hive invisibility, October 10th, invisibility time is limited by hive level. Hive toxicity, 0 slash 20. Host strength improvement, 0 to 1. Once the hive attribute is fully leveled, the host will gain an improvement in its own strength. Secret palace, the quality of honey is increased by 200%. The cultivation speed is increased. 200 evolution points are provided daily. The hive space is opened. Alchemy room, 4 cards per side. Hidden bee pavilion, 100 worker bees for the first stage of the mirror. 500 worker bees for the ninth level. 1000 worker bees for the 8th level. And 2000 worker bees each for the remaining mirrors every day. Enable the system hive establishment function. Chapter 68, Sneak Attack on the Medicine Field. Chin Feng check for a long time but could not see what the system was integrated with. Chin Feng looked at the hive speechlessly, feeling strands of despair seeping from the surroundings into his limbs and bones. So he simply stopped thinking about it. Chen Feng lay comfortably on his throne. 
enjoying the nourishment of his spiritual veins and drinking royal jelly. At this time, Chin Feng didn't know that the surrounding area had been turned upside down. The Beast King's rage burned the entire outer area of the Blood Forest. In order to find Chin Feng and avenge him, he sent a large number of his men to wander around the outer area. Wherever they passed, not a blade of grass grew. Chin Feng rested for two days, swarmed thousands of worker bees, and then fluttered his wings and flew out of the misty mountain. Reaching the first level, Chin Feng's flying speed became faster, like a tiny lightning bolt. Ding! Enemy attack was detected 5,000 meters ahead. Chin Feng found a group of Red Train King Snakes patrolling in the distance. Three Red Train King Snakes with two level mirrors, and five Red Train King Snakes with one level mirrors spit out snake letters, hissing. Chin Feng's small figure was hiding among the leaves of the Blood Birch Forest. Looking at the location of the Red Lian King Snake, it was a small medicinal field of square inches, with many mature medicinal materials growing around it. Chin Feng thought about it in his mind and flew back to Misty Mountain. Chin Feng sat on the throne, tapping his front feet habitually, picked up the straw and took a big sip of royal jelly, and then threw the straw down. Come on, bee! Chin Feng ordered a hundred first level mirror worker bees, a thousand ninth level worker bees, a thousand eighth level worker bees, and more than a thousand worker bees of eighth level and below, and flew out of the misty forest. The rest stay behind to guard the hive, some patrolling and some gathering honey. Chin Feng led the large army to Zaye Ocean and divided it into 10 first level mirrors, leading a group of 109th level mirrors and 108th level mirrors. With an order, the glory worker bees rushed out and instantly surrounded the snakes. The red train king snake of Urs Hongjing instantly became furious when he saw that Yu Feng dared to take advantage of Yao Tian. Bold little bee, do you know whose medicine field this is? You dare to come here and run wild. His. His. The rest of the red train king snakes seemed to be demonstrating, spitting out snake letters. Chin Feng glanced at the red train king snake in the double mirror with disdain. I don't care who you are. It's just this medicine field you want. Xian Tian has no way. Countless sword shadows rushed towards the red train king snake. Seeing Chen Feng's arrogance, the red train king snake hissed twice angrily and dodged left and right, avoiding the skill. Chin Feng was surprised for a moment. Then he leaned down and rushed down towards the red train king snake. The earth groans. The poison of nothing. Chin Feng desperately threw skills at the head of the scarlet trainer king snake. Not to be outdone. The red train king snake kept spitting out fireballs. Occasionally, it looked at the opening and swung its tail out, hitting Chin Feng. Because Chin Feng was too small, the red lian king snake's movements gradually slowed down. Faced with Chin Feng's fierce attack, he struggled to dodge. Suddenly, he couldn't dodge and was hit on the head. Chin Feng followed the slow pace of the Red Lian King Snake. After looking at the gap, I inserted a few more needles from the Red Prawn King Snake. The Red Train King Snake hissed angrily. The Beast King will not let you go. Then he fell to the ground. Ding! The host successfully killed the Double Mirror Monster and obtained 29,985 evolution points. When the glorious worker be saw the king taking action, he couldn't help but show his black tail needle and stabbed the head of the Red Snake King Snake. Within a few minutes, the Red Train King Snake on the battlefield was eliminated. Chin Feng gave an order. Destroy the corpse and eliminate all traces. Afterwards, he took some of the glorious worker bees and got into the medicine field. It's still the old rule. If you find any elixir, use it all for your own use. If it's a little special, you can take a look at it yourself and donate it to the king. When we came out again, the medicinal field was bare and there was no trace of any medicinal herbs growing there. At this time, the battlefield had also been cleaned up, and all the corpses of the Red Train King Snake had been cleaned up without a trace left. Chin Feng ordered his men to take the herbs he picked back to the hive, while he fluttered his wings and wandered around freely in the Beast King's comprehension. Chin Feng discovered that there was a large medicinal field about 10,000 meters away from the small medicinal field, and there were more than a dozen small medicinal fields of various sizes scattered far, or near the large medicinal field. There are more or less red trained king snakes. Jigo, hemp and other monsters guarding them. This should be a small medicine field open with the big medicine field as the center. Chin Feng secretly marked every location in the medicine field. Can the system build highs in these locations I marked? Ding! The nesting function is activated. Ding! The branch nest is established. Chin Feng looked at the results of his efforts and nodded his little head happily. Then he flapped his wings and flew back. After returning to the beehive, Chin Feng sat on the throne, 
sipping royal jelly, tapping the armrest of the throne with his front foot, and secretly thinking about the shocking plan. Come on, B. Chin Fong thought for a while. Each mirror leads a team of people to the hive to connect the information network. Releasing the news, the location of the medicine field and the sneak attack plan. Be sure to avoid the Beast King's eyes and monitor them strictly and report any news at any time. After receiving the order from the king, most of the bees took action. Soon the news spread among many monsters except the Beast King. Gradually, the monsters were ready to take action. Many monsters even united and prepared to attack the medicine field. Launch an attack. King! Some monsters have gathered in the southeast and are preparing to attack. After hearing the report from his men, Chin Fong stood up immediately, waved his front foot, and led the bees to the medicine field. After arriving at the medicine field, Chen Fong made careful arrangements. He snickered inwardly as he watched the monster beasts hiding in the dark. Not moving. Let me help you. Chin Fong flapped his wings and flew towards the scarlet trained king snake. Come on. Whoever collects the medicinal materials belongs to him. In an instant, the gathered monsters reacted and rushed out. The gathered monsters and some glory worker bees surrounded the red trained king snake layer by layer. After a fierce battle, not a single scarlet trained king snake escaped. The monster beasts returned with their loads and cleared the battlefield before leaving. The monster beasts tasted the sweetness and frantically raided the medicinal fields in the beast king's territory. Chin Fong was present every time, leading the glorious worker bees to make a lot of money. It didn't take long for the beast king to discover something unusual and summoned his men to investigate the cause of the loss of the medicine field. Due to the large number of monsters participating in robbing the medicine fields, and the strong strength of the monsters inside. The investigation progress was very slow, which angered the Beast King. When Chin Fong heard the report from his subordinates, he couldn't help laughing and collapsed on the throne. Then, I held the straw and took a sip of royal jelly. Come on, B. Go ahead and tell me to be more vigilant in the near future and strengthen our preparedness to prevent our whereabouts from being exposed. Seeing his subordinates doing everything in an orderly manner, Chen Fong clicked on the properties panel. Host, Chen Feng, Xi'an Tian First Level Mirror, 69985-10,000. Number of Reinforcements, 1. Number of Fusions, 0. Hive Level, 10. The Host Level cannot be higher than the Hive. Items that need to be upgraded, Rebirth Flower. Number of Worker Bees, 32666. The Transfer Cooling Time is 1 Day. Subhive Level 1. The Subhive Level is 1 tenth of the Hive Level. Looking at the Evolution Point, Chin Feng felt a little sad. He simply picked out some of the herbs he had picked in the past few days and put them randomly into the alchemy furnace and added some royal jelly. Ding! The alchemy furnace has been started and will be completed in 20 hours. Please pay attention to the host. Chapter 69 Prelude to the Storm The Red Snake King sent wave after wave of men to look for the culprit. But unfortunately the search was fruitless. Seeing the medicine field that he had worked so hard to cultivate destroyed. He was filled with anger and worries. The Red Snake King moved in full force, causing all the monsters and beasts around him to panic. The monsters feared the revenge of the Red Snake King and did not dare to come out of the cave. Chin Fong rested for a day, drank enough royal jelly, vibrated his wings, and flew out of the Misty Mountain, passed through numerous blood birches. Ding! There is an enemy attack 5,000 meters ahead. Please pay attention to the host. Chin Fong arrived at the large medicine field of the Red Lian Snake King and quietly stopped on the leaves of the blood birch tree. The big medicine field is a low-lying area, and the Beast King's cave is located on the high ground to the north of the medicine field. There are heavy monsters guarding the area, in order to prevent the attack on the medicine field from happening again. The number of troops was more than double than before. The sunlight fell on the herbs in the medicine field, refracting and giving off a little bit of luster. The luster created a tiny halo, which looked particularly friendly under the bared fangs of the monster. Chin Fong flapped his wings again and turned into a silent shadow, sliding into the cave of the Scarlet Lian Snake King. The cave exudes a cold and sticky atmosphere, and there are heavy monsters guarding every place. Hiss! Hiss! In the quiet cave, the hissing, sound of the red-trained King Snake was particularly permeable, filling the air with a tense atmosphere. Chin Fong wandered around the cave. His small stature did not attract the attention of any monsters in such a dark, damp cave. The Red Snake King was not in the cave. Chin Fong flew out of the cave with some boredom and looked at the medicinal field. Chin Fong thought about it for a long time, then swooped down and flew into the medicine field. Chin Fong secretly picked herbs in the medicine field 
and then put them into the space of water droplets. The Red Snake King snake hissed. It didn't affect him at all. After picking for a long time, the Red Lian King snake did not notice any decrease in the medicinal herbs. Chin Fong didn't stop until his front feet became slightly weak while picking. Chin Fong fluttered his wings and flew back to the hive, tapping the throne with his front feet, silently coveting the medicine field of the Beast King inside. If the Red Snake King knew what Chin Fong was thinking, he would definitely vomit three liters of blood and die. At this time, Chin Fong thought that the elixir he had made should have been completed, and he opened the alchemy furnace. Ding! The host has succeeded in refining by Ling Dan with plus 90% quality, and the alchemy room experience has been increased by 1%. Ding! The host successfully used the bailing pill, the hive attack power plus 1, and the hive attack power plus 1. Hive level 10, the host level cannot be higher than the hive. Items that need to be upgraded, rebirth flower. Number of worker bees, 52. 666, the transfer cooling time is 1 day. Hive defense, 6 out of 10. Hive attack power, 4 out of 10. Hive invisibility, October 10th, invisibility time is limited by hive level. Hive toxicity, 0 slash 20. Hive level 1, the hive level is 1 tenth of the hive. Hive defense, 0 out of 10. Hive attack power, 1 out of 10. Hive invisibility, 0 slash 10, the invisibility time is limited by the hive level. Hive toxicity, 0 slash 20. The men sent by the snake king are still searching for the instigator. At this time, a red trained king snake hurriedly ran into the cave of the inner beast king. King! This sneak attack on the medicinal fields is related to the black bees that rob your medicinal materials. There are hives and black bees in every medicinal field. When the beast king in the inner circle heard the news, he was instantly furious. Shameless little bee! How dare you be so arrogant! Here comes the snake! The snake king thought for a long time and stopped the urge to order the red lian king snake to find Chin Fong and tear him to pieces. Looking at the red lian king snake who surrendered under the throne, he showed a gloomy and strange smile. Don't alert the enemy! Go down! The red trained king snake, who was kneeling under the throne, felt a chill on his back and retreated quickly. The snake king rustled out of the cave, looking at the core area in the distance, gritting his teeth, and his eyes became more and more malicious. Shameless little bee! Just wait to be destroyed! The monsters in the core area are not something you can deal with! Chen Fong was lying on his throne and suddenly sneezed. Hey! What's going on? Could it be that insects can catch colds and have fever? Or maybe there's a beast plotting against me? Chin Fong shook his head nonchalantly, holding the straw and continuing to drink royal jelly. The sun was rising, and the fog in the misty mountains was so thick that even the sun couldn't shine in. Although the fog blocked the sunlight, Chin Feng's sense of time was indeed very strong. At this time, Chin Fong always felt a little uneasy in his heart. He planned to check out the Snake King's cave. He flapped his wings flew out of the misty mountain, turned into lightning, and came to the Snake King's cave. The Snake King has gathered his men and horses and headed to the core area with some of the herbs cultivated in the medicine fields. When they arrived, two huge white tigers with hanging foreheads were guarding the Beast King's cave in the core area. From the looks of it, they had reached the fifth level of mirror. The Red Train King Snake is asking to see the Beast King. So please give me a message. The two hanging forehead white tigers glanced at the Red Snake King with disdain. How come there are so few tribute herbs this year? The eyes of the white tiger with a hanging forehead became a little cold, and he stared at the snake king haughtily. I hope you will be kind to me. It's not that we don't pay tribute to the medicinal herbs, but there is actually a rampant and shameless wasp who united with other monsters to destroy the medicinal fields. The snake king was lying at the entrance of the cave, reporting angrily. How dare you be so bold? Just wait here while I report to the beast king. A white tiger with a hanging forehead glanced at the snake king contemptuously, and then entered the beast king's cave. Not long after, a roar came from the cave, and the snake king took two steps back in shock. Not long after, the hanging fronted white tiger came out of the cave. The lord beast king has given orders to send a group of monster beasts to follow you to help you eradicate the rampant wasps. Thank you, lord beast king. The snake king got up and leaned on the stone at the entrance of the cave again, showing a triumphant smile. Chin Fong wandered in the Beast King's cave and kept hearing the whispers of the Scarlet Train King Snake. The king will bring back a group of monsters when he goes to the core area this time to deal with the shameless bees. For sure, the little black bee is so rampant. There is no way to escape this time. Chin Fong secretly wrote it down. 
Is it possible that the Beast King was my old enemy in the previous life? Chin Feng felt a sense of humor, fluttered his wings, and flew back to the hive. Come on, bee. Strengthen the defense of the main nest and branch nests. When encountering enemies, each two first-level mirrors will lead a thousand worker bees to form a formation to meet the enemy. Chin Feng kept a large number of high-level worker bees in the main hive to preserve his strength. Watching the worker bees take precautions in an orderly manner is like the prelude to a storm. His front feet tapped the throne rhythmically, and his little head was thinking rapidly. We've almost plundered the medicinal materials in the inner area. Maybe it's time to explore the core area. At the same time, a large number of Chin Feng's hives were attacked. Chapter 70 Rebirth Flower Facing the crazy attacks of the Beast King and Snake King, Chin Feng led the worker bees to fight and retreat to resist. All worker bees obey orders. Yes, follow me to fight against foreign enemies. Chin Feng led a large number of worker bees to form a formation to meet the enemy. Xian Tian has no way. The earth groans. The poison of nothing. Chin Feng threw skills wildly, and the monsters kept falling under the skills. Ding! The host successfully killed the double mirror monster and obtained evolution points 2998.5. Ding! The host successfully killed the first level mirror monster and obtained evolution 2318.5. Chin Feng frantically checked the evolution points, and then looked at the attribute panel. Host, Chen Feng. Xian Tian first level mirror, 10,000 slash 10,000. Number of reinforcements, 1. Number of fusions, 0. Chin Feng saw that the evolution points were full, vibrated his wings, and flew back into the air where the red trained king snake and the dio fronted white tiger could not attack. He saw that the worker bees had suffered some casualties. Retracement. With one command, all the worker bees flew back into the air instantly and disappeared in a flash, seeing that there was not a single worker bee left in the sky. The red trained king snake and the diao fronted white tiger were dumbfounded and could only vent their anger by destroying the exposed hive. The third elder of the white tiger, with a hanging forehead sent by the beast king in the core area, could not help but feel annoyed. At that time, when the snake king reported, he still didn't believe that the little black bee could be so cunning. But now, he was convinced. The third elder Dio, he was very angry. As if he had punched a fist into cotton, with nowhere to vent. If he had not solved this matter well, how could he have established prestige among the monsters and beasts? How could he have convinced the public? Or even you will also lose the trust of the beast king. Find him. I'll find him. Even if I turn over the inner and outer parts. I'll find him. The third elder Dio, he sent out a large number of monsters to find Chen Feng's lair. Chen Feng returned to the main hive with the worker bees sat on the throne, held a straw and drank a large sip of royal jelly. The 300% quality royal jelly spread like a clear stream throughout Chin Feng's six limbs and bones. Come on, bee! Go ahead and tell all the worker bees to be on alert. Keep a low profile. And try not to expose the location of the main hive before I come back. Yes, king! Chin Feng drank enough royal jelly, flapped his wings and flew out of the misty mountain, heading towards the core area. The core area is different from the inner and outer areas. The blood birch trees here grow thicker and thicker. The leaves are as big as cattail fans and are as deep red as ink, giving the deep forest an eerie chill. Chin Feng passed through the thick blood birch trees and set up several branch nests in extremely secret places covered by leaves. Ding! The high setting is successful. Upon hearing the system prompts, Chin Feng's little head spun at high speed. Although the main hive is in the misty mountains, it is not safe and will be found sooner or later. Chin Feng quickly wandered through the forest, looking for the hive's foothold. Ding! An enemy attack has been detected 2,000 meters away. Please pay attention to the host. Ding! I found a beehive upgrade item. A high-grade heavenly elixir. A rebirth flower. With a maturity level of 98%. It is expected to mature in one day. Please pay attention to the host. With the prompts from the system, Chin Feng was overjoyed, and landed on the leaves of a nearby blood birch tree. In the gap between the leaves of the blood birch tree, he discovered two third-level white tigers with hanging foreheads and a swamp in the distance. Wandering around, there were two dark blue flowers growing in the swamp. The surrounding marsh gas did not affect their growth at all. On the contrary, the blue ground became more and more charming. It's true that you can't find anything without wearing iron shoes. It takes no effort to get it. The white tiger with a hanging forehead seems to have just discovered these elixirs. It is unable to fly and can only look at the elixirs and worry. It seems that the two white tigers with hanging foreheads have already agreed. 
One will stay here to look at the elixir, and the other will go back to report. Chin Fong became murderous towards the two white tigers with a hanging forehead, and followed the white tiger with a hanging forehead that went back to report. When they were some distance away, Chin Fong rushed towards the head of the white tiger with a hanging forehead and used his skills crazily. The earth groans. The poison of nothing. Xian Tian has no way. The hanging forehead white tiger died before he could react. Chin Fong fluttered his wings and turned back, using the same method to instantly kill another white tiger with a hanging forehead. Then, the corpse of the white tiger was thrown into the swamp. In an instant, a few bubbles appeared next to the corpse, and then slowly disappeared from Chin Feng's sight. There was still one day left for the elixir to mature. Chin Feng followed the route taken by the white tiger with hanging forehead and found the cave of the beast king. A white tiger with a hanging forehead, which was larger than the others, lay on the throne. Peep. Ding! The host successfully used peeping. Target, white tiger king with yellow forehead. Sevenfold mirror. Skills, wind blade. Swift wind sword. Chin Feng wandered in the beast king's cave for a long time and accidentally discovered the beast king's treasure pavilion. Although there were a dazzling array of elixirs in his water drop space, it still did not affect Chin Feng's coveting of the treasure pavilion. After all, no one would be dissatisfied with the abundance of treasures. Secretly writing down the location of the treasure, he fluttered his wings and flew out of the Beast King's cave, and then traveled to every corner of the Beast King's domain to gain a deeper understanding of the Beast King's strength before flying back to the swamp. Ding! Golden Snake Bodhi will be mature in two minutes. Host, please pay attention. The leaves of the purple flower continue to stretch around, and the original dark blue petals gradually open. Ben, and curl, and the color gradually fades into lake blue, exuding bursts of coquettish fragrance and luster. Ding! The flower of rebirth is ripe. Please pay attention to the host. Chin Feng quickly flapped his wings and flew towards the swamp. The fragrance of the flowers of death had already spread out, and it would soon attract countless monsters. Chin Feng landed on the petals of the reborn flower, plucked it off with the force of his front foot, and then threw it into the water drop space. At this time, the earth was trembling. Chin Feng ran towards another flower of death without thinking. He quickly picked it and threw it into the water drop space. His small crystal wings drove his small body and flew into the air to hide. Into the leaves of the blood birch tree. There was a burst of dust. And the beast king led a large number of monsters to stop by the swamp. Looking at each other. The fragrance of the dead flower still lingered in the sky above the swamp. Chin Feng quietly emerged from the leaves of the blood birch tree and flew into the distance. The beast king who jumped into the air seemed to feel something, and looked at the leaves where Chin Feng stayed. Thoughtfully, Come on, beast, look for the scent of the elixir. Go and find it for me. By this time, Chin Feng had already fled. Chapter 71 Fierce Battle Chin Feng flew back to the hive and lay carelessly on the throne. Lai Feng, report the situation. Yes, the glorious worker be knelt under the throne. King, while you were away, they had completely controlled the inner perimeter. They will probably discover this place soon. After hearing the report from his subordinates, Chin Feng put his foot forward, looking at the glorious worker bees going away. I always feel that the worker bees spawned by the system are different from the past. And I can't tell what is different. Simply, he shook his little head and thought about the strategy for the problem at hand. Chin Feng flapped his wings and flew towards the Snake King's cave. At this time, the number of hanging forehead white tigers sent from the Snake King's cave increased fivefold. While Chin Feng was puzzled, he felt a little uneasy in his heart. Then he flapped his wings and flew into the Snake King's cave and came to the Gathering Beast's cave. At this time, on the high throne of the Snake King, sat the Beast King in the core area, the Diao Forehead White Tiger King. The Beast King proudly glanced at the hanging-headed white tigers and red-trained king snakes prostrate under the throne. Wherever the Beast King looked, all the monster beasts felt chills running down their spines and their bodies trembling. Especially the Snake King. The suppression of his realm prevented him from even taking a breath. The elixir in the core area was lost. And the thief escaped to the inner perimeter. Do you know who it is? All the monsters looked at each other. And suddenly, the Snake King thought of a monster. Reporting to Lord Beast King, there is a demonic beast that specializes in doing this. I think it must be this beast. The Snake King paused. And at the signal from the Beast King's eyes, the Snake King spoke eloquently. This beast is a little black bee. Cutting and cunning. Not long ago, it destroyed most of the medicinal fields, resulting in insufficient supply of medicinal herbs for you. Please make the decision for us. 
The Beast King. The other demon beasts echoed. They had seen with their own eyes the cunning Wei Chen Feng and the glory worker be escaped. The Beast King slapped the handle of the throne. To be so bold. You can find this hiding place. Reporting to Lord Beast King. The inner area has been controlled by us. Only around the Misty Mountain. We have not searched yet. This bee must be hiding in the Misty Mountain. In order to avoid alerting the snake, we let him run away. Therefore, we have not attacked for a long time. The Beast King glanced at the Snake King and nodded slightly appreciatively to him. All the monsters and beasts listen to the order and rest for a day to attack Misty Mountain tomorrow. Chin Fong heard their plan without missing a word and flew back to Misty Mountain quietly. Come on, B. Go ahead and command. Ten first-level mirrors will lead 1,000 worker bees. Set up multiple checkpoints in the Misty Mountains. And use the mist to resist enemy attacks. Yes. After the Guangya worker bee went down, Chin Fong put herbs in the alchemy furnace and added some honey. Ding! The host has successfully put in the dragon beer grass. The dragon scale pill is expected to take three days to refine. And the current progress is 1%. Then, he looked at the attribute panel and felt a little sad. Now he urgently needs to upgrade. System, use these two dead flowers. Ding! The host successfully uses the rebirth flower. The hive defense power is plus three. The hive attack power is plus three. The hive toxicity is plus six. The hive defense power is plus three. The hive attack power is plus three. And the hive toxicity is plus six. Hive level, 10. The host level cannot be higher than the hive. Items that need to be upgraded. Rebirth flower. Number of worker bees, 72066, the transfer cooling time is 1 day. Hive defense, 8 out of 10. Hive attack power, 6 out of 10. Hive invisibility, October 10th, invisibility time is limited by hive level. Hive toxicity, 6 20ths. Hive level 1, the hive level is 1 tenth of the hive. Hive defense, 2 out of 10. Hive attack power, 3 out of 10. Hive invisibility, 0 slash 10, the invisibility time is limited by the hive level. Hive toxicity, 6 20ths. Ding! Check that the hive integrity is 100%. Is the host upgraded now? Upgrade! Wait a minute. Time is running out. The system will speed up the upgrade of the hive and shorten the upgrade time. The system took two seconds to determine and then sounded again. Ding! The hive has been successfully upgraded and 50% of the host's honey has been deducted. The estimated upgrade time is two days. Two days! In total, it's only about one day. I hope I can withstand it. Chin Feng lay on the throne. The spiritual energy of the spiritual vein nourishing his body. The current spiritual vein was of little use to him. So Chin Feng simply ignored it and drank royal jelly. After all, there will be a tough battle tomorrow. As soon as the rising sun rose, the roars of the monster beasts spread throughout the entire blood forest. Many monster beasts inside were hiding in fear. And some even fled to the outskirts of the blood forest in order to avoid the battle. The star worker bees distributed on the outskirts of the blood forest are working hard to collect honey. Hearing the roar of the beast, Little Hornet immediately gathered his troops and headed to the misty forest inside the blood forest. Over a period of time, the star glory worker bee has been improved as a whole, and the Little Hornet has even reached the first level. The Little Hornet had found a large army of glorious worker bees not long ago. The target number of worker bees was too large. So Chin Fong asked them to stay on the periphery and constantly build subnests to recharge their batteries. On the one hand, they would preserve their strength. And on the other hand, they would strengthen the team and improve it. Strength. Today, significant results have been achieved. Flying through the moonlit woods, he flew into the misty mountain without any hindrance. King! The star glory worker bees request to return to the team and fight together with the glory worker bees. Chin Fong looked at the loyal little hornet kneeling under the throne and nodded happily. That's right. Yes! The little hornet was excited, her tiny body trembling a little. Later, he was incorporated into the combat team of glorious worker bees. Report. King! The enemy has broken through the first line of defense. Chin Fong silently knocked on the guard of the throne. Lai Fong. Chin Fong ordered a hundred first level mirrors, two thousand ninth level worker bees, and three thousand other level worker bees, and secretly flew out of the misty mountain towards the beast king's cave in the core area. Following the route in his memory, Chin Fong led the glorious worker bees to the Beast King's cave. The Beast King only left a part of his troops to guard the cave. Chin Fong saw the right opportunity and led the glorious worker bees to storm in. 
The white tiger with gill forehead could not hold off the large number of glorious worker bees and kept falling to the ground. Some of the glorious worker bees were also injured. A third level white tiger with a hanging forehead saw something was wrong and immediately flew away to report to the beast king inside. Chin Fong ignored it and led the glorious worker bees straight to the beast king's treasure pavilion. Let's go! Boys! Whoever gets it will get it! Chin Fong confidently implemented the OK 3 Wong policy again. Stealing everything. Taking everything. And robbing everything. One buzzing. The only sounds left in the cave were the buzzing and sweeping sounds of bees flying. Chin Fong even kept throwing the treasures from the treasure pavilion into his own water drop space. Gradually, the treasures in the treasure pavilion continued to decrease until they were all looted. The third level white tiger with a hanging forehead that ran to report to the beast king kept running towards the inner misty mountains. When he arrived, the beast king had already broken through the five layers of defense of the glorious worker bees. And both sides suffered heavy losses. When the beast king heard the news that his lair had been taken away, he looked up to the sky and roared angrily. Looking at the glorious worker bee who was still resisting, he flicked his tiger tail angrily, looked at his subordinates, and gave an order. Retracement! He led a large army to his lair. But he didn't know that Chin Fong had already emptied all his treasures. Chapter 72 The Great Plunder Chin Fong led the glorious worker bees to the beast king's lair, which completely offended the beast king. The beast king came with a large army. After Chin Fong looted all the treasures in the beast king's treasure pavilion, he led the glory worker bees to fly out of the beast king's cave and ordered some of the worker bees to fly back to Misty Mountain with the treasures, while he led some of the glory worker bees to rush to the inner area at high speed. Snake King Cave The Snake King also left some of his troops to guard the cave. At this time, the Snake King, in order to express his sincerity, led his snake soldiers and followed the Beast King to his lair in the core area. If the Snake King had known in advance that his lair was being attacked, he would certainly not have made a decision that he would regret. Ding! The honeycomb upgrade is 50% complete. Chin Fong raised his front foot to signal. And when the Red Lian King snake was unprepared, he was caught off guard, led the worker bees, and stormed into the Snake King's treasure pavilion. Although there were not as many treasures here as there were in the Beast King's cave, it did not affect the looting of the large army at all. After all, most of the treasures in the Beast King's cave were accumulated by the monsters attacking them. And they also plundered the treasures from other monsters' territories. So they accumulated so much. At this time, there was a little snake hiding in the cave, secretly avoiding Chen Feng's large army, and running, swirlingly, to find the Snake King to report the news. Guys, keep looting and clear out for me. Chen Feng felt that he had a unique look like a bandit. So he gave an order, and the glory worker be followed behind his king and swooped into the treasure pile. Only when the treasure was in hand did Chen Feng stop plundering and let his glorious worker bees continue to carry it. It didn't take long for them to loot everything, and lead the large army back home with a full load. When the beast king arrived at his lair, he looked at the corpses lying scattered beside the entrance of the cave. He roared and ran into his cave. He saw that the treasure pavilion was empty, with only a few weeds lying quietly on the ground. As if mercilessly laughing at the beast king's stupidity, the beast king angrily hit the ground with his front foot. The stones in the cave trembled, and small stones rolled down the stone wall. Shameless little bee, you and I are at odds with each other. Then, a roar spread from the cave throughout the core area, causing countless birds to fly out of the forest. At this time, a red-trained king snake hurried over. King! It's not good! The little black bee broke into our cave! The snake king panicked for a moment, and finally managed to avoid fainting, with a slight tremor in his voice. Come on, snake! Retreat! Then, the snake king quickly led his snake soldiers and snake generals to the lair. Returning to the cave, the Snake King came to the treasure pavilion tremblingly and saw that the cave was in a mess, with only shriveled grass roots lying there. The Snake King spurted out a mouthful of old blood and fainted. His men quickly carried the Snake King into the cave. It didn't take long for him to recover, and the snake's eyes were filled with blood. The hissing sound spread throughout the cave. At this time, Chin Fong was lying leisurely on the throne. If you look carefully, you will definitely see a little black bee with its legs crossed, humming a tune holding a straw and drinking royal jelly. Ding! The honeycomb upgrade completion rate is 60%. The crisis is over for now. Just waiting for the hive to be upgraded. Life phone. Continue to strengthen patrols. If there is an enemy attack, deal with it directly. Yes! This time, 
It is necessary to loot all their treasures to prevent them from jumping over the wall in a hurry. And to strengthen defenses. Report to the king. The red train snake king saw the treasures being looted, vomited blood at the mouth, and fainted. Chin Fong was stunned for a moment, then laughed wildly, and even fell down on the throne with his hands on his stomach. After that, the little head was spinning rapidly. The snake king and the beast king would definitely not give up on this big robbery. The misty mountain has been exposed and is in danger, and must be moved as soon as possible. Chin Fong drank enough royal jelly and fluttered his wings to fly out of the misty mountain. After going around and around, Chin Fong found a cliff in the inner area. There were several caves on the cliff, and there was no trace of monsters in the caves. There are steep cliffs and jagged rocks. A towering tree stretches out from the cracks next to the cave. Its lush and fragrant leaves cover the entrance of the cave, making it impossible to be discovered at all. Besides, except for those that can fly, other monsters are unable to do so. Attack here. System. Set a coordinate here. Ding! The coordinates are set. Then, they turned back to Misty Mountain. That night, some families were happy, and some were sad. Naturally, the Snake King and the Beast King couldn't sleep, and they kept making plans in their hearts to seek revenge and seize the treasure, avenging their previous shame. Ding! The Hive upgrade is 90% complete. Jin Fong watched the progress bar crawling slowly and sighed silently. He habitually ignored his progress and just waited for the final result. Ding! The hive upgrade is 100% complete. Suddenly the hive trembled, and the size of the hive doubled in size with a bang sound. Immediately, the system prompt sounded again. Ding! The hive has been successfully upgraded and is currently at level 11. Ding! The host has upgraded the hive to level 11 and will be rewarded with 5 Yuan Dan. 2 for each side. Ding! The current level of the hive is 11, and the hive attribute level is too low. Please upgrade it as soon as possible. Ding! The quality of honey is increased to 400%, and the properties of honey are increasing faster. Ding! Please check the rest of the attributes automatically. Chin Fong has become accustomed to the fact that the system does not report attributes. System! I want to upgrade! The system paused for a few seconds, as if determining whether he met the upgrade requirements. Ding! The host has been upgraded successfully. Chin Fong suddenly felt that the spiritual energy was entering his body crazily then swimming and walking in every corner of his body, and finally returning to the spiritual source. During this period, there was no pain at all, just a warm feeling of spiritual energy nourishing the body, as if soaking in a hot spring. Chin Fong stretched his front and back legs, and small, crackling, sounds came from everywhere in his body. After that, click on the properties panel to view. Host, Chen Fong, Xian Tian double mirror, 1 slash 50,000, Number of reinforcements, 1. Number of fusions, 0. Beast King's mental technique, Tian Cheng Singju, 3rd level 0 slash 1. Beast King's deterrence, opens up Dan Tian Chi Si. Permanently improves own attributes by 10%. Peeping, 2nd level 0 to 1. Check for weaknesses within a certain range. Skill, Xian Tian Wudao, 3rd level, Xian Tian Sword Shadow has a 30% probability of paralyzing and paralyzing the target for 3 seconds. The earth groaned. Within 100 meters of the host's body, there is no difference in thunder attacks. The number of attacks is limited to 11, which is equal to the host's own level. Block, second level, pure defensive skill. Defense power is equal to 5% of own strength. Secret technique, Wu Wu Poison, second level, after using the venom. It can absorb honey and convert it into venom. If you are hit, you will suffer varying degrees of damage depending on your own strength. God's favorite pavilion, 11 out of 100. Trigger 10 to view the reminder of the gods. Hive level, 11, the host level cannot be higher than the hive. Items that need to be upgraded, rebirth flower. Number of worker bees, 52098, the transfer cooling time is one day. Secret palace, the quality of honey is increased by 400%. The cultivation speed is increased. 400 evolution points are provided daily. The hive space is opened. Alchemy room, 6 cards per side. Hidden bee pavilion. 100 second level mirror worker bees, 500 first level mirror worker bees, 1000 ninth level worker bees, and 2000 each of the remaining worker bees are used every day. Enable the system hive establishment function. Seeing the improvement in all aspects on the attribute panel. Chin Fong was not only a little relieved. Chapter 73 Inner Forces After the hive was upgraded, Chin Fong summoned the glorious worker bees, 
But the number of worker bees was too large. Chin Fong made a simple evacuation plan. The bees obey the order. The starry worker bees will continue to stay on the periphery. The intelligence network on the periphery will be stepped up and improved. The high-level worker bees will move with me. The other worker bees will find themselves after the hive is moved. Yes. One buzzing. The worker bees immediately took action. Although the Xingya worker bees were a little disappointed. They still obeyed the order. System. Move the hive to the reserved cliff. Ding. Hive transfer is starting. The hive instantly moved to the location with customized coordinates. Ding. The hive transfer is completed. The cooling time is one day. The hive left the misty bee. And the damp, slightly cold air outside instantly warmed up. There was a faint fragrance of leaves drifting into the hive along the air. After staying in the damp mist for so long, Chin Fong began to miss the smell of sunshine. Then, he fluttered his wings and flew out of the cave on the cliff. Chin Fong looked at the cave he chose and then at other unoccupied caves. Suddenly, he felt like a cunning rabbit has three caves. And he couldn't help but laugh a little. The transfer of the hive brought about a rare day of leisure and I couldn't help but flutter my wings and fly to the top of the cliff. Under the exposure of the sun, the stones on the top of the cliff showed slight cracks. Tiny stones were scattered beside them, showing a gray-black luster. A few small flowers came out of the cracks in the stones and swayed in the breeze. Chin Fong flew to the petals and lay down. He was small and light, and the petals bore his weight without any burden. Chin Fong was sunbathing comfortably, surrounded by the fragrance of flowers. Ding! An enemy attack has been detected 10,000 meters ahead. Host, please pay attention. The system prompt sound made Chin Fong tremble in fright, and he rolled down from the pedals. Chin Fong held his non-existent waist and complained secretly. I didn't know that bees can scare bees to death if they scare them. At this time, two hemp flies flew in the sky. The bloodthirsty hall will not take action in this incident. Probably not. It's not that serious after all. Liang Ma didn't notice Chin Fong falling from the pedals at all. Bloodthirsty Hall? Chin Fong recited it secretly, and a new term appeared in his dictionary. Halfway through the sunbathing, I was ruined and felt a little unhappy. So I simply flew back to the hive. Come on, bee. Closely monitor the movements of the Snake King and the Beast King. If there is any movement, report it to me quickly. Yes. Chin Fong looked at the worker bees going away, and the feeling in his heart resurfaced. He took a big sip of royal jelly and put his little head on his front feet to think. Suddenly, a flash of inspiration occurred, and Chin Fong finally thought of what was different about the worker bees he spawned. The worker bees spawned by the system were originally machines that executed orders. Now, the worker bees spawned gradually resemble real monsters with the emotional world of a two-legged monster. Chin Fong saw the doubts in his heart and felt a lot relieved. He knew that the worker bees he spawned would never betray him, which was a better point. I was really bored in my hive, so I flapped my wings and flew out of the cave, wandering around to get familiar with the surrounding environment. After finding nothing unusual, he flew away. Ding. A large number of enemy attacks were found 10,000 meters ahead. Host, please pay attention. Following the system's prompts, he saw densely packed emperor spiders in the distance. Bloodthirsty Hall. Are you really not going to take action this time? Maybe. Aren't high-level monsters allowed to kill themselves? Bloodthirsty Hall? When Chin Fong heard this, Fei Luo paused. After all, it was a rare day that he heard. Bloodthirst Hall. Twice. Then, Chin Fong showed a sly smile, vibrated his wings, and swooped down. Chen Feng's sudden appearance caused the Emperor Spider to immediately stir and move nervously. It seemed that Chin Feng's influence had not been eliminated. The Spider King saw that it was Chin Fong and knew that he would not attack them again. So he stopped panicking. How could it be you? Say H, low to old friends and catch up on old times. Hearing Chin Fong reminiscing about the past. Spider King trembled all over. What do we have to do? When the Spider King saw Chin Feng's eyes, he instantly took back the words he was about to say. He didn't want to offend the plague god, nor did he want the Emperor's spider family to perish in his own hands. Say it! Where is the bloodthirsty hall? You don't know that there is an alliance between the demon beasts. The demon king's palace. There are six major forces under the Demon King's Palace, Netherworld Valley, Shadow Evil Valley, Black Wind Valley, Broken Soul Hall, Pansher Pavilion, Bloodthirsty Hall, and under the Bloodthirsty Hall one of the forces is the Blood Forest. There are rules in the Demon King's Palace. High-level monsters are not allowed to kill on their own. Otherwise they will be attacked by heavy monsters. 
They are slightly intimidating among the monsters. For the sake of the power of the Shijo monsters. Develop. The Emperor Spider King spoke eloquently. His eyes still stealing glances at Chen Feng. He only hoped that the God of Plague would leave this place quickly. He secretly made up his mind to send Chen Feng away before moving again. Chen Feng got the news he needed and was about to leave. When leaving, I didn't forget to linger in the air and tease the Emperor Spider. Old friend, I will come to play often in the future. The Emperor Spiders looked at each other, looking at Chen Feng's retreating figure. The Spider King looked mournful and ordered all the Emperor Spiders to pack their bags and move away overnight. Chin Feng didn't know that the Emperor Spider had moved away from here and flew back to the hive. Silently digesting the information he got and thinking about his next plan. Chapter 74 Transfer Chin Feng crossed his legs and sat calmly on his throne. Life Feng Go ahead and set up subhives in various hidden areas in the inner area and establish a line of communication with the Xingyu worker bees in the outer area. Yes! The glorious worker bees received the order and took action instantly. These glorious worker bees always worship their king. And Chen Feng is the support of their belief. They know that as long as Chen Feng is around, all problems will be solved. With the efforts of Guangyo worker bees, the branch nest was quickly established successfully. Chen Feng built a branch hive second only to the main hive on a lush blood birch tree not far from the cliff. Since that battle, the beast king lost all the treasures in the treasure pavilion and suffered heavy losses in his troops. He was extremely angry and once again summoned all the white tigers with hanging foreheads to prepare to attack Chen Feng. After the snake king chi vomits blood, the root cause of the disease is found. When the chi is flowing, it is stagnant, and it may be impossible to make even half a step forward. Only by killing the shameless little bee can I vent my hatred and improve my cultivation. The snake king looked at Misty Peak with sinister eyes and hissed at the snake letter. Come on, snake. Pay close attention to the movements of the beast king. If there is any action, please notify me at any time. Yes. The snake king immediately gathered all the snakes, waiting for the beast king to attack. And then he helped him. Not long after, the snake king got the news that the beast king had gathered his tiger soldiers and generals to march towards the misty peak. The snake king was in high spirits, as if he had been given a shot of blood, and immediately led his snake soldiers and generals to join them. The beast king watched the snake king leading his men and ignored him. Misty Peak was surrounded by densely packed monster beasts. The Beast King was a little confused as to why it was so quiet. Could it be that the treacherous and shameless little black bee had some conspiracy? When the war first started, the Beast King suffered a secret loss. The little black bee took advantage of the low visibility in the fog to launch a sneak attack. In that battle, this little black bee deployed carefully without any flaws. Even after attacking for a long time, they failed to capture all the defense lines. There won't be any tricks this time. The Beast King felt a little uneasy. So he waved to the two third level white tigers with hanging foreheads next to him and indicated with his eyes that they should go in and explore the way first. The two white tigers with hanging foreheads looked at me and I looked at you, their bodies trembling with fear and feeling a little uneasy. They were all present in that battle and truly saw the power of the little black bee. Although they were small in stature, their attack power was super powerful. They saw with their own eyes that their companions lost their lives after being poisoned by the little black bee's tail needle. The beast king looked at the two hanging fronted white tigers who were not moving and kept threatening them with fierce eyes and annoyance. The two white tigers with hanging foreheads had no choice but to pace little by little. Looking at the two men who were not up to par, the beast king raised his front foot and kicked the two white tigers with hanging foreheads into the mist. The two white tigers with hanging foreheads were frightened and said something at the same time. My life is at risk. The white tiger with a hanging forehead staggered into the mist, eyes closed tightly, waiting for the arrival of the tail needle of death. However, there was no expected pain or unexpected buzzing sound. There was just endless silence. The two white tigers with hanging foreheads secretly opened one eye and did not find any enemy attacks. Then, they opened the other eye and saw that there was nothing but thick fog around them. They immediately felt relieved. So in the thick fog, wandered twice in the fog. The Beast King waited anxiously outside the fog, constantly looking into the fog. After waiting for a long time, there was no sign of the tiger. Then, he led the large army directly into the fog, and met two white tigers with hanging foreheads coming back from two circles. The Beast King glared at the two hanging forehead white tigers angrily. Waste! The two white tigers with hanging foreheads trembled and crawled on the ground, their voices trembling slightly. I would like to report to the king that no abnormality was found in the mist. 
all the little black bees seemed to have evaporated in the mist. The beast king roared angrily when he heard this. The monsters and beasts in the mist all softened in horror and fell to the ground. Coming beast, monitor the movement of the forest closely and find out where the little black bee has escaped to. Yes. Afterwards, the beast king led some tiger soldiers and generals back to their lair, while other white tigers with hanging foreheads searched the forest day and night. Chin Fong has been killing worker bees for three consecutive days. The worker bees that did not move with the large army are returning one after another. The total number of worker bees is more than 100,000. In the past few days, Chin Fong had picked up the treasures, but he didn't expect that the Beast King had quite a lot in stock. There are only 10 Shuanya Zaya Jinten medicines, one purple leaf magic flower, three TNI San Shu grass, three rebirth flowers, and 20 asparagus grasses. I guess they are waiting to take them when they are about to evolve. And the results are thousands of I never expected that Chin Fong would be given the advantage. Ding. I found a hive upgrade item. Please pay attention to the host. Chin Fong looked at the hive speechlessly. The system was about to be used before the flowers of death were warmed up. Then he took out two flowers of death. System. Use these two dead flowers. Ding. The host successfully used the reborn flower. And the hive toxicity plus one. Ding. The hive integrity is 66.7%. Host. Please pay attention. Chen Fong couldn't help but feel angry. You just can't leave one for me. There is definitely a bug. Otherwise, who can feed you with your appetite? Afterwards, Chen Fong reluctantly used the last flower of death. Ding. The host successfully used the reborn flower. And the hive toxicity plus one. Ding. Check that the hive integrity is 100%. Is the host upgraded now? Upgrade. Ding. The hive has been upgraded successfully. The estimated upgrade time is five days. Chin Fong sat on the throne. And his spiritual veins exuded traces of spiritual energy that warmed Chin Fing's body. After that, he walked to the alchemy furnace and opened it Shiran. Ding! The dragon scale pill was successfully refined. The quality is 95%. Please pay attention to the host. Then, more herbs were put in the alchemy furnace and some honey was added. Ding! The host has successfully put in the dragon beard grass. The dragon scale pill is expected to take two days to refine. And the current progress is 1%. The hive evolution shortened the alchemy time. The troops said by the beast king searched to no avail. Chin Fong saw that the hive had begun to upgrade. And decided to brush up on evolution points. Come on B. Follow me to the battle. Besiege but not attack. Chin Fong led a group of worker bees to surround a small group of white tigers with hanging foreheads. Xian Tian has no way. I saw a few sword shadows flying out and rushing into the team of the hanging forehead white tiger. The white tigers with hanging foreheads dodged one after another. One of them couldn't dodge. And a sword blade slashed across his left leg. Blood spurted out. A wound deep enough to see the bone came into view. The white tiger with hanging forehead screamed. Okay. Xuan Wu fainted. Chin Fong saw an injured white tiger with a hanging forehead. Laughed evilly. And swooped down. The poison of innocence. Chin Feng's tail felt a stinging pain, and a tiny poisonous needle, flashing with cold light, rushed towards the head of the injured white tiger with a hanging forehead. The pain in the legs of the hanging fronted white tiger coupled with the excessive blood loss. He had no time to dodge, and could only watch as the tail needle pierced his head. Chin Feng felt as if the tail needle was stuck into tofu, easily injuring the white tiger. Chin Feng's level has improved, and it is no longer what it used to be. It only takes about three minutes for the poison to cause death. The injured white tiger with a hanging forehead struggled to death. And the other white tigers with a hanging forehead were not to be outdone. Windblade! The white tiger with hanging forehead didn't react to Chen Feng's sneak attack just now. Now a comrade was injured, which instantly aroused their bloodshed. The wind blade attacked Chen Feng with an offensive and speed that was no less than that of Chen Feng's sword shadow. Chen Feng dodged left and right and rushed into the group of uninjured white tigers. The earth groans. The white tigers with hanging foreheads within a hundred meters of Chin Feng's body were all numbed and paralyzed by the thunder attack and could not move for a while. The poison of innocence. There was no cooldown time for the skill anyway. So Chin Feng took advantage of every opportunity and stuck a few needles into the heads of all the white tigers until the poison needle is used up. The white tiger with hanging forehead kept falling down during the skill. Ding! The host successfully killed the double mirror monster and obtained evolution points 2998.5. Ding! The host successfully killed the first level mirror monster 
and obtained evolution 2318.5. Ding! The host successfully killed a triple mirror monster and obtained evolution points 3568.5. The evolution points continue to increase until the enemy is killed until his hands are weak. And then, he returns home. The Beast King's pupils tightened. His men were attacked continuously in just two days and suffered heavy losses. The speed of Chen Feng's growth instantly sounded the alarm in the core Beast King's heart. His intuition told him that Chen Feng must be eliminated. Otherwise, he would regret it. After ensuring the safety of the core area, the Beast King took action. At this time, Chen Feng was fully prepared. Chapter 75 Strategic Retreat The Beast King learned the lesson this time and led part of his troops to the inner perimeter to prevent Chen Feng from making another sneak attack. At the same time, the Snake King also led the Snake soldiers and generals to fight with the Beast King. Under the full-scale search by the Beast King and Snake King's men, parts of the hive were constantly exposed to the public. At this time, the glorious worker be hurriedly ran in from outside the hive. Report to the king. The Beast King's men discovered the branch hive, and the branch hive was attacked. Chin Feng was a little surprised. He didn't expect it to arrive so quickly. Ding! The honeycomb upgrade is 50% complete. Come on, bee. Meet the enemy. Yes. Chin Feng left 50,000 worker bees in the hive. And he led the remaining 100,000 worker bees to attack. Ding! A large number of enemy attacks were found 10,000 meters ahead. Host, please pay attention. Chin Feng led the glorious worker bees to line up in an exposed hive, waiting for the arrival of the enemy. Ding! A large number of enemy attacks have been detected 5,000 meters ahead. Please pay attention to the host. Ding! A large number of enemy attacks were found 2,000 meters ahead. Host, please pay attention. The system keeps prompting. Ding! There is an enemy attack 500 meters ahead. Please pay attention to the host. Ding! The enemy will arrive on the battlefield in 5 seconds. Please pay attention to the host. Army attack. Chin Feng gave an order and the two sides engaged in a melee. Xian Tian has no way. Several sword shadows rushed into the enemy camp with afterimages, and they rampaged and injured several monster beasts in the enemy camp. Looking at the injured monster, Chin Feng dived down. The earth groans. The surrounding monsters were constantly paralyzed. The poison of innocence. Chin Feng showed his tail needle, and was about to prick the injured monster with its tail needle. At this time, the snake king rushed towards Chin Feng spitting out snake letters. Venomous Fong. The Snake King looked at Chin Feng coldly and shot the poison towards Chin Feng. Seeing that the situation was not good, Chin Feng quickly flapped his wings and flew into the air. The poison lost its target, drew an arc, and fell into the bodies of several Red Train King snakes. There was a scream, and the few Red Train King snakes lost their fighting power. They turned around and were killed by the glorious worker bees. The Snake King's nostrils were filled with heat and he had a strong tendency not to stop until he killed Chin Feng. At this time, Chin Feng kept thinking in his mind. If this continues, it will be detrimental to yourself. So why not? Subsequently, temporary preparations were made to sacrifice part of the branch nest as an illusion of escaping from the inner circle. Retracement. Upon hearing the order, the glorious worker beflapped its wings subconsciously and flew into the air. Chin Feng asked the system to notify every glorious worker be to abandon the exposed subhive and retreat while fighting to save their lives. The Beast King saw the little black bees trying to escape and chased after them, hoping to save Chin Feng's life. But they had no wings. The glory worker bees sometimes swooped down to harass the enemy, and sometimes flew back into the air. Gradually, there were fewer and fewer glory worker bees in the sky, and in the end, there were only a few hundred worker bees left. These hundreds of worker bees followed Chin Feng and kept retreating. Chin Feng saw that the time was right and signaled the remaining glory worker bees to retreat. Then, they and Chin Feng flew away. The Snake King looked at Chin Feng who was about to run away. His eyes suddenly turned red, and he chased Chin Feng regardless. Chin Feng watched the Snake King gradually break away from the large army and silently mocked the Snake King. Don't you know? Don't chase after the poor. It happens to be a little bit closer to evolving. So you can stay here? Chin Feng led the Snake King for another distance and looked at the worker bees surrounding him to protect him. Besieged but not attacked. Don't let him escape. Then, Chin Feng led the worker bees to turn around and surrounded the Snake King. The Snake King looked at Chin Feng who was running away. Suddenly turned around. Was stunned for a moment. Looked around. And realized that he had chased him far away. There was a thump in my heart. 
and I felt a panic. However, I thought that I was the red train king snake king of the fourth level mirror, and the little black bee queen opposite was the second level mirror. Gradually, I felt relieved. Little did he know that Chen Feng had killed many monsters that were higher than himself. Shameless little bee, today next year will be your memorial day. Chen Feng looked at the snake king leisurely and suddenly changed his mind. Come on, swarm, beat him, don't kill him, just leave him with one breath. When the snake king heard Chen Feng's order, a mouthful of old blood rushed into his throat, and he swallowed it secretly. His eyes instantly turned red, and bloodshot eyes appeared in him. Shameless little bee, take your life. Today will be your memorial day. Three yuan zero fire. The snake king's fire rushed into the team of glory worker bees, and the glory worker bees had no choice but to dodge to both sides. A few rushed at the front and had no time to dodge. A burning smell drifted through the wind, and those few glory worker bees had turned into ashes and returned to the world. Between heaven and earth, the snake king's speed soared to the limit, and he rushed towards Chen Feng. How could the glorious worker be let him get close? It flapped its wings quickly, formed an encirclement, swooped down, showed off its shiny tail needle, and pierced the snake king's head. Seeing the glory worker bees offensive, unwilling to be outdone, the snake king could only stop attacking Chen Feng and kept dodging the glory worker bees' attacks. Venomous Fong the snake king watched the glorious worker bees taking advantage of the overwhelming number of bees, venom spurting out from their mouths. The glorious worker bees dodged, and the venom followed the original trajectory and splashed onto the bark and leaves of the tree, instantly corroding a large area. The scarlet train king snake king attacked like this several times, but was stopped by the glory worker bee. Chin Feng couldn't help but feel angry when he looked at Chin Feng, who was sitting on a leaf with his legs crossed and quietly watching the excitement. Shameless little bee! Do you dare to fight me? What's the point of just hiding behind your subordinates? Chin Feng stretched his body and couldn't help but feel amused as he watched the glorious worker bees beat the snake king until he couldn't stand up. You can't even defeat my subordinates. Why should you let me fight you? The snake king looked at the difficult glory worker bees and slowly calmed down. He knew that he would not be able to get into Chin Feng's body unless these glory worker bees were dealt with. So he had to concentrate on attacking these worker bees. Chin Feng watched as the Snake King took serious action against the glorious worker bee. He moved his front and back legs, vibrated his wings, and swooped down. Xian Tian has no way. Several sword shadows flew towards the Snake King from behind, and the Snake King instantly twisted its body at a weird angle. The speed of the sword shadow was extremely fast. A sword shadow streaked across the Snake King's back, making a gash in the hard snake skin, and blood spurted out. The Snake King screamed in pain, and rolled on the ground. The smell of blood flowed through the Snake King's nose, stimulating every cell in his body. The Snake King's speed soared to the limit, and an afterimage appeared in front of Chin Feng. Venomous Feng. The venom drew a strange arc and rushed towards Chin Feng. Chin Feng was shocked. Sure enough, the quadruple mirror was not that easy to mess with. The frequency of its wings vibrated faster and faster, and he ducked below the ground, barely escaping the attack. Chin Feng did not let go of this good opportunity to reach the ground. The earth groans. The distance between the Snake King and Chin Feng was just within Chin Feng's attack circle. Luxury Hope's body was instantly numb and paralyzed, unable to move. The poison of nothing. Chin Feng found every opportunity and gave full play to the realm of killing you while you are sick. The Snake King didn't expect Chin Feng to be so insidious. He couldn't dodge and got a needle stuck in his head. Chin Feng's tail needle was extremely poisonous. And instantly, the Snake King felt dizzy. Chin Feng looked at the Snake King who had slowed down and gave the Snake King a few more needles. Shameless. The Snake King gradually fell down. His eyes widened. And he seemed to be refusing to rest in peace. The Beast King leads a large army and destroys the hive. The Chilian King Snake watched the Snake King chasing Chin Feng. So he broke away from the Beast King's troops and followed the Snake King. However, the Snake King was as fast as a beam of light and he soon lost track of him. The Beast King looked at the Scarlet Train King Snake going away. A bunch of trash! Later, they followed with a large army. By the time the Red Snake King arrived, Chin Feng had already fled, and the body of the Snake King was lying quietly in front of him. The Red Train King Snake's eyes were red, and they seemed to burst out of their sockets. The Red Train King Snake was lying on the ground, begging the Beast King who had just arrived with a large army to avenge their king. Chin Feng returned to the hive, lay on the throne, and drank royal jelly comfortably. Chapter 76 Strange Tiger 
Chin Fong already has enough evolution points, and is just waiting for the hive to be upgraded. Ding! The honeycomb upgrade completion rate is 70%. It is not Chin Feng's character to sit still and wait for death. This time, most of the hives were completely destroyed. Only a part of the hives were still hidden in the dark and had not been discovered. Come on, B. Recently, all worker bees are keeping a low profile. Don't expose their whereabouts. The most important thing is to improve their strength and inform the surrounding Xingyu worker bees to proceed with caution. Yes. Chin Feng tapped the throne with his front foot, thinking clearly about his next plan, then fluttered his wings and flew out of the cliff. Since the Red Snake King was killed, and the second elder also died in battle, the control of the Snake Tribe fell into the hands of the third elder, the Red Snake King, and became a subordinate tribe of the Beast King. Chin Feng walked through the Blood Birch Forest and watched the Red Trained King Snake, which was searching for Chin Feng's traces, crawling quickly among the trees. Chin Feng decided to let them go, as business was more important. At this time, Chin Feng stayed in a hive hidden in the Blood Birch Tree in the core area. There were only 180 worker bees in charge. The target was small, and did not attract the Beast Master's attention. After all, the Beast King still didn't believe that Chin Feng was so capable. The glorious worker bees who stay here should try to avoid direct conflict with the Beast King and don't attract the Beast King's attention. After instructing the glorious worker queen who stayed in the core area to divide the hive, she flew to the Beast King's territory alone, preparing to investigate and make sure she knew what was going on. One buzzing! The vibration of the wings mixed with the breeze, turning into a stream of light and entering the Beast King's cave. The number of troops in the Beast King's cave doubled. Chin Feng felt a little funny. He was really bitten by a bee with one move and was afraid of the well rope for ten years. A small group of white tigers with hanging foreheads patrolled by. Chin Feng quietly landed on the wall in the dark, dodging the patrolling tiger soldiers. Chin Feng kept exploring along the route in his memory. And at this time, he came to the Beast King's palace. The Beast King was lying on the throne, closing his eyes and concentrating. It seemed that Chin Feng's escape did not bring him a big blow. After all, the blow was not as big as losing the treasures in the treasure pavilion and being looted. Chin Feng came to the treasure pavilion in the Beast King's cave again and found that the treasure pavilion was once again filled with treasures. Although not as much as before. The treasure pavilion has accumulated so many treasures in such a short period of time. And it must have looted a lot of animal fat and animal paste. After Chin Feng finished exploring, he fluttered his wings and turned around to leave. At this time, the Beast King's subordinate, a double mirror white tiger with a hanging forehead, patrolled by and appeared in front of Chin Feng's eyes instantly. The white tiger with a hanging forehead was stunned. Chin Feng looked at the white tiger with a hanging forehead. Murderous intent flashed in his eyes. He flapped his wings, showed off his tail needle, turned into an arrow that left the string, and swooped down towards the head of the white tiger with a hanging forehead. The hanging forehead white tiger reacted instantly and moved its flexible body back to avoid Chin Feng's attack. Chin Feng looked at the hanging forehead white tiger who was dodging the attack, turned around and struck again. The hanging forehead white tiger lowered his voice while ducking away. Friend! This is the Beast King's cave! Stop attacking first and don't attract other white tigers with hanging foreheads! Looking at Chin Feng's disbelieving eyes. If I want to expose you, I can just summon other tiger soldiers and generals. At this time, the patrolling white tiger with a hanging forehead heard the noise and rushed over immediately. Chin Feng thought for a while and realized that what the white tiger said made sense. And then he hit on the wall at the top of the cave. The patrolling tiger soldiers arrived and looked around. They saw that there was only one white tiger with a hanging forehead. And there was nothing unusual about it. What are you doing here? Did you find anything? The patrolling tiger soldiers asked the white tiger with a hanging forehead in a fourfold mirror contemptuously. The hanging forehead white tiger shook his head. Nothing unusual. The patrolling tiger soldier snorted coldly and left with the other tiger soldiers and tiger generals. Chin Feng saw that the tiger soldiers and generals had left and flew down from the top of the cave. Why are you helping me? Let's go out and talk. The white tiger with a hanging forehead lowered his voice and gestured towards the entrance of the Beast King's cave with his eyes. Chin Feng nodded his head and then turned into an afterimage and flew towards the entrance of the cave in order to prevent the other tiger soldiers and tiger generals from discovering the abnormality. The white tiger with a hanging forehead walked out of the cave leisurely. At this time, Chin Feng was already waiting for him on the leaves of the blood birch tree not far away. The dazzling sunlight shone on the body of the diafronted white tiger, giving him a warm halo. 
Perhaps he had been in the cave for too long and was a little uncomfortable coming out. The doe forehead white tiger raised his front feet and placed them on his forehead, relaxing for a while, and then walked towards Chen Feng. The tiger soldiers and generals guarding the entrance of the cave looked at his actions and didn't care much. They continued to look down into the distance haughtily. In this way, Chen Feng and the hanging-headed white tigers, one flying and the other walking, walked for a long time until they came to a hidden cave and stopped. The white tiger with a hanging forehead sat down on a big rock next to the cave. Chin Feng also sat on the rock, and no one spoke. After a long time, the hanging forehead white tiger looked at Chin Feng curiously. Don't you have a lot of questions? Why don't you ask any more? Chin Feng felt a little tired from sitting, so he simply lay down on the big rock. Suddenly I felt a little hollow in my front foot, and I was not used to it. Every monster has its own secret. If you don't tell it, I won't ask. The hanging forehead white tiger looked at Chin Feng in surprise and found that he was really different. He had a mind that other monsters did not have. And he had courage and insight that other monsters did not have. He knew that this little black bee was the king of beasts. Send a large number of troops to find the enemy. Perhaps? You probably don't know many things in the core field. The hanging forehead white tiger looked at Chin Feng with certainty in his tone. Chin Feng did not deny it and nodded. You also know the Demon King's Palace. Chin Feng chatted with Daoya Baihu for a long time and learned a lot about things in core areas. They didn't separate until nightfall. Although Chin Feng didn't ask anything about him, he couldn't help but feel secretly curious. Watching the departing figure of the hanging forehead white tiger, he whispered silently, Who are you? Why do you know so well about the core field? Chin Feng fluttered his wings and flew back to the hive, lying on the throne, enjoying the nourishment of his spiritual veins, holding the straw and drinking royal jelly. He habitually tapped the handle of the throne with his front foot. The unpredictability of the white tiger hanging on his forehead made Chin Feng feel a little uneasy. And he felt that things were beyond his control. Ding! The honeycomb upgrade completion rate is 80%. The system prompt interrupted Chin Feng who was deep in thought. Now it seems that he is not an enemy. But he still needs to be careful. After Chin Feng figured this out, he relaxed. Chapter 77 Upgrade Chin Feng deeply felt that the level gap between him and the Beast King was too great. So the top priority was to improve his strength. Although Chin Feng can leapfrog the challenge, he will still be crushed if his level is too different. At this time, the primary spiritual veins in the hive can only nourish Chin Feng's small body, but cannot bring improvement. The hive is getting bigger and bigger. If you place the hive anywhere in the forest, you will find its existence. If other monsters knowing the function of the hive will cause a bloody storm, Chin Feng drank enough royal jelly and opened the alchemy furnace. Ding! The dragon scale pill was successfully refined. The quality is 95%. Then, he put elixir and honey in the alchemy furnace and flew to the core area with his wings vibrating. The men sent by the Beast King were still searching for traces of Chin Feng. Chin Feng seemed to have evaporated from the world and no trace of him could be found. In order to give the system enough time to upgrade, Chin Feng decided to keep a low profile in the core area for the time being. However, he still wanted to go to the Beast King Cave to explore. And he always felt that the aura of the Beast King Cave was sufficient. Chin Feng flapped his wings and flew out from the hive, heading straight for the Beast King's Cave. Since he was discovered during his previous exploration, he was extra careful this time. Chin Feng slipped into the Beast King's Cave and came to the Beast King's Hall. At this time, the Beast King had just come out of the cave and was not on the throne of the Beast King's Hall. He happened to pass by Chin Feng. One buzzing. Ding! I found a high-level spiritual vein. Please pay attention to the host. In the Beast King's palace, Chin Feng sometimes flew up, sometimes landed on the rock wall, and gradually flew to the Beast King's throne. The spiritual energy in other places was balanced, and only the throne had strong spiritual energy. Chin Feng slowly approached the throne and found a small gap behind the throne. From the gaps, strands of pure spiritual energy leaked out. Chin Feng felt the rich spiritual energy flowing from the bee's head to the limbs and bones, and instantly felt that the slow-moving Beast King's mental method was gradually starting to work. Chin Feng landed next to the gap in the spiritual vein. The spiritual energy overflowing from the gap was purer and richer. Chin Feng looked at the long and narrow gap and felt secretly happy in his heart. Small stature has its own advantages. Isn't this advantage coming? The Beast King will definitely not be able to enjoy such sufficient spiritual energy. If the Beast King knew Chen Feng's thoughts at this time, he would be so angry that he would vomit blood. Chen Feng's six little legs took small square steps, 
a bit out of step with a step that no one would recognize, and crawled forward slowly. The width of the gap is just enough to accommodate the width of Chen Feng's small body. Walking into the gap, the concentration of the spiritual pulse doubled. Chin Feng shook his wings comfortably and let the spiritual pulse brush through his body. Chin Feng lay on the spiritual veins and absorbed it. The Beast King's throne was blocking the gap in the spiritual veins. Chin Feng was not worried at all that he would be exposed. After a long time, the Beast King returned to his throne from outside the cave. He closed his eyes and rested, as if he was a little tired. Chin Feng looked at the back of the Beast King, estimated the time, and felt that it was almost time. So he took a deep breath of spiritual energy, climbed out leisurely from the gap in the spiritual veins, as if he was visiting his own home, and then, climbing along the wall for a short distance to the entrance of the cave, he flapped his wings and flew back to the hive. Chin Feng looked at the progress of the hive and looked at the top of the hive in silence. I should have known that 50% of the honey would be spent on upgrading the hive faster. Chin Feng sighed secretly and lay weakly on the throne of the hive, rested all night. Ding! The hive has been successfully upgraded and is currently at level 12. Ding! The host has upgraded the hive to level 12 and will be rewarded with 5 Yuan Dan. 2 for each side. Ding! Please check the rest of the attributes automatically. Chin Feng could imagine that the hive had doubled in size again. System! I want to upgrade! The system paused for 2 seconds. Ding! The host has been upgraded successfully. In an instant, the spiritual energy crazily penetrated into the body swimming and walking everywhere in the body, as if breaking into a hot spring, feeling the softness and warmth of the hot spring, and the last wisps of obedient spiritual energy returned to the spiritual source, seeing the improvement in all aspects on the attribute board. I stretched my small body, and small, crackling, sounds came from everywhere in my small body. Then, Chin Feng quickly flapped his wings, flew into the Beast King's cave, and entered the cracks of the spiritual veins allowing the spiritual veins to fully nourish his small body. The small body became stronger and tougher under the baptism of spiritual veins. When Chen Feng flew back to the main hive, he found that the hive seemed a bit crowded in the cave. Looks like it's time to move the hive. Chen Feng observed it for a long time and found that the tree stretching out from the cliff had dense leaves and was quite suitable for a hidden hive. System! Move the hive here! Ding! The hive transfer is starting! Ding! The hive transfer is completed. The cooling time is one day. The hive was instantly moved to a place with dense leaves on the tree on the cliff. And you couldn't see it unless you looked carefully. Chin Feng looked at the treasures plundered from the snake king in the water drop space. Although there were not as many treasures as those plundered from the beast king. There were actually five rebirth flowers. Five mysteriously small golden clouds. And five golden snake bodhisattva. It seems that most of the elixirs in the beast king's place were obtained by attacking and plundering in order to improve his own strength. The Snake King deliberately left many elixirs behind. System! Use these dead flowers. Ding! The host successfully used the reborn flower. And the hive toxicity plus one. Ding! Check that the hive integrity is 100%. Is the host upgraded now? Upgrade! And speed up the upgrade of the hive and shorten the upgrade time. After two seconds of judgment, the system rang again. Ding! The hive has been successfully upgraded and 50% of the host's honey has been deducted. The estimated upgrade time is two days. Chin Feng nodded happily when he saw that the system had left two death flowers for him. For two days, Chin Feng kept flying to the Beast King's cave in the core area to absorb spiritual veins. Two days later. Ding! The hive has been successfully upgraded and is currently at level 13. Ding! The host has upgraded the hive to level 13 and will be rewarded with 5 Yuan Dan. 2 for each side. Ding! Please check the rest of the properties automatically. Chen Feng clicked on the properties panel. Hive level, 13, the host level cannot be higher than the hive. Items that need to be upgraded, rebirth flower. Number of worker bees, 72,066, transfer cooling time is 1 day. Split hive level 1, split hive level is 1 tenth of the hive. Hive toxicity, 9 twentieths before Chin Feng could finish reading it all. The beehive doubled in size with a bang sound, and its head popped out of the dense leaves. At this time, five hemp flies flew in the sky, and the sweet smell of honey penetrated their nostrils instantly along the air. Chapter 78 Stealing Food A hemp secretly remembered the location of the hive and flew into the distance. The remaining two third-level hemps and two fourth-level hemps sneaked close to the hive. 
wanting to feed the honey. Ding! An enemy attack has been detected 1,000 meters ahead. Host, please pay attention. When Shen Feng heard the system prompt, he was a little surprised. The hive had just been transferred out, but it was discovered by the beast king. In an instant, he jumped down from the throne, vibrating his wings and flew out of the hive. When Shen Feng saw a ma in the distance, he couldn't help laughing. Chin Feng winked at his men and surrounded them when Ma didn't react. The earth groans. Chin Feng flapped his wings and rushed into the ranks of several Ma. His thunderous attack hit the Ma without reservation. Xian Tian has no way. When Ma was numb all over and before he could react, several sword shadows flew towards Ma near, and several wounds scratched by the sword shadows appeared on Ma's body at the third level. The sword shadow was filled with numb blood and sprinkled in the air, like a brilliant red line. Ma the fourth mirror reacted and rushed towards Chin Feng from both sides. Chin Feng escaped the attack of one hemp, but could not avoid the attack of another hemp. Block! Chin Feng was knocked a long way away, and he was frightened for a while. He secretly felt lucky that he had blocked it. Otherwise, he would have had to open a gash in his belly. Chin Feng's eyes rolled and his speed soared to the limit, leaving behind a few afterimages. In an instant, he was in front of the two third-level Ma's. He showed off his tail needle with a cold light and pierced Ma's head. The poison of innocence. Ma, who was in the third level, did not expect that Chin Feng could attack him. He had no time to dodge and could only watch as the tail needle pierced his head. Ma felt dizzy, swayed twice in the air, and fell into the cliff. Ma under the cliff, after flapping its wings a few times, hung down feebly. Ding! The host successfully killed the triple mirror monster and obtained evolution points 3,568.5. Then, Chin Feng spun around and attacked another injured third-level Ma. The other Ma was already on guard. But unfortunately, he was injured and his movement speed was greatly reduced. Chin Feng's tail needle flashed with cold light and arrived in front of Ma at a strange speed. At this time, the two quadruple mirrors seemed to have noticed Chin Feng's intention, and their sharp beaks carried the wind and attacked Chin Feng. Chin Feng had to change his offensive. The glory worker B also joined the battle group, dragging down the two fourth-level monsters. Chin Feng freed his feet to concentrate on dealing with the injured third-level monster. Chin Feng's skills came one after another, with no cooling time, and Ma gradually became unable to do what he wanted. Chin Feng rolled his eyes, and with a plan on his mind, he launched a skill attack close to Ma's side. Ma couldn't resist, fell off the cliff, and died. Ding! The host successfully killed the triple mirror monster and obtained evolution points 3568. 5. Under the attack of numerous radiant worker bees, Ma the fourfold mirror gradually fell into decline. Seeing Chin Feng deal with two pieces of hemp again, he panicked and lost his mind. Chin Feng saw the opportunity and flew between the two hemps. The earth groans. The thunder struck Ma and paralyzed the two Ma's bodies. Chin Feng led the glory worker bees and showed their tail needles to greet them. His head was covered with hemp, and he fell off the cliff. Ding! The host successfully killed a quadruple mirror monster and obtained evolution points 4698.5. Dispose of his body, and don't let other monsters find it. Yes! Ding! A large number of enemy attacks were found 10,000 meters ahead. Host, please pay attention. Come on! Gather all the worker bees to face the enemy. The glorious worker bees were assembled in an orderly manner. Chin Feng led the glorious worker bees to form a formation outside the hive, waiting for the enemy's arrival. The system keeps prompting. Chin Feng saw a swarm of hemp swooping towards the hive not far away. Army attack. Chin Feng gave an order, and all the glorious worker bees rushed towards the enemy. Chin Feng also flapped his wings and participated in the battle, throwing away skills one after another. Ding! The host successfully killed a quadruple mirror monster and obtained evolution points 4,698.5. Ding! The host successfully killed the five-layer mirror monster and obtained evolution points 5,898.5. Evolution points are constantly increasing. Ma attacked frantically, and his eyes turned red when he looked at the hive. Fortunately, the glorious worker bees were strong enough and cooperated with each other tacitly, resisting the attack tenaciously, and Ma did not get close to the hive. Bodies kept falling from the sky to the cliff. As if it was raining, the hemp in the sky continued to decrease. And finally, it was all wiped out by the glorious worker bees. The fierce battle in the air and the rare beehive attracted the attention of other monsters. Some monsters coveted the honey in Chen Feng's hive and gathered on the top of the cliff. 
In an instant, he was discovered by the glorious worker bees guarding the top of the cliff. Chin Feng led the glorious worker bees to prepare and eliminate waves of enemy troops. After wiping out the enemy, Chin Feng returned to the throne of the hive. Seeing that he still had some evolutionary points left, he took out the Shuanya Zaya Jintan and swallowed two Shuanya Zaya Jintan without thinking. A golden light burst out of his body. Move. There will be 10,000 more evolution points. Ding! The host successfully took Shuanya Zaya Jintan to increase the evolution points to 100,000 points. Triggering the Divine Familiar Pavilion 12 of 100. The host will be rewarded with two body tempering pills. System. I want to upgrade. The system paused for two seconds. Ding! The host has been upgraded successfully. In an instant, the spiritual energy penetrated into the body crazily and traveled everywhere in the body. Chin Feng felt a slight pain in his body. It was not as easy as the previous times. Chin Feng's belly became more and more bulging, as if the spiritual energy was about to burst out from the body, as more and more spiritual energy enters the body. Finally, with a bang, calm returns, the spiritual source becomes more open, and wisps of obedient spiritual energy continue to enter the body and return to the spiritual source. Chin Feng stretched his muscles, clicked on the properties panel, and checked. Host, Chun Feng, Xientian Quadruple Mirror, 1 slash 2000000. Peeping, second level 0 to 1. Check for weaknesses within a certain range. Skill, Xientian Wudao, third level, Xientian Sword Shadow has a 30% probability of paralyzing and paralyzing the target for 3 seconds. The earth groaned. Within 100 meters of the host's body, there is no difference in thunder attacks. The number of attacks is limited to 14, which is equal to the host's own level. Block, third level, pure defensive skill. Defense power is equal to 10% of own strength. Secret technique, Wu poison, third level, after the venom is used, it can absorb honey and convert it into venom. If you are hit, you will suffer varying degrees of damage depending on your own strength. The movements of the monster beasts in the past few days instantly reached the ears of the beast king. Chin Feng sat on the throne, holding the straw with his front feet and thinking quickly. It's not my character to avoid it all the time. With such a big movement, the Beast King will definitely take action. Come on, B. Recently, we have strengthened our defenses to prevent enemy attacks. Yes. Chin Feng jumped off the throne and flew outside the hive, looking at the distant sky thoughtfully. At this time, a glorious worker be knelt on one knee on the leaf in front of Chin Feng. Report. My King. There is a third level white tiger with a hanging forehead on the top of the cliff. And it wants to see you. Third level realm? White tiger with hanging forehead. Chen Feng muttered in confusion, with some vague guesses in his heart. Lead the way and take me to see him. Yes. Chen Feng followed the glorious worker B to the top of the cliff and watched a white tiger with a hanging forehead sitting gracefully on the big rock on the top of the cliff. It's really you. Chapter 79 Waiting for the Rabbit. Chen Feng flew to the top of the cliff and looked at the hanging forehead white tiger suspiciously. You have reached a new level in just a few days. People like this need to be vigilant. Chin Feng secretly planned in his heart. You come here? Looking at Chin Feng who was wary of him. The white tiger stretched his body gracefully. I have no ill intentions. I just came here to tell you that a batch of spiritual treasures and elixirs will appear in the forbidden area in the near future. Therefore, the beast king cannot worry about you now. Forbidden area? Chin Feng lowered his guard and came to sit next to the Diao Forehead White Tiger. Looking at the Diao Forehead White Tiger with some curiosity. The forbidden area is under the jurisdiction of the Beast King in the core area. In fact, it was not originally owned by the Beast King. You also know the rules among monsters and beasts. The strong one is the king. So it is ultimately under the control of the Beast King. The jurisdiction of the Beast King? Not far behind the Beast King's cave. There are two blood birches that are thicker than other blood birches. They grow side by side. If you don't look carefully at these two blood birches, you will feel that they are different from the ordinary ones. Blood birch trees are no different. However, if you look closely at these two blood birch trees, you will find that they are surrounded by colors that other blood birch trees do not have. Cross these two trees, and behind them, you will find Ling Bao. Miraculous elixir. Chin Feng rolled his eyes and secretly memorized every word that the hanging-headed white tiger said. Why are you telling me this? Chin Feng looked at the hanging forehead white tiger strangely. A hint of wariness flashed in his eyes. The white tiger with a hanging forehead turned his head, saw Chin Feng's fleeting alertness, and sighed silently. 
There is no need for me to harm you. If I wanted to harm you, I would not have let you out when I was in the Beast King's cave. As for why I want to help you, are you interested in spiritual treasures and elixirs? Chin Feng also knew that he couldn't get away with the White Tiger. So he simply stopped asking questions. However, the uneasiness in Chin Feng's heart quietly surfaced. This kind of monster that was beyond his control gave him a serious sense of crisis. And he vaguely felt that things were far beyond his scope. Is this what you came here to talk about? The hanging forehead white tiger nodded slightly. Then stood up and jumped off the stone. Glanced at Chin Feng. And walked away. Chin Feng looked at the departing figure of the white tiger with hanging forehead. Thoughtfully. At this time. Chin Feng was sitting on the throne. His front feet habitually tapping the armrest of the throne. It is still unclear what the purpose of this beast is. Whether it is an enemy or a friend. His words cannot be fully believed or disbelieved. Chin Feng slowly came up with an idea. Flapped his wings and flew out of the hive. Heading towards the Beast King's cave in the core area. In the Beast King's cave. The tigers. Soldiers. And generals were all in good order. And there were no abnormalities. It was just that the number of white tigers guarding the cave had decreased. Is it possible that he lied to me? Chin Feng flew to the Beast King Hall again with a buzz. Looking at the empty throne. Chin Feng tilted his head. Then, he quickly flew out of the Beast King's cave and flew to the forbidden area according to what the hanging fronted white tiger said. Chin Feng, who had reached the fourth level of mirror, was flying at a speed comparable to the speed of light, leaving behind afterimages wherever he passed. Not long after, they arrived at the forbidden area mentioned by the Diaw-fronted White Tiger, which was guarded by tiger soldiers and tiger generals. At this time, the Beast King stood quietly between two blood birches, looking inside, as if waiting for something. Chin Feng saw this and knew what was going on. So he quietly flew back to the hive in order to avert the mistake. Come on, B. Let the B team be ready and ready to go at any time. Yes. The wait is long. Although the moment when the elixir and spiritual treasure broke out was coming. He was ready. However, I still felt a little uneasy inside. Chin Feng was drinking royal jelly on the throne. He thought of the mysterious white tiger with a hanging forehead. So he flew out of the hive and decided to investigate. After passing through many blood birch trees, he stopped on the leaves of a blood birch tree not far from the Beast King's cave. Meditating, the white tiger with a hanging forehead is the subordinate of the Beast King. So he should always be in the Beast King's cave. Chin Feng flapped his wings and flew into the Beast King's cave. After all, he had been in and out of this place. And it couldn't be more familiar. After checking one place after another, no trace of the white tiger with a hanging forehead was found. Chin Feng felt a little tired and stopped on the rock wall to rest. It reminds me that the first time I met the white tiger with a hanging forehead. It was in the treasure house of the Beast King. So I simply tried my luck. Chin Feng flew into the treasure pavilion and found that apart from the treasures, there was no monster. He shook his head in disappointment. But fortunately, he didn't have too much hope. Chin Feng landed on the wall and turned around to leave. At this time, a white tiger with a hanging forehead walked in. Chin Feng took a closer look and saw that it was the white tiger with a hanging forehead that he was looking for. The Diao forehead white tiger walked into the treasure pavilion and took out leaves one by one from a corner of the treasure pile in the treasure pavilion. There were densely carved things on the leaves. Not long after, the Diao fronted white tiger left. Chin Feng watched the Diao forehead white tiger go away, then flew down from the rock wall, came to the place where the Diao forehead white tiger just stayed, and took out the pile of leaves. It was blocked by the white tiger with a hanging forehead and could not see clearly. Chin Feng took it out and saw the whole leaf clearly. Those few leaves were a little withered and yellow. The leaves were not dry. But there was not much moisture. It seemed that they had been left here for several days. It's gone. But it's well preserved. Chin Feng looked at the leaves, which were densely painted with monsters. He looked left and right. It took him a long time to understand what the paintings were. The first leaf was painted with a black clawed eagle. Chin Feng thought for a while, and thought that the Black Clawed Eagle was also in the core area. He should be occupying another area. The second leaf was painted with a Bloodthirsty Butterfly. The Bloodthirsty Butterfly is second only to the Beast King, the Overlord of the Deep Forest. No monster is willing to offend this god of plague. The third picture depicts, in addition to drawings of other core regional lords, each leaf also had a drawing of a Beast King. Chin Feng looked at these leaves thoughtfully. Looking like this, it should all be information about the Beast King's enemies. However, why did Yafor White Tiger collect this information and put such important information here? 
Is it possible that there will be no monsters here to search for it? So it is put here? Chin Fong nodded in agreement, confirming his idea. Silently found a leaf not far away. Copy the copy. And secretly remember the other monsters except the Beast King. Then, it vibrated its wings and flew with a leaf towards the entrance of the Beast King's cave. The number of soldiers in the Beast King's cave has decreased a lot. Now Chen Feng's speed can be said to be lightning fast. He is not worried that he will be discovered by those tiger soldiers with a leaf. Chen Feng avoided all the patrolling soldiers and generals with ease. He seemed to be wearing a yellow with green coat, dancing gracefully in the cave. The white tiger with a hanging forehead was hiding in the dark, watching Chen Feng's retreating figure, with traces of danger in his eyes, as if he had always been here, waiting for Chen Feng's arrival. Chapter 80 Forbidden Land Chin Fong flew back to the hive with this leaf that recorded important information. After flying back to the hive, Chin Fong sat on the throne, put the leaves aside carelessly, and drank a few sips of royal jelly. The sweetness of the royal jelly turned into a stream of clear venom, moisturizing the tired wings and six limbs. Chin Fong crossed his legs, picked up the leaves with his front feet, and sat upright, as if the two-legged monster was reading a newspaper. Looking at the crooked and horrible picture I drew, I silently raised my forehead. However, I could still see the appearance of a monster. After further research, I remembered all the monsters on the picture, and then put the leaf into the water drop space. Chin Feng's front foot habitually hit the armrest of the throne while thinking in his head. Although the white tiger with a hanging forehead helped Chin Feng again and again, Chin Feng knew that there was no such good thing in the world. A white tiger with a hanging forehead that he had never met before did not help his king, but instead helped an alien beast. Of course, it would arouse suspicion. Chin Fong thought about it for a long time. But he still couldn't figure out what the white tiger on the hanging forehead was about. His mystery gave Chin Fong a sense of danger. So he suddenly had an idea in his mind and decided to go to the forbidden area to investigate again. Come on, B. Strengthen precautions to prevent other monsters from attacking. Yes, King. Chin Fong held the straw with his front foot and took another sip of royal jelly. Then he vibrated his wings and flew through the blood birch forest to the forbidden area. Outside the forbidden area, tiger soldiers and tigers will surround the entrance to the forbidden area. Two white tigers with hanging foreheads are constantly looking into the sky to prevent monsters from flying in. Two white tigers with hanging foreheads are looking into the distance to prevent the enemy from invading. There are also two hanging forehead white tigers. The white-fronted tiger looked languid and was dozing off to the side. Chin Fong carefully poked his head out from the leaves of the blood birch tree. When the two white tigers turned to the other direction at the same time, his speed soared to the limit and rushed into the forbidden area. Chin Fong only felt a flash of white light, and his vision went blank. Within a few seconds, it returned to its original state. Gone! When Chin Fong saw the scene in front of him clearly, he was a little horrified. The forbidden area seems to be another space, completely different from the blood forest. The blood forest is covered with blood birches, but other tree species are very rare. There is a vast ocean of color in front of you. The mushroom-shaped grass has a shining blue light, making the forest full of dreamy colors. Strange-shaped stones protrude from the earth and stand next to the towering trees, like guards. Ding! I found Huangjia's top-grade elixir, TNI Sanchikeo, with a maturity level of 60%. It is expected to mature in 15 days. Please pay attention to the host. Following the system's prompts, Chin Feng saw several elixirs hiding in the cracks behind a tree. He saw three small tentacle-like rhizomes extending from two dark blue leaves, as if they were swaying spiritually. Ding! I found a high-grade elixir from the Yellow Order, the Purple Leaf Magic Flower, with a maturity level of 80%. It is expected to mature in 10 days. Please pay attention to the host. Chin Feng was flying and saw a black-purple flower blooming on several plants not far away with three purple leaves. The flower exuded a charming fragrance, echoing the deep red light on the flowers and leaves. Chin Feng's light body flew over these trees. And what he saw was a waterfall. Ding! I found Huangjia's top-grade elixir. Shuanya Zia Jintan. Ding! I found a heavenly top-grade elixir. Golden Snake Bodhi. With a maturity level of 70%. It is expected to mature in 15 days. Please pay attention to the host. With his first picking experience, Chin Feng flew towards the waterfall. Above the waterfall, there were a few small blue weeds growing in the cracks in the rocks of the mountain. There were a few small blackleaf golden clouds and golden snake bodhi trees growing on the mountain. No obstruction can be seen at a glance. Chin Feng recognized it at once because he had used the Shuanya Zia Jintan 
and the golden snake Bodhi many times. Next to a golden two-leaf shrub, a black epiphyllum bloomed. All the silver light emitted by the epiphyllum was absorbed by the golden two-leaf shrub. Several rays of silver light echoed with the golden light, adding a different color to the waterfall. The water from the waterfall fell into the river from a high place and washed along the river bank. The stones along the river bank were worn and rounded. The water in the waterfall stretches along the river and pours into a misty clear spring exuding wisps of spiritual energy. With so much water being poured into it, the spring water is neither too much nor too little. There are several thousand petal lotus growing in the spring. Ding! I found a low-grade elixir from heaven. Thousand petal lotus. With a maturity level of 70%. It is expected to mature in 15 days. Please pay attention to the host. Ding! I found an intermediate spiritual vein. Please pay attention to the host. Chin Fong flew above the spring and felt the nourishment of spiritual energy. And was very surprised. Could it be that the spiritual veins are under the spring? Chin Fong looked longingly at the bottom of the water. He only saw a hazy mist and no trace of spiritual veins. Chin Fong felt that the water in this clear spring might be bottomless. So he simply described the spiritual veins in his mind. The pulse looks like. Chin Fong flew forward again. There were elixirs growing everywhere in the trees, bushes, springs, and crevices between rocks. With the help of system prompts, Chin Fong almost knew the specific time. About half a month later, all the elixirs will be born and the location of the elixirs will be remembered silently. Chin Fong lingered here for a long time, weighing it in his mind. He estimated that he had only seen one-third of the forbidden area. The Beast King attaches so much importance to this place. There should be countless elixirs here, and some of them may be hidden in invisible areas. Chin Fong secretly thought in his mind that there were so many elixirs, but he still needed to plan something. The brave will be overpowered to death, and the timid will be starved to death. Only those who have a plan will have a plan. This time, we will definitely make a lot of money. Chin Fong couldn't help but feel happy in his heart. Then, the crystal wings flew out of the forbidden area accompanied by the breeze and returned to the hive. Chin Fong sat on the throne, feeling a little excited. Come on, bee! All high-level radiant worker bees are divided into two groups. One part stays at the hive, and the other part gathers the bees and is ready to go. The glorious worker bee kneeling on one knee under the throne looked at the excited king and paused. Yes. King, the glorious worker be received the order and turned around to leave, etc. Chin Fong seemed to have thought of something and stopped the glorious worker be who was about to leave. Send some people to the forbidden area behind the Beast King's cave and keep an eye on their every move. Yes, the glorious worker be raised his head and looked at Chin Fong. When he saw that Chin Feng's order had been issued, he stood up and left. Chin Fong, who was immersed in excitement, did not see the movements and demeanor of the glorious worker bee. If he had seen it, he would definitely be surprised. Time passed by one second, and Chin Fong did not forget the spiritual veins in the Beast King's cave. Chin Fong felt that it was very troublesome to go back and forth, so he simply stayed on the spiritual veins in the Beast King's cave. Pure spiritual energy baptizes Chin Fong's bee body all the time, and the Beast King's mind in the body rotates rapidly under the water of the spiritual veins. The bottleneck that has not fluctuated for a long time has faint signs of breakthrough. At this time, Chin Fong had a vague premonition in his heart. And while absorbing the spiritual veins, he also had an idea. You can't eat hot tofu in a hurry. And you can't rush for a breakthrough. It's time to go back to the hive and see if anything happens. When Chin Fong was about to arrive at the hive, the premonition in his heart became stronger and stronger. Can't help but thump. Is it possible that something really happened to the hive? Chin Fong was on the verge of tears and sped up his flying speed. Chin Fong wandered around the cliff twice and found that there was nothing abnormal. He flew into the hive and checked it again. There was nothing.